units, level four mobilization. Location, Fisk Tower. Fisk? SWAT is 1084 at Fisk Tower. All units stand by. Warrant is en route. Did you take him down yet? No. We're at Fisk Tower, but still waiting on the warrant. Mind if I join in on the fun? You know how his lawyers are. This one needs to go by the book. Come on, Yuri. I've been waiting eight years for this. You really want to help? Head to Times Square. Sounds like his guys are trying to keep my backup from reaching the scene. You got it. Almost there. Hello? Parker, where are you? We must run through the demonstration at least once before the Grant Committee arrives. Uh, yes. Sorry. Yes. Dealing with a personal issue. I'll be in soon. I promise. Ugh. Better wrap this up quick than get to my real job. Looks like Yuri called in the cavalry. Bring in the hammer. guys on his payroll. Spider-Man, what's your status? Almost done here. You? We're about to go in. Be there soon. Can't wait to see Willie's face when you slap the cuffs on him. Okay, Yuri. All done. What's happening? Yuri? Yuri! I knew Fisk wouldn't go quietly. Get more backup. And lock down the airspace. Yuri, you okay? If he makes it out of that building, we're gonna lose him. I'm gonna go, uh... Do your thing. Yes! He's the day, Willie! Heads up! Hey, where are you going? Okay! I'll clear a path. Follow me! Get out of here, Spider-Man! We got this!
sorry to break it to you, but you do not got this, buddy. What Spider-Man got here? Get him out there with Oh, thanks for the confidence boost, guys. Bring him down already. Come on, come on. They shut the elevators down. Take the stairs. I prefer a more direct approach. Spider-Man, status. Heading to the upper floors and hoping nobody turns on the elevators. Our choppers are taking fire. Looks like Fisk has armed men on every floor. He's desperate. And he's hitting us with everything he's got. I have to find him and end this. Not yet. We just picked up Chatter. They're wiping all their data servers. We need that evidence if we want to put him away for good. Okay, server room it is. Call from May. You better answer. Hostile, next uh, floor up. Hi, Aunt May. What is all that noise? Watching a superhero movie. What's up? I just wanted to make sure we're still on for dinner tomorrow night. Totally. Uh, listen, I gotta go. Well, okay. Love you. Love you too. Huh. It's like my own private ventrance. Fisk may be a dirty criminal, but he has remarkably clean air vents. Hurry up. The boss wants everything erased. Can't make it delete any bad They're so cute when they're oblivious. Ah, come Halfway there. Just need another minute or two. You think the cops know where we are? Don't worry about out there. Is this tech support? I forgot my password. Spider-Man! You want some? See just how good their security is. Oh, you guys forgot the latest kernel patch. Hiding so cowardly. Even for you. Says the guy frantically erasing his search history. After all these years, more still just an ignorant child. True, but that's part of my charm, isn't it? Damn you. Get that door down now! Get past him! Destroy everything! I'm in an ass! Look around you. I do. Well, there was that time I took down a pompous, overstuffed crime lord before breakfast. Without me, the scum I kept in check would run rampant. It'll be your fault. Get ready for the main event. Yuri, an explosion just... I saw it. This could have the whole place wired. I'm sending in a bomb unit. I'll make sure no one gets in their way. Kill him, or the boss will kill us! You're gonna have hell this day! I think that's all of them. It's clear! Move up! Hey guys, I guess bombs are part of Willie's getaway plan? Sounds like they're trapped. You go after them. We'll look for the bombs. Ah, help! Somebody! Everyone clear out! Evacuate the building! I heard more people back that way. I'll find them. Spider-Man! We can't move! We're pinned down! I'll lift it. When you're free, get out fast. If you can walk, help the injured. Got it? Go, go, go. Thank you. He did it. Let's go. Okay, Willie, coming your way. Spider-Man, it's Yuri. How we doing, Captain? Could be better. Our choppers took a beating. We just had to ground our last one. If Fisk calls in a chopper, we have no one to stop it from landing. And no one to chase him if he flies away. Why do I get the feeling that's what he was planning all along? Because he probably was. Damn. Yuri, get EMTs up here, fast! We're trying. Uh-oh. In 
Incoming! That's enough out of you. More rockets? A little excessive, don't you think? Son of a... What? Is it National Rocket Day or something? Man, how'd the bomb squad guys get through this? Settle down. I've got enough for everybody. Okay, room is clear. The bomb squad must be somewhere ahead. Hope they're okay. You guys all right? We were just about to call for backup. I think I'm it. Lead the way. We'll be right behind you. Heads up, boss. Bed with Fisk all along? Oh no, I'll never get that image out of my head. So your plan didn't work. On to plan B, getting kicked in the face. Hey Yuri, looks like some of your guys were on Fisk's payroll. Good news is, they were Willie's last line of defense. I'm right outside his office. Take him down. Now. With pleasure. Writing your memoirs? Don't forget the hyphen between spider and man. Get the chopper ready. I won't be long. I'm surprised you made it this far. But your foolishness ends now. Uh, you do know I can still see you, right? 80 years of this insolence. Oh, for me? You shouldn't have. Gotta wait for an opening. If you want it. Willie, you seem angry. I will destroy you! Take your best shot! Give me an opening. You're out of your depth, boy! Not this time. gonna say the same to you. You know what to do, men! Surrounded! Everyone keep gay! Come on! Tire Sepadoya! Hang in there! Where are the reinforcements? I don't know, boss. Ah! <laughs> 
Kiss now? Yeah, maybe later. Finally off to Rikers, huh? You know, I think you've got more enemies in there than I do. If you think this will be more than a minor inconvenience... Whoop! Gotta go! Hey, good luck, Willie. I have a feeling you're gonna need it. Idiot! I'm the one who kept order in this city! One month! In one month you wish you had me back! The Kingpin is heading to prison. End of an era. I feel like I should celebrate. Maybe take a vacation. Parker, where are you? The committee will be here soon. We need to run an equipment check. I'm almost there. Blocks away. Uh, guess I'll just do it myself. No, don't. It's not safe. Uh. Gotta love Doc's enthusiasm, but sometimes it gets him into trouble. Better get there before he hurts himself. Sorry I'm late. Oh. You started without me. The Grant Committee's director will be here soon. It's fine, Parker. I invented this equipment. I think I can handle it. Power dampener. Man. Um, maybe we should abort. Not yet. Hold on. Dr. Octavius, are you okay? Another setback. But we're close. Is anyone hurt? No, it, it was all the, my fault. The energy levels exceeded our expectations. From a certain viewpoint, that's a very positive development. It doesn't smell very positive. I assure you, in the next phase... Let's not get ahead of ourselves. <coughs> Is there somewhere else we can discuss this? Maybe you should take the rest of the day off, Peter. But we'll talk later. was a disaster. How could the dampener have failed? I know Doc said take the day off, but I have to figure out what went wrong. Ooh, you are in bad shape, little guy. Finished. See if that worked. Good as new. Doc's been testing new materials for the prosthetics. He asked me to review his work if I had time. May as well dig in now. Doc was testing a new contact material for the prosthetic. Hydrogel polymer composite. Strong, but there's a lot of impedance. Better tell Doc to keep looking for other materials.
All right. I should get out of here before I screw things up for Doc even more. Spider-Man, it's Yuri. Fisk make it to Rikers yet? Not Rikers. Our boy qualifies for the VIP treatment. He's in the raft. Ah! Joining Scorpion, Electro, and the rest. This should be honored. That's esteemed company. Can you swing by the precinct? Got an issue that could benefit from your unique skill set. For you, Yuri, anything. I'm on my way. Huh. Looks like Jameson's got a new episode out. Wonder what my number one fan thinks about the Fisk takedown. This is Just a Facts with J. Jonah Jameson, where listeners like you discuss the issues affecting our city with Pulitzer Prize winning two times. Two times. Pulitzer Prize winning former publisher of the Daily Bugle. Hey, blood the book. And, and as always, if you order Mr. Jameson's book, Spider-Man, Threat or Menace, within 24 hours of our broadcast, you'll get an autographed copy at no extra charge. No personalizations. Don't ask. Not gonna get it. Welcome to Just the Facts with J. Jonah Jameson, alerting you to the threats you don't even know about. Let's dive right into the calls. Speak. Okay, so not for nothing, you gotta give Spider-Man respect for taking down Wilson Fisk, right? I mean, one less mob boss is good for everyone. Is that right? Tell me, are you a police officer? Prosecutor? Maybe an award-winning reporter with decades on the job like me? Uh, no, I'm a plumber. Now that you quit smoking, what do you tell people when you come up here? That I need a break from their crap. Fair enough. So, why'd you call? Need a date to the policeman's ball? You got a black and white suit? Uh... No ball this year anyway. We spent too much integrating Oscorp surveillance tech. Worth it though, right? It was. Until an hour ago. The whole system went down. Citywide. Every tower. How? They tell me someone sabotaged the central server, and now all the towers are offline. Hmm. Inside job? Maybe. We'll figure it out later. Right now we need to get the towers back online. Fast. And you called me? Aw, that's sweet. I called someone I could trust. Plus, the signals are scrambled and we have no idea how to fix it. Ooh. I love a challenge. You break it, you buy it. I thought you trusted me. Let's take a look at this tower. Input bands have been shifted. Subtle. We just had a tower come back online. Was that you? Not just a pretty mask, huh? Whatever you did, any chance you could do it to the other towers? Sure, but just so you know, I had to sync up with the tower to fix it. I'm seeing all crime data in the area now. Looks like there's a break-in happening near me. Great. I've got units nearby. Don't bother. I'm on it. Do it! Watch my back. Pretty sure these guys didn't forget their keys. Okay, wrapped up. Thanks for that. Now I'm seeing an assault near you. You're in luck, Yuri. Your favorite tough but lovable grizzled seen too much detective is in town. What? No, 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 no. You promised you wouldn't do that any- Spider cop. Please, no. So you're the snitch. Back off, creep. Yep, she's the one. I said back off! Leave me alone! Keep me quiet, lady. Don't touch me! Help! Get away from her! Oh, crap! Spider-Man! 
Walk away now, or she's dead! Let me go! All clear, ma'am. I knew Jameson was wrong about you. You're a little weird, but you got a good heart. Have you got somewhere to go? I can take care of myself. I'm sure you can, but just in case, there's a place called the Feast Center. Seen it. I don't want charity. They got the best wheat cakes in the city, hands down. Mom used to make those. Haven't had any in a long time. I'll check it out. Thanks, spider guy. It's spider man, fellow. Should be able to spot the next tower from up there. From his elevated position, Spider Cop spies his destination. A second surveillance tower. Are you narrating yourself? What? No! Of course not! The Chief never did understand Spider Cop. Thought he was a loose cannon. Already regretting this. Bet I can modify these towers to track more than just crimes. Score. Towers are picking up all kinds of RFID signals now, including one nearby. What is that? <clears throat> Not good. Can't have people taking pictures of my three chest hairs. Tools I need for suit repair at the lab. I wonder if Dr. Octavius is left for the day. Doctor! How did it go with the committee? I'm so sorry I screwed things up. Not at all, Peter. They're just nervous in the face of imminent triumph. They'll calm down. They always do. Should I head back to the lab for cleanup? No, no. I'm stepping out for dinner anyhow. We'll resume tomorrow. Short break, then back to creating the future. I wish I could bottle and sell that man's optimism. Sounds like he's left the lab for the day. Good time to work on my suit in private. Looks like Doc's gone for the night. Time to sneak in some spider work. Parker! Dr. Octavius! I, uh, uh... What you got there? Chinese. If I know you'd be here, I would've... What are you working on? Oh, just a side project. <sighs> of course. It's you. I, uh, I, I don't know what oh, you're... Oh, come on, Parker. It's obvious. Let, let me explain. I only wish you'd told me sooner. I wanted to. But I was afraid that if word got out, my family might be in danger. Huh. Yes. Uh, I guess if you design his equipment, you're bound to be a target, too. Yeah. Um, yeah. Don't worry. Your secret's safe. Well, I'll leave you to it. Check your email. I hope this isn't how Doc fires me.
Peter, the revelation of your second job as Spider-Man suit crafter, is that the right term? <clears throat> is a reminder of the good man and partner you are. No matter how hard you work, you still find time to help others. I hope you don't mind, but I noticed the suit was a bit damaged, and I took the liberty of sketching up some of my own improvements. Attached are a few ideas I had on how you could enhance his suit and help protect Spider-Man, who does so much for this city. Looking forward to the incredible work that we are doing and changing the world together. Your partner and friend, Otto. White spider, huh? Hmm. Same old me. Spider-Man, I think I figured out how Fisk's men are keeping his rackets running. Construction sites. Wasn't that shut down when he was arrested? No, it's one of his legitimate businesses. Multiple investors. We can't act without cause. But now you've got that, right? That's why I'm hoping you can keep an eye on the locations. Tell me if you see anything suspicious. You got it. I'll be your nosy neighborhood Spider-Man. My loyal listeners, brush heads, they call themselves, though I uh, never quite understood why, will remember my warning about the downright Orwellian crime monitoring system the city was installing. Well, it's not operating. Why, class? Because someone came to their senses and realized they'd be violating civil liberties? Wrong! Because those incompetent bureaucrats built a network that crashes more often than a wino driving a bumper car. So your tax dollars got wasted, and there's nothing... Yuri, I'm at a Fisk construction site, and there's a lot of guys here who aren't exactly constructing. What are they doing? I'm gonna go find out. Huh, just got a text from Doc. Looks like he attached an idea for a Spidey gadget. Man, does he ever stop inventing? Wow, this looks like it could work. Awesome. Doc would be proud. Can't believe Spider Man finally won. It ain't over till it's over. No, I know, but I remember when he was a punk kid and the boss used to hand him his ass on the neck. I thought the boss killed him that one time. Maybe he did. Legend says there's more than one Spider Man. Bite your tongue. That's all we need. Spider Man. You guys are new here. So let me give you Uh-oh. More of them. He's gonna throw it! Spider-Man, turns out we've busted four illegal firearm dealers within a three-block radius of that site. Gun running. Let's see what I can do to cut down the supply. Boss is sick and tired of you. So am I. Dang, looks like they called their buddies. Shut your mouth permanent! Are you kidding me? Oh, hey, more guys. Welcome to the party. House rules. Leave your shoes at the door. Unless you're not wearing socks, in which case, buy some socks already. Place is locked down, Captain. Actually, web down. And someone finally reported shots fired, so I've got officers inbound. Good work. Huh, 
It's Mr. Lee. Hello? Peter, it's Martin Lee. I just wanted to let you know we need a little extra time to get set for May's party. I guess the cake delivery is stuck in traffic. Oh, sure thing. Just let me know when you're ready and I'll swing by. Great. Talk to you soon. Now, where did I put my bed? 1010. Witness called in a narcotic sale. Mobilize on Dutchtown. <sighs> Mr. Lee's probably in the kitchen, getting ready for the party. Hey guys, how's the game going? How does it look like it's going? I'm winning. Get this guy checked for dementia, Pete. I'm crushing him. Well, the important thing is having fun. <laughs> I have a lot of fun whooping his ass. Hey, Peter. <laughs> What's up? Just dropping in. Hey, Martin, so sorry I'm late. You were right on time. Just keep her distracted while we get everything ready. You got it. Hey, there's my favorite aunt. Peter, what a nice surprise. Need some help? Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, there are some heavy no, boxes. No, 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 I mean, I mean, I mean, not yet. I mean, I came to, uh, uh, uh I just, just, just wanted to talk. Okay. Okay. Um... Peter. Are you in trouble? Do you need money? No, no I, mean, I mean, I'm a little behind on my rent, but... No, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Girl problems again, huh? What? No, that's crazy. I still wish you and MJ could work things out. She's a great girl. She is, but... The two of you would make some beautiful wow. baby. Uh... Peter. What is it? Come on, you can tell me. These past few years, you helping me through college and working here, and sacrificing so much and asking for nothing. I just wish there were more people like you in the world. He's right. Five years ago, you walked in here and told me you were inspired by my mission to help others. Now it's you who inspires me. Thank you, May, for everything. Here's for many more years of service. Thanks again for setting all this up. Oh, I just wish I could do more. Well, May's always told me if you help someone... You help everyone. <laughs> yeah, maybe we should send May to City Hall to have a word with the mayor. I gotta run. Um, thanks again for the party and everything. It, it, it really means a lot. Voicemail from Yuri. Should check it outside. Voicemail from Yuri. Hey, silent alarm at the auction house holding Fisk's estate sale just tripped. Could you check it out? Quietly? I don't want to make a scene if it's nothing. Fisk estate sale. Sounds fun. Wonder what the kingpin had hidden in his closet. Peter, I lost track of you at the party. Yeah, I uh, had to get to the lab. Sorry. Don't apologize. I just wanted to tell you how much what you said meant to me. I always wonder if I'm doing right by you. Well, st I am losing patience. Where is the file? There's someone else here. They must have taken it. Those masks. Who are these guys? There's no one here but us. We will find the file, or you will die. This is bad. They'll kill her if I alert them. Need to pick them off silently. Yuri, the silent alarm was legit. Masked gunman and a single hostage. Looks like a heist in progress. 
Copy that. Sending units your way. Keep the situation from getting worse in the meantime. Can do. Gotta do this quietly. Don't want to alert the others. They always look so cozy whipped up like that. Should web him from above. Whoa, careful. You stay quiet now. Someone's coming. They'll see me down here. Wears thin. Someone else is here. I swear. She must have the file. If they're here, where are they? I don't know. Yen Jing Yo Kyla. Wating Twala. Jarmy, right? time. Hey, what is that? Belongs to don't move, buddy. If I had a nickel for every don't move, hey Pete, MJ, what are you doing here? Same as you, working at least I was. Oh, I uh think this is yours. Yeah, thanks. So, Robbie's got you covering a break-in for the Bugle? Well, Robbie doesn't technically know I'm here. And it wasn't a break-in until a few minutes ago. Uh, uh huh? Let me explain. Excuse me. Hi, Mary Jane Watson. I'm covering the Fisk estate sale. Hello. Craig said we'd do this tomorrow. I like to get a jump on things. Well, I don't. You'll have to come back tomorrow. Right. Okay. I'm sorry. Hey, Craig? No, sorry. It just... It looks like we're gonna have to run something else on the cover. I don't know, uh, maybe the expressionist piece? You know what? I think I can make today work. Are you sure? You're here, no moment like the present. Thank you. Craig? Never mind. We're good. Let's get started. Look around and familiarize yourself with the items. I'll be waiting by the Baku statue when you're ready to begin. Can do. Sometimes I feel like the whole history of the world is just boys playing dress up, getting into fights. Let me know when you're ready to begin. Sounds good. Starting with the prize, a one-of-a-kind Kake Monbaku. Oh, beautiful. It's a Mifune? Correct. Mr. Fisk has exceptional taste. Did you know him well before his arrest? In a professional context. I handled many of his sales. Let's move on, please. Now this exquisite piece exemplifies the traditional Tarashikomi puddled ink effect. The two Neo are so imposing. I can see why Fisk liked this piece. Definitely his style. He loved the duality. Destruction screams, but creation toils in silence. Was there ever anything irregular in any of the sales you handled for him? No. 
No, of, of course not. Not that I was aware of. Notice the intricate gold inlay on this ceremonial tea set. It's just... A friend in the DA's office mentioned that Fisk used art sales to launder stolen goods. I'm... sure I wouldn't know anything about that. Oh, I know. I was just wondering, now that he's arrested, if you had ever noticed anything... strange. You know what? I'm actually running short of time. Why don't we grab the cover photo while we can? When I told my DA friend I was doing a piece on you, he mentioned your name was familiar. Just the photo, please. Stand right there. Are you sure there's nothing you'd like to say, maybe off the record, regarding Fisk's activities? I don't think your readers would have any interest in... Damn it. Wait here, please. Wait. I recognize that statue. I gotta get a photo. That shouldn't be here. Craig, I'll call you back. My dear, I think it's time for you to go. Oh, um, could I use the restroom real quick? Fine. Follow me. Thank you. This... this is a really lovely space. It is. And this will be the last time you see it. The ladies is around the corner. Be quick. Of course. Be right back. Hello, Craig. Funny you should call. Because the reporter you sent is clearly not working the puff piece we agreed upon. No, she's here now. I've got to get into that back room. If that statue is what I think it is, this just turned into a huge story. What do you mean he had to reschedule? Quiet. If she's not your reporter, who is she, Craig? Who is in my auction house? Oh my god. He told me about this. Fisk used it to hide evidence. Why didn't the cops take it? I know this statue opens, but how? I wonder if there are any clues in here. That's the Neo behind them. But it looks different. something. A statue can move. Most common pose is latent power. Mouth closed, left arm down, right palm facing forward. Hmm. Two poses. Mouth closed, left arm down, right palm facing forward. That's it! Norman Osborne. What is this? Devil's breath. What is devil's... <gasps> Excuse me, sir. You you can't be not good. Where's the statue? In in in, in there. Ba Wen Jin zao shu lai. I was on my way to the exit when I saw you. You're lucky to be alive. Says the guy I saved five minutes ago. Listen, whoever these masked guys are, they're after this file. 
But I'll never get it out of here while the place is swarming with them. Right. Okay. Um, you hide back there. I take out the bad guys. You make a break when it's clear. Sounds like a plan. Good to see you, Pete. Yeah, you too. Not exactly how I pictured us meeting again, though. Funny. That's exactly how I pictured it. Did she change her perfume? Focus, Pete, focus. She don't! Yes! All right. Of course. Should clear these guys out before I push forward. Okay, Pete. I'm hidden near the front. Give the word and I'll make a break for it. Will do. How about that file? What's in it that these guys want so bad? Notes on something called Devil's Breath. Fisk was hired to build a secret research lab for it. Not clear what Devil's Breath is, but it seemed to scare Fisk. He compares it to Pandora's box. Not much shook Fisk. We need to get you and that file out of here. Hang tight. There we go. That's all of them. No! Let me go! MJ! Stop! No. Hide! Not cool with the hostage taking, guys. Whoa, what is up with that glowy stuff on your hand? Are you guys ghosts? Never fought a ghost before. I mean, I've fought specters, but, you know, technically specters aren't ghosts. All ghosts are spec- huh? Huh. Looks antique. I think I know someone who could help track down where this came from. A job for later. I just talked to Craig. You are not the reporter he was sending. You don't even work for Heritage Arts. Never said I did. Hi. Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. You... You will not write a word of what you saw For the here. record, what do you know about the file those masked men stole? That... I, I don't... What about the long history of stolen goods Fisk has laundered at this auction house? Your editor will be hearing from our attorney. Mix? <laughs> like the last six months never happened? <sighs> Since when did Mix become Italian? Uh, no idea, but I'm still glad he makes these fries. Totally. Best in the city. So, how's the grind at the Bugle? Mm. Well... Yeah, well, I just got an all-caps text from Robbie about my so-called antics tonight. So it looks like I'll be meeting with a legal team. Again. Uh, as soon as he reads the article you're gonna write, guaranteed promotion. So, creepy mask guys. What's your take? 
Just another night in the city. What's your take? I feel like there's a bigger story there. Let's not make this all about business. How's how's it going with you? Did did you get that promotion? No, but we're on the cusp of something really big. You know Oscorp would hire you in a heartbeat, right? One phone call to hair. Sure, but Dr. Octavius' work will help millions. I'm, I'm right where I want to be, right where I should be. Almost sounds like it's more important than your other job. I've never heard you talk like that before. A lot can change in six months. Why did you ask me here, Pete? You know, just, uh, just dinner between friends. Friends? Is that what we are? I Maybe mean, we could be, you know, you know if, if that's what you wanted. <laughs> There's a lot of baggage here. Yeah, sure, but is that so bad? I mean, baggage can carry good things, too, like, uh, like money and uh, keys, and raspberry lip balm. Do you remember why we broke up? This is a trick question, isn't it? Saved by the siren. Talk to you later. Go. Cool. Love seeing you two together again. You always were my favorites. Hey, it's me. What's with the units heading down third? Looks like our old friend Herman Schultz is at it again. Shocker! Didn't he just get paroled? Yeah, well, I guess it didn't take. No worries. Herman's just a big cupcake. I'll have him back in Rikers by bedtime. Just had dinner with my ex after saving her from masked criminals. And now I'm gonna go beat up a maniac who uses shockwaves to rob people. What a perfectly normal life you have, Peter Parker. Peter, I just want to make sure you haven't left any equipment you've built for your friend around the lab. It's no bother to me, but if the Grand Committee stops by again... Don't worry, Doc. I make a point not to leave anything there. But I know my friend appreciates you looking out for him. There's a lot of people who don't like him very much. That buffoon Jameson and his audience of sheep? Please. The people who do great things in this world are those who don't let bullies like him stand in their way. People like us. You said a mouthful, Doc. Take care. Hi, Herman. Seriously? Give it up! You're never gonna catch me! That's what you said last time. I don't wanna hurt you! You'll just slow me down! Wow, that's considerate. What's the money for, Herman? Gotcha. Now let's talk. I said... I'm done. Noted. Honestly, Herman, why are you robbing again? You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone, or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice! Shut up. Move, move, move! You know what, Herman? You have, like, zero personality. But your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? Maybe later. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Look 
Looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ. You're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here, and I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah. Whenever, whatever. So I guess... Almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. Peter! What can I do for you? I'm uh, sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. Uh, she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where did she find it? I'm really not sure. Why? What is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. It scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Why take the risk? Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. I could pet. Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Peter, Mr. Lee spoke to me. He seemed worried. Are you into something dangerous? Oh, it's just a story Mary Jane's investigating. Don't worry. I'll make sure she's careful. Please tell me you two are back together. We're talking again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. He's just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You've got a good boss, May. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. All units, there's a view. Hello? Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey, what's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I mean, I didn't forget, forget, I just... I, I'll be there soon. <sighs> His tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker. You're better than this. <sighs> That's right. How did I lose track of time? <sighs> How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes. 
<laughs> hey. Hey. What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. <sighs> Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work. In a secure environment. At Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> easy, easy, easy. They, they, they didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. I wish I could do something to help Doc. Maybe call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. No. Norman never listens to Harry. He even tried to kill funding for his research stations. Hey, one of those stations is nearby. I should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. Must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. Harry left me a message about these before he left for Europe. Pete, hey, I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's gonna shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is, too. Well, it's not gonna pay the bills, but it sounds like it means a lot to him. I'll do what I can to help. Spider-Man, Shocker has escaped, and now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was, but one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him, then gave him his suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Damn. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank. Herman! Long time no see. Hey, I'm no lawyer, but uh, I'm pretty sure that's a parole violation. Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Want to play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb rest? Okay, face punch it is. Whoa! Your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You want to fight? Let's fight! Man, can't wait to put you back behind bars so we can talk science. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid, you just stupid. You talk too much! 
Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, is there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? And who determines the ideal ratio of talking versus not talking? Also, how would you measure? Words per minute, syllables per second? Or is it more about how many words one uses to express a single thought? It's all so subjective. If you ask me, some people don't talk enough. Okay, now I can do some real damage. Why are you doing this, Herman? Because if I don't, they'll kill me! If you come clean, I can help you! You really want to help me? Just let me have the money! Sorry, not gonna happen. Gotcha! Coming your way! You know, people don't use banks anymore. You're lucky you found actual cash. If you really want to rob banks, try day trading. It's all the rage. Wait, 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 wait! Oh, no! Aw, oh, come on, Herman! If you tell me who you're working for, I can help you cut a deal! If I talk, I'm dead! They made that very clear! Catch! You're freaking me out, Herman. It's not like you to be afraid of people. Not even sure these guys are people. Could be anything under those masks. Wait, did you say masks? <laughs> these masks guys, what do they want the money for? Don't know, don't care. As soon as I finish the job, I do. <laughs> <laughs> Give up now and we can protect you! No way! You ain't see what I see! You son of a... Okay, last chance to give up! This time I really mean it! Quit moving! Okay, I was kidding before. Now is your last last chance! Seriously! Sorry, Herman. You brought this on yourself. Literally. Man, he was scared and desperate. These demons are everywhere all of a sudden. Okay, Yuri. Shocker's all yours now. Good work. We have a special cell waiting for him at the raft. We'll make sure he stays behind bars this time. Also, I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey! The Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. Not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway, have you had any more reports on Demon, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? You probably don't want to know. <sighs> Shouldn't have asked. Doc left a message. Peter, I might have been a bit hasty advising you to find another job. I have a plan. Give me a bit of time. We may yet live to invent another day. The indomitable Otto Octavius. That's great news. Hope his plan works. Demons are after some serious financing. Hey, so I looked into reports of demons. I knew you'd come around. They've been pretty busy tonight, hitting a lot of Fisk properties. They're going after Fisk? Damn. You thinking what I'm thinking? Brewing gang war? Let's try to get ahead of it. 
Are there any Fisk properties that haven't been hit tonight? Let me see. Patrol reported a bunch of activity at one of his shipyards in Portside. Thanks, Yuri. I'll check it out. Hey, Yuri. Any idea what Fisk uses that shipyard for? No idea. Let me send an officer to meet you there. His name's Jefferson Davis. That's his beat. He's a good cop. Been working the Fisk case for years. If anyone knows what's going on at that shipyard, it's him. They said one toe inside the vault. I'll have your head. Got it, boss. Tripling security. Demons won't touch a thing. Listen up! Demons are making moves on all our caches. Lost two tonight already. Boss may be in lockup. That don't mean his hardware's up for grabs. Com check, Eagle 2, you up? Eagle 2 reporting in, eyes on. What caches are the demons after? Need to take out Fisk's men and figure out what they're guarding. Whatever it is, I don't want it in Fisk's or the demons' hands. Snipers everywhere. Might need to deal with them first. You just made a big mistake. How the hell is this stuff made of? These webs off me! Take his ass! Get down! You know we can't have vigilantes trespassing or doing illegal searches. Yeah, I know. Which is why I brought a warrant. So what do you say we do some perfectly legal searching? I like the sound of that. What's your name? Officer Davis. Call me Jeff. And you are? Uh... uh... <laughs> Just messing with you. My son's a big fan. So, that warrant cover breaking down doors? Not without a lot of extra paperwork. Okay. I'll find another way in. Any place this rundown should have a hole in the wall or a broken window. Check around back. I'd go myself, but you know, not Spider-Man. I feel like I'm in a horror movie. Hello? Any fishermen with a grudge and a hook for a hand? Okay, where's that locked door? Jeff, you there? I'm doing my best to refrain from knock-knock jokes. Appreciate it. You see a junction box powering the door? Yeah, got it. If we can overload it, that should force the door open. Smart, but I don't have anything that packs enough current. Try this. Stun gun, genius. Capacitors in this are just what I need for an upgrade I've been thinking of. Electric web for the wind. The gadget man, huh? You remind me of my son. Started taking apart the TV when he was five. <laughs> now he's unlocking his friend's phones. Sounds like he could teach me a few things. Okay. Nothing illegal in plain sight? Kinda anticlimactic, huh? At first glance. Let's look closer. Looking for something specific? This yard's been here a long time. Bootleggers used to use it back in the day. Gotcha. Those guys love their hidden rooms. Check it out. Sound hollow to you? I got a hidden panel, like the one on the door. The conduits lead out the back. Look for another junction box. Let's see if my mask lenses can pick up the conduits. This myself. Hey, I doubt I would have found it without you. 
Hmm. You got a big fat nothing. Well, there's one secret room that could be more. Notice anything about the floor? Aha. Uh -huh. They can hide the doors, but not the scrapes they leave. Keep an eye out for more of those. I know I'm after scrapes. I should take another look around. Pay dirt! Scrape, no door. None I can see anyway. Great. Be right there. Maybe not. Elevator's busted. Sit tight. I'll pull you up. Second floor, rusted machine parts, big honkin' rats. <laughs> Careful, the bridge is out. I got this one. <sighs> nice, stuck the landing and everything. We're not all donut eaters. <laughs> Fair enough. Another secret door. I'll rig the lock. Let me know if you find the junction box. Yep, on it. Found one. Nailed it! Hell yeah, you did. Hey, check this out. Nothing. I'm starting to feel like this is Fisk's way of messing with me. Well, look at the walls. They kept guns here. They wouldn't have moved them to the front door. Gotta be a passageway we're missing. Check out the wall. This might control access to another area. Fisk's men were talking about a vault. Maybe we're close. Bet on it. Looks like a dual circuit. See if you can find a second junction box. If I were a junction box, where would I be? Follow the conduits. They should lead you in the right direction. Ah! Found it. Clear. You were right, Jeff. Trap door. Outstanding. Think you can help me out? This thing's heavy. One, two, three. Well, that isn't spooky at all. Probably an old bootlegger's tunnel. And it looks like no one's cleaned it since Al Capone. Big chunk of concrete in the way. I can't get through. Let me see how it looks from the top. Got room to maneuver here. Hang on. I'm blocked. Anything you can do? What was that? Subway, maybe. Let's hustle. The place is unstable. Okay, that definitely wasn't a subway. No. It sounded like explosives. And that sounds like demons. The vault! Hurry! Come on, let's go! Demons are already gone. How'd they beat us here? Must be a back door. See if you can find it. This place is one hell of an armory. Or was. There. They blew the locks to get in. Smash and grab. They were moving fast. Got empty crates here. And it looks like they took the ones they didn't clean out. Stay here. Hell no. 
It'll take both of us to stop them. And some of these. They're moving. Let's go. Get them! Find cover! Trucks full of gunmen in one day. Time to hang up the webs. Decides to run on time. We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are gonna tell their story with or without you. And they thrive on controversy. So what's your end? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Hop in. She's good. Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's Route 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? 
me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Municipal garage, Bowery and Grand. Not a problem. I don't care if I lose everything else, but I have to find my Spidey drive. Can't be that hard. Finding a tiny flash drive in a 30-ton garbage truck? I have years of research on that drive. Everything I've worked on since high school. Of course it's locked. Can't have people stealing garbage. Maybe there's another way in. Okay, no need to panic. Maybe they haven't dumped the trash yet. Nada. Ugh. Okay, time to panic. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Sorry, is there any chance the truck wasn't at the garage? Sure, I guess. Just means it'd be somewhere in West Chinatown. Great, I'm headed there now. Hey, it's a long shot, but sometimes the guys stop for pizza before they drop off. Really? I'll check out the pizza shops. Any idea which one? One of the mom and pop joints, I think. Jerry's? No, that's uptown. I mean, original Jerry's. Oh, right. No, started with an L, I think. Larry's? That's on the east side. Uh, Leo's. Leo's, yeah. That might be it. Man, I love Leo's. I'll pick. Wait, I think I see the trucks. Thanks, Eddie. Should be some trucks close by. Nope, stuff's not here. There has to be another truck around here. Should you just be standing here like that? Whoa. No sign of my stuff. <coughs> what an interesting smell. Wait, you jumped through that window. Eddie, you're my only hope. Not there either, huh? You sure they were around here? Well, the guys might have switched routes due to the upcoming Osborne rally. If your pickup was on Route 35, they'd be dropping off at the incinerator right now. Incinerator? Over by Manhattan Bridge. Better hustle. There's the incinerator. Hope I'm not too late. Uh-oh. Looks like trouble. You okay? Yeah, thanks. This gang's been terrorizing the whole neighborhood the last couple of days. There's probably more of them on the way. I'll keep an eye out. Hey, mind if I look around for some, uh, some personal items? Sure, have at it. I gotta go file an incident report. There's something there. Gotta move these bags out of the way. <laughs> I think that's it. Be here, please be here. Yes. Hope it still works. Phew, looks like everything's here. Hey, look, it's an old gadget prototype. Looks kind of awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? Uh, I think I can make this work. Look, is that guy? It's a spider. Uh oh. Ice. Okay, well, this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? 
Guess I could try MJ's. All right, how am I gonna talk my way onto MJ's couch? Let's see. Uh, hi, MJ, it's Peter. Any chance I could stay over to... Oh, that's too cool. MJ! I was just in the neighborhood and... Oh, that's lame. Hey, MJ, now that we're talking again, I thought maybe... Oh, okay, that just sounds pathetic. Why am I making this such a big deal? We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just a couch. MJ's couch. Oh, what am I thinking? Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh, looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. I wish Harry was in town. I could crash with him. Huh. Someone left me a voicemail. Number's blocked, though. Hey there, spider. Long time no see. Miss me? Come to this address. Catch me if you can. Uh-oh. I think I know that voice. Hello, spider. Been thinking about you a lot lately. We were good together, weren't we? Maybe it's time to reignite the flame. The black cat. Don't tell me she's scoping out places to rob. She promised she would give up that life. What was she looking at? Anything look out of place? There. One of her cats. She packs those with range extenders, then harvests nearby RFID signals. I'll let Yuri know to pick it up. Felicia's too smart to be putting herself at risk like this. She must be desperate for some reason. Better keep an eye out. Hey, Yuri. You still have Black Cat's suit and equipment in the evidence lockup, right? I think so. Why? Is she back at it? Maybe. Just double check and let me know if her gear is still there. Will do. Hey, May. You're calling late. What's up? I thought we were going to meet up for dinner tonight. Oh, right. I'm sorry, I forgot. It's been a hard day. We lost funding at the lab. Oh, Peter. I'm sorry. I also kind of got evicted from my apartment. What? Do you have a place to stay tonight? Actually, no. Not really. I hate to ask, but any chance you have room at the shelter? Of course. Feel free to use the couch in my office. Thanks, May. Hey, so this gang war between the demons and Fisk is really heating up. I know. Even Shocker's a part of it. Got roped into running jobs for the demons. These guys are serious. Do they just want to replace Fisk? That'd be bad enough. Hope it's not something worse. <sighs> Can't believe I haven't slept since the Fisk takedown. Gotta start taking better care of myself. What are you doing here so late? Hope May's couch is comfortable. Miss you. I can't take this. You can, and you will. I'll pay you back. Soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. 
And just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Well, I guess I better get busy. <sighs> Hope Mr. Lee's okay. Are you sure you can spare that money? Easily. Working here leaves very little time to spend money, and I'm just fine with that. Man, was I ever a dork. Hello? Hey, did you see my story? I did. Robbie must be pretty happy right now. Yeah, it kind of went viral. And get this, Mayor Osborne just announced he's going to give Officer Davis an award this afternoon. Wow. Wait, isn't Osborne's campaign rally this after... Oh, I see what he's doing. Yeah, we all do. But still, a pretty cool moment for Officer Davis and his family. I'll be there covering it. Wanna join me? Yeah, of course. See you then. So humiliating taking money from May. I should head out into the city and try to pay it forward. Hey, Jeff. Congrats on the ceremony today. I'll be glad when it's over. A truck full of armed demons scares me less than public speaking. But I'm calling about something else. What's up? Just got a tip that the demons are moving on the fifth construction site in Midtown. My wife would kill me if I ditched the ceremony prep to play cops and robbers, but I thought maybe my friendly neighborhood partner would want to know. Understood. I'll do a swing by and let you know what I find. And hey, here's a tip on public speaking. Just picture everyone in their underwear. Wait, not Osborne. You know what? Just never mind. <laughs> Consolidated shipping. Jeff, I'm here. What do you see? Find the rest. The boss wants them dead. Looks like the demons are moving in on Fisk's territory. You got this? I got this. <laughs> You got what you came for. You don't need to kill us, too. Fisk's territory is ours now. Not today. Hey, Willie. You. Nice jumpsuit. Slimming. Stay out of my business. Wait, the demons. Who's their leader? Keep my men alive and maybe I'll tell you.
saving bad guys from other bad guys. Not how I thought today would go. Big guy. here. Wait for the police. Fisk, your men are safe. Your turn. Who runs the demons? Maybe he's there. Maybe he isn't. Check the roof. I've missed these cryptic Fisk talks. That just happened? Yeah. I'm getting reports of a helicopter with a wrecking ball? Yeah, things with the demons got complicated. Sit tight, Yuri. I got this. Please. That helicopter is destroying the city. I know. Bring it down. I know. Maybe you could superhero a little faster? Working on it, Yuri. Call you when it's done. to regret this. Hi! Is this the flight to Newark? Second engine. Need a plan. 
the plan real fast. I guess this is the plan. Come on, Pete, you got this. You got this, you got this, you got this. Don't screw this up! These masks are so awesome. Where do you get them? Oh, Solomon! They're cool bags! Do they have a website? Uh, yes! Hey, Yuri. I caught the bad guys, but... But what? You might want to bring a ladder. Yo, Miles. Hey, fanboy. Oh, crap. I'm late. You coming? Uh, nah, I gotta get to City Hall for my dad's ceremony. All right. Tell your pops I said congrats. MJ, did they start the ceremony yet? They're still setting up. Where are you? Got hung up at work. Be there soon. Another message from Doc. Peter, I don't want to jinx us, but the lead I'm following might not only get the project back on its feet, but also expand it in ways we never could have imagined. Everything happens for a reason. Even Norman pulling our plug. Really hope this works out. Doc's work is too important to go unfinished. There's the sage entrance, and we'll be right out front. <sighs> Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. The last time I gave a speech, I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. <laughs> well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey, you got this, Dad. I mean, come on, you saved Spider-Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> Or, maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> Come on, honey. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so... so? I think this gang war may finally be over. Like, like over, over? I'm, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends? Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um... Well, thanks, Jim. Couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. But, uh, instead of coffee, maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over, uh, I'll cook. Or we could, you know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> for acts of extraordinary bravery. Above and beyond the call of duty, it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with a Department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family. My wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes, I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, 
and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help, but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass. I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer. Over there. Right there. What the hell? Where do you think you're going? What? Oh, 
这边有问题。这边好像有声音。看看讲坛那里有没有活人。没动静，接着走。Can't cross yet. Gotta find a way around these guys. I was right there. Gotta help him. Shooting you, Tom. So bad. I got you, Dad. to leave now. Dad. 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 No! Wake up, Dad. Wake up. Wake up. I'm sorry for your loss. Do I know you? I'm Peter Parker. I was at City Hall when... Look, I know you don't know me, but I just wanted to say... I know what you're going through. Uh, that's what you were gonna say, right? Or it all gets easier with time. Don't worry. It's, it's part of God's plan. I'm sorry. I was just try trying to help. I know. I'm sorry about that. I don't know what I'm going to do with him. Sorry, Jeff. I'm busy. What's up? Have you started looking for Martin Lee yet? No. I told you, I can't start a manhunt based on a hunch from Spider-Man. But I'm telling you, he's the guy. Get me some solid evidence and we'll talk. Solid evidence. Right. Hey, 
It's me. Hey, so what are you thinking? I'm thinking I screwed up, and that kid lost his father. I know you too well to say you should give yourself a break. What about the police? Do they have any leads on them? They're not even looking for him. Even Yuri doesn't believe me. Then it's up to us to find him. I've been doing some research. Go to this address. Martin Lee bought a controlling interest in this recycling center last year. You think he's hiding out there? Maybe. We know he's not at Feast. If he's not at the recycling center, maybe you'll find some evidence as to where he might be. Yeah. Good work, MJ. I'll let you know what I find. Oh, one more thing. I talked with a detective about questioning the arrested demons. They're all claiming Martin Lee has the power to, quote, corrupt people. Corrupt? What does that mean? They say it's sort of like mind control. It brings out the negative part of you. It makes you do things you wouldn't normally do. Uh, sounds a little far-fetched. This is coming from a guy who can run up walls. Would you look at that? Half the crime tower's back up already. When spider cops on the job, come hell or high water, the job gets... Nope, nope, nope. Nope. She'd never admit it. But the chief was warming up to Spider Cop. His casual disregard for by the book thinking was a breath of fresh air. She'd come around someday. MJ's hunch was right. The place is crawling with demons. Gotta take these guys out, then have a look around. Okay, that's all of them. Huh. High security lock. They use these on banks, not recycling centers. Maybe if I can find where it gets its power from. Looks like I could override the circuit. Need my electric webs. Well, that did something. It looks like the circuits need a little more juice. Uh-huh. That's it! Oh, man. Lots of high-tech equipment. Maybe later I can recycle this stuff into some weapons of my own. These must be where they're planning to attack. Wait, these are Osborne campaign offices. All the paths originate from the same address. Guns from Fisk's armory. Explosives from Fisk's construction site. Truck bombs? This is crazy! This wasn't a gang war. The demons were stealing from Fisk to go after Mayor Osborne. Hey, did you find Lee? No, but you were right. Lee's using this place as a front for the demons. Bomb making, gun running. Oh my god. And it looks like they're planning another attack. This time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. We must have some kind of beef with Norman Osborne. I found an address here. I think it's their staging area. If I hurry, I might be able to stop them. Be careful. Yuri, it's me. Make it quick. I'm busy getting yelled at by my boss. Martin Lee and the demons are planning another attack, this time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. Are you sure? We've had a lot of false leads in the past week. Trust me on this one. I'm sending you the address of a recycling center. You'll find all the evidence there. Got it. I'll get those campaign offices evacuated. But if you're wrong about this, you're gonna help me find a new job. Consolidated shipping. A lot of guys. I should try to do this quietly. But also with style.
Well, he's not out here. Better check inside. Huh. Invoice from an auto shop. Pale horse rides. That's one expensive tune-up. What else can I find around here? They have bases all around the city. This is bigger than I thought. Looks like the demons have an army. As if one deadly glowing whip wasn't enough. Expecting, but it was definitely not this. Hey, MJ, I think I stopped the demon's attack on Osborne's campaign offices. Nice. Did you find me? No, but I found something we should look into. A place called Pale Horse Ride. Sounds familiar. I'll check it out and get back to you. This is new. No, no, no. This one's mine. All right. I'm executing this son of a... Hey! That's not how we do things. Down! Down! Code SM-1. Whoa, whoa! Before we do this, who the hell are you guys? Code SM-1. Code SM-1. Holding for orders. Copy Code SM-1. I have a visual. Hold for Silverburn. Entrance. Solid eight out of ten. Nine out of ten. Release him. He works with us. Yuri, explanation, please. This is Silver Sablanova, head of Sable International. A private security force. Paid for by Mayor Osborne. Oh, the mayor has a pet army now? Next time you get in my way, I will not be so gentle. Go. We'll talk later. Sorry about that Sable thing. I should have told you earlier, but it all happened so fast. It's okay. We're still best buds. We're not best buds. Well, that took a dark turn. Anyway, 
Sable has the mayor's ear and unchecked authority. We've searched that address you gave me, found plenty of evidence of a bomb plot, but nothing that leads back to Martin Lee. I'm working on that. Hey, MJ. Hey, so I dredged up some records on Martin Lee's other business holdings. He's got places all over the city. Huh. The locations line up with a map I found at that shipping business. I'll check them out. Let me know what you find at each one, and I'll work on building a case. You got it. I'm headed to Lee's office at Feast to see if I can learn more about why he's doing this. And what he's got planned next. Okay. Say hi to May for me. Wait, you don't think she's in danger, do you? No. Lee's only got one target on his mind. Norman Osborne. Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No. Why? I'm just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. I should check out Lee's office. Need help with those veggies? I learned a long time ago, you're more help staying out of the kitchen than in it. Pete, glad to see you're okay. Hmm. Hanging in there. This office is locked. How do I get in there? Quietly. I don't feel safe anymore. Huh. Never seen that room before. Whoa, what the... High voltage lines. What needs this much power? I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. No, I don't know when that will be. room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. Lee's parents. Looks like there's a keyhole in the frame. I thought Lee's parents abandoned him. Why build a shrine to the people who threw you away? This is the ghost story Lee's father read to him. ...about a demon that could only be mastered through balance. Lee's journal. Bet this fits the lock in the portrait. Lee sounds conflicted. Almost like he didn't want to head down this path. Hmm. Some kind of puzzle lock. That seems right. Oh, I see. Yes! Whoa.
What are you hiding, Lee? Lee sure is obsessed with masks. Is it a Jungian thing? Like, he needed to pretend to be someone else to let his darkest feelings out? Pretended to be a demon, until he became one. He's giving his powers to the others. MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Creepy. It's a burn room, wired to destroy evidence. Get out of here. Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. I get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack plan. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. 
MJ, hey, just checking in. Peter, hey, can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait, remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more, but I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah, see ya. Dinner? Huh. What should I cook? A lab. Uh, like now? This is my defining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Uh, okay. Be right there. Wonder if this means I have a job again. Guess I can stop by. Just for a minute. Missed another call from Doc. Peter, I wanted to make sure you're still available. I can't pay you yet, but I've pulled enough strings to keep the wolves from the door a bit longer. If we can get up and running, I know this new version of the project will attract investment. Massive investment. Stay ready. Fingers triple crossed, Doc. Hey, Doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. We really need to get better about organizing our workspace. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it. You ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that, and well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. 
I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Why don't you do the honors this time? I think we did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. You sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. Missed call from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. What's that? Hey, sorry I missed your call. Are we still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but... Yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, dinner at MJ's. No expectations. It'll be hard to screw this one up. Peter! You are not gonna believe what happened. So you know that address you gave me? I went there. MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. This is the address Pete found. Men are all carrying firearms. What is this place? That off might be something inside that connects this to Lee. Need to get back there. Huh? What was that? What dumbass can't put their shit away? Bet it was happy. Yo, Rick! Boss wants to talk to you. Get in here! I need to get into that office. What are they building? Is this all for Lee? You tried any yet? What was that? Those barrels seem important. Alchemax. Why is that so... What's in these? Boss! Come on! We'll never notice! Tombstone. You're right, Rick. Uh, won't notice? Because uh, it won't be there. God damn it! I said I'll fix it! You got some stones, Rick. <laughs> Let's see if they break.
Such a disappointment. And now I need a new welder. Building for Lee. But why does he need an armored vehicle? There must be something else in this office. Here we go. GPS trackers. What is Tombstone using these for? All right, boys. Time to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway, here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. <laughs> the great dumpling catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves devil's breath, whatever that is. Yeah, I'll dig into it. So I was thinking, what if we teamed up? What, what, you want to be my sidekick? Like a spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. Ah. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh! Oscorp CFO! Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did... Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where do you want me to, uh... Just a couch is fine. <laughs> yeah. See you later? Yeah. Hey, it's me. This curry is legit. So what do we know about Charles Standish? Let's see. Chief Financial Officer at Oscorp. Single, known for his art collection. If Lee's after him, it's gotta be related to Devil's Breath. I'll run a search on everything in that file. Let me know the second you find something. I think Lee might be planning something even worse than City Hall. So, are we partners now? Cause it sure feels like we are. Partners! Uh, sounds good! Okay. See ya, partner. Police look like they could use some help.
assist, my man. Someone radio dispatch. We need a wagon. There's probably more of them inside. You guys stay here. Somebody was in a hurry. Spider-Man! You're hurt. I'm okay. But you gotta find Mr. Standish. Fast. Those guys in the masks kidnapped him and forced him up to his place. He lives in the penthouse. Top floor. Okay, sit tight. So glad you're here. I can't find my car. I could I parked on this level. Wait, you guys work here too? This building is serious about parking enforcement. Elevator won't work, they know I'm here. But maybe I can sneak up through the elevator shaft. Should be able to make it up to the penthouse from here. Okay, almost there. Stay out of the light. Not good. Standish. Okay, now what? Enter your password. He sounds nervous. Maybe I should take him out. Literally didn't see that coming. Okay, all clear. Hope Standish is all right. safe now. What were they after? Just financial records. About Devil's Breath? How do you know about that? Why do they want it? I don't even know what it is. Mr. Osborne's been pouring money into it for years, but he keeps the whole project a secret. I'm the only one who has any record of it. Not anymore. Looks like they copied some records to a secure server. Payroll information. On a Dr. Isaac Delaney. Who is he? I, I honestly don't know. Down! Come on, come on! Wait, the elevator! <gasps> Hold on! Oh, 
Almost got him! Try to fall slower! You okay? Yeah. I think so. Good. Good. You know, as elevator shafts go, this is pretty nice. <laughs> hey, Yuri. You okay? Yeah. But I didn't get much out of Standish before these Sable guys stepped in and told me to back off. What's the deal? I get the sense all they care about is keeping him quiet. Because he knows about Devil's Breath. Right. Whatever the hell that is. I'm working on that. I think I just got a lead. A lead? You sound like a cop. Don't you mean... Spider Cop? Uh, Yuri? That's fair. Peter, what happened with Standish? He's safe. Okay, good. I'm missing this. They were looking for a name. You got a pen? Yeah, go. Dr. Isaac Delaney. Okay. Who is he? What's his deal? I was hoping you could tell me. I'm on it. Just give me a few. Oh, and before I forget, you left that tracker from Tombstones at my place. I'll drop it at Dr. Octavius' lab. Let you know what I find on Delaney. A shootout. That's not good for anybody. Message from Doc. Sorry to call so late. My mind's bursting with ideas. We've been thinking too small, Peter. Why replace missing limbs with facsimiles when we can improve upon them? People who've lost an arm understandably want it back, but we can give them something better. The human body doesn't need to be our default. We can go so far beyond it. Just some thoughts to conjure with. Doc's really giving it both barrels. If he doesn't burn himself out. Nearby units advised. Witnesses called in a Hey, you have time to check something out for me? No, but if you ask nicely. Just got a call about a suspicious looking box on a rooftop in Hell's Kitchen. I could call in the bomb squad, but if it's just some kid's science project. Yeah, I know. Budget crisis, yada yada yada. So? Uh, will you please check it out? There's the magic word. I hope it's some kid's science project. Man, I miss those days. School projects are so much easier than real-life projects. While I'm here, I should examine the transmitter MJ found. If I can reverse-engineer this, it should track Tombstone's shipment. That should do it. Time for a test run. Okay, just gotta follow the signal. Should lead to whatever it is Tombstone's moving. Tombstone. This guy's the mother of all headaches. Impermeable skin plus zero morals equals bad time. Hope running a chop shop is the worst thing he's up to. There. That truck. Out for a Sunday drive? Oh boy, gang's all here. Biker gang down. Let's see what's in that truck. Uh, chemical containers. But they're scrubbed clean. Looks like they came from the Alchemax plant in Harlem, but... What was in them? And that sound means the end of our lightning round. Should head to Alchemax when I get a chance and find out what was in those barrels. Tombstone's up to something. Probably illegal. Definitely dangerous. Friends, I've just received an update on Adrian Tombs, a.k.a. The Vulture. Apparently, this winged criminal has fallen ill with cancer and he's been moved to the RAF's infirmary for treatment, which will undoubtedly cost a fortune in public funds. Now let me ask you, why do we even have an infirmary at the RAF? It's a supermax prison, 
full of maniacs. If they get sick, let nature take its course. Now I realize that's harsh, but so is my tax bill. All units advised, we have a reported assault in progress. Incident is active near Carnegie Hall. There's the Alchemax plant. Huh, good timing. Tombstone's men are loading fresh supplies. What for, though? Is he getting back into drugs? They're heavily armed. This might be easier if I stay quiet. Where are all the security guards? You think all these chemicals are safe to be around? Safe with being around the boss if we screw up. Shake the freaking leg. Hey. Shh. Tombstone's men are down. Now to find out what's in these barrels. Diox 3. Isn't this the chemical Tombstone was exposed to as a kid? What's he doing with it now? That stuff's not for us. Feeling those drug inhalers and the Diox 3 are related. Should analyze an inhaler to find out what's going on here. All right, what's in you? Diox 3 plus designer amphetamines. Pretty clever recipe for temporary invulnerability. I'm impressed. And worried. This stuff hits the street and there'll be a huge market for it. With Tombstone as the sole supplier. I think I can synthesize a counter drug. Wonder if there are any lab supplies in that truck. Time for some artisanal science. There. Single dose of the counter drug. Just need to test it out. Maybe I should pay Tombstone a visit at his chop shop. Tombstone down. The angry drug lord drank alone. There's a poem in there somewhere. <laughs> you know better than me. Never was the literary type. How'd you even manage to connect with Martin Lee? I'm top of my game. I don't go without it. People find me. You know, if you ever wanted to team up, we could do some real damage. Ah, so flattered. But the exploitation of suffering thing gives me pause. I need to tire him out before I try the counter drug. Could have touched Tombstone for days and he wouldn't feel it. Wonder if the counter drug would work on him. Boys, get in here! You remember last time we did this dance? Your leg healed up on me. Ah! Hurts when it rains, but otherwise dandy. Sweet if you'd act. Can't use the counter drug till I take out Tombstone's gang. Ah! 
Drug work. Time to take him down. The hell was that you dosed me? Feel that. Uh, funky. Oh, uh, you know, particulated deep locking agent. The usual. You actually hurt me. I don't remember the last time that happened. Welcome uh, back to the human experience, Lonnie. Uh, my tongue feels funny. My tongue is supposed to feel funny. Oh, yeah, totally. Harvest it someday, Lonnie. I want to find you doing good. Wanting a soup kitchen or something. Soon a soup cave? I'll be. <laughs> End of the day, this is what I love. Great fight. Great challenge. You and I are very different people. <laughs> Can we say your crazy drug lord days are done, please? Sure. For now. Hell of a run, though. <laughs> Not quite how I'd describe it. Too much to hope you'll be taking it easier now that you're, uh, you know, mortal? <laughs> Not a chance. Threat of death just ups the thrill. Hell of a left hook. Can't wait for the rematch. I can. Hmm. <laughs> I like you. Well, that was dramatic. Wonder how long Tombstone's powers will be negated for. Probably not long enough. Good work for now, though, Pete. Pats on the back all around. Stable teams. Missed a call from Aunt May. Peter, I spoke to Miles' mother, and she loved the idea of him working here. Oh, the poor woman's grieving herself while trying to be strong for her son. She needs some time to just grieve. And he needs to see that life's still worth living. That was a very thoughtful suggestion, Peter. The kind that would have made them proud. Stable teams, this is Control. What's the status in Murray Hill? MJ, what did you find out about Isaac Delaney? Check out the picture I just sent. Which one is Delaney? I don't know. Guess you'll have to go to the party to find out. Good thing I already have a costume. Halloween party. Guess I don't have to change. Delaney's dressed as one of my greatest foes. Let's find out which one. Why you guys gotta be so nasty? I just tried. Everyone's in costume. My people. Excuse me. Are you Dr. Delaney? Oh, Spider-Man, my nemesis. You won't catch me this time. <coughs> oh no, smoke. Whatever will I do? This is the end, Spider-Man. Now I have you. Hey, what's wrong with you? I worked on that helmet for a week. I need to find Dr. Delaney. He's out in the party somewhere. Who are you? I'm your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. <laughs> Smart ass.
guy throwing down candy could be Dr. Delaney. Gotta find a way up there. I'm looking for Isaac Delaney. I think he's on the dance floor. There he is. The lizard in the lab coat. Hey look, it's Spider Boy! Isn't some one of your nemesis? We gotta uh, fight. Maybe later. Oh, what's the matter, Spider Wimp? You afraid of my mighty horn? Hey, hey, hey who? What, what are you? Come on! Hey, uh, wait! Uh, kick fight. his ass, Spider-Man! What the hell? Oh! what you want this is a joke right those aren't real guns back now let him go yeah keep your head down Everybody okay? Yeah. Good. Uh, happy Halloween. <laughs> Who are you? You recently began working with someone in an Oscorp lab. How do, you, how do you know that? We don't have much time, Isaac. Tell me his name. Show's over, Lee. Apparently the show's not over. His name, Dr. Morgan Michaels. Thank you. That's all of them. Gotta find Lee.
Yuri, I need your help. I've got reports of shots fired at ESU. Yeah, that's me. I'll explain later. But right now, you need to find a Dr. Morgan Michaels. Martin Lee's coming after him. Copy that. Spider-Man, who is this Dr. Michaels? I think he's the head scientist on this Devil's Breath project. Did you find him? Yes and no. Sable says they have him under protection at a safe house somewhere in the city. But they won't tell me where. I thought you guys were working together. So did I. Okay, I have an idea on how to find him. I'll let you know if it works. Pursuit in progress. Back up. Hey, did you find Dr. Delaney at the party? Yeah, but so did Lee. Oh no, what happened? Lee corrupted him and made him kill himself. That's horrible. We have to stop this guy. We will. Before Delaney died, he gave Lee a name. Morgan Michaels. Morgan Michaels? Who is he? Not sure. But I bet he works on the Devil's Breath project. Have you learned anything from that Devil's Breath file? Yeah, get this. A few years ago, Osborne came to Fisk and asked him to build a lab, but to keep it hidden from regulators. Secret lab? For Devil's Breath? If it's as dangerous as we think it is, I can see why. Where's the lab? It's not in the file. Osborne made Fisk destroy all records of it. All I have are invoices from Osborne's personal account to Fisk Construction. Knowing Fisk, he kept the invoices around for blackmail material on the mayor. Everything leads back to Norman Osborne. Guess it's time to pay him a visit. I doubt he's gonna tell you anything. Wasn't planning to ask. Okay, that's how I can get into Norman's office. Can't get in there without shutting down some security systems. But if they see me, they'll put the whole place on lockdown. I should be able to hack into the security network modules from the outside. There are the network cables. Just need to follow them to the security module. There we go, a security module. Looks like there's four of these around the building. That should make things easier. What the hell? Security teams, call in. Sable Team Alpha standing by. Looks like an electrical problem. Copy that. Keep an eye on the exterior while we try to track down the issue. Just when I thought it would be easy. Okay, just two more modules. Attention all Sable Teams. There's a small possibility we have a trespasser on site. We're analyzing data now. Stay vigilant. Copy that, Control. There it is. Damn it. Another subsystem is going offline. I need a team to scan the 85th floor exterior. Copy control. Bird inbound. Gotta move. Hi, MJ. A little busy right now. I'll be quick. Listen, I got a lead on Charles Standish's location. I think if I can get to him, I can make him talk. He knew about Dr. Delaney. He probably knows about Morgan Michaels as well. Okay, just... Don't do anything crazy. Speaking of crazy, gotta find that last module. There's the last one. Nice. Now I can get into Norman's office and hopefully find out more about Morgan Michaels and Devil's Breath. Exterior sweep negative. Should we go on lockdown? Not yet. Mr. Osborne is in the middle of an important call, but keep tracking. There must be someone out there. I'm way ahead of you, Wilson. I had my people go through all your files. If you try to expose our business arrangement, it'll be your word against mine. And I'm not the one behind bars right now. Wait, is Norman talking to Wilson Fisk? Neo statue? What are you talking about? The Neo statue from the auction house. They must be talking about that file MJ found. Jackpot. GR-27. Hmm. Dr. Morgan Michaels is the chief scientist, but the location of the lab is redacted. AI-controlled CRISPR? If that actually works, it could cure any genetic disease. 
Cystic fibrosis? Huntington's? This is crazy. Creepy. Whoa. GR-27 is devil's breath. It's designed to cure diseases, but in its current form, it's like a bioweapon. Dr. Michaels keeps the only sample with him at all times. That's why Lee wants him. We find Michaels, we find Devil's Breath. Hey, Pete. What's up? MJ, get this. Devil's Breath wasn't designed to be a weapon. It's a treatment for genetic disorders. But its current form is wildly imperfect. In trying to fix the body, it rips it apart. We need to locate Dr. Michaels. I don't trust Sable to contain something this deadly. I may have a lead on that. Charles Standish is being held at Sable's Central Park compound. If anyone knows Michael's location, it'll be Oscorp CFO. I'm trying to reach him now. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Sneaking into a Sable compound. That could go bad fast. I should head up to Central Park. Looks like Doc checked in. Peter, I've had an epiphany. It's all about the mind. Take me, for example. A mind of unlimited potential, shackled to a tired, old body. Think of what that mind could achieve if it were freed. In developing our neural interface, we need to think beyond replicating the tired putterings of our physical forms. Instead, reach into imagination and possibility. Reach into the mind. I've never heard Doc this excited by a project. Hope he's not too excited. Where are you, MJ? Crap. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Stand is just somewhere in there. Gotta get past that guard. Time to see if these lures Pete gave me work. That gap in the fence looks promising. Just need to distract the guard. What's that? Demons are killing anyone related to Devil's Breath. Standish is in real danger. Got it. Time to move. Standish. I knew it. I've got to get to that tent. <laughs> Standish is secure, ma'am. Lockout comms as well. I do not want leaks to press about Michael's or Devil's Breath. On it. She's nervous. Standish must know something about Dr. Michaels. Looks important. Safe houses. If Dr. Michaels is in one of these, Standish might know which one. There's Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries Devil's Breath around with him. Osborne doesn't trust anyone else to secure it. I hope his ego doesn't bite him in the ass. Or us. <sighs> Close. Come on, come on. Charles Standish? Holy crap! Charles, where is Dr. Morgan Michaels? Lee sent you. Didn't he? No. <laughs> he wants to kill me? You tell him to do it. 
Do it himself. I'm not with the demons. I'm not with Sable. I'm a reporter. And I want to see Lee stopped. Just like you. Watson. I've heard your byline. Sable won't listen to me. She has Michaels in the Bowery. They're moving him to a new safe house tomorrow at noon. But she's totally ignoring Grand Central. Grand Central? The demons were talking about it when they held me. They're going there to get... To get what, Charles? What do the demons need to get at Grand Central? <laughs> what the... Charles! Oh! What the hell? not a Sable guy. Definitely not a Sable guy. Sorry, Charlie. Okay, time to Wait, go. No, he knows something. <laughs> Was maybe the most awkward swing of my life. MJ is not happy. Well, that was maybe the most awkward swing of my life. MJ is not happy. Hey, okay, another thing. Sorry, Charlie. <laughs> you knock a man out, destroy my background research, and the best you got is sorry, Charlie? Is everything a joke to you? What? MJ, no, I, I screwed up. It, it was a tension breaker. Tension breaker, right. <sighs> you know this is exactly why we broke up. I thought we broke up so you could focus on your career. We broke up because you wouldn't stop treating me like a baby. Don't do this, MJ. Don't do that, MJ. Oh, that's too dangerous, MJ. I may not have super spider powers, but I'm not made out of glass. You snuck into the middle of an armed military. You know what? Can we not do this right now, please? Did you learn anything about Dr. Michaels? <sighs> Fine. <sighs> Michaels is in the Bowery somewhere. Sable's moving him tomorrow at noon. Awesome. Anything else? Was he saying something about Grand Central before I jumped in? He was... No. It was nothing. Listen, I gotta go, Peter. Filing deadline. Peter. That's how you know she's still mad. Peter. Nice work, Mr. Superhero. Man, I'm worked up. Gotta blow off some steam on patrol. That's Miles' mom. Hello? Mr. Parker? It's Drio Morales. I want to thank you for getting Miles the job at the pizza shop. Glad to. And please, call me Peter. Mr. Parker is probably someone more together than me. I should tell you, he has reservations. I finally gave him a choice. This or more therapy. He needs this. He just hates to feel like a victim or be pitied. Gotcha. I'm the same way. I'll let Aunt May know, and I'll make sure I'm there his first day. Thank you again. This means a lot to both of us. Peter, I'm about to begin another test. Oh, sorry. My bus broke down in uh, there were no cabs. But I'll be there as soon as I can. I'm losing them. Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Try to get it under three milliseconds. I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter.
Call that a mild success. I call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... It can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Ah, uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future... I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Oh, Peter, before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. Man, I remember the first day I interviewed here. Direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Hmm. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours. Thank you again, Peter. Don't know what I'd do without you. Hi, May. Let me guess. Running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so... Good. I'll be there soon. Bye! What are you doing here? just made your last mistake, punk. What the? Does it seriously take this many guys to rob a teenager? Spider-Man. You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, that was really brave. But next time, leave the fighting to the pros. Okay? Uh, okay, but what if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time. But when I do it, I have... Oh, like that time you fought Ryan on the Brooklyn Bridge? That was so awesome. Perfect example. If the other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's, that's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. All right, put him up. Seriously? Yeah, come on. First thing, 
Don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet, and when they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Okay, Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jock, okay? I can <laughs> Oh, sh S Sorry. No, 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 it's all good. You keep that up and uh, you'll be fine. All right, lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey, uh, thanks. You know, anytime. I just punch Spider-Man. Shelter should be just ahead. Yo, Miles, what's up? Bro, you're not gonna believe this. I just met Spider-Man. What? That's crazy. Hey, did you show him our hacking app? Oh, man. I totally forgot. Oh, you suck. He totally would've bought it off you, and then we'd be, like, famous. Yeah, I'll show him next time. I, I gotta go. I promised my mom I wouldn't be late. Cool. Later. Shelter guy? Is he the one who did the bomb? Have you seen him? No. But did you like this? Wow, that was too easy. I can't believe Sable systems are unsecured. Maybe I'll send an anonymous tip. Okay, hacking app. Don't fail me now. Almost there. Miles, you don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. No, I gave you a choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. This is mine. Okay. Sorry. Mom. Yeah? Just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. Oh, honey. I love you so much. We'll get through this. I gotta go. I'll call you on my way home. Almost there. Can't take a detour now. Dead demon faces. You know what? Just, just keep breathing. I'll be back soon, Mr. Hunt. Hey, hey, Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no. I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um, what can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place? Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic? It fits. Good one, kid. Piece of junk. <laughs> oh, hell. Damn hunk of junk. Uh, you mind if I take a look? Eh? Huh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these CR when they're... CR what? No, no, you just gotta smack it a couple times. Get it. Go! 
Or could be a loose coax cable. <sighs> all right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, please, go ahead. Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, hey new kid. I'm empty wife, here. Rio and son Miles, as well as brother Aaron. In addition to the hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. Hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's gonna be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, thanks. Uh, listen, Cat, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. Let's see if Ant-Man needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh... Brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. It's nice to see you. Well, grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. Almost noon. Sable should be moving Dr. Michaels. Better get to the Bowery and locate him. I'm afraid our computers are a bit outdated. Oh, that's cool. Peter, be careful out there. Miles told me the Sable patrols are being very strict. Hey, Yuri. I'm heading to the Bowery to make sure Michaels gets to his new safe house. You know, safely. I wouldn't do that. Silver Sable made it clear you are not welcome. Yeah, well, what's she gonna do? Shoot me? Honestly, 50-50 chance. Ah, fine. I'll be in the neighborhood, but not too close. Just in case. We're ready for you, Dr. Michaels. Is that the devil's breath? It's called GR-27, not... <sighs> Just be careful. In the wrong hands, this could... Don't worry, we're the best in the world. <sighs> I feel better already. Code 381, package is on the move. This way, Dr. Michaels. What the hell is that? Yeah, sure you do. Yuri, I'm in pursuit of Martin Lee. I think he's got Dr. Michaels and the Devil's Press. Copy that. More units coming your way. He took Michaels alive, so that's good. Probably so we can force him to make more Devil's Breath. I have to stop that truck. Tank, whatever.
Coming, and he will destroy all sinners! Sorry! Lee, hand it over! honest, I was hoping to bring you here. My abilities lend me a certain persuasiveness. I've been watching you. I was waiting for you at City Hall. You never came. Where were you? Is this real or in my mind? It was a shame so many had to die with no heroes to save them. That officer saved your life, didn't he? He was here because of you. And Norman wanted to use him. A futile gesture, in the end. And where was Norman during all this? Slinking away like a rat. He knew what was going to happen, and he fled. Norman is a hidden cancer on this city. He must be excised, with no trace of his corruption to return. Norman hides behind his mask of lies. I will break it apart, and drag him into the light. Put on the mask. Become one of us. Thanks, but no thanks! One way or the other, you will join me! Uh -oh. All the souls you've lost, the innocent victims you couldn't save. Martin, their blood is on your hands! You can stop Osborne. You have so much strength. I can give you will. Their bodies filled the gutters, and you did nothing! I can't save everyone! What's one life? A simple trade. One life for a city of souls. You defend Osborne while he sits in his ivory tower? This isn't real. Show me your true strength. Kneel before me. I will pull your mask. And expose you! The shadows are sworn to me, and I will give them strength! What? Destroy the mask! Stop! I won't abandon you in the darkness, Martin! You can't! 
can't! You can come back to the light! Okay. Did they take it? Yes. How worried should I be? Very. You're a popular guy. Where is the serum? I'm gone. The Discoya. So-called superhero. You think you save people, but you just make it worse. This is your fault. My fault? He was under your protection. You really need two of those? <laughs> Stop! We need to brief Mr. Osborne now. I'll go with her. Thank you. I'll remember this. Getting much coverage. I should look for more towers to activate. All units, getting Yuri, tell me you've got a lead on Martin Lee's location. We have footage from a guy at a coffee shop. Looks like he hopped into a black sedan after the crash. Black sedan, great. Let me finish. We have a partial plate. And one of my patrol guys just found a matching plate. Black sedan in a parking lot near Canal and Hudson. You're a good cop, Yuri. I'm on my way. Spider-Man. Hello? Is this working? Dr. Michaels? How are you calling? Borrowed one of Sable's radios. Listen, transit hubs are the most likely release points for Devil's Breath. Airports, bus terminals, train stations. It'll spread like wildfire from there. Why the hell is Oscorp developing a bioweapon in the city? Shouldn't this be in an Arctic bunker? Devil's Breath is personal for Norman. It's been his obsession for decades. The project breaks every state and federal regulation on the books, but he doesn't care. If the city finds out, he can kiss re-election goodbye. Well, never mind re-election. He'd be tried in The Hague for war crimes. Why are you telling me all this? Aren't you just as culpable as Norman? Yes. Completely. But Lee's actions have been a wake-up call. We've ignored the project's risk for too long. I trust you, Spider-Man. You're the only one trying to do the right thing. Please, protect the city from our mistakes. Doc left word. Parker, I wanted to thank you. Your work on the neural interface has been invaluable. I wish you could see what that means right now. But it's beginning to dawn on me just how powerful and insidious the forces arrayed against true visionaries are. I promise you, though, it won't be long. Success will come. Whatever it takes. Powerful and insidious forces. I don't like the sound of that. Need to check on Doc when I get a chance. I got it. I got a picture. Damn. Devil's breath is gone. I should call MJ and Warner. This is Mary Jane Watson. Please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. What are you up to now, MJ? Standish said the demons are looking for something at GCT. But what could they possibly need here? Should probably call Peter and let him know what I'm doing. Actually, scratch that. He'd probably just tell me to go home and chain myself to my laptop. I'll just check things out quick and let him know what I find. Try it for yourself and see how Oscorp is making your world better each and every day. Incredible. This Gaia microbe dispersal device releases specially formulated microbes into the atmosphere and in turn 
leaves our oceans and rivers cleaner than when man first walked the earth. Mr. Lee. This will be easier for everyone if you remain calm and do as I say. Police! Over here! No! Office. I would like to speak to Mayor Osborne. Who's calling? The man he is looking for. What do you want? I want you at Grand Central Terminal in 30 minutes. By yourself. Or there'll be more blood on your hands. I'm on my way. Are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Just hurry. Going as fast as I can. What are you doing at GCT? I'll explain later. Listen, Lee's going to release the Devil's Breath. You've got to get out of there. He's not going to do it until Norman Osborne gets here. Wait. This must have been Lee's plan all along. Make Norman responsible by forcing him to release the Devil's Breath himself. Sort of makes sense, in a twisted, psychotic way. Okay, I'm here. Coming into the terminal now. Anything I should be on the lookout for? Why don't they just take our money and leave? Don't panic. This will be over soon. Looks like he's got some drones patrolling. Guess he's prepared for you. Don't worry. I'm in the ventilation system. Can you see a safe exit point? If I get any closer, the drones will spot me. See that tablet I'm looking at? That controls the drones. Think you can snag it? Yes. If you can distract them, and not get shot. I'm ready. Tell me when. Okay. I'm ready. Incoming. Listen, I'm a reporter. I have a direct line to Mayor Osborne. I can help make sure he arrives. On time. How? First, let him go. you out of here. What about the devil's breath? I'll come back for it. No. We're partners, remember? Can we argue later? If we don't help those people, they could die. So could you. I can't let that happen. No. No, I got myself into this. I'm getting myself out. What do you mean you got yourself into this? I don't like this. There's too many of them. The 
And let's start taking him out. Quietly. They're still too close. That did it. Grab him. Now. MJ, did you know Lee would be here? Not exactly. What do you mean? I thought something might happen, but not like this. Why didn't you tell me? I thought we were partners. Hey, partners trust each other, Peter. What do you mean? I trust you? Yeah, when I'm sitting at home behind a laptop. Oh, come on. Can we please get back to saving the city here? Start the timer. Now's your chance. Keep him busy. I'll take care of the devil's breath. You know what you're doing? No. That's never stopped me before. Oh, okay. Looks like the blue is connected to the battery, and yellow to a fan. The red one has a little exclamation mark. Okay, you'll want to detach the wires from the battery first. Trace the wires to the other end and unplug them from there. Okay, unplug the wires from the battery. Disconnect the battery wires. <sighs> what a mess. Pull the first wire. Now the second one. What? The timer just changed to 30 seconds. Ah, it's a collapsing circuit. What comes next? The fan? Yes, then the last wire. Okay, now the red one. Got it. You did it. Wow. Yeah. Now let's get these people out of here. I could use a little spidey help. You ready? Right. I'll clear a path. Try to do it quietly. Will do. Gotta be careful or the hostages will get hurt. for you. Anyway, I can talk trivia all day, but I gotta stop your wingnut of a boss from destroying the city. Time to wrap this up. Lee's escape plan is to use the train. Can't let him get away. Lee's getting away. Finally. Sorry I'm late. It's kind of my thing. Why 
are you doing this? Paying off an old debt. No brakes? No problem. <sighs> that totally worked last time. Yuri, they still doing construction on 42nd and 1st? Streets closed for another month. <gasps> Why? <sighs> Stop. Prison. And please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, hey, it's me. Let me know when you want to talk. Texting isn't talking? No, 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 not that kind of over! there to figure out. Oh, you think? Breath is safe with Sable. How do you feel? How do I feel? How much time do you have? Not much. Heroics for you means paperwork for me. But I just wanted to say, good job. Thanks, Yuri. I kind of needed that. All this time with Lee, I've been ignoring the city. Time to get back to being a friendly neighborhood Spidey. Just in time to celebrate. Celebrate? W wait. W where are the arms? Oh, wow. So cool. But how did you... Intracranial neural network. 
Neurotransmission speeds under one nanosecond. Faster than signals travel inside the brain. Never mind to an external prosthesis. We did it, Peter. No one can take this away from us. Amazing. And your work on the neural web was the key. But we haven't even tested it yet. There's so much we don't know. It works beautifully. Uh, come on, take a look. This is impressive. Hmm, little error, though. Voltage spike. Should be an easy fix. See if that worked. No, this is worse than I thought. Hope that stabilized it. Damn it, the spike is cascading. I don't know if I can fix this. bad doctor doctor I found a potential problem everything has problems if you look hard enough but fortune favors the bull it's time to show the world what we've done Otto the neural web isn't isolating your motor neurons it could be affecting other parts of your brain, your, your inhibitions, your mood. I, I just think we need some more tests. We've got enough tests! For the first time in my life, I don't feel like a failure. I feel like me. Otto, you're not a failure. But this could permanently damage your mind. Please. Right. at it. I'll work out some bugs. Go. Go. You sure you're okay? Yes. Thank you, Peter. For... for everything. is now behind bars. When I make a promise to this city, I keep it. The people of New York will soon make a decision that could change the course of this city forever. So when you're casting your vote, remember what I've done. We're all safer now than we've ever been. Liar! You have no idea what you're in for. I should check on Miles. Hey, Pete. Hi, Miles. I just wanted to see how you're doing with the news about Lee. Look, if you didn't want to work there anymore, May and I would understand. I did want to quit when I heard. Then I remember what my dad used to say. A hero is just a guy who doesn't give up. That's true. Assuming he's doing the right thing. I got you that job. I'd hate for you to keep doing it if you think it's wrong. Oh, the people here... Nothing Martin Lee did is their fault. They need help and I'm helping them. I think Dad would want me to stay. I think he'd be proud. I know he would. And Miles, I'm proud of you too. Anytime you want to talk, just call. Thanks, Pete. You gotta go. May just gave me a list of all the supplies to get. Alright, later. Peter! Y you okay? I'm getting by. 
I don't know how I feel about you running this place all by yourself. And these people need help. If I lose a few hours of sleep, so be it. So have you heard from Mr. Lee since? No. But the Martin I know couldn't have done that. Whatever's become of him, that's not the one I want to remember. So, how are things with MJ? Oh, it's, uh... Well, you know, she's, uh... It's, uh... It's, it's complicated. Honesty. That's what got me and Ben through the rough patches. You guys had rough patches? Oh, sure. Especially when we were your age. So, are you honest with her? Does she know the real you? Hey, turn it up. I want to hear this. A spokesperson for the police has confirmed that this was the truck carrying the device used in the Grand Central Terminal attack. Oh, it never ends. Peter? Captain Watanabe, leave a message. Yuri, where are you? Call me when you get this. I just hope the devil's breath is still there and still secure. If the demons got to that truck, this just went from bad to catastrophic. Folks, you've no doubt heard about the riot at Empire State University. But this is not your usual toxic mix of underage drinking, entitled millennials, and hormones run rampant. Authorities are keeping a tight lid on the situation, but my sources tell me the demons drug the students, turning them into deadly rage machines. What happened? Even bigger problem. Rikers? We have to hurry. Hop on. What happened? It was a coordinated attack. Must have been planned from the outside. Every cell block is breached. We're minutes away from every prisoner and Rikers walking right up Fifth Avenue. What about the raft? Should be okay. It's a supermax facility. Better security and a separate power grid. Good. What about the Devil's Breath? Sable's handling it. Do you trust them? Do I have a choice? in your escape plan. Someone's trapped behind that door. Just 
Sure. It was. Let's go. Maybe it's not as bad as it looks. I love the optimism. But in my experience, when it looks bad, it's usually worse. Look out! Yuri! Ah! I'm flipping! Gotcha! Hold on! <laughs> You okay? Yeah. Welcome to the park! Just in time for the fight! Looks like we made parole, boys! Electro? Why is he letting everyone out? I'll head for the main control center and see how bad the situation is. Got it. I'll go join the party. Everyone just quietly go back into your cell and lock the door behind you, okay? Please? I'm gonna cut you, spider! Hey, what's your status? Me? 
Just trapped in a prison with every criminal I've put away in the last week. <laughs> this is too good to be true. Scorpion, can you hold on a minute? I was in the middle of a phone call and it was business. <laughs> and now Scorpion are all on the loose. What's going on in the rest of the prison? Camera system's almost up. I'll give you a sit rep soon. Okay, I'll keep tracking Electro. I thought this was a chase! Gotta stop this guy. How do you like my new suit? Dashing. Where'd you get it? It's an exclusive club. if you don't want to. We definitely want to.
Each of you has a job to do. Your debts will be repaid when we're done. Go! It's over, Norman. Time to give them the truth. Okay. Yeah, fine. Can you uh, can you pass us out for me? Sure. But they are working around the clock on a cure for this deadly disease. The citywide quarantine is being heavily enforced by Sable International, who maintain tight security over all transit points. Throughout the city, police and Sable agents continue to battle with Rikers and Raft escapees. Meanwhile, Mayor Osborne has gone on record blaming Spider-Man for the prison break and citywide sickness and branding him a fugitive. But he has yet to provide evidence. And many believe the mayor is just deflecting blame, since an exclusive report by the Bugle revealed that this disease originated in a secret, unregulated Oscorp laboratory here in Manhattan. Mayor Osborne insists that Oscorp Turn is on NDC on an anti-serum, but has not provided any further evidence to support this claim. Get back to work. The doctor said you still have 14 broken bones. Which means I have 192 non-broken ones. Thanks for taking care of me, by the way. The hard part was keeping you hidden from Sables. They've branded you a priority target, you know. I humbly accept the honor. What is happening to our city, Yuri? I don't know. Feels like the end of the world. Maybe it is. I'm here to help. Good. There's gangs of escaped prisoners banding together and taking over entire city blocks. Looting, strong-arming local residents, you name it. I'll take care of them. What else you got? The mayor told Silver Sable to do whatever it takes to find Lee and Octavius. So she's just rounding people up indiscriminately, holding them captive in bases around the city. I've even heard rumors of enhanced interrogation tactics. You mean torture? <sighs> Don't worry, I'm on it. This is our city, Yuri. It's time we take it back. Great. My men are tracking the supervillains. I'll update you when we make progress. For now, do your best to stabilize the city. Yeah, I've been trying to reach you all day. Are you okay? The prison break turned the city upside down overnight. I'm fine, man. I'm staying safe. I'm more worried about you. Oh, no. Don't you do that. Feast is the safest place in the city right now. Our sister locations uptown, not so much, but we're safe and secure down here. 
Let's hope it stays that way. I'll stop by when I can, May. Love you. You too. Spider-Man, the Raft MVPs are back on the grid, laying siege to our police precincts. My men need your help, now. Get to a vantage point in Midtown and I'll explain. On my way. Is it Octavius? No, two of his flunkies, still searching for the doctor. I have to be honest, that one scares me. Might be the smartest supervillain I've ever encountered. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about. Hold tight, Captain. Okay, Captain, got eyes on. Fill me in. Rhino's assaulting the Upper West Precinct. Electro's at the Upper East. We need you to turn the tide. Head to either. They're both equally screwed. All units. Officers needed to neutralize the riot. Officers in Murray Hill, stand by for further instruction. Peter, are you available? We need help at Fee's sister's side of town. The Veteran Center in Harlem? What's wrong? Men from Rikers are demanding food and supplies. The staff are barricaded inside, but they need help. Miles and I are headed there to evacuate the staff. Don't do anything until I get there, May. I'll meet you in Harlem. May sounds exhausted. I really hope she isn't sick. We need to help Yuri, then get to Harlem. Yuri, I'm nearing the Upper East Precinct. Good. Electro and the demons are boxing my men in. The setup is... complicated. You'll understand when you get there. Yuri Watanabe, master of suspense. Question. Officers are under fire. Yeah! This isn't good. Transformers are charging the building, trapping the police inside. Yuri, complicated was an understatement. I'm gonna have to disable these Transformers to free your men. Even if you manage that, they'll still need your help with the demons. That's why I'm here, ready to serve all your electricity and demon-related needs. Four more of these. Three to go. Man, I did not miss dealing with Electro's elaborate supervillain antics while he was in the raft. Trapping the police with a network of energy transformers? Who does that? are free, but demons aren't backing down. Need to lend a hand. <laughs> Yuri, your men are safe. What's next? Get to the Upper West Side. We're trying to shelter civilians, but Rhino isn't making it easy. He never does. On my way. Miles left a voicemail. Pete! Hey, Pete! Hey, May wanted me to call you. Things in the Veteran Center are not good. Convicts are trying to break down the doors. Mary Jane's here, but we're getting people out to the basement. We need more help. I hope you can get here soon. I need to finish with the precincts fast and get to Harlem. Rhino's on the move, but former guests of Rikers are laying into your police barricade. I'm gonna even the odds. Do it. 
If those barricades fall, the people inside are done for. that happen. I'm on it. One roof clear. idea to give these guys jetpacks. Guys, we're on the same team. At least wait to attack me till after we take out the convicts. All lawbreakers will be pacified. Pacified? Anyone else feeling very 1984 right now? Oh, just me? Come on, anybody? KPs are down. We need to deal with Sable's flying monkeys now. Yuri, precinct is secure. And I just found out what it means to be Sable's priority target. Not fun. That'll teach you to piss off international mercenaries. Guess so. Okay, I need to sign off for a bit. Call me if things go south. Will do. And thanks. You've given us a fighting chance. Okay. I need to hustle to feast sister site in Harlem and help May. Peter! Thank God! We need you at the Veteran Center. Where are you? I got held up. Are you okay? What's happening? The convict started a fire. We got the building stack out, but May and Miles are trapped inside. I'm trying to find a way into them, but the fire is spreading so fast. Stay where you are, MJ. I'll handle this. Damn it. Move it, Pete. Move! Peter, fire and rescue's on the way. I found a fire escape that'll get me- MJ, stay back. I don't want to have to rescue you too. Peter, don't be crazy. Wait for help. May! May! I got you. Hang on! Oh. Hey, man, you all right? Get to the window! <coughs> it's too far. Uh, hold on! Just brace yourselves! <coughs> Come on, you stupid piece of... Come on, May! I've got you! Oh my god! Go! Go! Miles! Come on! We've got 
you. We've got you. Is May okay? Everyone is safe. MJ, if it weren't for you and Miles, I would have been... As dead as I would have been the last eight and a half thousand times you saved me. Pretty sure I still owe you a few. <laughs> That's smart. <coughs> hey. I'm sorry I screwed things up. It's just... Hard being the one who always gets saved, you know? Sometimes I want to do the saving. I'm sorry I made you feel like you couldn't. Still partners? Always. Oh. Hey, uh, so I didn't know if uh, you wanted sparkling or, or flat or spring or mountain spring. So I got one of each. Am I interrupting? No. Um, MJ, Ms. Watson, and I were just talking strategy. Strategy? That's right. The city is in danger. It needs our help. All of our help. All right, well, call the play, coach. Okay. Divide and conquer. Ms. Watson, we need an anti-serum for Devil's Breath. Oscorp's developing something, but there's no way they can keep it safe from Octavius and Lee. We need to find the cure and protect it. I'll chase down some leads. Miles, you need to be my eyes and ears at feast. Anything goes wrong, call me. We need to keep that place and the people there safe. All right, you got it. What are you gonna do? Gang of costume nut jobs is taking the city apart piece by piece. Time I return the favor. Hey, wait, um, how do I call you? I mean, do you, do you have like a cell phone in your, in your po pockets or something? Ms. Watson can give you my number. Good luck, team. Do you have his number? Are you Spider-Man's girlfriend? That'd be so cool. If... <sighs> Come on, Sherlock. Show me what you got in this water smorgasbord. The city feels a little more under control. Miles is watching Feast, MJ is tracking a Devil's Breath cure. Time for me to focus on finding Otto, stopping whatever he has planned. Yuri, we need to start tracking the big boys. Still no leads on Octavius? No, nothing. Forensics can't even do a sweep of Times Square. Everyone in that department but the intern is sick. I might be able to turn something up, let you know what I find. You know what I like about you, kid? You're always getting better. Gee, thanks, creepy stalker guy. You can call me Taskmaster. Because you keep leaving me tasks? That's kind of on the nose. There's a group of mercenaries committing crimes across the city. These mercenaries wouldn't happen to be your mercenaries, would they? No. All I know is they're getting paid well for their work. Unless you stop them, that is. What's in it for you? I get to watch and learn. Now reports are coming in that Martin Lee, along with exhibiting freakish abilities like those of you-know-who, has lately seemed to display almost a split personality. <laughs> this is hogwash and a clear attempt to evade justice for his crimes. Only a fool would believe that he's Mr. Positive one moment, helping the poor with a smile, then suddenly he's Mr. Negative, blowing up... Wait a minute! Mr. Negative. That's gold, Jared. Gold. Trademark it. Stat. <laughs> as I was saying, folks, Morton Lee's evil side, or as everyone is now calling him, Mr. Negative, has been revealed as the... Spider-Man. Here to lend a hand? Thought you might need one, officer. You don't know the half of it. Never seen anything like this devil's breath stuff. Forensics is having a hell of a time. News reports say this is where Otto released Devil's Breath. 
Might have left some residue I can track. Hmm. Some residue on this sign. Maybe I can isolate it. AT rich leader sequence. This looks promising. Oscorp's modified CPF-1. Definitely Devil's Breath. Should be able to track the dispersal path now. The trail goes in a few directions. Need to find the right one. Not this way. Should try another vapor trail. The trail leads down into those vents. What was Otto doing up here? Should be a door or an access hatch around here. Well, this is moody. Good old Rhino. My second favorite Russian. Otto developed a corrosive to free Rhino from his suit. A certain government agency spent years trying and failing to do that. Only took Otto a few days. Old man Vulture. Enough tangled power source for Vulture's wings gave him spinal cancer. And Otto's developing an experimental treatment to save him. Looks like Otto recorded messages for his crew. Adrian, what bitter irony that your miraculous wings should have brought such horrors on your body. Thankfully, you are now working for me. When our work is settled, the treatment I've developed will cure you. You won't shuffle off this mortal coil just yet, my friend. Electro. Total live wire, that one. Max. When you first conveyed your dream to me, I thought you insane. Pure energy. <laughs> but as I dove deeper into the problem, I discovered a way to give us both what we desire. I promise you, when we are done, you will be pure energy. Or so close to it as to make the difference irrelevant. Electro's big pipe dream is to become pure energy. Doc actually managed to modify his harness to get a little closer to that goal. What's this now? Otto must have used this map to plan, but it's blank. Unless there's something here I'm missing. UV bulb. Huh, nothing happened. Must be a way to get that lamp on. Huh. Hidden markings. Otto's tasked the villains to destroy Oscorp holdings throughout the city. He's trying to take apart Norman's empire piece by piece. Mac Gargan, aka Scorpion, aka Crazy Pants McCrazy. It's rare for me to admit this, Mr. Gargan. Clearing your debts was more difficult than I anticipated. You are in arrears to some demanding individuals. But once the reservoir job is finished, your financial obligations will be finished as well. Otto Octavius is nothing if not persuasive. Scorpion's helping Otto in exchange for a clean slate. Criminal record expunged? Gambling debts erased?
Alexei, I've followed your career with great interest. The world sees you as a witless dullard. I see a warrior with a poet's heart. I know you desire freedom from the battle suit you're sealed inside. Help me achieve my goals, and freedom shall be yours. Otto's rage is driving him. The neural interface is exacerbating it, but his hate is genuine. He'll destroy the whole city to hurt Norman. Norman. I feel like I can't turn around without seeing his face. He smiles for the cameras, collects his accolades, and keeps his boot heel pressed against my neck. Why can't anyone else see how selfish he is? How reckless? How... evil? If only they could be made to see the Norman I know. The man behind the mask. Looks like Otto's been studying Sable's tech for weaknesses. Martin Lee. Can't believe this is the same man I knew at Feast. Oh, Martin. When I first realized it was you targeting Osborne these past weeks, I was shocked and saddened. But then, as the situation evolved before my eyes, I felt... inspired. You took the bold steps I had always dreamed of, Martin, and you took them without hesitation. I am honored now to join you on this path towards true justice. Seems like Otto and Lee have more of a history than I thought. How long have they known each other? Oscorp has snaked itself throughout the city. Power, communication, public safety. Norman made his company essential, but also fragile. If a disaster were to occur, and a few small pressure points were tweaked, it would all fall apart. The public would see Norman for what he is, a leech on their lives. Yes, just a few simple steps, and he would be ruined forever. How many men would I need? Well, let's see. First, some kind of disaster. A hurricane, an earthquake, or a plague. Next, assaults on Oscorp's power grid and emergency relief send the city into chaos. Let the people see the truth about Norman. Yes, just a handful of men. No more than a half dozen. A sinister six. Martin has been arrested. Norman looks pleased, believes he's safe. He has no idea. He's just put all the rotten eggs a man might need into a single basket. With Martin in raft, Alongside Scorpion, Rhino, Vulture, and Electro. A single swift kick is all it would take to send those eggs tumbling down the hill. Straight at Oscorp. And Norman. Yes. Just one small kick. I think it's time for me to lace up my boots and climb the hill. This is my final recording. Peter, if you're listening to this, please know that I did what I thought was just. It may have been extreme, but when it comes to Norman, half measures will never do. Of all that I risk by taking this next step, the loss of our friendship will pain me the most. 
I hope that if we meet again, it will not be on opposite sides. Scorpion must be trying to poison the city's reservoir. Another Oscorp-owned property. Rhino's targeting Oscorp shoreline properties. Which is he hitting first? And why? Electro's disabling Oscorp power plants. Makes sense. Seems like the last stage of the plan is a direct assault on Oscorp. And most likely, Norman. What's Vulture doing in Times Square? I need to keep my guard up. Lee's going after the Devil's Breath anti-serum. Using something called Icarus? Icarus, this is it. Hello, Spider-Man. We've never been properly introduced. I'm o Otto Octavius. There is no Icarus, is there? No. Martin needs no assistance to secure the anti-serum. Icarus was a ruse to get you into position. Into position? Huh? Need a lift? So refreshing to work for a man like Octavius. Backup plans for his backup plans. MJ, hey! Oh, Pete, are you okay? What's happening? Traffic's rough. Listen, Lee's gunning for the anti-serum. We need to find Oscorp's Devil's Breath Lab before he does. On it right now. Pull up every building permit in the city. If there's a record of the lab, I'll find it. That's great! Okay, uh, uh, talk soon, MJ! Trap failed? Softened him up. Time for plan B. You really grew in prison, didn't you? Not even close, Max. As usual.
again, hate to be the pessimist, but I don't think you guys are assessing this situation accurately. Nothing more than luck! <sighs> Electro's been grounded. Spider-Man, I presume. If you really cared about this city, you'd be helping me expose Osborne for the criminal he is. By killing innocent people? I would have restored the power. You're sick. You need help. I have all the help I need. And we will not stop until Norman gets what he deserves. when they team up. Just need to catch my breath. What time? Oh, man. Need to update Yuri. Yuri, Vulture and Electro are down. Four to go. I saw. Also noticed a rooftop in Times Square exploded. Wouldn't happen to be related, would it? Nothing gets by you. It was Octavius' staging ground. He's using the villains to pull apart Oscorp. Vulture and Electro were targeting power plants. Scorpion's going after water treatment. Not sure about Rhino yet. Something along the shoreline. That's good enough to start. I assume you're going after Scorpion? Yeah. City's already on the brink. If we lose clean water, we might never come back. I'll update you when I make progress. Sounds like a plan. Hey, Pete, you okay? That's what I was gonna ask you. I'm fine, but you and May are in the middle of it. We're busy, but people need help. And I'd rather be doing something than waiting around for somebody else to fix things, you know? Yeah, I heard that. Just make sure you protect yourself. Mask and gloves. And rest every now and then. While that goes double for May. <sighs> Nobody can make that woman take a break when she doesn't want to. But I'll do my best. Thanks, Miles. Give- There's the reservoir. No sign of Scorpion. Better take a closer look. Now, if I was a mercenary dressed like a scorpion, where would I be? Behind you! <laughs> Me, I'd end it now. But Octavius is paying, and he wants to torture you, which I respect. <sighs> Damn it! What did he inject me with? Whoa, what the... Is that a sea of poison? Can't be. This can't be real. Must be the poison. But I can't take any chances. Gotta get to higher ground and analyze whatever he injected me with. Okay, should be safe for a minute. Need to analyze the neurotoxin so I can create an antidote. Scorpions made some upgrades. Hallucinogenic neurotoxin. My brain will create nightmares that my body thinks are real. I have to create the antidote fast. First, I need a natural steroid. Extract from an Eclipta Alba plant should do the trick. ESU's greenhouse is nearby. Hope it's in season. Greenhouse! They clipped the Alba. Should be inside the greenhouse. There it is. Is that real? Or in my mind? It can be both. Duck? It's just the hallucinations intensify. You can get through this. Doc, you sound... Like I did before the neural interface affected my mind? My obsessions were always there, but the interface allowed me to fully embrace them. I have to fix this. Fix you! Somehow! 
Ah, uh, Peter. Always try and shoulder the responsibility, even when there's no hope. I can't tell you how many times your unfettered optimism has kept me going when things look good. I'll miss being with you. I really will. I'm sorry, Nelly. I'm so sorry. Yes, yes, you're sorry. And yet, you let it happen. There's the Eclodob. The plan will buy me time. But I need an antitoxin to mix a permanent antidote. One of Harry's research stations was developing a synthetic atropine. Gotta get there fast. Giant deadly scorpion tails. Lovely. Thanks, brain. How you feeling, spider? Raw panic crawling up your spine. Scorpion? How'd you get this number? Always asking you these interesting questions. Have fun chasing pink elephants. There's the research station. We need that atropine. I have to get into this atropine right now. <laughs> Atropine's gone. It's you. Oh, not again. You're too late. Just as you were too late to help me. This isn't you, Doc. Ah, but it is me. The Me Polite Society found me. The parts of myself I suppressed. Help me break those chains. I'm sorry. I'll find a way to help you. I swear it. Stop deluding yourself. You never help anyone. Stop running from me. Let me try. I want nothing from you. You're a failure at life, love, career. You bring nothing but pain! No, stop! I'm not giving up on you! Please, just talk to me! I can help you! So you can treat me like all the rest? Containing me? Suffocating me? No, I will let my genius shine on its own. I saw you, Peter, taking notes, stealing ideas, a rat in my own lab. To think I called you a friend. I am your friend! There it is. The atropine. It's you. Got the atropine. Now I just need to mix up the antidote. Looks like I'm headed back to the lab. Still with us? I'm nearly cured. Sorry to bust up your plans. Oh, Lamb, don't worry. There are plenty of surprises left for you. We'll be seeing each other again real soon. Count on it. I made it. Somehow. But I'm running out of time. I need to mix the antidote. I think not. You're in my domain now. You're just like us, trying to steal my genius. Everything that happens now is your fault. I knew you were laughing at me, all of you, behind my back. You beg me for. Thought I forgot about you, Scorpion. Are you even real? Hold still, I'll show you. Not gonna be that easy. Sure it is. Now I know you're the poison trying to distract me. Bring it on. One down. Hope that's the last of them. 
I can barely stand up. There's the equipment I need. Finally. I'm running out of time. I can feel it. I think I did it. Where'd my suit go? I think I took decontamination a little too far. I'd better put some clothes on. Much better. Let's just go ahead and forget that ever happened. Ooh, it's still foggy. Need to work the last of this poison out of my system before I tackle the other villains. Good time to go on patrol. MJ, hey, you mind if I toss a kind of thorny ethical question at you? When is it okay to give up on a friend? Oh, wow, Pete. Thinking of Otto? That obvious, huh? Yeah, understandable, though. Man, the high-minded, generous part of me wants to say never. Being a true friend means being there, even when people lose their way. But with what Otto's done, I just don't know, Pete. I guess you have to decide if the Otto Octavius you knew was still in there or not. Maybe if he was ever even in there at all. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, MJ. I gotta process some stuff, I think. Call me anytime, Pete. I'm here for you. Yeah, update for Little Tokyo. Observation post reporting in. All clear. Right over here. Until Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter. It is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up, May? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go! <coughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> I'm okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and Ben. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? No, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. Quiet, quiet. So much for a milk run. How did a bunch of convicts even do this? Looks like an exploding bulldozer went through here. I can't turn back. Beast needs those antibiotics. You hear the sound his head made when the big guy hit him? Like a bug on a... I heard that. Need to distract him. Hacking app should work. We own this town now. Uh, must have imagined it. I might be able to hack that. Better hurry. Trauma kids. Supplies. No antibiotics. Gotta be somewhere. Oh boy. Better Gotta avoid that source. sniper. Exploding bulldozer. Supply loops and schedules. Now! Just as out! Gentlemen, I apologize. My associate is 
inelegant. He doesn't understand the fine art of persuasion. Stop! I did not need to see that. So let me know I have these. Get off me! Just give us the wallet! Give it us, man! Help! Hey, leave him alone! Big mistake, kid. You can't just push people around like that. Or what? Like this? Haha. <laughs> Kids got guts. Hip squared. What the hell's he saying? Not gonna be saying anything in a second. <laughs> oh! Whoa. You want a taste? Nah, I'm good, kid. Taste? 
I need to work on my fight banner. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. You okay? Hey, so, uh, don't freak out, but, um, I gotta fill you in on some stuff. Incredible work, Miles. Stick close to Feast. If the convicts get desperate, they may try to raid the shelter. Way ahead of you. Anything else happens here, I'll let you know. Great. Thanks, Miles. Yuri! Figured out Rhino's deal. He's attacking Oscorp's relief centers. Think I know which one he's hitting next. Reports of a possible earthquake and or demolition derby at the Harlem Center. Sounds like our boy. Headed there now. You holding up okay? Tired. But hanging in there. We'll get through this. Keep the faith. Hey, MJ, what's up? You okay? I'm fine. Coming through Oscorp records. Hey, this is random, but you remember that trip we took to Staten Island with Harry? To find the best pizza in the city? Yeah. Ten hour odyssey for burnt toast with cold American cheese. How could I forget? Something about all these old Oscorp files made that day pop into my head. Harry was so excited about riding the ferry. Just made me think about how much simpler things were back then. No jobs, no super villains. You could throw away a whole day looking for bad pizza just cuz. You now it feels like if we take a nap, the world will fall apart. Yeah, this adult thing is rough. But I guess the work we do means today's kids can have their own Staten Island adventures. In safety. Kind of a circle of life thing. Circle of bad pizza. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That's a good way to look at it. Thanks, Pete. Pick on someone your own size, Rhino. There is no one my size, folk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Rhino, what's with the team up? I thought you were a loner. Beans and eggs, folk. All of my big beans and eggs. <laughs> Okay, Rhino. Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oscorp, oh, love you, but you do know it's rude to cut in, right? What were you gonna do if I didn't show up? Beg him to give up? Yes, Gargan, that is exactly what I would have done. Ah, like an old married couple, you two. How did you not see that coming? But whining. Now's my chance. Do you know what Octavius will do if he finds out you failed? I failed? Yes, you freak show! Might help. 
help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. Pete, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of sables, man. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Excuse me. The lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security sweep. Gotta turn him around. Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Continuing sector sweep. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self diagnosis. The fabulous Osborne boys. Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. Huh. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. No false sounds. Fire doors disengaged. <sighs> Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry <sighs> forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto Pax in Bello, Peace in War. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. You'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. Norman locked up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key?
Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but... Thank you, Dad. You know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. God, Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Harry's room, but it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. This must be the key for Harry's room. What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney, like his mom. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum's ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Got a real mad scientist thing going on. Norman Osborne, GR twenty seven research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR twenty seven is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's Breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure. 
I almost can't believe it. Norman Osborn, GR-27 Research Log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. I have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Spiders. Is Norman trying to reverse engineer Peter's abilities? The labels on these cages. Bioelectrokinesis. Optical camouflage. What the hell is he trying to create? Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. Had no idea they owned so much of New York. Commercial buildings. Wow. So many records facilities. Oscorp's going all in on defense research. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. <sighs> Kinda makes sense, though. Michael's is the lead on Devil's Breath. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Dr. Strom. Isn't he a robotics expert? No movement from Dr. Van Adder. Must be out of the city. Looks like a map of the Upper West Side. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. No, I need to track Michaels. Van Adder is a dead end. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti-serum is, he must have been too. No, Norman's not crazy. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath lab. Bravo, bravo, bravo. And this must be the C team. Good old Alpha team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. Should check the patrol routes against Oscorp buildings. Good old Alpha team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. GR27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27, Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I... We'll be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. They created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! 
Who's there? Oh, no. Have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location and a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. You're amazing. <laughs> it's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. I'm not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You... you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks. Partner. that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world, they can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. Okay, Norman's on his way to get the anti-serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. Oscorp just created an anti-serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh no. That could be Norman's helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This will all be over soon. I promise. demons before I can follow Lee into the lab. Time to KO those snipers.
Spider-Man. Leave now. My men will handle this. Sable? Lee wiped out the agents stationed here. They're not handling anything. You have been warned, superhero. Sable made good on her threat, but these guys aren't looking to team up. Tired of you harassing our agents, Spider-Man. This ends tonight. You guys think I took out your men? You gotta be kidding me! Demons and Sable are down. Time to follow Lee inside. Why are you so heavy? You harass my men, destroy my equipment, and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you right now. Listen, I don't like you, you don't like me. But Lee has your client inside this building right now, and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. We could fight each other. We could fight Lee, but not both. Does this mean we're good? You will help me secure Norman. After that, I make no promises. Works for me. Lee's out of control. You secure Osborne. I will talk to him. Okay, Lee. No more running. This ends tonight. This is insanity. I have to find a way to reach the Martin Lee I know. The man who built Feast. No way to go but down. Stand back, Spider-Man. This is she and Osborne. I know about the accident. I know what happened to your parents. The accident? You sound as clinical as Osborne. My parents died because of me! Because of what Osborne did to me! You're more than your past! Don't let it control you! I tried so hard to make my parents proud! To honor their legacy! But to truly honor them, Osborne must see justice! I won't let you do this, Martin! Lee's pain, his anger, it's fueling his power. Sample. No, no, Martin. I told you I'm sorry. It was an accident. I was trying to help. You don't help people. You use them. 
You, Martin! Don't let revenge win. Fight it! Martin, you can walk away! No! Osborne must suffer! This is the wrong way, Martin.
useless. Look on your face. You can't imagine how satisfying it is. Ready for your final act? worry about him right now he needs a hospital no no hospital feast i need to speak to your head doctor there's no doctors here Who's running this place? Me, mostly. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a while, but I'll do my best. I'll need masks, uh, gloves, right. whatever you have to sterile. Thank you. You can thank me by not dying. Oh, my God. They say she could go at any moment. Where are you going? I need to find Otto. He has the anti-serum. <laughs> Maybe you can't. Maybe Spider-Man needs help from his friend Peter. What? Peter helped build those arms, remember? If anyone can find a weakness, it's him. Go get him, Tiger. Right. No. 
No, that's not it. Maybe it's this one. No. Uh, uh. MJ's right. I built the neural interface. That means I can destroy it. There must be something at the lab I can use. This is Control. Where are we with Union Square? Observation post reporting in. All clear. Spider-Man. Hello. Man, I gotta change this number. I must leave New York. Recent events... Give me pause. Your rescue of Osborne, despite his hatred, is effective. me. I must return home. Reflect on this life I choose. Hey! I think I'm actually gonna miss you and your death troopers. Unfortunately, my agents will stay. Though I question our work, they do not. And Osborne continues to pay. I am sorry. So close to being good news. Indeed. I will miss you and your bizarre witticism, Spider-Man. Until we meet again. What a strange, violent lady. We did the impossible, Doc. But now I have to destroy it. With a little creation of my own. to beg? Not gonna happen! <laughs> the world will know the truth before they mop you off the pavement. Oh! Oh! Tell them what you did! I... never... Oh! Everything you have is built on lies! Lies! Ah! You stole my company, my ideas. Now, the truth. The truth. Okay. The truth is, you were only ever worth a damn when you worked for me. The truth is, you could never accept that I'm better than you. You're a failure, Otto, and you always will be. Otto, you've worked your whole life to help people. Please. You're fighting the wrong man. But I 
done it your way. We don't have much time! Please! I'll turn over the anti-serum when Osborne paid for his crime! You've already done enough to ruin Osborne! I see you have a new suit! It won't help! I know your weaknesses! I have no weaknesses! Save the city! Then we can do whatever you want! I already know what I want! Now get up! Give me a Enough of this! I won't let you win. This means too much to me. Not more than it means to me.
hate that you're making me do this! We were going to change the world! You look tired, Parker. Not tired. Just hurt. If you want to change the world, you have to be the kind of man who can make the hardest decisions. <gasps> I couldn't agree more! I saw you as a son. I should have known you'd turn on me. Just like all the others. Turn. Turn? I've worshipped you. Your mind. Your conscience. Wanting to help others. The way you never gave up. That's because men like us have a duty. A responsibility. To use our talents in the service of others. Even if they don't appreciate it. We have to do what's best for those beneath us. Whether they understand it or not. No, you're wrong! You are everything I wanted to be! You just threw it away! Yes, of course. You're right, Peter. Oh. I see that now. The neural interface affected my mind. But I can fix it. We can fix it together. If you'll help me. Do everything I can. I'll make sure you get the best help. No! If they put me away, they'll take my arms! I'll be trapped in this useless body! Please, Peter. That wasn't me. You said you'd never abandon me. You promised. Remember? And of course, you rest easy, knowing your secret is safe with me. You do what you think is best, Doc. It's all any of us can. Peter? Even when it hurts like hell. Peter, where are you going? Peter? still viable. We'll need the entire sample as a base to produce more doses. How long will that take? A few hours. Maybe a day. What if we use it to cure someone right now? Then there won't be enough to cure the others. I'll give you a few minutes.
You're gonna be okay, ma'am. I've got the cure right here. Take off your mask. I want to see my nephew. You knew? I've known for a while. I never wanted you to worry. I did. And I am so proud of you. And Ben would be too. All the people you've saved. I don't know what to do. Yes, you do. So? Hi, Mary Jane Watson, associate editor. Congrats. <laughs> Thank you. I knew you could do it. <laughs> what about you? Find a job yet? Oh, no, but uh... I'll be right with you, honey. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I was actually considering maybe a career change. Hmm? Yeah, I think I might want to become a chef. <laughs> I'm sorry, no, it's... You're a scientist, a good one. In the last project I worked on, I created a monster octopus that almost destroyed the city, so... Yeah. I mean, you do make a hell of a chicken curry. <laughs> I do. Still working on my dumplings, though. Going camping? Oh, uh, my uh, new place isn't gonna be ready for about a week, so I'm gonna be crashing with Miles for the next few nights. Oh. You know... You can always stay at my place. Only if you want to. No, I, I mean, I mean, I mean, yes. I mean, no, no. I don't. I not want to. But meaning, I, I, I do want to. But only if you do. I never stopped wanting to. Me neither. I'm not an expert or anything, but I think it's in the way that you ask her. Uh, I'm getting too nervous. <laughs> hey, all right, so where do you want this? Uh, right over here is fine. All right. Hey, so Pete? Yeah? I, uh, kind of got to talk to you about something I can't tell my mom about. What's up? 
Well, um, weird things have been going on. Like, physically. Oh. Oh. Uh, well, you know, you're at that age where, where your, your body starts to change. And so you may be noticing some areas, no. for example. Not that. Uh, I think it's, I think it's better that I just, um, I show you. I show no, you. No, 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 no. It's pretty weird, right? Not that weird. So close. But I'll keep trying. I will find a cure. I will. I love you, son. Mary Jane Watson, Associate Editor. Begin research notes. My sources are saying the Magia is mounting a comeback. The old crime families were all but wiped out until Fisk went away and they started filling the void. The old Dons were working harmoniously for years, but now that there's a power vacuum, there's bound to be a power struggle. It's only a matter of time before one of the families makes a move on the others. Better follow up with my sources in the Force. Hopefully we can stop this crime comeback before it even starts. Hey Pete, I'm working on a story you might be interested in. New one. It's about the Magia crime families. The mob? I thought they went out with swing dancing. Both times. They were in decline, but with Fisk and the demons gone, La Cosa Nostra is making a comeback. I love it when you talk dirty. Easy, Tiger. So you know the feds raided the Magia last month? Sure. Well, one of the Dons had this lost masterpiece painting called the Maria, and now they're displaying it over at Manhattan Mocha. And? And I have a source who says one of the families is planning to steal it back. Tonight. Sounds like there's more to it than just art appreciation. I'll swing by the museum. MJ. Looks like your source was right. There's a small army of goons trying to break in. Stay on the line while I take a closer look. Just be careful. If those guys are Magia, they play for keeps. Hurry up. Come on. The boss wants that painting. We should have been in and out by now. You want to try? Be my guest. Sheesh. Some people do anything to avoid paying full price admission. What about the guards? They give us any trouble? The boss says kill on sight. He's not messing around, huh? Damn, what the nap time? I see him! Fight Time for a little demonstration of the fine art of subduing criminals. I know some of these guys. That's Federico Frizzelli and Sal Petrillo. Those guys are part of Hammerhead's crime family, right? Why would he want the Maria? It doesn't seem like his thing. I'm gonna look around. Make sure no one got in a different way. I'll let you know if I find anything. Nope. No one got in through here. Wait, what's this? Hey, what is that? 
MJ, someone cut a hole in a skylight. I'm gonna check it out. So while Hammerhead's guys were trying to break in the front, someone else slipped in through the roof? Looks that way. No sign of anyone. At all. Shouldn't there be guards here at night? Yeah. Maybe check the security booth near the entrance. There should be cameras there, too. They would have seen whoever broke in. The security booth's secure. I need a palm print to get in. Any clue about what happened to the guards will be inside. Is there a way to override the lock? Not without a guard's hand. <laughs> Actually, they're handprint. If you can't find the guards, maybe you can lift prints from the things they touched. Oh, yeah. Good idea. Always happy to lend a hand. What's that? Okay. If I were a handprint, where would I be? A flashlight. I can get a partial. Got a handprint. Well, a part of one. Looks like I'll need more. Weird. It's like the guards just vanished. Now, where can I find some more partial prints? There must be a print on here somewhere. Another one. Cool. Trained guards wouldn't leave their stuff around like this. Unless they didn't leave voluntarily. Hmm. Nope, I don't get it. Wonder if there's a print on here. Okay, I should have enough partials to reconstruct a handprint. I should be able to reconfigure the scanner so it takes my data. If I bypass the optic sensor, I can upload my own data. We're in. Nice. What do you see? They're alive. Looks like they were tranquilized. No signs of a struggle. Definitely not Hammerhead style. So if not Hammerhead, who? Is there a camera feed? Let me check. Someone switched off camera five. Well, that's suspicious. Let me turn it back on and see what they didn't want anyone looking at. It's pointing at one of the paintings in the exhibit. That has to be the Maria. And no one's stolen it yet. I need to see this up close, figure out what's so special about it. The Maria is a brilliant example of modern pastoral impressionism. The saga of its repeated theft and recovery are almost as intriguing as the artwork itself. Looks like a pretty normal painting to me. It is. There's way more valuable stuff in that museum. So why is the Magia so worked up about this painting? Hang on, MJ. Someone's coming. Keep an eye out. Spider-Man could still be here. Damn it. Got a lock behind security glass. Hey, tell Frank we're gonna need to break out the big guns. MJ, Hammerhead's guys called in reinforcements. They haven't spotted me yet. Good. Try to keep it that way.
sleep it off. Cops will be here any minute. The hell with this. Grab what you can and run. Great. Now they're looting the other art. Gotta stop them before they make it out. There's only one way out of here. The way they came in. Next time, try the gift shop. life choices. Yeah, I think I got them all. A lot of art to put back, though. What about the Maria? This could have all been a distraction. My thoughts exactly. I'll head back there. Hopefully the glass was thick enough. Security wall's intact. And bulletproof. Nobody's getting near the Maria anytime soon. Mission accomplished, then? I hope so. Yeah... I'm gonna have to call you right back. Why? What's going on? You look good. <laughs> Been working out? Oh. I mean, you know, a little. So, you swinging solo now? Or back with your ex? That's a lot of questions. I'm just curious. Yeah, I hear that's bad for cats. How about you tell me why you're really here? I was just waiting for the right moment. Look behind you. Rockets! Who brings rockets to a museum? Have you not met Hammerhead? I like your new tricks. And I'm tired of your old ones. Weren't you gonna stop stealing art? Who said I'm here for the art? What are you doing? Think you have lives to save. Not again. Hey! Wait, 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 wait. Hey! Help! She go. Peter, is everything okay? Sorry, MJ. I just uh, ran into an old friend. Who? Trouble. So Black Cat was the one who went in through the roof. She was working with Hammerheads guys. Yeah. She was probably watching me the whole time I was in there. Just tell me you didn't let her get away with the Maria. She didn't. Good. She smashed it and stole a data drive hidden in the frame. What? Uh... Sorry. So what do you think was on that drive? Good question. I'll start asking around. Then I guess I'll start following cat prints. All units, we have reports of an explosion in the vicinity of Times Square and Bryant. Explosion? Better check it out. Looks like another car bomb. Which family set it up this time? Hammerhead again? Probably. Might be more nearby. Better call in the bomb squad. Bombs under things? Time to go small. Okay, keep moving, keep moving along. 
Okay, buddy, let's find the other explosives. Disarmed. Need to find the others. That's all of them. Hammerhead's on a mission. Better keep a lookout for more of these around the city. Hello? Spider-Man? This is Detective Mackey. I got your number from a friend of the force. I bet I know which friend. What can I do you for, Detective? Probably better if we spoke in person. Can you stop by the Greenwich Precinct when you get a chance? I hear you like meeting on rooftops. Sure thing. See you in a few. This will keep me busy while I wait to hear from MJ. That museum heist was crazy. It's not Black Cat's style to work with guys like Hammerhead. Hope MJ can find out the story behind that data drive. As you probably heard, Spider-Man stopped the crime boss Hammerhead's thugs from robbing the Museum of Contemporary... Detective Mackey, I presume? Thanks for coming. I want to talk to you about the Black Cat. I plead the fifth. Not the new cat. The old one. 20 years ago. I worked the case. Black Cat is a copycat? Huh. What happened to the original? He died in prison. But we never found all the paintings he stole. I've got a new lead, but the department doesn't want to waste resources on an old case. Wasting resources is kind of my specialty. Great. Head to this location. I'll fill you in on the way. I appreciate your help. I'm retiring soon, and this case is my biggest loose end. So I went through the files to give it one last shot. The old cat preferred to steal art. But right before he got busted, he hit a smoke detector factory. Smoke detectors? That's random. Not really. He stole the americium 241 inside him. We thought he had a buyer for the radioisotopes. But I was watching a movie the other night and saw something that gave me an idea. What if he tagged the paintings he stole with those isotopes in order to help him find them once he got out? What movie were you watching? Wait, don't tell me. Spoilers. So I was thinking, if we track the isotope, we could find the stolen paintings. I have a scintillation counter in my suit that should do it. I'll call you if I find anything. Thanks, Spider-Man. If I can close the books on this one, I can retire in peace. I think I'm close to one of those stolen paintings. The signal's coming from this power box, but I'm not detecting any electricity. Maybe it's a fake? I wonder if this is how... Huh. An art storage tube. Detective, I found a stolen painting. It was hidden in a fake power box. Yes, I knew it. Leave it there. I'll have someone pick it up. In the meantime, I'll send you some other locations we know Hardy frequented. Sounds good. Wait, did you say Hardy? Yeah, the original cat's name was Walter Hardy. I'll pull his files and have more details next time we talk. Walter Hardy, the original black cat. Felicia Hardy, the black cat that I know. This appears to be a family business. reported an active shootout around Hudson and North Moor. Isn't that area controlled by the Magia? Yeah, whatever Black Cat stole, it might have just triggered a gang war. Well, I'm on my way to check it out. Any other updates on the museum heist? So here's what I got. Nobody knows what was on that drive in the Maria painting. But word is, Hammerhead now has the drive. And the Magia families are freaked out about it. Must have been pretty valuable if it made a notorious art thief ignore art. I wonder why she's working for Hammerhead. She usually flies solo. Who knows? I stopped trying to figure out Felicia a long time ago. Felicia, huh? You guys on a first name basis now? Well, I mean, I guess, maybe? Well, let's just keep each other in the loop, okay? Not being subtle. Time to shut this down before someone gets killed.
grenades all here. Did I get everyone? get time off if I talk? You won't if you don't. Oh, this is the white haired chick. She told us to come down here and make some noise. Sucker bait. And I'm the sucker. Where'd you meet her? This is the bodega on Waverly. Uh. MJ, the whole shootout was a distraction. Black Cat set it up to draw police away from Waverly Street. The other Magia families has a front on Waverly. The Ciceros, I think. Maybe I can still catch her. Felicia takes her time. She's nothing if not methodical. Is she now? Uh, I'll keep you posted. There's the bodega. All right, Felicia, where are you? There's her stakeout gear. What were you looking at, Felicia? Gotcha. Uh. Oh, hey, Spider. Felicia, the Magi are no joke. You shouldn't be playing with them. Oh, but I like to play. Spider-Man! He's working with the cat! Get him! You guys sure do jump to quick conclusions. I'm not working for Hammerhead or any other crime family. I'm just wrong place, wrong time. Well, that was fun. And where's Felicia? I like watching you. Reminds me of old times. What's on that drive? Not entirely sure, to be honest. Then why are you stealing it? If I don't... They'll kill my son. <laughs> Wait! Your son?! Damn it. Felicia has a son? Can't be. I mean, it could be, and I could be... No, 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 no. I'm not gonna think about that right now. MJ, I found the cat, but she got away. Really? How methodical of her. She stole another day to drive. Hmm. So each family has a drive. I wonder what's on them. Did you learn anything else? Uh, well, not much. Okay. Sounds like she's helping Hammerhead make a power play on the other crime families. Which could end badly for everyone. The last thing the city needs is a gang war. I'll let you know if I turn up any info on those drives. I think I'm what close to one fan? of those stolen paintings. Wait a minute. Screwball? Ugh, don't tell me you're out of jail. I sure am! And I brought some of my fans with me. Oh, aren't they just the cutest? <laughs> I'd love for you to swing by, TTYL! Something tells me those guys weren't released for good behavior. Better get over there and check it out. One of the stolen paintings should be around here somewhere. If you followed my career, and of course you 
have. You know, I notched my first big bylines covering the Magia crime family. Time to put Screwball's fans back behind bars where they belong. Hey, didn't I lock you up already? No? Well, first time for everything. One thing hasn't changed. Screwball's getting others to do her dirty work. What were they setting up anyway? Spider-Man! Wasn't that exciting? Perfect way to kick off my brand new show! Starring you! Sorry, my dance card's full. Pretty sure you'll make time for this. Because if you don't, my fans will get angry and people will die. I just love reality shows, don't you? Uh, some people do anything for clicks. Hey, Peter. I might have found Black Cat's next target. Really? How? Because according to police dispatch, there was just a burglary matching her M.O. I'm sending you the location. Hey, if you find her, don't let her play you again. Yeah, I'll be on guard. She's... I don't know. She just seems to bring bad luck wherever she goes. Black Cat brings bad luck. That's a little on the nose, Pete. Felicia, what have you done this time? Cops have blocked off the whole street. If I can pick up the cat's trail, maybe I can catch up to her. Looks like the security guard was hurt. Maybe the EMT can tell me what happened. What happened here? Spider-Man, uh, I heard someone stole a rare book or something. Is the guard gonna be okay? Pretty bad case of photokeratitis. Basically a flash burn of his corneas, but he'll recover. I need to check the alley. If Felicia did this, I've gotta find her. Antique book. Looks like it's volume two of a set. Where's volume one? There's a high-end pawn shop owned by the Macho family around here. Felicia already took two data drives from other families. Did she just take a third? There have to be more clues around here. Magnesium flare. Probably would burn that guard's eyes. If I analyze the residue, I can track her. Got it. There's the trail. Let's see where it leads. It's having a hard time focusing. I can't be a dad. I mean, technically I can be, but... Oh. I need to tell MJ. She'll know what to do. But how am I gonna tell? Looks like a member of the Machio crime family. Should I get ramen after this? Spider-Man, KO Vito! Take him out! And here come some of his brothers. Ever think maybe Vito got KO'd for acting exactly like this? The Ciceros were right! Spider-Man took it for Hammer! Like I told the Cicero guys, I do not work for Hammerhead. And I'm kind of insulted that you would even think that. Tell him that he must Better get back on the trail. Those look like Hammerhead's guys. MJ, sending you a pic of a plate I need you to run. Got it. I'll let you know what I find. Did you get it? Yeah. What the hell? Where's the drive? She says she wanted to deliver it to Hammerhead personally. Didn't I tell you to get the drive? Yeah, but she gave the other ones to him, so I just figured... So I tell you to do something, and you don't do it! Now, you know what happens next. Wait! 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 Oh. Uh.
Hey, don't act so surprised. I said you knew what happened next. I can handle this cloud. Here, fellas, it's probably overdue. MJ, the cat got another data drive. Just one more, and Hammerhead has the drives from all the other Magia families. We gotta figure out what's on those drives. And there's something else. There's this thing. Probably not a big thing, but it could be a thing. A little, maybe big thing. Please say a sentence that doesn't include the word thing. Okay. The reason Felicia's working for Hammerhead is because he took her son. Huh. I didn't know she had a son. Well, certainly sounds like something Hammerhead would do. There's this, uh, other thing. You know that she and I, uh, dated for a while. Yeah, so? Oh. Oh, are you serious? I mean, I don't know for sure, but it's possible. Ew. Ugh. I need to hang up now. Okay then, she'll call back when she's cooled off, right? Hi, Peter. It's Miles. I was wondering, uh, wait, is this a bad time? No, it's fine. What's up? Oh, uh, nothing. I mean, wait, are you doing Spider-Man stuff right now? A little bit, yeah. Really? Like what, specifically? You mean what am I doing right now, at this moment? Yeah. Uh, unless you think that's, like, creepy or weird or something. Yeah, yeah, it, it probably is. I bet I sound like a stalker or something. Miles, it's okay. What did you want to talk about? Nothing. Nothing. I'm sorry. It, it can wait. I'll call you back later. Hey, MJ. First things first, head to this address. It's the last known address of the Costa family safe house. If my source is right, they have the final data drive. MJ, listen. No, you listen. I, I kind of overreacted the last time we talked. Not at all. You reacted exactly how I would have. We weren't together at the time. And it's not like I didn't date other people. Right. Wait, you dated people? Like, plural? The point is, we're adults. And there's a kid in danger. So let's get to saving him. I don't deserve you. I know. Okay, so I think I know what's on those drives. Years ago, the families agreed to a joint accounting database in order to keep the peace. Put all their assets in one place. And require all five data drives to access it. So Hammerhead steals Black Cat's son. And then forces her to steal the drives so he can steal the assets from the other families. Hammerhead's trying to get rich quick and bankrupt the other families in the process. We have to find that last drive before he does. I'm on it. Felicia, we need to talk. Oh, I do miss our little chats. But I've got to run. She shorted out my web shooters with an EMP. Guess I'm doing this the old-fashioned way. Come on, I want to help. Then back off. If Hammerhead's got your son, you can't do this alone. Why not? I've done everything else alone. I'm saying you don't have to. Why won't you trust me? We worked together before. Answered your own question, didn't you? Felicia, why didn't you come to me with this? Because it's not your problem. It's mine, and I'll handle it. Maybe I don't think it's a problem. Wait. 
Unless you mean the gang war, because that's definitely a problem. Stay away. I'm better off on my own. Huh? Finally, web shooters are back online. I can help you stop Hammerhead! How? No killing, no breaking the law? Your way won't get it done. Felicia, about your son. I just need to know. Is he... He's mine, and I'll take care of him. Stubborn little spider. I just want to talk. Still with me? I could go all night if that's what it takes. Now you're getting my attention. I gotta play harder to get. I need to get closer. Last time. Don't look for me. Can we talk like human beings? This feels pretty human to me. I know what's on those drives you're stealing. Look at you, brawn and brains. You can't give Hammerhead the last drive. Once he has what he wants, your son will just be a loose end. Let me help you. What are you thinking? Stall him. Give us some time to find your son. I missed you. Glad we're back together again. Not like that. Shame. Okay. I can probably give us a couple days, Max. So, about your son. Is there a chance I'm- Later. For now, let's find him. When he's safe. We can talk about that. Keep in touch, Spider. Oh, MJ's gonna kill me. Hey, you get her this time? Yeah. She's gonna stall Hammerhead while we all try to find her son. Did she tell you if you're... She didn't say. Of course she didn't. Are you sure she's not just playing you? I know her. She wouldn't be working for someone like Hammerhead unless she had to. Okay. Well, I'm gonna run that plate number you sent me. I'll let you know where it leads. I'm running out of steam. Time for a pick-me-up. Eddie's Pizza. Eddie, it's Spider-Man. Spidey, you sound hungry. You know it. Can I get the usual? Extra pepperoni? I'm on it. You want rooftop delivery? Yes, please. Same rooftop as last time. Give me a few. I'll let you know when it's ready. While I'm waiting on Eddie, let me head out into the city and see what's what. Hi, Miles. Just calling you back. What was it you wanted to ask before? Hey, Peter. Uh, it was just... I mean, it's no big deal or anything. I know you're super busy. I was just wondering if there might be some time we could, you know, start training? Training? Yeah, maybe just the basic stuff, like swinging from a skyscraper. Or... Swinging from a low building. Or a tree. Miles, you're 15. You need to focus on school. That's way more important than... Yeah, but... If I finish all my homework early and you've got some free time one day... I mean, you started when you were 15, right? And I nearly got myself killed at least a hundred different times. I can't let that happen to you. Okay. Yeah, I get it. Talk to you later. Oh, man. What am I gonna do with that kid? You guys need to work on the organized part of organized crime. Thank you, Spidey. All right, Spidey. Your pie's ready. 
Thanks. You're a lifesaver. Nah, that's your job. But if you like it, can you give us a shout out on the social medias? It really helps the business. Will do. Later, Eddie. I don't think I've ever been this hungry. <laughs> I love you. But now, I must destroy you. Hey, I followed up on that license plate. It's registered to a storage company owned by one of Hammerhead's old friends. I'm there now. Uh, give me a few minutes. Um, I'll be there as soon as I can. In the meantime, I'll just take a quick look around. Okay, first things first. Look around, see if the boy is being held here. And if he is, get him out safely. What do I do if the kid looks like Peter? Stop, MJ, just stop. This guy looks like he needs a nap. What's that? Sheets of counterfeit bills. Looks like Hammerhead's got a new hobby. Need a photo before I move on. What the? Yeah. Better investigate. Yeah, All that stuff about him and cracking guys' skulls. It's just hype. Oh, that's a lot of cash. Looks counterfeit. Good shot. No sign of the boy here. Weird as the idea of Pete being a dad is to me, I can't imagine what it's like for him. But I bet he'd be a good one. Perfect. I should get a picture of that guy. Might help build a case if this goes south. I'll see if my contacts on the force can positively ID him. All day with this damn phone! Get back to work! No more slacking off! An unguarded laptop. Golden opportunity. A shipping manifest. This could lead to their distribution center. Ah, oh, hell no. Uh -oh. All right, I'll tell the boy. The Costa family's causing trouble. Acting like they want to go to war. I gotta have a sit down, see what we do about this. We're on high alert. You see anyone, don't take any chances. Take them out. Okay, got all the shipping company data, which will hopefully tell us where they're keeping her son. I'll look through it later. But now, gotta get out of here. Quietly. That. Hey, is it true Hammerhead got shot in the head and lived? Damn right. Spit one of the bullets right back at the guy who shot him. After that, he got the plate put. Ah, what a mess. Who's gonna clean it up? You. Me? How about you? How about no? How about both? You first. No, you first. I think I've outstayed my welcome. Better get out of here, fast. Huh? Okay, everybody, huddle up. We gotta talk about this situation. You think the Costas are gonna be a problem? Any problem they cause, Hammerhead can make one a lot bigger and bloodier. <laughs> Close as I ever want to cut it. Sorry, 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 sorry. What are you doing here? And why do you smell like pizza? Because I just ate pizza? Well, while you were out enjoying lunch, I was gathering evidence and trying to find a missing child. I ate as fast as I could. I've got stuff to follow up on. I'll call you later. Oh. Note to self. No upside downies after double pepperoni. Thanks. Hey, I need your help. I'll send you the location. Felicia? What's going on? I think one of Hardy's old stashes is around here. She expects me to just rush on over? And here I am, rushing on over. 
Yes, I've been thinking it over, and you're totally right. I need to focus on school right now. Glad to hear it. But I still want to stay active, so I tried out for the basketball team. And that's okay, right? Uh, yeah. Just be careful. Keep it believable. Don't do anything too flashy. Like what? Well, no dunking up. So what are we looking at? Got a tip from an old friend. Hammerhead's keeping something extremely valuable in that office above the bar. A lot of guys in there. If they spot me, my son's dead. I'll draw them out. Then you sneak in. My hero. Come on. <laughs> Please. where the vault is no details yet but i've got more books to go through keep looking enough of this crap everyone hit him at once can i have this dance it's about time you've gotten soft in your old age old age hey i might be older but i'm not old can you guys just get off lunch break or something <laughs> First spider. No, no, no. Did you find the location of the vault? No. But we're narrowing it down. And it's definitely where he's keeping my son. Yeah, speaking of him, there's an overdue conversation we... Do you ever miss this? What? Me getting shot at while you steal things? I really tried going straight. Got a job that didn't involve breaking or entering. Even started wearing sweatpants on weekends. I wondered where you went. Must have been hard for you, especially with a child. I need to go deeper if I'm gonna find him. Let me help. If we're supposed to be working together... Some things I do better alone. Some things. I'll call you if I need an extra pair of hands.
Hey, MJ. Did you get any good info from that laptop? I'm still decrypting the data. Should have something soon. Good. In the meantime, we've got another lead. We think Hammerhead's keeping her son in a vault. But we don't know where the vault is. Once I crack these files, maybe we can combine my chocolate with your peanut butter. Do not make a saucy joke out of that. It's hard to resist a setup like that. But I'll hold the sauce. Thanks, MJ. Let me know what you find. Sorry, I'm back. Anyway, if you're gonna play basketball, don't do anything too flashy, okay? Like what? Well, no dunking, obviously. Oh, right. Of course. Miles? It was just once, and the dude was talking trash. It was so perfect, I wish you'd have been there. Miles! I won't do it again. I promise. As long as you agree to start training me. Uh, let me think about it. <sighs> cool, cool. Okay, homework time. Gotta go. Peter, I finally decrypted that laptop. You know that room-sized vault you were talking about? I found a record of it being delivered to a shipyard near Hell's Kitchen. That's gotta be where the boy is. Thanks, MJ. Better call Felicia. At this hour, it's either a booty call or you found something. Hopefully your son. I'm sending you an address. Meet me there. MJ nailed it. This place is isolated. They could keep the kid here for weeks without anyone noticing. This is the place. I know it. If they spot us, it's over. We need to take them all out. Like we used to. Quiet as a cat. Sneaky as a spider. If they spot us, they might kill your son. We have to do this quietly. Better check that out. Here I go. Something's over there. You let me get them all. Why is that? I don't know. I... Ah, I get it. You just like to watch. You are just... you're too much. I know. You're welcome. Lots of places to hide a vault around here. You check the shipping containers while I check in that building over there. Felicia. What? I'm sorry Hammerhead did this to you. Yeah, well... He's about to find out. You mess with the cat, you get the claws. Should check out those shipping containers. Yeah. Uh, just a bunch of boxes. Better keep looking. Pianos. That's random. But no kid. On to the next one. Building supplies. And no kid. He's gotta be in one of these containers. Sable International? What is this stuff? Whoa. Hammerhead's got Sable weapons? I wonder what else he has. Huh. that question. Spider-Man! Shoot him! Hammerhead thugs and sable weapons. It's the perfect mashup I never asked for. Felicia, where are you? Another Sable APC. I wondered where all those went. APCs? Rocket launchers? Miniguns? What did you guys not steal from Sable? Oh, 
Whoa, that was close. Damn. Gotta clear these guys out and find Felicia. Sure, you know how to use those weapons? Okay, looks like you do. They'll be cleaning you off the walls, but I'm not bring them down. And that's it. Gonna be sore tomorrow. Okay, time to find Felicia. She said she was heading into that building. The vault. Felicia. No, no, no. You gotta be kidding me. Tell me you weren't just stringing me along. Sorry, sweetie. But I needed help to pull off a job this big. All you ever wanted was Hammerhead's drive. The entire wealth of the Magia. In the palm of my hand. You gave Hammerhead fake drives? You think he's gonna be mad at me? So... The kidnapping? Your son? That was all just a lie? Lie is such an ugly word. I prefer misdirection. Do the right thing. Take the drives to the police. Hey, I earned these. Besides, Hammerhead's on a mission and nothing is gonna stop him. If anything, I just help slow him down a bit. They cleaned up the whole yard! Check the fault! Time to go. I'll raise a glass to you on the Riviera. Felicia! Boss, we're in. And? Uh, drive's gone. Uh, new plan. There's a tracker on that drive. Find her and kill her. And if she's dumb enough to go to a little penthouse, I've got a crew waiting there to send it sky high. What about the drives? I don't care about the drives. I just want her dead. Got it. We'll find her. If there's a tracker on that drive, Felicia's in trouble. Gotta get to her, fast. Miss me already? Hammerhead knows where you are and he's going to kill you. There's a tracker on his drive. I don't get you, Spider. I just calmed the hell out of you and here you are trying to save me. How can you be so damn nice all the time? It's not about being nice, it's about doing the right thing. You've got so many talents. I wish you'd use them to help someone other than yourself. Yeah, well, you should know by now. That's not how I roll. People can change, Felicia. Love you, Spider. I'll miss you. Wait, your penthouse! He's rigged it to explode! Don't worry. I've still got all nine lives left. Damn it! Hang on, Felicia. I'm coming. Felicia! Wow. And they still haven't found a body? No. Do you think she survived? I don't know. I mean, anything's possible, but... So... How's it feel to not be a dad? <laughs> no. No, I'm serious. Honestly, I, uh... I'm kind of relieved. Yeah, I've got a lot going on, you know. Yeah, <laughs> you do. But I 
think you're going to be an amazing dad someday. At the right time. <laughs> With the right person. Captain Yuri Watanabe, situation report. Felicia Hardy, AKA the Black Cat, is missing, presumed dead. She had partnered with Magia Don Hammerhead to blackmail the other family's leadership. Hardy betrayed Hammerhead. Using appropriated sable weaponry, he retaliated aggressively. Both Hardy and the blackmail material were lost in his attack. Now Hammerhead is out for blood. Blackmail no longer an option. He's gone to the mattresses, hoping to eliminate the other Magia Dons by force. To do this, he's continued to appropriate the heavy arms Sable left when they pulled up stake. We've impounded as much of Sable's equipment as we can, but it may not be enough. It's an all-out gang war, and New York is caught in the middle. But we may have just gotten lucky. The Magia have Hammerhead pinned in the old Harlem Sanitarium. If we can keep his men distracted, a small team may be able to infiltrate the building and take him alive. We've got one shot at this. We have to make it count. Getting bad down there. Ready when you are. Copy that. I'll get him looking the wrong way. You gentlemen ready? Spidey, check it out. Nice. That's not regulation, Lieutenant. Sorry, Captain. Birthday present from the kid. Not every day you run ops with the man, you know? I'll let it slide. This time. Now get back on the ready line. Yes, ma'am. Let's do this. that chapter in the art of war about misdirection no good the Maja civil war hammerhead's men versus all the other families and i'm caught in the middle of course you're digging out so many of us can't believe hammerhead picked a dilapidated sanitarium for his own base no wait i can totally believe it just need to keep these guys focused on me while yuri and her team sneak in and grab hammerhead What did he just do? Every Don should have a name like Hammerhead. Let me think. How about, uh, Moose? That's a majestic animal. Maybe Stingray? Let's stick with the aquatic theme? Look, I'm spitballing here. <laughs> Neither side is really falling short on manpower, huh? Yuri, you good? Target elimination. Confirmed. Moving on. Let's go! Let's move! Yeah, she's good. Where's he at? This one's for the dog! You keep beating each other up. I'm just expediting the process. More Maja thugs, more Hammerhead thugs. More destruction of public property! You're gonna be like a bug on a windshield! Enough with the bug puns already! Huh. Does Sable know you borrowed her shields? You know, I know a guy with a way cooler shield. We're losing too many guys. We're gonna pound your face. That was about as tough as I expected. Better catch up to Yuri. Hey Yuri, we're all good outside. How's your team? 
Oh, bad reception. She must be in the basement or something. Gotta catch up to her. Oh, good. It's nice and creepy. Definitely not haunted. I know Yuri can handle herself, but something isn't right in here. I've gotta catch up to her. Please don't let there be any bathroom ghosts. I can't deal with that today. Probably not every old sanitarium is haunted by the ghosts of the people who were mistreated there, but this one almost definitely is. Hey, Yuri, do you read? Well, it's worth a try. Huh. This looks like Hammerhead's base of operations, but no Hammerhead and no Yuri. They were betting over districts. Over who gets to control what once the rest of the Magia are out. Good luck with that. New Yorkers love being told what to do. The other Magia Dons, very subtle. Yuri! That didn't sound good. Gotta get to her, fast. Where'd they come from? Who cares? Cops everywhere, and the spiders here too. We'll take them out. We'll take them all out. You know what's in the room? I should get this guy out of everyone's way. during the infiltration. That's all of them. Now what did Hammerhead leave a room full of goons here to watch? Tech. But what's the rest of this stuff? And how'd Hammerhead get his fins on all this? That's a lot of live video gear. Pretty sure Screwball would downvote this immediately. That's new. Feels too professional for a Hammerhead production. CCTVs. Yuri's gotta be on one of them. I have to get in there. They repurposed the old security system. Come on, Yuri. Thing is, I'm a gentleman. You'd have knocked. You could have come right in. No. But you had to go and sneak around. <laughs> That's the problem with your new cops. <laughs> No respect. Coward! Of course, used to be. We earned your respect. You hit us, we hit back. Made you know your place. <laughs> Gave you the fear. <laughs> but now... Now you think a stiff breeze will blow us <laughs> over? How about no? Captain, 
I'm sorry. Do it! Now! There it is. There's the fear. Do a cap. Do it! Yuri! Yuri, where are you? Yuri, you sure you're okay? Fine, I just need a chance to catch my breath. Let me run point. I'll track Hammerhead, figure out what he's planning. You need time to heal. That would be... good. I need to call my men's families. Let them know what happened. But don't leave me out of the loop. You learn anything, let me know. Promise. We'll stop this guy, Yuri. No, not stop. We're gonna nail him to the wall. Hammerhead made it personal today. Can't let him continue to run wild. Been hearing rumors his men are posted up at the bar with no name. Good a place as any to start the hunt. Pass with let me the hell in, you idiot! Ha! Good one. I've been working on it. <laughs> The bar with no name. Watering hole for New York's most notorious criminals. Last time I went in there, the fight lasted most of Labor Day weekend. But now I have you, my adorable little friend. Someone in here must know what Hammerhead's planning. Need to eavesdrop on a few conversations, see what I can learn. No guns, no fighting, no powers, huh? That's expecting a lot from the folks who run through here. Yeah, but I don't want to give you my guts. I'm sorry to inform you that those are the rules. Okay, Spideybot, work your EMP magic on that outlet. Sorry, whatever Maja repair guy has to fix this. Okay, but I don't wanna. I understand your concern. Unfortunately, I can't let you into the car. A lot of background noise. I don't. Should run a filter to ID mentions of Maja and Hammerhead. Gotta isolate their vocal waveforms. I pulled out a nice uh, pair of dental pliers. Perfect. Let's see what these upstanding gentlemen have to say. So glad we left the Magia behind. Hammerhead's the future of this city. You don't think it's kinda messed up? What? You know, what he's doing to himself. Project Olympus. It ain't natural. What? And your travel tattoo is natural? <laughs> It's not the same. <laughs> okay. I don't like to make assumptions, but I'm pretty sure there aren't a lot of valedictorians in the room here. That's crazy. All the Magia Dons are holed up in one location? Morons think they're safer that way. Boss will show them. Gonna hit them all at once. In the war, take over the Magia. <laughs> Stupid Dons. If Hammerhead takes out the Dons, he'll control the whole Magia. I have to reach them first. Someone here must know their location. Uh, I don't think he knew as much as we thought he did. Yo, this assault on the Magia Dons. Where's it happening? Got a location? Nah, new guy says he knows, though. Hammerhead told him personal like, he says. What's up with newbies getting intel before us? Gonna bust this kid's chops. I really hope the new guy knows where the Dons are at. Come on, new guy, you can do it. Hey, <laughs> yeah. could you know where the Dons is at? K. 
keep your voice down. It's just, uh, I, I don't know. Come on, new guy. I knew it, friggin' new fish. But, but I do know who does know, uh, Vinny and Gino. Yeah, they're in the back, and they ain't telling nobody. Like that's news. Vinny and Gino know everything. Stop running your mouth, new guy. Vinny and Gino, huh? Need to get in the back, see what they know. The door by the pinball machines must lead to the back. Just need to get it open. Only a fuse might get someone to open that door. Coming through. No shot. Hammerhead's printing money for years. Literally. There. Okay, onward. I need to find Vinny and Gino. Figure out where the Majadons are. Olympus business? I heard. I don't like it. Could be interesting. Could be. It gets you dead. Project Olympus? Why does that keep coming up here? Vinny and Gino, I presume. These guys know Hammerhead's next move. I think there's notes on that table. It's a defensible location, you know. Sure is, from the outside. These Majadans have no idea what Amrad has in store for them. Majadans location surprise. AM radio. Vintage. Yeah, like it's their birth. Should have brought Damn it! That got one of them. Now for the other. So like, the first day of school. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that makes sense. So the Majas hiding all the other Dons in the same spot? Yeah. Good thoughts with the lights. Ah, you kidding me? Now's my chance. Is there an eclectic box in here? An electric box? That's what I said. Dons are hiding in the Auerbach Theater. I need to reach them before Hammerhead does. Nice work, Spiderbot. Now hide and I'll come back for you later. With several bottles of bleach. Hey, MJ, it's Pete. Yeah, I have your number in my phone, Pete. You don't have to tell me it's you. Right, obviously. Listen. I know you're working on that piece about Magia fronts. I found something that might help. Yeah? I have the location of four Hammerhead businesses, and I'm willing to bet real money that they're not legit. You have no money to bet, but I appreciate the sentiment. I'll look into them right away. Why don't you let me do the legwork? I'll pass along what I find. That would be so helpful. I'm on a deadline. Let's talk soon. All units, officers transporting key Hammerhead witness requesting backup. A witness brave enough to stand up against Hammerhead? I better go and keep an eye on him. You didn't need to call for backup. I really did. You don't think we can drive a guy a few blocks? Have you seen what's going on out there? I don't trust anybody. They're moving. I'll stay on their tail in case anyone shows up without an invite. Hammerhead thugs. Always in the wrong place at the wrong time. I gotta keep that witness safe. Witness tampering is against the law. You boys wouldn't want to commit a crime now, would you?
That could have gone badly. I should keep an eye out for more of Hammerhead's guys around the city. That was too close. Let's get the witness to the backup safe house. DA can record his testimony there. Spider-Man, how's the hunt? Good. Got a lead on the Dons. How are you? Tired. Just finished calling my men's families. It was... Hard. Good. But hard. I'll take care of this, Yuri. Don't worry. Okay, on to the Auerbach Theater. It's done sitting time. The Dons must be inside. Looks like they're safe. Break the building with explosives. Overkill much, fellas? Gotta take Hammerhead's men out. One bomb down, one to go. So now they're on the other rooftop. Of course. More explosives. Gotta move fast. One down. Take cover! There's two. The crowd holds its breath. Don't you guys ever get tired of losing? I'm just saying, it must be a morale breaker. We'll be shooting you off the walls when I'm done. And yes, folks, yes, it's a triple play. The crowd goes wild. Okay, the Don should be safe now. I should head inside and check on them just in case. Hope the Dons are okay and ready to find a new hideout. Guys, we really need to rethink your security set up. Right. Because of the digging tank things, obviously. Crap, this did not go well. Yuri, he got away with the Dons. What? Are you serious? The Sable tech he's been stealing? She had more in her arsenal than I thought. You told me you would take care of this. You told me not to worry. I did, yes, and I screwed up. I'm sorry. No more breaks. No more time off. I'm on this now. I'll call you when I've got a plan. Crap. Great work, Pete. Just great. Hey, guys. It's me, obviously. Really don't have time for this today, screwball. There's always time for great content, especially when it stars New York's favorite spider guy in a series of high stakes, life or death challenges. Come on. Join the fun. Don't keep my audience waiting. Hey, Peter, you got a sec? What are you up to? Oh, you know, the usual. Spider in, man in. What's up? I just wanted to thank you again for that first lesson. I mean, I thought we were actually gonna do stuff, but now I'm like so full of knowledge, this whole thing is unreal. When nobody's shooting at you, it is, in fact, fairly rad. So. When's our next lesson? Oh, uh, I don't know, Miles. There's a lot going on. I've been finishing all my homework early, and all my chores are good around the house. And I haven't dunked on a single bowl of basketball 
both points, I swear. No, that's great, Miles. You're doing a great job. I'll, uh, let you know as soon as I'm free, okay? Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Thanks, Peter. I have created a monster. A monster of enthusiasm. Hammerhead continue to arm himself, and those burrowing tanks will tear apart our lockup. I'm spreading the remaining Sable gear throughout the city. Give him multiple targets. Force him to thin his men out. Okay. What do you need from me? Protect the transports. We'll have multiple runs in transit at once. Be ready to back up any that get into trouble. You got it. Once the gear's relocated, we'll focus on Hammerhead. Stay sharp. Lives are on the line. Not liking what I hear in her voice. I gotta make time for Yuri after this. She gives me a lot of grief, but I can't let her down. Let me see if I can pick up the police comms channels. Unimpeded. All units, eyes up for armed hammerhead hostiles along transport routes. Armed hostiles? Not for long. More snipers! Halt and wait for the all clear! I can't let Hammerhead's men get their hands on all those Sable weapons and tech. Uh. Line them up and knock them down. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Route's clear! Let's move! What is it with guys like Hammerhead always wanting to fight? Probably has something to do with not having a binky when he was a baby. Surprisers! Surprisers? Oh yeah, it's a word now! Hammerhead must have a mole in the department feeding him info on the convoy route. Even more... Uh, oh, that's it, I'm going with dig boys. That's what they're called now. Police can keep the Sable Tech safe. All units, situation developing near the mayor's compound. Something's, something's coming out of the ground. We need backup. Repeat, assistance requested. So much for all clear. Time to move. Feels like Hammerhead's gone to war against the police. And Yuri's working herself to the bone. I know she cares about her men. She's got to learn not to shoulder all that responsibility. Says the king of shouldering too much responsibility. Look out! Hey, Spider, she's dead! No, 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 they're running with the Sable Tech. I've got to keep this off Yuri's plate. I'll handle it. I can handle it. Hey, Spider, you just keep following us, okay? Oh, I plan on it. Love it when a plan comes together. You know, Spider? This is your plan? This? I'm losing them! Here's your stuff!
Curbside service. Yuri, good timing. I just... Hammerhead was keeping you away and we fell for it. Get back, now! Yuri! No, no! Prep the first responders. Make sure the ER is clear and knows we're bringing in. Knows... knows what we're bringing in. This was all a setup. Distracting me from Hammerhead's real target. I need to get to Yuri. Why did he hit the police precinct? I thought all the Sable tech was out of there. Yuri sounds okay. Physically, at least. I know she's tough, but everyone has a breaking point. I'm so sorry, Yuri. I should have been here. He knew exactly what he was doing. He went straight for the case as marked Project Olympus. Any idea what that is? No, but he has it now. And we'll get him. I know. Where are you going? To teach a lesson in fear. Whoa, 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 whoa. Deep breath. You can move, or I can arrest you. Yuri, we need to work together. You need to stay the hell out of my way. This could not possibly end well. I can't believe how badly I've screwed this up. The way Yuri looked. I need to find Hammerhead before she does. But how? My leads are dead. Maybe set a keyword check on the police band. Hope for some mention of Hammerhead or the Maja. You still busy? Uh, a little, Miles. Why, what's up? Uh, it's just, you know, I'm really itching to get back out there. Keep training, get working on my Spidey skills. Yeah, I'm so sorry. Things have been so... I know, I know, I know. Uh, you're super busy. So I was thinking... Why don't I just come with you? Come with me? Where? Yeah, you know, like one of your missions, or quests, or patrols, or whatever you call them. Taking down bad guys, stopping evil, you know? That stuff, the, the superhero stuff. I think it's a bit too soon for that, Miles. Though I definitely appreciate the offer. Why? Well, it's not like the movies, you know? You can get seriously hurt. There's some pretty bad dudes on the streets right now. I gotta learn somehow. I know. We'll get together soon, okay? I promise. Okay. Thanks, man. Uh, teens make me feel ancient. Wait. Keyword check has something. Repeat. Reports of gunfire at the Hammerhead establishment. The bar with no name. Available units redirect. Someone hit the bar with no name. Need to hurry. Get there before the police. And see what I can learn. Okay, got here before the police. Let's see what went down in here. This is... brutal. Who did all this? Yuri. I've never seen Yuri lose control like this. Hey, what is that? Spiderbot! Wow. I can't believe you survived all this, little buddy. Is that a phone? Call from Vinny. Uh, hello? Gino, the hell you been? Lady Cop just lit up the warehouse on 3rd. Lady Cop? Yeah, what, what a knobby or whatever. She, she wrecked the joint. I'm dropping my engine at Mercy General, then meeting the main crew to get ready for tonight. Ready for... what's happening tonight again? Bro, you hit your head or something? 
The big show! Boss wants everyone sharp. Get your ass in gear. Meet us at the rally point. Big show. Hammerhead must have something planned with the Dons. I need to find out what. Best bet is tracking this Vinny guy. Hope I can get to Mercy General in time. When Yuri left the precinct, she said she was going to teach a lesson in fear. That's not the part that scares me the most. It was the look on her face. I've seen that look on a lot of criminals, but never a police officer. Mercy General, okay. Running a trace of all cell phone usage in the last five minutes. If my man Vinny's still here, I should be able to track him. I hope. I'm getting some signals, but I need to get closer to match Vinny's ID. Now, just need to isolate the signal. Nope, not Vinny. Come on, be you, Vinny, be you. Not him. Gotta keep searching. Please be Vinny, please be Vinny. Not his ID. Damn. I feel like a spy. The most... Come on, come on! Yes! That's him! Bless you, Vinny! There's Vinny. Better stay close, but not too close. According to Vinny, Hammerhead has a show planned for tonight. And I doubt it's on Broadway or off Broadway or experimental black box off of Ludlow Broadway. Come on, Vinny, give me something. You're my only hope. He's getting into a car. Bad move, Vinny. You know how valuable that parking spot was? Since Hammerhead kidnapped the other Dons, he's been quiet. My guess is it has something to do with them. I just need to find out what it is, and get to Hammerhead before Yuri. This must be where Vinny's meeting the main crew. Should eavesdrop. See if I can get any more details about tonight's big show. When are we heading to the construction site? Later. Boss wants moonlight. He do love his drama. All right. Let me know if you see Gino, yeah? Told him to meet me here. Whatever's happening tonight, it's going down at a construction site. But which one? Hammerhead controls a half dozen. Wait, wait. We going to the east side or the west side tonight? West side, you schmuck. Come on. Right, right, sorry. Inner ear problem, you know. Gets me turned around. Construction site on the west side. Narrows it down, but not enough. Gotta keep listening in. The hell is Gino? He was supposed to handle the concrete. Show starts at 9 p.m. sharp. No time for screw-ups. I'll check in on the mixers. It'll be ready by 9. Promise. Show starts at 9. Good to know. But I still need a location. Bro, it's the site by the A stop on 34th. G train don't even run in Manhattan. What's wrong with you? Give me a break, man. I'm from Jersey. A on 34th. Got it. Jeez. Construction site by 34th. That's Hudson Yards. That's it. Hammerhead's planning something for the Dons tonight at Hudson Yards. I should make sure these guys can't show up for the assist later. I got you covered. Hey, you hey. Uh, nap time. Okay, time for the show. Hope I'm dressed for the occasion. Why can't Hammerhead just be a normal Maja criminal? You know, quietly running a waste management business? Wearing track suits, eating lots of meatballs, running the occasional scam? Why does he have to have such grand ambitions? Uh, maybe it's that plate in his head. Hope I'm still ahead of Yuri on this one. 
If she gets face to face with Hammerhead, she'll probably do something she'll regret. Help! Get us out of here! The Majadons. Look who it is. The bug. Just in time for the broadcast. Broadcast? Good evening, New York. Welcome to tonight's entertainment. The changing of the guard. What is that? Remember when honor and loyalty weren't just words? Is that the when the Magia were feared and respected, tonight, the good old days are coming back! Help! Help! Wish I could join the festivities. Sit tight. I'll be seeing you all real soon. Gotta get that guy off the mixer controls before the Don's drowned. Stopped it. For now. Now to keep them off the controls. Can't let him get back on the mixer. I sure hope I beat Yuri here. Gotta try webbing the mixer itself. Come on, extra strength web formula. Please hold, please hold. Got it. Guess I can add cement proof to my webbing's list of features. Everyone hold tight. We're gonna get you out of there. Tons will be safe with the police. Now for Mr. Tall, Dark, and Flat-Headed. Nice work, Bug. Kinda spoiled my big night, but we'll roll with it. Risks of live TV. You like? Project Olympus in action. Finished it up while you were playing with the Dons. So that's what they're wearing in Paris this season. Hate to say it, but brushed gun metal is not your color. I'm trying to revitalize the mob over here. That takes long-term leadership. Now, I'm long-term. Your parts warranty may be long-term, but you, you're nuts. Nah. I'm just a guy who knows a thing or two about PR. The city don't take the Magia seriously no more. Don't respect us. But after they see me break you in half, all that's gonna change. Time to bring back the glory days. Yeah, 
Turning yourself into a crime against nature? Maybe not such a good idea after all, huh? <laughs> Pal, you weren't listening when I said long term. Old school Maji's got patience. Knows how to wait till just the right moment. <laughs> <laughs> Yuri! What are you- No! Yuri! Don't do this! Captain! Stop! This is bad. Last time we met, you said something about fear. How do you feel now? <laughs> Just dandy. I feel bad for the captain, but I'm glad this monster's dead. Who says he's dead? Mary Jane Watson, Associate Editor. Begin research notes. What started as a museum heist a few days ago has turned into a brutal assault on the city, and the casualties keep piling up. Last night, after almost killing Magia Don Hammerhead, Captain Yuri Watanabe was forced into administrative leave. Sources say she told the chief, this won't stop me. Note, follow up on this later. Feels like this isn't the end of her story. Meanwhile, Hammerhead, who was pronounced dead at the scene, was revived and escaped custody. Police are searching for him, but there are no solid leads. His men are continuing to target Sable, weaponry, and vehicles, including something called Project Olympus. From what we can gather, Project Olympus is an Oscorp and Sable-funded initiative. Bio-enhancement technology meant to transform people into indestructible super-soldiers. Hammerhead is ruthless and insane and now apparently indestructible. <sighs> but first things first, figure out where Hammerhead is hiding. The question is, what are we gonna do when we find him? Hey MJ, I'm following the police to an Oscorp plant. Sounds like Hammerhead's guys are at it again. Got any updates on Yuri? Nothing yet. You miss her, don't you? Yeah, we were a good team. I mean, not like me and you, but, you know. I know. So listen, I've got a source at Oscorp. They're ramping up production of this Project Olympus equipment, which is probably why Hammerhead's men are attacking that plant. The Olympus contract is for Sable International, part of a deal she made with Osborne during the Devil's Breath Crisis. And I just learned it's all supposed to be shipping overseas to Simcaria. Simcaria? Silver Sable's home country. And also the site of an increasingly bloody civil war. Have you heard about this? No, I'm not really caught up on international news. We've been a little busy with our own war here in New York. It's a hell of a story. I'll fill you in when we have more time. Yeah, it'd be nice to talk about something other than Hammerhead for a while. What do you think about taking a vacation when all this is over? Vacation? I'm not sure I know what that word means. <laughs> yeah, I'm with you. But seriously, we both need it. 
I'll start doing some planning. Let me know what happened to that Oscorp plant. We will do. Dance off. I love those. It's my turn. This new armor is cool and all, but I kind of miss seeing your desperate attempts at 70s gangster fashion. You guys get right to the point, don't you? So, are you guys all friends outside of work or just co workers? You know, maybe your whole organization has gotten too big too fast. You might not even know each other. If that's the case, let me introduce you. Vinny, this is Vinny. Vinny, Vinny. Why is nobody laughing? Come on, Spider-Man. Let's play Save the Pigs. That's just rude. <laughs> Jetpack guy does not have. Oh, hello, ambush guys. Where'd your buddy go? No one's talking, huh? Maybe you just can't hear me over the sound of those jetpacks. You know, instead of stealing everything, you guys should try making your own stuff. It's much more emotionally rewarding. Maybe you wouldn't be so angry all the time. a regular dare or a double dog dare Is that yours no but it would be so awesome if it was you okay yeah Long time no see. Who do you work for? <laughs> he works for Hammerhead. Where is this Hammerhead? Whoa, whoa. Can't we, like, go grab a coffee and catch up like normal people? By the way, I love your new hovercrafty thing. Tell me everything you know. I talk a lot better without a gun in my face. You have three seconds. Just put the guns down. One. We really gonna do this? Two, six, nine, eleven, eight, seven, three. <laughs> <laughs> Sable, you seem a little stressed. Can we do some relaxing breaths? In, out, in, out. Tell me where to find Hammerhead. I wish I knew. But if we stop punching each other, maybe we can work together. Together? Never. What did I do wrong here? Wait, have you been listening to Jameson's podcast? He was supposed to be the protector of this city. And yet you have allowed this Hammerhead to steal all of my weapons and supplies. I didn't allow anything. I'm trying to stop him from stealing your stuff. Then you are failing! Badly! Oh, that hurts! But you're not wrong! Who knows? Perhaps you are secretly working with him. Uh, wow! Uh, now I'm insulted! I do not know you! Obviously! And I do not trust you! You will stay out of my way or suffer the consequences! Stay out of your way while you do what? While I find and kill Hammerhead! Good luck with that! He doesn't die so easily! He has not met me! Let's <laughs> go. <laughs> <laughs> 
Damn you! What happened to you? I thought you were a good guy. I am good at what I do. But I am not a guy. Lost in translation, I guess? Ah! And you can thank me by not dying. Hey, MJ. So guess who's back in town? Silver Sable, I know. How did you know that? It's my job to know things. So I imagine she's here to stop Hammerhead from stealing all her shipments. Which is good. Maybe you guys can team up. Yeah, that doesn't feel very likely at this point. Well, listen, I'm gonna keep looking into the Simcaria story. It's... Spider-Man is a failure. You might think this would make me happy, and to some extent, you'd be absolutely right. But today, I am tired. Tired of all the senseless violence continually afflicting our streets, which that mass menace failed to put an end to. He failed to stop Hammerhead and his men, who are now using stolen Sable International weaponry to wreak more havoc than ever. And speaking of Sable, Miss Abuse of Power herself is back in New York, this time aboard some kind of fancy schmancy gunship. Where was that when the city was cowering under the terror inflicted by Martin Lee and Otto Octavius, huh? Collecting dust in a Centurion warehouse? It's a shame that Spider-Man couldn't have done us all a favor and just taken each other out. Hey, MJ. Sorry we got cut short earlier. I had to deal with Screwball. Again. You seem to have a lot of women in your life lately. And all of them challenging. Except for you, of course. Huh. You don't think I'm challenging? Uh, no. Unless you want me to think you're challenging. In which case, you, uh, challenge me. In all the right ways. <laughs> well done. Thank you. Okay, I'll keep looking into Hammerhead's plans, and I'll call you when I find something... challenging. In the meantime, I'll swing around the city and do some spidey stuff. Hey, MJ, what's up? Hammerhead guys are hitting an Oscorp shipping facility near Seaport. Got it. I'm headed there now. Question for you. We know Hammerhead stole most of the Sable weapons already, and a bunch of equipment from police lockup. Now he's stealing Sable tech that's bound for Simcaria. Where is he putting all this stuff? No idea. But if we can find out where, we can cut off his supplies. I'll try to cross-reference his men's activity with the city map. See if I can't nail down a location. Good plan. Hey, so I've been reading up on the situation in Simcaria. There's a ruling dictator attacking his own people. Apparently Silver Sable's been working alone to arm the rebels and fight back, but she's losing. Sounds like she could really use the stuff Hammerhead is stealing from her. Explains why she's so angry. And desperate. Maybe. He's here! Get moving! Hey, don't leave! I just got here! You guys sure seem like you're in a hurry! Probably has nothing to do with all those stolen goods in the back, am I right? I'm sure it's all a big misunderstanding! Police will be here soon to help you return what you accidentally stole. Ah! Now stay here while I go help your friends. Gotta catch up to that other truck. Oh no, you saw me! Fine, you win this round. And your prize Whoa. is a one-way ticket to Rikers. Okay, just two more. Someone. What the hell is that thing? A jet? Okay, it's just get up out of here. No, 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 not the park. She's shooting at us. Yeah, no kidding. Run faster. 
If you guys had stopped earlier, we wouldn't be having this conversation right now. Oh, Sable, what are you doing? You're just escalating things. Let me handle the rest of these guys. No, they cannot escape with okay, this equipment. Okay, back to the chain. Oh, great, more of them. You guys only gotta find another line of work. Although maybe you have good work-life balance. Who am I to judge? There. Now stop stealing stuff, okay? Please? Gosh, she's tearing apart the whole financial district. I can't wait to hear from Jameson after this one. Drones now? Because he's really into modernizing his workforce. Those drones are going after Sable. That should help her, right? Right. Sable, I just want to make it very clear. I'm trying to help you right now. Get off. Sure thing. As soon as I take out the rest of these drones. Hey, Sable, you're all clear now. I'll just assume silence means thank you in Simkari. Okay, now on to that last truck. Hammerhead. If I talk, he'll kill me. So you do what you gotta do. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look, we both want the same thing. If we work together, we'll find him. Trust me. Right. We work together. Like partners. Yeah, partners. So you'll call me? I am 77% sure she's not a robot. have a Sable agent pinned down. Not exactly a fair fight. Let's even the odds a bit. to teach me how you do all that. I wish I could say there was an art to it. Mostly I just try to go where the bullets are. Well, I am in your debt. What were these guys after? These are humanitarian supplies bound for some carrier. You have heard of the civil unrest? I heard it was more of a civil war. Indeed. Well, these men attacked me and stole most of the supplies. Where they took them, I do not know. I'll keep an eye out and let you know if I find any. Nice to meet you, uh... David. David Obademi. <laughs> Spider. Spider-Man. Okay, that sounded way less awkward in my head. Hey, MJ. Peter, head 
to Soho. I have a lead I need you to check out. One of my jailhouse sources just told me that some of Hammerhead's guys are always at a certain pizza shop. Maybe you can trail them, find out where Hammerhead's supplies are. You know, just once I'd like to have a phone call where we talk to each other about our days. Like normal people. Okay. So, honey, how was your day? Well, uh, Sable and I caught some bad guys. Oh, so you are working together. In concept. You two have to find a way to work it out. Hammerhead's too powerful to take on alone. My jailhouse source also said that Hammerhead's using this Project Olympus stuff to, quote, improve himself even further. Further? He was already a walking tank. Exactly my point. If you two don't stop him soon, he might become unstoppable. Ah, uh, too many people around. I'm not gonna be able to get close looking like this. Maybe if I ditch the suit. I'm just your average New Yorker. Hey, I think that's the place that got a three-star review in the Bugle last week. No wonder it's crowded. They're mine or yours? Mine. Yeah, what's up? Okay, tell them we're on our way. Hey, come on. We gotta run an errand for Tony. Now? We're almost to the front of the line. I know, I know. Just come on. We need to run an errand for Tony? Those have to be Hammerhead's men. Better follow him, but not too close. So what do we gotta do for Tony? Get his laptop. Guess he left it in his car. Are you serious? Why can't he get his own damn laptop? Boss probably has him doing something more important. Somebody following us. Be cool, Pete. Be cool. Hmm. Guess not. Well, where is the boss anyway? I don't know. Hmm. Tony probably does, though. He's tight with the boss. Damn freaking Tony. Listen, I'm gonna go talk to Sal. Keep people off the lock for a minute. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, frickin' Tony. Max, I gotta get closer to hear what they're saying. If I can't get next to them, maybe I can get above them. I need to get out of sight. Maybe climbing walls until I'm hidden. No one can see me. Now I can climb up to the rooftop. If I get above those guys, I can hear them. I've gotta get to that alleyway. <laughs> Swear on my mother's grave. Guy thinks he's next in line. Ha! <laughs> next in line to shine my shoes, maybe. Ain't that the truth. Anyways, Tony said he needs his laptop. Guess it's got all kinds of important stuff on it. As laptops do, we put it up in C3. Slot C3, huh? If I can get Tony's laptop, it could lead me to Hammerhead. Thanks. Oh, wait. <laughs> Stimulating conversation, guys, but I've heard enough. Spider-Man, take him out! that laptop. Let's see if I can hack into it. Bada bing. Looks like he's got a Find My Phone app installed. Let's see where you are, Tony. Hey, Pete. Hi, honey. How's your day? on some car, yeah. I'll make it quick then. Your tip was a good one. I'm on my way to one of Hammerhead's top men. If anybody knows where Hammerhead is, it's him. That's great. Then one of his guys mentioned setting a trap for Sable. What do you think that means? I think it means a bunch of old school Magia thugs feel threatened by a confident, powerful woman. Uh, right. Sorry, Pete. I don't mean to blow you off, but I'm on a deadline, so. Yeah, totally. Talk later. No, I don't know when she's coming. You just gotta be ready. There's Tony. I don't think that's enough, guys. Double it up. Then take him out of the bases. Why are you making me do your job for you? All right, then. How about this? 
How about I tell the boss exactly what you just told me? And if this thing goes south, he'll know exactly who to come down on. Yeah, that's what I thought. This ain't a negotiation. Sleep it off. What the hell? I'm gonna get this. Hey, Spider-Man. You see that sable chick? You tell her my boss wants to have a sit down. Yeah, I could. But she doesn't really listen to me. Or anyone. Give me the address. Wait, where, how did, the address! Uh, Colexco building, rooftop. No, wait, it's probably an ambush! Sable, you're headed into a trap! It does not matter. As long as Hammerhead is there. You don't get it. I'm trying to keep you from getting hurt. I can take care of myself. Usually you can, but Hammerhead's been using your Project Olympus stuff. I know. Then you know he's turned himself into some kind of giant Franken monster. And that is why I must stop him. But not like this. Not by going right into a trap. Ah, oh, Sable, what are you doing? Oh, hey, look, a trap. If only we had some kind of advanced warning. Ugh, I can handle this. I'm sort of tempted to sit back and watch, but that would just be petty. They trapped her with their own tech. Looks like the whole thing is powered by those generators. One down. You doing okay in there, Sable? Or is it silver? Or is it something else? Your friends call you. Wait, you don't have any friends, do you? And I bet you're proud of that for some reason. Good work. Thank you.
you're alive. Did you honestly think I was dead? How did you find me? Same way she did. Watch out. That girl has trust issues. How long have you been watching me? Watching us? Long enough to know you're making a mistake. Hammerhead's gotten too powerful. Do you really think I have a choice? Here. Wait, is that... Everything you need to know about that ugly thing. Sorry for what I did to you. But now we're even. One more thing. His head? Not as strong as you think it is. Bye, Felicia. Let's see what's on this thing. If they're keeping Sable in that base, I bet they have those stolen humanitarian supplies in those other bases. I should call David about this. Hello. Hi, David. It's Spider-Man. I think I may have found those humanitarian supplies bound for Simcaria. Great. Can you send me the locations? Well, there's just one wrinkle. They're in heavily fortified bases guarded by bionic madmen with futuristic weapons and impenetrable armor. That is quite a wrinkle. Why don't I scope out their hideouts first and get back to you? Thank you, Spider-Man. I greatly appreciate all your help. Time to check in with MJ. Peter, are you okay? I saw people posting pictures of you and Hammerhead and Sable and... And Black Cat. Normally she brings bad luck, but not this time. I knew she was still alive. What was she doing there? Saving my skin and giving me a lead on Hammerhead's hideouts. Turns out he's been stashing all of the stolen Sable tech underground. What? How? I'm on my way to find out and hopefully rescue Sable if she's still alive. Listen, I've been digging into this Simcaria thing. It's a big story, something I feel like I need to be a part of. My boss agrees. Wait, you're going to Simcaria? When? Tonight. It's a rapidly developing situation. You and Sable can take care of Hammerhead. You don't need me. Just because I don't need you doesn't mean I don't need you. That's sweet. But listen, other countries are ignoring this crisis, including ours. These people are helpless, all alone in the middle of a war zone. It the entrance to his hideout must be somewhere close by. Huh, must be underground. Attention units. Magia are raiding a Sable <laughs> supply con. That's a new smell. Yuck. Hope I find Sable before the fumes overwhelm her. If I can get through this without getting wet, that'd be a win. Hello? This is so cool. Hey! Sibylet! Whoa, look at this place. The amount of work it takes to make this city run is just crazy. I'll never take fresh water for granted again. Okay, let's see where this leads. Looks like some loose bricks up ahead. Nice. Okay, onward. Hammerheads, guys. They've taken over an abandoned subway platform. Gotta take these guys out, then look around for Sable. I should follow the power cables. jacked into the subway's power line somehow. Hope that's not a load-bearing subway car. I don't think there's gonna be any way to do this quietly. Nice. Okay, follow the yellow wire. Better not find any lions, tigers, or bears. Ah! Tunnel's blocked, but I think I can still squeeze through. Body bags? 
Well, this just took a turn. What do you mean, what happened? The guy inside the thing, like the other guys. Who was it? Don't remember his name. Sal's cousin, I think. Was it messy? Nah, he just came out all blue. I think he stopped breathing in there or something. Did you hook up the oxygen line like I said? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I think so. Boss ain't gonna like hearing, I think so. Then forget I said it. And I'll forget you were drinking on... Spider-Man's been here! Project Olympus. These pods require... I told you, I just helped manufacture these things. I didn't design them! Guess we got the wrong guy then. On the bright side, now we got our first test subject. No! No! Don't! Don't turn it on! Please! Just give me a few minutes. I can figure it out. Now that's what I like to hear. I should have a look around, see what I can learn. Sable jetpacks. I'd pay good money to see Hammerhead's guys learning to fly in these things for the first time. Whoa. If Hammerhead gets his hands on this thing, we're in serious trouble. That cop almost killed me. I thought you said I'd be indestructible. I said almost indestructible. After all, you're still human. Then make me less human. I'm... I'm not sure what you mean. I mean what I said. Now get to work. All this stuff belongs to Sable? Yeah, most of it's overseas, though. What are you thinking, boss? I'm thinking about how she took over the whole city in a matter of days. You mean back during that Devil's Breath thing? Yeah, that was crazy. Not so crazy when you got the right equipment. Well, we got those digging things. Not good enough. If we want the best stuff, we're gonna need her. Yeah, okay. How are we gonna do that? Just keep taking her stuff. She'll come to us. So this is where these guys work, huh? The windows, smells like a sewer, a psychotic boss. Basically, your typical office job. Sable, XRT-89, Subterranean Troop Deployment Vehicle. That's the real name? <laughs> I'm sticking with Dig Boy. There. The only way out is through. High voltage wires and sewer water. What could possibly go wrong? If there's one takeaway from this underground lair thing, it's that Hammerhead should have fewer thugs with guns and a lot more safety inspectors. back for me. Why? Because I need you. I work alone. I used to say the same thing. I know what's happening in Simkaria. I know why this means so much to you. You think you know, but you do not know. What can I do to make you trust me? Look, I think I know how we can take down that monster, but I can't do it alone. Damn it! He let her loose! Okay. 
Here's the plan. Oh. Good plan. No lethal force, okay? That was awesome! High five! You said you could defeat Hammerhead. You, uh, know you left me hanging, right? There are medical records in here. Yeah, mostly about that metal plate in his head. Carbon steel. Super strong, pretty sensitive to... Heat! have an idea. I, uh, solemnly swear to, uh, do whatever you tell me to. I will call soon. Ow. But, yeah. Guess I'll do some spidey work while I wait for Sable's call. Hey, what's that? Glad to hear it. What's up? I've been listening to the police radio, and there's stuff happening all over the city, like constantly. Pretty overwhelming, isn't it? How do you do it? I mean, you can't be everywhere at once. Remember what May used to say. You help someone, you help everyone. Yeah, but I never really understood what she meant. Okay. You know that lady that came in to feast the other day with her two kids? The one who just got evicted? Yeah. After she found a job and was about to move into her new place, she told me, as soon as I get my first paycheck, I'm sending as much as I can back to this shelter. So we helped her, and now she wants to help others. Helping is like a force multiplier. Exactly. May was pretty great, wasn't she? The greatest. I'm gonna send you an address as soon as I'm done with all this, so stay ready. And bring those web shooters with you. Finally! I am ready. Meet me at my base. I've been meaning to ask. How exactly do you have a base in the city that I don't know about? Right. Good talk. Why is she always hanging up on me? Maybe she didn't hang up on purpose. Probably just got disconnected. She could be waiting for me to call her back. Or she could be running out of minutes on her cell phone plan. I mean, she's probably doing international roaming. That stuff is expensive. Or maybe she just really needed to polish her pistols. Let's apply Occam's razor. The simplest and most obvious solution is... She hates me. Ugh. Logic takes the fun out of everything. Let's get to work. So where's this base you talked about? Whoa. Your toys are so much cooler than mine. I love this invisible floating fortress thing. But now that all of New York City has seen it, Hammerhead will probably be here soon. I am counting on it. So let us work quickly. I have acquired the Class 5 laser array. We need to calibrate it to prevent it from overheating. 
Lucky for us, I'm working on my masters in calibration. Let's do this. Okay, what's first? Pull the housing array into place. On it. Ah! Whoa, nice laser. Housing locked. Done and done. We are not done. Oh. We must reset the targeting field, aerials. Sure thing. I have no idea what you're talking about. Exit the hangar and navigate to the top of the nearby transmitters. Alrighty. So, we should talk about the strategy with Hammerhead, don't you think? What is there to talk about? Find him. Then focus the laser on the plate in his head. The laser will heat the carbon steel to critical temperature, which will rearrange its molecular structure. And soften it so I can knock him unconscious. I get that part, but how do you know it won't, uh, melt his brain? When the wolf attacks the sheep, he risks getting shot by the shepherd. Okay, well, Shepard, just remember my no-killing rule, okay? Done. How's it look? Systems appear functional. Now we must test the targeting and power levels. Cool. Wait, this doesn't involve shooting me, does it? Not yet. But I do need you to launch those targets. Right. Okay, ready? Ready. Bombs away! Hit it! Oh! Ah! Just a few more. Cool with me. This is fun. This is how modern militaries do skeet shooting. Oh, oh! Can we do one more, please? You are a child. Uh, yeah, well, we're all children on the inside. Ah! Whoa! Ah! Come back. We have one more thing to do. On my way. We must adjust the gyroscopic navigation stabilizer in order to compensate for the weight of the laser. Go to that terminal and wait for me to activate the system. System ready. I'm going in. Okay, that should do it. You two teaming up now? Phew. But it ain't gonna do no good. Uh, Sable? Use a little help here! Can you fix it? I am trying. Okay, that's it! I just wanna thank you for showing me what I've been doing wrong for years! Okay, almost there. Just as soon as I kill you both! Keep trying, keep failing! I'm indestructible!
Do you know what I respect? A guy who knows when to quit. Commencing bombing run. Damn, I missed. Keep them coming. I'll make sure the next one hits. Yes, got it! Time to get personal! Was fun. Hey, you have dinner plans? I know this great pizza place. I must return to Simcaria. Right. You have a war to fight. I do not like to fight. I do what I have to in order to help my people. I know. That's what heroes do. I am no hero. But you have taught me a few things. Oh, yeah? Like what? Like how to disarm my enemies with bad jokes? Actually, they're good jokes, but I understand humor can be subjective. Thank you, Spider-Man. For everything. I don't do hugs. Yeah, right. Of course. Uh, hey, can I get a lift back to the city? I I'd swim, but it'd take forever to get the river smell out of my suit. The web shooters are a little tight. Get used to it. Just try to keep up. <sighs> up until about a year ago, my life was pretty normal. I lived in the greatest place ever. Brooklyn. Represent. Had two cool parents and loved all things science and superheroes. Everything changed, though, when my dad was killed in a city hall bombing. I... I couldn't believe he was gone. But Peter Parker and his Aunt May, they were there for me. And so was Spider-Man, who I later found out was Pete. Crazy, right? Then when the Devil's Breath crisis started, things got intense. It seemed like all of Spidey's villains were on the loose. I managed to do my part to help him out. And after all that, believe it or not, a spider bit me, and I started to change. I didn't want to worry my mom, so I went to Pete. And now, we're officially spider bros. 
He's been training me up, and I'm actually getting pretty good with this whole web swinging thing. I'm still learning to juggle this responsibility with everything else in my life. School, friends, a new home. I moved to Harlem a few weeks back. But I'll tell you, I can't wait to see what the future holds. I got you. Hey, thanks. No problem. Hey, uh, you think you're gonna add that new Spider-Man too? The kid? Yeah, uh, maybe. Original's just my guy, you know? Yeah, I know. Hey, is Tails Bodega around here? Yeah, bright yellow sign down the block. Can't miss it. Thanks. Beautiful work, by the way. Maybe leave a little room for the new guy. Just in case. down in some rocket fuel. How are you drinking? Very, very carefully. Okay, go time. Helix 2 en route with heavy payload. Copy, Helix 2. We've got you on scope. This is a big operation. It's gotta be. Hundreds of felons escaped from the raft last year. Now it's time to move them back in. Police aren't taking any chances. Especially not with our guest of honor. Getting a lot of interference here. One of those guys who helped Doc Doc is in there? I think so. Could be Vulture, could be Scorpion, could be someone bigger. Okay, we got a problem. Hold back, Miles. Let me take. I got this beat. Don't worry. Oh, no! 
Contain it before. Me. Before that happens. Hello, tiny spiders. Christmases, I was locked behind 30 feet of steel. 
I intend to enjoy this one. He's a menace. Yeah, too soft. He's a low energy menace. Too easy. Maybe he's a weak minded. Oh. Hey, Jonah, look at that. Very fast. Menace. A feckless, treacherous, unhinged menace. Jonah. Mijo, ¿dónde está? It's getting late. Hey, Mom. Yeah. Coconut milk. Still trying to find it. It's been kind of uh, an adventure. Are you running? Yeah, uh, sorry. I'm trying to catch a train. Mira, mijo. No seas mentiros. You got the milk and hurry home, please. Sí, ma. Te quiero mucho. Yo también te quiero. Now we're never miles. We gotta stop him. On my way. We gotta bring him down fast. Yeah, yeah. What do we do? Let us raise temperature. Oh, bad, bad, very bad. P, are you okay? No. No, no, no! I'm okay. I've got him. Headed your way. Be ready. Okay. Yeah. Might, uh, need a minute. <clears throat> <clears throat> Hey, in the future, just do the time, man. 
No more breakouts, please! You will not stop me! You destroyed half the city! Don't you care? <laughs> Guys, wow, just <laughs> wow. Simon Krieger, head of R&D at Roxxon Energy. Pleasure to meet you. You too. Uh, sorry, I think our ball landed in your yard. No, actually did us a favor. We uh, just bought the place. Uh, we're planning to tear it down for a build. But uh, looks like you beat us to it. I wanted to thank you, both of you. Taking down Rhino? Solo? <laughs> you are going places, bud. Thanks. But he, he's still dangerous. Nah, we'll hold him for the police. You know, I always think these super troopers are overkill until mm, something like this happens. Oh, duty calls. Hey, uh, really great to meet you both. <laughs> Future's looking bright. Hello. Hey. He's right. Yeah. Let's clear out. Let the police do their job. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Bioelectricity. Wow. Gotta be honest. Little jealous. Hey, look. I got nothing on the OG. Think we should run tests tomorrow? A little voltage analysis? Oh. Man, yeah, sorry. I've been meaning to tell you, I'm not gonna be around for the next few weeks. Is this some kind of pee joke I don't get? No. Uh, MJ's headed overseas for the Bugle and requested me as her photographer. Kind of a working vacation for us. Oh, man. Look, I don't know if I'm ready to fly solo. I screwed up today big time with the helicopter. But then you delivered big time. You saved my bacon, Miles. I got lucky. Hey, I did this gig for eight years without backup, and you better believe I screwed up lots of times. But that is how you learn. What's this? Christmas present. But first, you gotta take the oath. Oh. Um, okay. I promise to do everything in my power to protect this city. I promise. That's it? That oath a real thing. Totally. Definitely didn't just make it up. See you in a few weeks, Spider-Man. New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. Please don't screw this up.
Yo, Genki. Dude, Rhino? What? <laughs> yeah. Where you at? You get into the apartment okay? Yeah, your mom let me in. Unpacked slash dumped my stuff all over your floor. And now I'm in the park, grabbing some air. Oh, perfect. Dip over to the amphitheater. Got something to show you. Dude, is this spider related? Please tell me you got a piece of Rhino's horn or something. Pics I've seen of the fight are straight up nuts. <laughs> definitely spider related. And definitely better than a horn. Oh, loving the suspense. I'm there. I will never get used to you doing that. Hey, look, check it. Christmas present from Spider-Man. Open it. Dude, put it on. I'll cover you. Oh, what? <laughs> never seen a guy change clothes in Central Park? Okay. How's it looking? Whoa. Miles Morales, congratulations and welcome to your very first super suit. This is only half of the present. Well, what's the other half? I'll let you know when I find it. This is the place. Looks like Pete set up a lot of gear. Miles, get ready for your first holographic training challenge. These challenges are spread throughout the city. Each one focuses on a new move or technique. This one focuses on acrobatic improvisation. Get into position to start. Hollow training? Oh, I am so down. First up, air combat. Fighting the enemy on your turns is a great way to gain the advantage. Now follow up with a mid-air attack. And now a personal favorite, the swing kick. This holotech is next gen! With the right parts, but I can make it portable. Uh, and that's the bingo. Uh, blue screen of death. Tons of high tech gear we can sell. Uh, oh crap! Spider, take them out. Then grab the gear. Trying to catch some hands? Yes. Okay. Let's go. Take the spider out and grab the tech gear. It's gonna make tanks selling this stuff off. Just so you know, this is official Spider-Man tech. Y'all are not authorized to resell. System error. error. That's it for the tech thieves. Now to fix a training sim. Critical fault on circuit AF-15. Colonel Panic. Let's try a BIOS reset. Nice. That did it. it. Looks like P made stealth, swinging, and combat challenges. Gotta check these out when I get a chance. Hey, dude. I think you should check out Roxxon Plaza on your way home. I just walked by, and I'm pretty sure someone's breaking in. Uh, yeah. I'll look into it. Hey, so I want to hear more about your new spider power. I think it's some kind of bioelectric discharge. Or supercharged static electricity. Ooh, we gotta name it. What about venom power? You know, because it stings. <laughs> okay, that's not bad. I'm gonna run. Plaza first, then home. Remember, venom power. Trust me, it's gold. Hi there, I'm Simon Krieger, and what you're standing next to 
is a new form reactor. Once activated, this reactor will supply enough energy to power all of Harlem. Now, I'm sure you're thinking, Simon, how is that possible? And the answer is new form. Just one canister of this revolutionary fuel source is enough to supply Harlem with clean, safe energy for the next 500 years. Soon, we'll be opening reactors throughout Manhattan, and then worldwide. Get ready for a planet powered by Nuvor. Roxxon, we're here for you. What was that? Hmm. No sign of anybody. They broke a bunch of stuff. Maybe they were looking for something. Huh. Maybe search for new form. What were they gonna do with it? <laughs> Their tech is unbelievable, but Venom totally wrecked it. Yeah, Genki's right. Venom's a good name. Hey, you at the plaza? You were right. It's a break in. Sounds like they're after new form. Is the stuff in the reactor? It's not installed yet. They're talking about shipments. Weird. Super weird. Hey, I did that grocery shopping your mom wanted, but she's wondering where you are. Dinner's almost ready. Crap. Okay. I'll try to wrap this up. Thanks, man. They were talking about new form shipments. I need to figure out what they found so I know where they're gonna hit next. They were tracking new form shipments, but why? Oh. Rocks on security. They can take it from here. Yeah. Gotta look into this later. Gotta get home. Christmas dinner sounding pretty good right about now. I'll look into that group and the new form shipments tomorrow. It's too cold to change out here. Genki stay in a couple of weeks. Gonna be a lot of late nights working on spider gear. Spider suit ideas. Gotta make sure mom doesn't see this. <laughs> Pete took me to see this. He totally cried at the end. And so did I. Man, this TV is as old as a boiler. This move really hasn't sunk in yet. Still feels like a boiler's apartment, not ours. Let's see what Genki's working on. 
Oh, Spinanagon. Dude needs to finish so I can play it. <laughs> Middle school graduation. Haven't seen these two in a while. Ay, bendito. Mijo, qué guapo. Oh, gracias, mami. I invited a guest tonight. Can you get the apartment ready? Oh, uh, maybe put on some music to set the mood? Ah, oh, Nadja. Really? Your campaign manager on Christmas Eve? Well, tomorrow's rally isn't going to plan itself. Thanks for getting the apartment ready, mijo. Hello? <laughs> Fifteen years in Brooklyn without a stain. Then we moved to Harlem. Might be a sign. Oye, espera hasta que llegue la hora de la cena, por favor. Yes, ma'am. Yo pensé que ya habíamos llenado ese formulario. No. Is the mystery Oye, guest Uncle Aaron? Un segundo. You know I don't want him coming around here. I just thought... Never mind. Let's talk about it later, okay? Nadja, I'm back. I'm gonna make you proud, Dad. Hmm. No records. Hey, Mom! Where's Dad's vinyl? Um, should be in my room. Thanks. Seguro que sí. Okay. No, no, no te creo. Ese hombre está loco. Probably tripled my average shower count since I started this hero thing. heirloom? I didn't say it before. Thanks for inviting me to stay over break. Anytime, man. Your parents like in Hawaii? Before you got home, they called me from the top of Haleakala, so I'd say they're doing okay. I didn't want to miss Christmas in New York. You can't. It's the best time of the year. That's what I said. Guess Mom's not done unpacking either. <laughs> that wallpaper just screams, Abuela. Mom ordered like a hundred of these because the article mentioned Dad. Who is the Spider-Man? If only you knew, Ma. Well, what's that? Huh. Must have gotten mixed up in the move. One of Dad's old case files. Who's the Prowler? I wonder if Dad ever caught the guy. I haven't looked through these since before City Hall. Dad's favorite album. He put this on every Sunday while he made coffee. Oh, <laughs> salsa from Abuela. Mom and Dad would move when this came on. I think this was Uncle Aaron's. Dad never played it, but he also never got rid of it. What's the pick, DJ? The greatest record ever. Haven't heard that one in a while. It was Uncle Aaron's. Oh, well, it's a great record. Hmm. Hmm. Mm -hmm. 
What else did you need me to do? Lighting the tree would be perfect. Sorry, Naja, I'm back. Glad Dad's tree survived the move. Me too. He loved that little guy. Ain't no Christmas like a Brooklyn Christmas. I miss hearing him say that. That doorbell's been broken for years. Miles, could you get that? Of course. How are your parents, Genki? I haven't talked to them in a while. Mom City Council run came together fast. People in Harlem really love her. Finn? Hey! Fixed your doorbell. <laughs> it's so good to see you. How are you? It's been like... Months. A lot's changed. Yeah. It really has. Is that our guest of honor? Come on in, you two. Dinner's almost ready. Finn, I'm so glad you could make it. Thanks for inviting me, Miss Morales. <laughs> <laughs> we missed you. Well, this one especially. Uh, hi. Finn, this is Genki, my friend from Brooklyn Visions Academy. Genki, this is Finn, my best friend. <laughs> my other best friend. Oh, yeah, you guys won the middle school science fair at County, right? You made a, uh... Energy, energy converter? converter? Jinx! <laughs> oh. uh. The wiring in this building is such a mess. I'll check the circuit breaker. Gracias. So... Christmas by candlelight? I promise I didn't break it when I fixed your doorbell. I had to consider that. No good. Breaker doesn't have power. Looks like the whole block's out. Let me check if I can see anything from the fire escape. Okay, honey. But be safe. Definitely can't get to the transformer from here. Unless you're super sticky. People on the roof. Can't go up there. Yeah, I've got the whole block. Really hope no one can see me up here. Don't look out the window. Don't look out the window. Think Miles is having any luck outside? I hope so. Our are only going to get it so far south Bioelectricity can take down Rhino. But can it save Christmas dinner? It worked! Oh man, those lights are bright. Did not think this through. Gotta get back inside ASAP. Keep them distracted, Genki. Nothing to see here, nothing to see. Come on, Genki. Is Miles still outside? Actually, oh. uh, what about a photo? <laughs> Right now? Yeah, you know, precious moments. You gotta capture them. Shouldn't we wait for Miles? No, he hates photos. <laughs> All right, everyone squeeze in. Ready? Great photo, great photo. Oh, hey, Miles. Uh, who's ready to eat? You guys sit down. I got this. Mm, smells good. Mmm. Finn, tell us everything you've been up to. You still in robotics club? I had to quit, but I've been studying biotech on my own. Nerd. Oh, says the guy who has to wear an ascot to school. <laughs> hey, only on Tuesdays. <laughs> Does your brother Rick still work for Roxon? 
I don't know how anyone could work there after seeing your last campaign ad. You went for Simon Krieger's jugular. <laughs> that reminds me. Genki, you have a certain flair for social media. Could you spread the word about tomorrow's rally? Yeah, we'll be trending by midnight. <sighs> Sometimes it feels like Simon Krieger's my real opponent. Roxxon has so much influence here, but they don't answer to anyone except their shareholders. Harlem needs someone to fight for the community. That's Mom's campaign speech voice, in case you couldn't tell. <laughs> uh, you want to proofread these before I post them? Yes! Do not hit send! <gasps> <laughs> So, what's going on with you? What do you mean? You seem... I don't know. Distracted. Want to talk about it? Not tonight. It's Christmas. Hey, how are you handling the move from Brooklyn? I mean... It's fine. Ugh. You hate it. No. Nah. That's your, I hate it, but I'm too nice to say it voice. No. It's... I don't know anybody here, and I'm always having to ask for directions. You need to find a good restaurant, a barber shop, somewhere you can shoot hoops. You'll settle in. What if we hang out tomorrow? Just the two of us. You're not too busy? It's winter break. I can put off homework for at least another week. Okay, I'll text you. It's a date. I, I mean... N not a date, uh, you know, a, a friend date. Still as smooth as the last time I saw you. <laughs> <laughs> So I stayed up last night and designed an app for your new suit. Thing's got a crazy custom OS, nothing I've ever seen before. But I ran it through a disassembler so I could reverse engineer the plugin architecture and... Uh... You just fell asleep again, didn't you? Miles! I'm up. I'm up. It's almost done compiling. Oh, thank you. Ready to try out my app? Yeah, man. Let's do this. I'm connected to your analytics. Let's test drive this baby. All right. I can see everything you see. How are you not puking all the time? Lots of practice. Welcome to Friendly Neighborhood 1.0. It lets New Yorkers directly request your help and report crimes in progress. Nice UI. Thanks. Oh, look, someone just made a request. The request came from a guy named Aaron Davis. Wait, what? That's my uncle. Does he know you're Spider-Man? No, gotta be a coincidence. Uh, I'm headed to the subway stop. some help? I'm Spider-Man, by the way. Yeah, I know. Aaron Davis. I think somebody's messing with the sensors. I'm getting bad data from the main relay up top of Grand Central. On my way. Wait, wait. Yeah? Where's the other Spider-Man? Oh, he's on vacation. But don't worry, I got this. <laughs> He definitely didn't recognize me. Oh, he's calling through the app? This is Spider-Man. Hey, forgot to mention. There was a break-in last night right next door at Roxxon Plaza. Group called the Underground. Caught him hanging around my stop this morning. The Underground? You know anything else about them? They think of themselves as a young mafia. They've been around a while, but now they've got a new boss. Tinkerer. Tinkerer? Thanks for the tip. 
So, uh, you call Spider-Man often? Like, for help? <laughs> Didn't really have a way to get in touch to this app thing. But I saw you on the news last night taking down Ronnie. Figured you were the right person to call. <laughs> cool. Have you, uh, been working at the subway long? Nah, took the job last year after my brother. Well, anyway, I was trying to make some changes. Decided this job was a good place to start. The train going down on my watch doesn't exactly paint me in a good light. Well, when we fix them, you can tell your boss you showed initiative by using the Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man app. <laughs> I'll do that. Good luck with the sensors. <laughs> There are way too many wires on this one. It's got to be messing with the signal. Where do these cables go? Hey! Hey, yourself! The signal relays are being jammed by something. Hmm. This is crazy tech. Hate to do this, but... Sensors are back online. What did you do? Took care of the guy messing with it. And it looks like they left some of their toys behind. Hey, I'm gonna have to call you back. Whoa. Bet I could use this to make those hollow drones Pete designed. Perfect time to try out those new hollow drones. Hello. You do the hollow drones. Look out. Stop running into each other. Heads up. Okay. Hope the trains are running again. Should check in with Uncle Aaron. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Davis. How are things looking now? I've got a signal with no trains on the tracks. Something must have gone down at the yard. It was the underground messing with your sensors. I'm thinking. Does Roxxon ever use the subway to ship new form? Roxxon? Uh, the subway system was designed to carry people. Not freight. But this line got some updates when Roxxon Plaza. So they could be using it under the table. Hmm. I'll follow up on it. So, uh, you mentioned your brother. You got other family? I haven't seen them in a while. I had to make some changes. Like taking this job. I miss him. Especially my nephew. We used to make beats together. Well, maybe now you can see him again. Then, your family. Oh, so cute. Yeah. Uh, I should go. Fight underground. Bye. Underground's wrecking everything. Maybe I can stop them quietly. How do you know? Those guys Paper up. told us to get in and out quick. This stuff takes time, man. What was that noise? <laughs> Gotta be quicker than that. Don't look at me, don't look at me. Underground's wrecking everything. Maybe I can stop them quietly. One down. You think this whole plan will work? If it doesn't, Tinkerer will come up with another plan. That's all of them. That's all of them. Now to get the trains back on the tracks. Controls are probably in the office.
Tinkerer. Monk said that's their leader. <coughs> oh, man. We read the controls. Gonna have to get the trains back on the tracks by hand. Or web. I can use that turntable. Spin the turntable, pull trains with webs. Should work. That works. Almost there. It worked. We've got trains on the tracks. Now they need power. Hmm. They busted the controls here, too. But not the generator. Okay. I can use that to power the trains. Probably. My webs are conductive. Trusty New York subway. Yes! Hey, Mr. Davis. Did anything change on your end? Panels just lit up like Christmas. Good job, kid. Glad to help. If anything else comes up, just post a note in the app. Wait a second. I got a little something here. It's not much, but... For, for me? It's the least I can do for the guy who just saved my job. Cool, cool. I'll head back now. Hey, Miles. Just landed in Europe. How's day one of solo Spider-Manning? Pretty good. I stumbled on a conspiracy in my neighborhood. Classic. You have a plan? Sort of making it up as I go. The mark of a true Spider-Man. Well, if you need me, I'm a phone call away. And a cross-Atlantic flight, but it's fine. Sure, man. Oh, and thanks for the gift. It is awesome. You learned it. Oh, MJ needs me. Gotta go. Bye. Dude, fixing the subways made the app blow up. You have so many requests. Like, uh... Oh, this one's from Teos. That guy rules. Oh, I should definitely check that out. Now that the whole city's counting on me. We're like the number one app in NYC right now. Check it out as soon as you're done with your uncle. He still doesn't know you're you, right? Had a couple of near misses, but I kept my cover. I'll check the app as soon as I'm done here. Later. Already getting some ideas. Oh, hey, Mr. Davis. I'm almost there. You gotta hurry, Spider-Man. Underground's here. Putting bombs on the tracks. Bombs? For real? Guess they didn't like you fixing things. I'll get there as soon as I can. Hang tight, and don't go outside. What? Gotta stop this quick. You don't need you here, Spider-Man. They're gonna blow the whole line. Not if I can help it. Let's put web work. Okay, bombs are down. Now for these guys. There's more on the upper tracks. Right. I'll get them.
that, you learn new forms getting shipped by train. Then today, you attack the train. Why? To stop new form? To steal it? You did it, kid. Trains are back, underground's done. You do good work. Yep, yep, go around. The next train is arriving in five minutes. Please stand clear of the approaching train. Underground did a number on my suit. Could do a patch job. You okay, Mr. Davis? Yeah, thanks to you. Oh, hey, here you go. One year unlimited subway pass. Thanks. Did I get the name right? How did you... Um, okay. Gotta go. Hold up, Miles. I kind of suspected when I saw the news yesterday. Watching your moves on those escape cons, juking guys left and right. Could have sworn I was back at the park playing pickup with you and your dad. You were quick then. A lot quicker now. Don't worry. I won't tell your mom. Promise? Promise. Look at you. If your dad could see you now. He'd probably freak out. <laughs> He'd definitely freak out. So you taking over for the other Spider-Man? Nah. Like I said, he's just on vacation. Right. And he left you in charge. Yeah. A lot of responsibility for a kid your age. I can handle it. Hope so. But listen. You get in over your head, you give me a call. I'm here for you. Got it? Got it. Thanks, Unc. Genki said the app's blowing up. City definitely needs a Spider-Man. She'll patrol for a while. Different vibe from Brooklyn up here. Spider-Man! Spider-Man! Well, I wanted to tell you my favorite... Me! Um, right here. What? Not you! My cat! Named after the real Spider-Man. Bunch of jerks broke in here and robbed my place. I think they took Spider-Man too. That's awful! You see where they went? Overheard them say they're hitting the power substation. A couple blocks over. I'll find them. And your cat. Sure, kid. Guess it can't hurt. Should probably call Genki when I get there. Why would these dudes go to a power station? There's my way in. Genki, I need help. Some dudes robbed Tails Bodega, then headed to the closest power station. Weird. You got my full attention. Watching through your live stream. They're shooting transformers. Okay. Out for the count. The station's output is down to 64%. Maybe you can find a backup. Good thinking on the backup systems. You're good at this hero stuff. <laughs> nah, I I'm just a spectator. Just need to find Tails' cat. <gasps> Spider-Man! Wait! Wait! Spider-Man went down the elevator shaft. I'm coming for you, Spider-Man. Hang tight. Spider-Man, wait! Oh. I think I know what these dudes want. There's a bank on this block. No power means no security. So if we fix the power, we're preventing a bank heist? Stopping crime before it begins. In a world where only two men can see the future, only they can stop it. 
All right, all right, gotta focus. What is the boss want to set up here of all places? Peace out! Uh! Uh! Sounds like someone's paying them. Any idea who... What? So, output's at zero. I got that. Pulling up emergency lights... Okay. You can restore power if you charge the other backups. On it. Okay. Gotta push ahead. Find the main generator. And hope I can fix it. These guys keep talking about their boss. Any idea who it is? Dude, a lot of people want to rob banks. It was worth a try. There's the main breaker. I gotta clear out these guys. Then I can figure out how to fix it. Lights out for you. Sounds like whoever planned the heist knows Spider-Man. And not in a good way. Has to be the other one. I don't have that many enemies. Yet. Great optimism, bro. Time to check the breaker. The breaker. Let there be... What the hell was that noise? <laughs> Spider-Man? Huh? You can't have him! Don't you know it's rude to interrupt the bonding Now for the breaker. For real this time. Let's get out of here, Spider-Man. Hey man! Power restored, bank high stopped, Spider-Man the cat saved. Call in a day's great work. I'm posting in the FNSM app about these guys and their boss. Get leads on who we're dealing with. Call you soon. Oh my god! It's him! Get a picture! <laughs> hey, Teo, got a surprise for you. Oh, yeah? What's that? <gasps> Spider Man! Oh! <laughs> Did you have an adventure? <laughs> oh, you almost gave Daddy a heart attack. Oh, yes, you did. Oh, yes, you did. <clears throat> uh, good work, other Spider Man. Thanks. Yeah. Of course. Hey, man, any leads on who our cat thieves were working for? I'm chasing down a couple of problems that might be connected. Robberies on Harlem's commercial strip, and something going down at Feast North. I'll post in the app when I know more. Cool. Thanks, dude. Hey, hey Spider-Man. Spider -Man. We still What's meeting good? today? Never got a text back from you. Oh, yeah. Sorry. I've been wrapped up in my own stuff. But I'm free now. Well, sweet. 78th and West End. 78? By the Science Center? Why there? You'll see. Don't be late. Gotta run. 78th and West End. That really is? Guess I'll find out what she means. Better hustle over. Up here! Fire escape's shakier than it used to be. Careful on the way up. <sighs> this 
So, this is why you wanted to meet here. Almost bailed you took so long. Give me a hand, it's stuck. <sighs> Time capsule seen better days. You remember the combination? Yeah, it's, uh... Man, it's, uh... You kidding me? Y'all gotta start remembering this code. Not always gonna be around to tell you. We'll remember, we'll remember. We'll remember, yeah, yeah, good. Now, uh, what are you gonna put inside this bad boy? Secret time capsule. Only Miles and I know. Boom! Oh, that's right. Keep it secret, keep it safe. Hey, Rick, you gonna take that job at Roxxon or what? <laughs> Why? You gonna take it if I don't? Maybe. Waiting to see the offer. Okay, competition, eh? Well, they're talking a good game. Want me to uh, <clears throat> lead their clean energy group. And you know me. Clean, clean power, power save, save the, the world! world. <laughs> I love my nerdy fan club. Oh, speak of the devil. Rocks on. Back in a sec. You remember the code, right? Um. The Fibonacci sequence. Nice. A reward. I mean, our energy converter was pretty fire. Truth. You think it's still on display at the Science Center? Hope so. Wow. <laughs> Look at this. Goober Central. Rig looking suave as ever, though. Yeah. Something going on with him? You guys fight or something? No. No fight. Finn. It's fine. Why do we really lose touch? Crap, now I'm late. I gotta go. Hey, I feel like we both have stuff we're not sharing. Next time we hang, no secrets. Okay? Yeah. Mm, maybe. If you're on time. See you soon, short stuff. You know I'm taller than you now, right? Not in here. Middle school graduation was bittersweet. Finn went to Midtown High, but I got into Brooklyn Visions. Said we stay in touch, but man, high school's like a whole new world. Man, it was so good to see Finn. I should find the other time capsules we hid. But a little later. I gotta get home from Mom's rally. Phone, check. Subway card, check. You got the house key? Yeah, I got it. Come on, we're gonna be late. Uh, hey, <laughs> dude, I am so filling your suit with snow. Are you still wearing your suit? Yeah, you know, just in case. It's gonna be fine. See, this is my favorite part of living in Harlem. Pop-up street fair, best food in the city, awesome music. Yeah, this is pretty cool. That looks really cool. You're welcome. Oh. Sorry. I should take ASL with you next semester. I've basically already mastered Espanol. Ah, uh, see? There's the cuando. <laughs> Honey, you're worrying. Gloria! Hey! Hi, Miles. This is my girlfriend, Steph. She just started volunteering at Feast. Good to meet you. I'm sure we'll run into each other at the shelter. Uh, speaking of... No shiz for you till after winter break. 
open by then. What do you mean? Ah, uh, don't worry about it. Enjoy your mom's speech. I'll call you after break. Sweet kid. Listen. I'm at the nearly completed box office. Oh, yes. Yeah, Over oh, here. Didn't expect to see you here. I'll clear out before your mom sees you. Who's this? It's my friend Genki. He's helping me with my, uh, spider project. Uh-huh. You look out for my nephew. You hear? I'll try, but he doesn't make it easy. I'm standing right here. <laughs> Enjoy your mom's speech, kid. Dude, you told him? You figured it out. Who do you mean you get there? Underground town. What do you think they'll do next? Hopefully, realize fighting Spider-Man is too much trouble and decide to go home. <laughs> if only. Good luck, Miss Morales. Thank you, Tim. Look, Roxanne's really into the constant vigilance thing, huh? For real. Buenas noches, vecinos. Do you remember what we lost when Roxanne bulldozed this block? Hey, you okay? Let me remind you. Yeah, it's just last that time we did one of these, my dad. Best hand-rolled ice cream in New York City. And Junipero's daycare. It'll be okay, man. Your mom's got people looking out for her. St. Teresa's church. It was choir. Plus, now you're a spider. Even now, Roxxon is transporting new form. It's experimental fuel across the city. But they won't tell us the risk. This message is for Roxxon. The man you answer to, Simon Krieger, is a killer. This plaza is a monument to everything he's done. I won't let it open. The underground will stop it. We've got a situation here. Everyone, stay back! Stay home! Nowhere to run! Weapons up! They need you. I'll help your mom. Everyone, stay back! They need it! Stay back! Stay back! I got you. Let's go. next move. Okay. I'm logging into your analytics. I'll help how I can. Good idea. And Genki. Thanks for helping my mom. Anytime, man. What was that? You're hurt. What if something happens to you while I'm not there? Mijo, this isn't like City Hall. We're all okay. You stay where it's safe. Entiende? I'll be back soon. And I'll even let you sign my pass. Okay, Ma. Nos vemos en casa. Te quiero. Uncle Aaron, you okay? I'm on. I tried to reach you and your mom. Where are you now? I'm headed to Braithwaite <laughs> Bridge. There was an explosion. All right, but if Roxxon shows up, you run. Got it? They'll look for some of the blame for all this, and it won't just be the tinker. Okay, I'll be careful. That explosion looked bad. I gotta hurry. Looks like the plaza was just a warm-up. Or a distraction. Go, go, go! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Let's not shoot each other, all right?
Get rid of him. Then grab as much as you can carry! <laughs> safe. After the explosion, the bridge started We've to... We've got eyes on the other Spider-Man. Please advise. What's going on? I have no idea. Copy. <laughs> no! No, I'm not your enemy! What are you doing? He no. saved hey, us! You? Hey, leave him alone! He's I'm recording this! 
to Roxxon being here for us. They were gonna shoot me. They didn't even listen. Are you okay? I don't know. Here today is Simon Krieger. Discussing the destruction of Braithwaite Bridge. Look, I want to root for the new Spider-Man, but his... What, what did you call it? Bioelectricity? You want breakfast? Well, that cost us Roxxon property, and it destroyed a bridge. But this Roxxon is messed up. That's not what happened. When... Finn's the tinkerer. She stole the new form. No idea why. And it's my fault the bridge blew up. No, it's not. I'm headed to the campaign headquarters. You boys need anything while I'm out? I could pick up dulce de coco. I thought you'd quit after last night. Why would I quit? I said I'd fight for my home. I meant it. You could have. You could have died. Our family doesn't give up. You know that. Mom! Phyllis said the cocoa would be great. If you don't mind. I don't mind. When I got powers, and I, I thought I'll be able to fix anything, do anything that Spider-Man does. Whenever you say Spider-Man, you always mean the other one. You're Spider-Man. You can fix this. Time now, huh? Feels like people need friendly neighborhood now more than ever. We gotta think of a shorter name. All the good apps are one word. Miles, finally got through. Oh, uh, hey Pete, what's going on? I saw the news. It was in Simkarian, so either a bridge exploded or a bagel was fumigated, which doesn't make any sense in context. 
Either way, I'm looking at flights. I can be back tomorrow night. No, don't do that. It's okay. I figured out who's responsible, and I'm gonna stop them. I promise. Okay, I trust you. But if you need help, I'll be on the first plane home. Otherwise, I'll see you when I get back in a few weeks, okay? Yeah, okay. Thanks. And good luck learning some Karian. Uh, why are there seven different words for bathroom? Okay, boss. What's the plan? Finn's family has a repair shop in Midtown. She used to do all of her work there. If I'm lucky, she still does. Wouldn't it be easier to just call her and talk? I don't think so, man. Seeing her on the bridge? I don't know that person. I need to figure out why she's doing all this. All right, man. Do what you feel is right. Keep me posted. Shop's all boarded up. Sad to see it like this. I should find a low profile way in. Don't want to draw attention. <coughs> Hello? Man, this place is dusty. No one's been here in a while. Ben and I spent a whole summer helping Rick repair old guitars. There wasn't anything he couldn't fix. Rick's ESU textbooks. He took night classes so he could keep running the shop during the day. Guy was unstoppable. Someone left the lights on. Rock saw an ID for Ella Sterling. But the photo is of Finn. Some kind of meds. GCSF. Used for treating bone marrow decay. Whose was this? The team that created New Form all got sick. Wait. Rick was project lead? Nothing in here's been touched for at least six months. Okay, this is a secret room. Video file from six months ago. Running a test upload. <coughs> Half my team is sick. The Krieger still want to make his new form. We need to do this tonight. Let me. You sure we're ready? We have to be. They broke ground in Harlem today, out of schedule. Poisoning the city to make a buck. They keep cutting corners. Ignoring safety reports, I can't. Let them pervert my work like this, Finn. Okay. First we flush the core, then we wipe all data. You're sure they can't just make more of this stuff? No. No, as long as we take out the backup supply in Jersey, too. But without me, they'll have no idea how new form works. Project will be DOA. I'll record us. Things go wrong, video uploads straight to the bugle. Perfect. You ready to save New York? Ready. There's a second video. Ugh, damn it. No uploads. Phone must have been damaged. Won't let 
tonight be for nothing. <laughs> I promise, Rick. They were trying to shut the new form project down. Something went wrong. Last known location of her phone. If I can track it. Okay. Come on, come on. Be invisible, be invisible. Come on. He's here! Hold it up! Oh. He get close? Straight up vanishing really freak these guys out. If I wait for the snipers to calm down, I can take them out from above. It's a Mecco stove. I must have tripped a silent alarm or something. Finn's phone. Maybe I can understand what happened to Rick and why she became the tinkerer. There, got a location. I should call gang. Fill him in. Hey, did you find anything in Finn's shop? Yeah. I know why she's doing all this. Something happened to her brother. Something bad. Oh, man. Rick was working at Roxxon. He was their lead scientist on Newform. Whoa. And it looks like Newform was making him sick. Simon Krieger has been telling everyone how safe it is. He's lying. Finn and her brother tried to shut down the prototype reactor. Prevent further development. What happened? Don't know. Yet. Finn recorded the whole thing on her phone. But then she lost it inside the lab. I'm on my way to get it. Listen, I'm right here. Call if you need me. Will do. Roxxon Research Labs. This is where the whole new form project got started. Finn's phone's in there somewhere. I think I just found my way in. That Finn has high voltage shielding. Wonder what powers it. I gotta disable it somehow. Taking you down, Spider Man! Okay. Now to get into the building. Absorbing energy fried the generator. I can't believe that actually worked. And I'm in. Breaking into a lab full of armed guards. Christmas break sure is different this year. I should be at home, taking naps, playing a ton of video games and eating like a hundred Christmas cookies. Which way? Uh-oh. We've got a report of a breach through the outer exhaust system. If it's underground, kill them. Spider-Man is in We need backup. <laughs> Another one bites the dust. Hey. <gasps> hey, kid. <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> Damn, Miles. We're a skinny ass kid. You hit hard. Uncle Aaron? You're the prowler? My dad had a foul on you. 
I know. And I bet you got a lot of questions right now. But we need to get out of here. You picked the wrong place to break into. I'm not leaving till I find what I came for. Listen, I did some work for Roxanne a while back. You don't want to mess with these guys. If we get caught in here... Then help me. Ugh. Stubborn as your father. All right. But we do this my way. I know a place I can access a security terminal. Let you know what's coming. Remote mines. Use them if you get in a jam. Don't get caught. <laughs> See that vent with the laser shielding? How'd you do that? I've worked with systems like this before. Now focus. Looks like a good time to try out those remote mines. What's going on with the cameras? More power outages? Nah, that was in Harlem. Rhino took out a whole power plant. Gonna mess with more. Oh. So what is it you're looking for? A phone. I tracked the signal. It's coming from somewhere deep underground. Lowest point in the building is at the bottom of the reactor site. Then that's where I'm headed. Oh. Out for the count. Should be a vent in that room. Leads to a lab, then the reactor. Like a new form reactor? It's what these schematics say, yeah. Where's the new form I asked for? Oh, uh, we're trying to make more, but Mason didn't leave behind any notes. And? Well, I had heard that one canister of new form survived the uh, incident on the bridge. Now, if we had access to that, I... Don't you think that if I had it, I would give it to you? Yes, Mr. Krieger. I just want to make it clear that without that canister, it will be impossible to Shut hit the up. deadline. I... I'm doing everything in my considerable power to find that canister. However, right now, it would help me for you to go back to your lab and do your damn job. Krieger's on a deadline. So you're gonna tell me whose phone you're looking for? The Tinkerers. You gonna tell me why you're stalking me? <laughs> to protect you. You should feel honored. I came out of retirement to watch your back. I can't believe my uncle's the prowler. And I can't believe my nephew's risking his neck for a phone. Let's get on with it. You're close to the reactor prototype. Need to take these guys out. Hope the platinum of being this close to the reactor. You should have come! Yeah. Yeah. Nice work. Thanks. Silo's just on the other side of that blast shield. Use that terminal to open it up. Wait a sec. There's more labs around the city? With a new form reactor in each one. New form made Rick sick. I need to shut these down. Focus. Get the phone and get out of there. Reactors below. Powers this whole facility. Phone's all the way at the bottom. It looks like I need to figure out a way past that fan. And all those guys, too. Remember what I said. Don't get caught. I got some serious new firepower. Man down! Repeat! Man down! <laughs> Call in to make sure you're not hurt, or, you know, dead. <laughs> Thanks. Actually, got my uncle here helping me. The subway worker guy? Yeah. Turns out, he's also the Prowler. Long story. Wait, the Prowler? The thief who runs around in purple? Former thief. We're not partnering. It's just a one-time thing. Your uncle's the Prowler? That's a lot, man. Like, a lot, a lot. I know. I gotta go, Genki. I'll fill you in later. 
Be quick about this, nephew. I'm trying to shut down cameras and alarms to keep more of them from coming. Break the wires above the fan, and it should stop. Thanks. Gotta disable that fan somehow. Battery needs a charge. Please don't explode. <sighs> nice. Okay. Camera, video. Here it is. Okay. Core dumps a two person job. You start to override here, I confirm it there. Step one in wiping new form from existence. Any regret? Destroying the thing you made? <laughs> You see me lately, right? Let's make the world safer. Ready? Ready. Triggering override in three, two... Ben! That wasn't me! Industrial sabotage, Rick. Really? No one's gonna care about a few sick people uptown or a dead engineer. You're just the cost of doing business. No! No, no, no! I can stop it! No! I can stop this! No! 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 Rick! Rick, no! No! Ben! No, no look! <laughs> Someone else is in there. Find out how. Rick was trying to save people. And Krieger killed them. I have to finish what they started. Uncle Aaron, can you unlock the reactor shooting from where you are? Why? You got your phone. Now let's leave. That reactor killed my friend. It needs to be shut down. Permanently. I need your help, Unc. Please. Uh, Uncle Aaron? Okay. Stand back. Thanks, Unc. Whoa. Just like the generator outside! Only you! What are you doing? Mom! Stop! <laughs> Ah. You gotta get out of there, man. Can you move? Yeah. Go down that hallway. Now! I feel real bad right now. Right? It's tearing me. I can't. Ah. Mom, talk to me, kid. You all right? I feel like I just got dropped out of a plane. But at least the reactor's disabled. You're almost out. Uh, I really needed that phone. Now what am I gonna do? Come on, kid. I can't get to you before Roxxon does. Huh. Oh, stay down! We're taking you into custody! They've got orders to capture Why? What do they want? Study you. Interrogate you. Don't know, don't care. Just don't let them. God damn it! What? Mom, I just got booted from the system. Give me a minute. I'll get you out of there. Got it. Let's go, before more of them show up. Whoa. That was super cool cloaking tech. How does it... Work. 
You take the left. I'll take the right. Real bad. Don't worry. We can take these guys. No, I ain't worried about that. I'm worried about after we get out of here. We're both on Greek short things now. to lay low. Don't trust anybody and don't take off that mask. Wait till Roxxon finds a better talk. I can't lay low. I still need to find Finn. Your friend's the Tinker. No wonder you care so much about this. It's not just that. I'm... Protecting New York is my job. Use Finn. Tell her you want to join the underground. You just told me don't take off the mask. Don't tell her you're Spider-Man. Go to her as a friend. No, she's too smart for that. You'd be surprised. People get stupid when they care about someone. Like you're being stupid now. Because I told her the truth. I told your dad the truth. How do you have my back? He would. And my brother. Instead, he cut me out. If I kept my mouth shut, maybe I'd still have a family. You know what you have to do. Okay, I should call Finn. No, no. I've got time to check on the city. Yeah. Miles, you know how many followers you've gained since the app went live? It's crazy. I've been running some numbers, and I know you said no to ads before, but maybe we could reconsider? No. Right. No, uh, of course not. Just saying. So did you find Finn's phone? Yeah. But, uh, it melted after I absorbed energy from a new form reactor. What? How are you not dead? Felt like it was for a minute there. But then I released all the energy in kind of a mini explosion. Luckily, I didn't bring down the whole lab. Man, I gotta start taking notes on all your new powers. So, what's the plan now? Uncle Aaron thinks I should tell Finn I want to join the underground. Then I could take the new form so she doesn't use it for whatever. Whoa, like, lie to her face? Yeah, but I don't have any other leads. You know what we need? Target sight. Engaging with the I guess. Well, good luck. Call if you need me. Got him sighted! Spider-Man, hey, I'm Caleb. Good to meet you. Saw your mural at Teo's. Oh, that's the other guy. But I'm still here to help. <sighs> Every business on this block's had inventory stolen over the last few weeks. Paper products, kits, sanitizers. We're all local. We can't swallow a loss like that. Did you report it? Sure, but no one's taking us seriously. Camille, she runs the restaurant next door. Decided to look into it herself. Went down to the shipping center that supplies all of us. I'll meet her there, see if I can help. Thanks, Spider-Man. Good to have you looking out for us. Hey, Genki. I'm looking into some robberies on Harlem's main strip. Caleb's Clean Cuts and Pana Fuerte. Oh, I love Pana Fuerte. Did you try the arepas? I can't eat before I do intense superheroing. It's kind of like pool rules. Right, totally. So, what's the plan? Track down the stolen inventory, find out who did it, 
see if it's connected to the guys who robbed Tails Bodega. Sounds good. I'm on call for tech, map, and thinking through problem support. Cops? What's going on? Witness said a woman was stuffed in a trunk after arguing with some ex-con types. We got night From an Oscorp cam, Camila Vasquez owns Pana Fuerte in Harlem. Oh my god. They kidnapped Camila. I had to try and find her, but cops won't like me interfering. Tell me if I get a look at the clues. Jacket from David's complete auto repair. Someone dropped it when they peeled out. Hey, you know where I could find David's complete auto repair? There's 12 of them in Manhattan. You need to narrow it down. You've been working a lot of overtime. Camila oh, definitely bought that. We need to figure out where they took her. Here. And you're the only one. You can say it. Out of family. Sorry. Parking garage receipt. Chinatown. Is there a David's complete auto repair in Chinatown? Yep. Sending you the address. Radio from Chinatown. A woman matching our Vic's description. Seen in an alley. Let's move. <laughs> Hey, Spider-Man, any leads on our M4? Yeah! The guys who stole it? I think Camila caught them in the act. They kidnapped her. What? You're sure? Positive. I'm on my way to help her. <sighs> Good thing you came by when you did, Spider-Man. Thank you. Get the hell away from me! Cops! Everybody go! No, no, no! Just let Camila go! Am I seeing this right? Camila's in that car? Yes! That's speeding through Manhattan, yeah, dangerously yeah. close to crashing? Yes! Oh my god. Camila, you okay in there? Trunk open. Please help me. Are you okay, ma'am? Spider-Man, I, I I didn't expect you to. But those men. It's okay now. You're safe. They, those men were paid to steal our inventory, drive us out of business. They're holding it at the docks on FDR, near the bridge. I'll get your stuff back. Do you need help getting home? No, no, no. I can call a cab. Gracias. You saved my life, sir. Yankee! Camila's safe. She caught those guys stealing inventory. Said someone paid them to do it. About that. I did some digging. Someone anonymously filed a request with the city to use eminent domain powers to condemn Camila and Caleb's block. Has to be the guy paying our criminals, right? So he can move in? Totally. I put in a counter request asking for an investigation into whoever's trying to buy the land. Dude, you're a genius. I'm headed to the docks to get the supplies back. Call you soon. Crates. Crates. More crates. Where'd they hide the supplies? Bet those guys know. If I listen in, I can figure out which crate to open. What are you planning to do with that stuff? Barber shears, napkin holders? Probably dump it. You can get started if you want. Green crate with the white star. Got it. Now I can take these guys down. No! Harlem One. Also guys working for mystery boss? Zero. Now to find the goods. Green container, white star. That's it. 
Supplies should be in there. Blocked by other crates. Can use that crane. Now to get that inventory out of the crate. For real? More of you? Your boss gave you rocket launchers? This guy's serious. it. All the stolen supplies. Hey, Caleb. Found your inventory. Bring a few trucks down to the docks, and I hope you move it back. We were ready to file for bankruptcy and close our doors for good. Because of you, we're back on our feet. Thank you. A thousand times. Thank you. You ever need a haircut, drop by. It's on the house. Uh, how would that work with the mask? I've seen stranger. Oye, you need food too. You're a growing boy. Mira, come by Pana Fuerte anytime. We'll wrap up something nice for you, okay? Appreciate it, both of you. Everyone on the block feels the same. Done is good, Spider-Man. Doing good work out there, Spider-Man. With your help! Any leads on our mystery guy? Yeah, I'm working on a short list. So far I've got Vulture, Scorpion, Tombstone. Don't think Electro could pull off something like this. That's a lot of big names. But we'll deal. I want him out of our neighborhood. Aw, it's the first time you've called it ours. Don't make it weird. Too late. <laughs> okay, I gotta do it. Call Finn, get her to let me in the underground. Hey, Miles. You okay? Uh, yeah. Why would you say that? Oh, uh, I saw the news about your mom's rally. We're fine. Do you have time to get coffee, maybe? I can make time. There's a place on Edison, near Fisk Tower. They don't do foam art, but people don't take pictures of their lattes, so worth it. Okay, meet you there. <sighs> Okay, halfway into infiltrating a dangerous group of criminals. Cool, cool. I was really glad you called. I needed a break. From what? Oh, just... stuff. So, uh... I went to your folks' old shop. Thought you might be there. Looked like there might have been some kind of fight just before I got there. I went inside, looked around. Found out about Rick. I'm so sorry. What else did you find out? I want to help you. But you gotta talk to me. I'm really sorry your mom got hurt at her rally. If that new Spider-Man hadn't shown up, everyone would have been fine. Please don't try to talk me out of this. I know what I'm doing. Okay. Good. So, that's my big secret. That's why I've been so busy. What's your excuse? Uh, well, school, volunteering at Feast. You're always busy with stuff like that. What's the real reason? The real reason is, I've been taking on a lot more responsibilities than I can handle lately. Made me push my friends away. But I'm here to fix that. Maybe I could join your club? Crew? Team? Uh, 
I don't know. You know, Rick was... He was the best. I get why you're doing this. If you want my help, I'm all in. If not, no worries. Your secret is safe with me. You're a good friend, Miles. Okay, let's go. Where? You know I'm not good with heights. You'll be fine. I'll be watching. You'll need to prove yourself to the underground. I'll show you how when we get to Fisk Tower. You're set up in the Kingpin's office space? After he went to prison, the Fed seized his property. They haven't gotten around to selling it, so we moved in. How'd you get involved in all this? The underground, the Tinkerer. Tinkerer's a nod to my role. I built everything. The masks, the weapons. Programmable matter. Right. The underground tried to rob my granddad's shop and saw what I was working on. We made a deal. I know you're after Krieger, but what do they get out of it, besides guns? Notoriety. They want to be so well-known, they can get away with anything. And you're good with that? I can't take on Roxxon alone. Come on. You need to jump from the crane to the balcony. Show them you're fearless. They're watching? Through the windows. You have to do this. Come on, you'll be fine. Gotta do this without giving away I'm Spider-Man. Come on, Miles. Make it look good. Officially in the club now? Sure. But watch your back. These guys take a while to warm up to new people. Here it is, where the plan comes together. So, your plan. How does New Form fit in? Krieger's saying you stole a shipment. I stole one canister. I'm making some adjustments. Don't worry about it. Take today to settle in. Right. Good, you're back. Gavin needs it. Not now. Got a new recruit. Fine. Oh man. Yeah. You built all these? Yeah. As long as the new weapons keep coming, the underground stay loyal. Is that a programmable matter sword? New enemies, new solutions. You mean Spider Man, right? This week's most unwelcome surprise. <laughs> How many times do I have to explain it to him? Miles, I need to deal with something. Hang here, okay? Oh, yeah, sure. This is tip. Now's my chance. I gotta figure out where she's keeping the new form. Might be able to find some clues in here. This stuff from Martin Lee's gang? Yeah, trophies. Gotta establish dominance if we're gonna replace this and run New York. These guys are well trained if they took down the demons. Wonder where they train. <laughs> Seen these before. This um a supply crate? Full of a good challenge. Here, Bridge attacks we getting the underground down. a lot of press. Can we throw that rack? As for me, we should be focusing on Pinar. Or whether on this new form trap. Lugging it around. Maybe they brought it here. 
You know, I've hated Spider-Man since the old one didn't stop the devil's breath thing. Not surprised the new one sucks as much as the first. It's a lot of cash. Even more downstairs. Old man's basically funding us. But if he likes it or not. More downstairs. Sounds promising. You were doing fine before. Ooh, risk would not like this. I had secrets and trap doors all over this place. You wrapped them all. We all possess power now. Secret rooms. No place to hide a deadly fuel source. Hmm. Might be using this secret rooms on the ground level. Great time's over, kids. Group two, head downstairs for training. Sounds like where I need to go. Are you texting? Uh, my mom. Yeah, she needs me at home. Right now? Really? Yeah, her wrist is in a cast. I need to help with dinner. Did you tell her I'm. Thanks. <laughs> you can head out that way. See you back here soon? Definitely. Let's see if they keep their secrets downstairs. Genki, I'm in the vents. Nice. Did you find out where they're hiding the new form? Not yet. But I saw Finn head toward the basement, so I'm gonna try and follow her. Hey, when you're crawling through vents, do you ever feel like you're in a movie and start humming suspenseful music to yourself? And then think about getting caught and put into a cell suspended over an alligator pit, and then making a bomb out of gum wrappers to escape? Wait, what? No! Cool. Just curious. Okay, I'm in the atrium. I need to shut down some underground training exercises. Then I'll look for a secret room. Okay. Still no sign of Finn. He must have gone somewhere. I read this interview with Fisk where he said he loved art with a purpose. What does that mean? I don't know. But they also found a bunch of secret passages in his house hidden behind art. So... Yeah, gotcha. I'm looking. have secret exits like this. wonder if Fisk planned to use it when the other Spider-Man came for him. He should have built a faster elevator. Maybe he would have gotten away. Let's not start giving the supervillains ideas, cool? You hear all that noise in the atrium? Must be held a training exercise today. I know you don't want to talk. Three people got sick after the bridge. Three. You know how dangerous this form is. You knew this would be dangerous. It's the deal we made. But if we are getting sick too? You can't hack it, you can get out. The underground doesn't have time for weaklings. You hearing this? New form is making the underground sick too. They're so callous about it. Another way new form Spider-Man. You moved the new form? Safely? Yeah, to the lab uptown. 
Genki. He moved a new form. We're not sure if the canister's safe. It was hot, buzzing, like it's unstable. It's that new Spider-Man. His powers messed with the structure. Tell everyone not to touch it. Their hideouts. New form's gotta be in one of them. I need a clearer picture. Then I can narrow it down. We don't know enough about this stuff. What it is, where it came from. My brother created new form. Chief chemist. And Roxon killed him. I won't stop until Roxon's gone. Are you with me? You know we are. Good. I need power. Generators, car batteries, whatever you can find. Bring them to the theater. you took of the map. Looks like the underground are squatting in old Fisk construction sites. What about a theater? Finn mentioned one. A theater, huh? That's... Don't say it, Genki. Dramatic. You said it. That'd be the Gem Theater. Sounds like that's where she hit the new form. So that's my next stop. If you're headed to the theater, I'm all in. If you're gonna check out those underground hideouts first, I know someone who can help. Cool. I'll add the hideouts to my to-do list and hit you up when I get to the theater. I'll be here, trying to figure out why Speed Nonagon keeps crashing. Finn's not meeting the underground at the gym till later tonight. He'll probably have some time to check the app, or whatever else needs doing. If I can figure out what Finn's planning to do with the new form and take it from her, it'll be a good day. You're right, Genki. Underground are everywhere. You might say they're overground? <laughs> Keep working on that one. <clears throat> Barriers electrified. Ow! And not friendly. Your suit says that was 300 kilojoules. How is that just ow? Benefits of bioelectricity, I guess. Power can be supplied all locally. Any sign of the power source? Several. Bet these cables lead the way. Electrified barrier is next level. Maybe they got nervous after someone infiltrated Fisk Tower. Who do that? for the others. No more underground. Soon to be no more generator. That did it. Barriers fresh out of power. And prime for smashing. Auditorium. Now it's locked. Oops. 
Maybe there's a staircase or an elevator. Like that elevator. If I can lift it. Hey man, I I'm thinking. What if you told Finn you're Spider-Man? Yo, Finn. Not only did I lie about joining your club, but I'm also the guy trying to stop you. Okay, yeah. We can work on the delivery. <clears throat> Giant armored silo looks promising. Really feeling like my gaming rig is underpowered right now. Yeah. Finn's going full supervillain layer here. Are you seeing this giant armor container thing? Totally not suspicious. You think the new form's in there? I got a hunch, yeah. Finn has got cables running away from it. No wonder. Rick's invention. Krieger doesn't understand New Form well enough to make more, but Finn does. She mapped out how his reactivity works. That's one. Need to power the others. So why do you think I should tell Finn I'm Spider-Man? Don't you think she might react badly? Let's make a pros and cons list. Uh... Pro, she's your best friend. Besides me. Con, she's a tinkerer. Pro, talking to her is easier than sneaking around behind her back. Con, the other Spider-Man was super clear. Don't tell anyone who you are. You told me. Maybe if she knows it's you she's fighting, she'll rethink the whole tinkerer thing. Maybe you're right. Finn's been making new weapons to deal with me. Guess she told the rest of the underground to keep tabs. <laughs> All right, that's two. Hope this is a good idea. What's the worst that could happen? Says the guy 30 blocks away. <laughs> Finn's feeding rocks on bad intel so they don't get close to her or the new form. She's good. <laughs> Looks like Finn's making a new mask? Shield? As soon as I find a way around the underground's weapons, she comes up with something new. That sounds promising. Gotta check the supercomputer. All right, what are you up to, Finn? Finn's pumping energy into the new form, making it unstable like my Venom did. Which exploded the bridge. So... what? Does she want to blow up the theater? <sighs> Not the theater. Roxxon Plaza. Whoa, what? That's... how could she... It's not open yet, so there'd be no casualties. I can't let her do this. I'm taking a new form. Come on. Come on! Crap, crap, crap! Spread out! He's here somewhere! I need to get the new form. After I deal with her glow stick army. Just to put it out there. What if Finn's right? And this is the best way to beat Roxxon? Finn's not just talking about throwing a rock through a window. She wants to blow up a building. Oh my god. If any part of her plan goes wrong, people will get hurt. You can't let her take that chance. You're right. Let's get that new form out of here. Even Spider-Man's not ready for this. Okay, now for the new one. Okay, see? 
Our words. How about you stop being so flingy? Oh, she's not tired yet. It is not going well. Where are you? I don't know. I'm dodging explosions. I need a new strategy. I'm gonna do what you said. Uh, tell her the truth? Yeah, as soon as I catch her. Think of her! I gotta tell you something! Slow down! Do you think I'm stupid? You wanna hear this! I promise! Get off, Spider-Man! <laughs> oh crap! Not good, not good! Hope the ship's okay! Good reason not to end you. My mom would be very upset. Maya? Can we just... You two on the roof! Great. You still at my place? I'm actually at home. My parents get back next week, so I thought I'd clean. But I can come back. Nah, it's okay. I'll call you later. Now what? Hey, Uncle Aaron. I need, um, I need some advice. About what exactly? Just everything. Are you free? I can wrap up with him. Call you in a few. Thanks, man. Talk to you soon. I have no idea where Finn is. Or the new form. I guess I should kill some time till Uncle Aaron's free. He's north is shut down. Man, it's way too cold for people to be out on the street. I should go as Miles. Figure out what's going on at Feast. Hey, Genki, I'm gonna talk to Gloria about Feast, as me, not Spider-Man. Undercover by not being undercover. I like it. 
Hey, Gloria. What's going on? Why is everyone outside? A pipe burst. We cleaned it up, but the city won't let us reopen till the plumbing's fixed. I've had it repaired three times, but it keeps breaking down. Can you send people to other fee shelters? They're at capacity. Everyone here, they've got nowhere else to go. We're trying to keep people warm and fed, but in this weather... Anything I can do to help? Yeah, actually. Could you check on the people camped in the park? They don't always open up to management. Happy to. Then get back to your vacation. You work too hard. Yeah, yeah. Need to figure out what happened with the water. Maybe someone here knows. You're fine. I've got a nice warm apartment to go back to. I'll get that. Thank you. I'm Steph, Gloria's girlfriend. I'm volunteering at Feast. Or what's left of it. Yeah. Gloria said the city won't reopen the building. They're being unusually stubborn. And they showed up so fast to condemn us, less than an hour after the flood. I sound like I should be wearing a, a tinfoil hat, huh? No, that's weird. Well, listen. Thanks for your help. Okay. Suspicious. I should keep talking to people. Maybe I can fix this. Bricks? Here. I got you. Thanks, man. I'm trying to keep this stuff dry. I was so worried we'd get robbed, and the flood happened. I even bought a knife. Why did you think that? Caught some guys casing the place. Chased them off, but they just came back. Then they up and disappeared right before the flood. Huh. Well, let me know if you need anything else. Be careful with that knife. Can do. Thanks. What made you come up north? With the flood? Pipes are old. Hey there. Did I overhear you talking about someone from the city? Yeah. About a month ago. Shelter put in a new water heater. Inspector came by. He said we were in good shape. Then all this went down. Yeah. You think he'd catch that? I gotta run. Stay warm. You too. Hey, you busy? Working on speed Nonagon. What'd you find? Guys were chasing feasts right before it flooded. The city swooped in like suspiciously fast to condemn the building. And an inspector said the pipes were fine right before one burst. You think sabotage? Definitely. I need to change into my suit. I should change. Gloria said the city will reopen the shelter if the pipes are fixed. Let's see if I can pull it off. Leads to a storm drain. Clogged by... Ugh, trash. No wonder the pipe burst. Clear the trash. I don't think the water's running. Oh, I know how to fix it. You gotta find the pump station. How do you know that? I did a clean up the rivers project in fourth grade. So they're sparkling clean now? Well, cleaner. Do not go in the Hudson. Yankee, these are definitely the guys I bought at the power station. Okay, I get the bank heist and the power station, but why mess with the beast? Let's find out. Who's there? Keep an eye out! Back up! This is a mistake! You gotta turn on the pump. Hey, clean up the rivers guy. Pump's pressure is in the red. Looks like they messed with the valves. You'll have to reset them individually before you can turn on the pump. Did you hear those guys? Their boss wants to run crime in Harlem. Drugs, protection. Ugh, can't people just visit for the food at museums and not make a mess? Non-Spider-Man related questions. 
Have you started Jane Eyre for Miss Mallard's class? I haven't done any home. Hang on a sec. Found a valve. This one's got a pressure meter. Probably means it's old. Mm. Oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap. Ah, I gotta web it. One valve down, two to go. I'm back. We were talking about winter break reading. It's wild. I just finished this wedding scene. Oh, can't put it down. Are you reading right now? I thought you were helpful. Hold that thought. Behind. Crash. Cool. Oh, oh, so cold. Cold, cold, cold. That's two. One more, and I can turn the water back on. Hey, sorry. Assign reading. Go. Uh, yep, nope, I I'm here. You have my undivided attention. As soon as I finish this chapter. Five minutes. Oh. Oh, come on, kids! Hey, guys! You want to tell me who your boss is? No? Okay, fine. <laughs> Now for the pressure valve. It should be fixed. I need to turn on the water at the pump station. Hey, Genki. Can you call the city? Get him to send someone to Feast North and declare it uncondemned. One official sounding call from a high school student pretending to be an adult. Coming up. Turn up the goon squad. Need to get rid of these guys. Good night. Actually, Easier than I thought. Hey, man. I just overheard. Their boss is in the raft. Oh, whoa. Right side? Maybe we can cut off however he's communicating with people on the outside. I'll look into it. Now we gotta turn on the water. Water coming on. Now. Great timing. City inspector just got the feast. Should be able to reopen soon. Cool. I'm gonna head there. Make sure Gloria's got everything she needs. So, reasons for the boss of this whole shady operation to go after feast. One, the land it's on, prime real estate. Two, having a shelter in Harlem reduces crime, like, a lot. And if he wants to be a crime boss, he actually needs crime to boss around. Exactly. But we stopped him. Go team! Hey there. Oh, Spider-Man. Hi. Always happy to meet one of you guys. Oh, uh, <clears throat> Yeah, listen, I was fixing the water system, and I noticed your shelter was affected. Should be fixed now, though. That was you? Inspector just came by, said we're good to open. Everyone can go inside. Oh, Spider-Man, you've got perfect timing. Don't know how much longer we would have held out. Thank you. Hey, Gloria, it's Miles. I heard Feast North is open again. We had a little help. Spider-Man, if you can believe it. Thanks for stopping by. People in the park said you helped a lot. Happy to. Now get back to your winter break. We'll see you when school starts back up. All right. Bye. Hey, I've been talking to a local street artist named Haley. She has a lead on where this whole bad guy Harlem takeover operation is set up. That's awesome. Where can I find her? She's super busy helping plan the King's Day Parade, but I'll post in the app as soon as she's free. Oh, you met her. Before the rally, remember? Street artist, uses sign language. Oh, yeah. She's cool. I'll look out for your post. Cool. Talk later. I gotta call you back. Oh. Hi, Miles. Spill it. Give me the whole situation. Then, 
Roxxon, Underground. It's just a lot, you know? You're 17. You're stressed. And you're a superhero. You gotta cut yourself some slack. You still making beats? Not much since I started this. Work-life balance, kid. Most important thing. Here. Little project your dad and I started back in the day. Our mixtape. Had rhymes ready and everything. How come I never heard about this? Because we never finished. We sampled street noise around the way. Wanted the city to be our beat. But your dad had the masters. And after things went bad between us... <sighs> but you can finish what we couldn't. Plus, it'll take your mind off work. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What do I do? Load that up. I'll walk you through it. I set up holograms to guide you. Scan the source. Holograms, huh? You still in my moves? <laughs> this was in my playbook before. Okay, don't think about Finn. Focus on sounds. Clear my head. Scan the holograms and it'll unlock files on that drive I gave you. Help you figure out which sound you're looking for. There you go. Yeah, 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 that's it. Rest of the sounds you need are spread across the city. I left a few messages for you, too, to help you get a feel for each location. Oh, dope. Hmm. Not now. Hey, get some you like? <laughs> yeah, really unique dynamics. See? Old man still knows his stuff. <laughs> and you were right about clearing my head, too. I know what to do about Finn. I gotta see her. Try to talk her out of all this. In person? Where? Trinity Church. Tomorrow night. Why so interested? Because you got a target on your back the size of Jersey. You don't have to protect me. Someone should. <sighs> you know... You said you never finished this tape because of how things went bad between you and Dad. What actually happened between you two? It was... complicated. We were too similar, and too different. <sighs> Finish the tape, get all the samples, and you'll hear the whole story. Promise. Alright, thanks, Unc. Trinity Church. Remember, Tinker is yours. But leave the boy alone. Man, I needed that. I was beat. Okay. I'm gonna call Finn, as soon as I'm ready to go. Mom? Genki? Anyone home? I think it's just me. Hard to think of Ma as a little kid. A little music would be nice. Never gonna get tired of this one. I've got the blues. I feel so lonely. Kinda I nice to have the apartment to myself. If I could Bridge attack didn't slow mom down at all. I'm not careful. Genki's gonna turn into mom's sidekick. Who 
Who doesn't love an ohm meter? Nobody. That's who. <laughs> she can always request it in the app. Uh, Genki said you could help me find the guys messing with Harlem? You followed them? It's dangerous. And brave. Uh, I'll, I'll go there. Try to shut them down. find our criminal friends set up. Hoping I could shut down however they're communicating with their boss. I'll check nearby cell phone towers. Do some network surveillance. See if I can figure it out so we can cut the connection. Yo, call you when I'm there. Genki, guys are definitely set up here. Gonna clear them out. See if I can shut down this whole operation. Happy punching, Spider-Man. I think I heard something. Guys, we got a man down! Okay, now to get inside. Gotta be a way inside. Huh. That gear should lift the door. Not what I expected. There's gotta be more here. Footprints. That vanish. Okay. Big ol' do not push button. I'm gonna push it. Whoa. Hey, pulled network data. Webcam calls to the raft are definitely coming from here. So cut the network connection, brick the computer, no more boss giving them orders. Exactly. The underground basement hideout where they planned all their takedown Harlem schemes. Cool, cool, cool. Even without pulling off the bank heist, their boss is loaded. These guys really don't care who gets hurt. As long as their boss gets what he wants. Can you help me run a hybrid attack? Sure. But first try V-A-N-E-S-S-A. -S -S Vanessa? If this setup belongs to who I think it does... What is this? Who are you? Oh, crap. Fisk. A child playing dress-up, pretending to be Spider-Man. I can sever the connection from here. Just keep him talking. Fisk. I stop what you're doing in Harlem. You're done in my neighborhood. Your neighborhood? How touching. You'll learn that when you cross me, the people you want to protect are the ones who suffer. What did that mean? <sighs> I don't know. But we have to find out. Ugh. Someone invested in a zoom lens. Fisk wants to find me. This is why Pete's always telling me to keep the mask on. I think I'll take this off their hands.
Feast North, Caleb's Barbershop, the power plant, everywhere they've targeted. Money, land, control. Fisk wants everything. I should head back to the park. Tell Haley I took care of these guys. Yeah. Miles, Haley texted me. Fisk's guys are attacking CJ Walker Park. I thought I took them out. Some were scattered around the neighborhood. You gotta hurry, man. They're going after people at the party. Tell Haley I'm on my way. Stayed away from my neighborhood! What was that? For you. Spider Man! my home too. I doubt that. Bye, Haley. Hope to see you again. Done in Harlem, thanks to us. And don't say no mile thanks to you. <laughs> okay, you're right. We did it together. <sighs> How's it feel to be Harlem's friendly neighborhood Spider-Man? Not gonna lie, pretty good. Oh, almost forgot to tell you. Danica Hart heard what we've been up to. She wants me to come on her show. That's awesome. You nervous? What? Nervous? No, I mean, oh crap, what should I wear? I don't think it matters, since it's a podcast. I mean, well, what if she can hear that I'm wearing sweatpants? What if she wants to hop on webcam? Oh my god, I, I, I gotta get ready. Uh, bye. Look out! All right, time to call Finn. Hope she answers. Hi, Spider-Man. Finn, hey, we need to talk. In person. So you can lie to me again? so I can make this right. Please, meet me at Trinity Church. No more lies, I promise. If you're screwing with me, fine. I'll see you there. At least she's willing to meet. Okay, Trinity Church, let's go. That was a hell of a way to tell me you're Spider-Man. What if I'd killed you? You want me to feel bad because you almost killed me? I want you to stop lying to me. I let you in the underground because I thought you understood. I do understand. What Krieger did to Rick? Roxxon needs to pay. Not like this. This is the only way I can beat him. I need you to look the other way. Please. I can't. I made a promise. So did I. 
Why'd you pick here? My dad brought us. To that concert. Seven choirs from seven countries. Remember? Ghana was my favorite. Ghana wasn't there. You're thinking of Guinea. No, no. I'm pretty sure it was Ghana. Guinea, Belize, Poland, Cuba. South Korea, Thailand, Venezuela. You're right. I usually am. Usually. <laughs> what? she was going to be a handful. But you. I guess I was hoping that you and me would see eye to eye. Where are we? <sighs> You're behind the curtain, bud. <laughs> this is our most secure facility. And here the sausage gets made. You're a real prick. You know that? <laughs> you know, when... Her brother and I were developing new form. All you did was put your name on the patent. He said the only thing you knew how to do was sell other people's ideas. You know, at least I still got a pulse, babe. But let's not dwell, right? The first thing we're gonna do is I'm going to... <clears throat> Wow. <laughs> that is awesome. Are those involuntary defenses? Oh man, that's hot. You see, I'm gonna get that mask off you. And I'm gonna find out what makes you tick. Because you just smell like next level bioengineering. And you know what that smells like to me, kid? <laughs> that smells like money. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna hit the gym. Leg day, can't skip it. Get her to tell us where my new form is. <laughs> can't really open the plaza without it. Oh, and uh, use him. Time to finish what we started on the bridge. <laughs> no cameras now. <laughs> 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 Whoa. Are you okay? They were gonna kill you. Holy shit. Tougher than I look, huh? <laughs> Let's find a way out of here. Roxon kept Rhino instead of giving him to the police. It's crazy. Nothing about Roxon surprises me anymore. You okay? I will be, once we're out. I'm shutting off security cams. Can you check that computer? We need to get a good look at the base, so we can make a plan. What did you find? There's the exit, through this office. We have to lift the base lock down first, from the control room. First, we need to escape the security wing. I'll go down to the floor, see what we're dealing with.
door is locked. Venom worked in the cell. Should work on the door. Hello. It's unlocked. I'm headed to the floor. Right above you. That security door is our way out, but I'll have to hack a few terminals to disable the alarm. I'll handle the security goons. Security cameras are down in the south wing. Rhino probably turned them off. Oh! Lights out for you. There's two more ahead. Did you find those two? Did Rhino track them? No, he's on patrol. Hang on, I heard something. Oh! Another one man bites man the down. dust. Way's clear. Ordering another sweep. Ben, we gotta talk. Blowing up the plaza is a bad idea. So is poisoning the city with an unsafe fuel source. Yeah, but there has to be a better way to deal with rock salt. Sometimes strategies are imperfect, like deciding to lie to your friends. Let's just focus on getting out. Fine, but we're gonna talk about this. Huh? Heard something Okay, I'm shorting the magma. I need you to trigger the override back there. On it. Okay, really. Why Tinkerer? It's a nickname from Rick. When he was teaching me to repair stuff in the shop, he'd call me the little Tinkerer. I don't know. Makes me think of him. I never heard that story. I like it. Looks like a voice memo from Krieger. I liked Rick Mason, I did, but... Bleeding hearts don't survive this business. Maybe we should set up a plaque in his memory or... Uh, oh, oh, uh, name a bench after him. <laughs> yeah, I bet he'd love that. Simon Krieger. Bastion of compassion. More info on Rhino. I know he says he wants out of that suit, but let's face it, the metal onesie is the only reason anyone gives a damn about him. Just upgrade his armor. If we help him smash Kid Spider, he'll forget all about wanting out. There's nobody this guy won't manipulate. Hey, Roxxon's stealing your stuff. From what I hear, you are too. Thanks for that, by the way. Notes about Roxxon independent contractors. We need an outside partner to track Tinker and Spider-Man for us. Tombstone's off the grid. Black Cat's gone straight-ish. What about the guy in the purple? What did he go by? What was his name? Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he'll do. Guy in purple? That can't be. No, no way. Triggering the override. There's a voice memo on here. Sir, the police are asking about Rhino. What do we tell them? Our man at the Rav is setting up a special work release program. Tell the police Rhino's doing the little community service. Can't believe they got away with this. Door's unlocked, but I need you to force it open. Can do. You know if we work together, we could do a lot of good for New York. Yeah, but only if we figured out how to trust each other. was only supposed to grab the girl. <sighs> yeah, he didn't like that. Here's the deal, bud. Spider-Man's the best leverage I got against Miss Mason. I mean, you caught them together. Well, I mean, you caught them, but it was thanks to your intel. So, clearly there's something going on there. <laughs> you agreed to leave the kid alone. Uncle Aaron? Ah, the kid. I love how you say that. It's just so paternal. Let Spider-Man go, and I'll get you new. Feed you underground intel, whatever you want. 
See? Leverage. Works every time. My Spider-Man. Here's leverage for you. I've seen things. New form making people sick. What you did to Rick Mason. If I went public. Yeah, but you won't. Here's the deal. You're a wanted thief. Plus all the jobs we've done together. But you'd be in the cell right next to mine. And we both know you're a little too self-serving for that. So we're gonna head in and check on Miss Mason and Spider-Man. Uh, but it's kind of an invite-only party. Yeah. Bye. Roxxon, but I didn't think he'd... he sell me out. I can't believe this. You led me into a trap. Why do I keep listening to you? Then no. There has to be an explanation. I didn't know this would happen. Just... save it. Let's keep you Yeah, sure. They initiated a lockdown. That's the control room we have to get into. So we need past those security shutters. Got a maintenance panel here, but it needs power. Let me see what I can do. Gotta be attached to a generator. <laughs> there! We've got power. Accessing... Uh, I can't hotwire the shutters, but I can move machinery. Like that crane. Maybe we can use that. I'll look around. They built engines for their APCs in here. Hey, Crane's over this engine thing now. Engine thing. I've got an idea. Can we move the crane back to the assembly line? Yeah, I think I know where you're headed. Okay, this laser should activate the engine. Oh crap, laser shorted out. I think I can reroute power. You're good. Use a laser. One laser coming up. Perfect. If I overcharge the engine, it'll be explosive. And explosive is just what we need to destroy those shutters. Time to make it explosive. Get down! Let's go. Almost out. That's our way out. Give me a few minutes to get it open. Looks like they guessed our plan. Not hard. There's only one exit. All right. I'll take care of those guards. You get that door open. Ugh, one thing. Did you ever think about calling me to tell me you were Spider-Man? You know... After my parents died, Rick basically had to become my dad. I thought I'd miss having a brother, but I had you. Finn, I... Get this door open! That won't hold forever! Go! I'll be fine, just go! Those guys with the lights on their helmets can spot heat signatures. They'll see you if you try to go invisible. Wonder how much of their R&D department is dedicated to fighting us. Probably millions of dollars in untaxed money. You clear the floor, I'll work on overriding security so we can get out. I can still access machinery if you need me to move anything. Those webs are holding the door. Whole base is on alert, though, so be careful. Listen, I know you don't trust me. You're right, I don't. 
What can I do to change that? Stop going behind my back. And stop acting like I haven't thought this through. No one will get hurt when I take down the plaza. No one except Roxxon. You know they deserve it. Just promise to talk it through with me, okay? I promise to listen. Really listen. I've made up my mind. They know you're here. They're calling reinforcements. Guess I'm doing this the loud way. Get through. Meet me in the showroom on the far side of the assembly line. See you there! Coming? Looks like they locked the doors. I'll find another way. Do you have proof? Because I don't think the word of two vigilantes is gonna convince people. There's gotta be a way. I think that's the exit. Hey. Lost and found. Thanks. I know this place. This is Krieger's lab. Krieger has a lab? Mostly for show, but yeah. Rick showed me a photo once. Krieger's lab? Wait. All the current New Front Project data is on here. Toxicity reports, failed safety reviews, and Krieger's name's on everything. This would destroy Roxxon. You like my new color? Immune to your little zappy pops. Zappy pops? Come on, man. Now, we finish this! Sure, he doesn't do anything. I'll be right back. Krieger's Dado shut Roxxon down the right way. You know, Krieger told me how your brother died. <laughs> Very amusing. <laughs> shut up. <laughs> he also told me. 
It was your fault. <laughs> Krieger updated the reactor. Tried to supercharge it to make his deadline. If Thing goes through with her plan... Oh my god. Harlan... You ought to die. Grab a washcloth. Some antibiotics. Miles? Where have you been okay, Passo? What are you wearing? I have to tell you something. Finn's attacking the plaza. Yeah. So that was you chasing her through the city. As Spider-Man. You could have died. No lo puedo creer. Why didn't you tell me about any of this? All those talks we had? How to keep yourself safe? But this... <laughs> I didn't want you to worry. And the other Spider-Man's gone. I just keep making things worse and worse. And I'll screw up things with you. Miles. There is nothing you could ever do or ever be that would make me stop loving you. Nada. You give me strength, Miles. That's all a hero really is. Someone who's brave for the people they love. Just a guy who doesn't give up. Gloria's handling feast, and Teo's gonna help us go door to door. Perfect. Let's get this evacuation started. I'll meet you outside. You remind me more of your father every day. Mm. You stay safe. Well. Hey, I'm telling people in Harlem they need to evacuate before me and your mom go door to door. Okay, cool. I... I wanted to say thanks for always having my back, man. Hey, I could use your help before you go. You got it. I want to cross-reference underground activity with buildings that could store a new form. Maybe you could hack Oscorp surveillance towers or... I'm in. It'll take a while to narrow down. That's all right. Thanks, man. Gonna stretch my legs a little, then head out. Gonna take some time to work on music when this is all over. Your mom texted. She's working on this building, then heading down the block to evacuate people closer to the plaza first. You still gonna help? Totally. As soon as I find Finn's latest new form set up. What do you think I should say to Finn when I find her? I don't know, man. Get the new form from her. 
Then you can offer the olive branch. Yeah, hope it goes better this time. You think you have enough time to get people out of Harlem? Depends how long it takes Finn to finish making the new form explosive. You're right. I should get moving. Genki tracks down Finn. I should check the app. See if people need help. Hey, I found Finn's setup. The Oscorp Science Center. It's closed for renovations. Oh my... Our energy converter! That won the middle school science fair! That's how she's gonna finish making the new form unstable enough to blow up Roxxon Plaza. Whoa. It's like she picked it to get back at you. Maybe she did. <sighs> Thanks, Genki. It's my job. Speaking of, time to help your mom evacuate Harlem. Later. Okay. Oscorp Science Center. Finn needs to know what'll happen if she goes through with her plan. And if she won't listen, I'll take the new form. Destroy it if I have to. You ever need my help again? Sorry about this, nephew. Can't let you go back out there. Let Krieger and the Tinkerer kill each other. Go back to being Spider-Man when the heat dies down. And what? Just hide down here? I don't get to pick and choose when I'm Spider-Man. I gotta stop Finn. No, you gotta survive. I've been trying to teach you that, but you don't listen. You want me to survive so bad? Why sell me out to Krieger? Wasn't a sellout. <sighs> yeah. I'm serious. You were never supposed to get caught. Krieger broke our deal. You want it back in the family. And that's the best you could do? I saved your life! You threw me in a cell! To protect you! Like this is protecting me? Damn it, Miles! I'm not gonna lose you, too! And I'm not gonna let people die just to save my skin. You underestimated me. Damn it, no! Don't fight me on this! I don't want to, but I can't stay down here. And I'll do what I have to do. Keep you safe. This cloaking tech. I need to short it. This isn't about me at all. It's about you. You're great. Don't you turn this on me. When are you gonna understand that I have to fight for this city? When are you gonna understand you can't do that if you're dead? You don't realize I'm the only one trying to save you. And I'm trying to save everyone else. Don't say his name! <laughs> <laughs> 
You want your mom to bury you too? I won't let you. Hologram? More tech from your bloody guy, Rockstar? I attack. You can't keep up. You're naive, nephew. Still the kids looking up the spike. No. I'm the kid who knows people are looking up to me. You're never gonna accept me as Spider-Man. The risk I gotta take? You're right. I'm done letting my family die trying to play hero. How far will you take this? You're gonna kill yourself proving you deserve that mask? If that's what it takes. I know I messed up. I let you down. We're family. Family? That didn't stop you from lying to me, manipulating me, fighting me? Being family isn't enough anymore. Doesn't have to be like this. You, me, hating each other? That's how it happened between me and your dad. I don't want to repeat that. I don't either. But I can't be the person you want to turn me into. I can't turn my back when people need me. I have to be better than that. Genki, my uncle just kidnapped me. Locked me up. What? Dude, are you okay? I had to fight him. Then I said, I, I told him, we're done. We're good. I'm sorry. That's... That can't have been easy. It's what I had to do. I'm headed to the science center. Call me if things get bad in Harlem. I will. Good luck, Spider-Man. The impulse renovation and the underground moves right in. Finn's gotta be inside. Finn, you here? Exhibit was down that hall. Winning the science fair, getting to show off our converter here. We were so proud. <sighs> Finn, come on. We need to finish this. You and me. got to be with our project down that hall <laughs> Come on molasses I want to see our project while we're still young. Where tomorrow's innovation is today's reality. I'm coming, I'm coming. Hey, where'd they put us? I've got the museum map on my phone. Our project's in a special exhibit on the top floor. 
Can't wait to see our names on the little sign, like real scientists. Today, Oscorp Science Center. Tomorrow, every major museum in the world. Didn't you just the Housing homes are the key to sustainable, healthy living beneath the sea. Commercial and industrial algae cultivation is already used in a number of products, from colorants to pharmaceuticals. I wonder what algae tastes like. Probably kale. Ugh, I hate kale. This model combines the design of a submarine with the deep-sea integrity of an unmanned underwater vehicle. Oscorp's prototype would unlock new possibilities in humanity's ability to explore. <laughs> you and I gotta get one of these. Bet we could build one out of a vacuum cleaner and some old tires if we put our minds to it. Think underwater living sounds like science fiction? Think again. Underwater habitats have been used around the world since the 1960s. This model proposes a permanent residence beneath the waves. Today, New Yorkers are building up to save space. Tomorrow, we could be building beneath the sea. Pass. What, you scared? Of sharks, the dark, tiny enclosed spaces? It's a no for me. Since the mid-20th century, scientists have envisioned human habitation beneath the sea. Looking out your window, someday you might see the brightly striped clownfish, or even the menacing anglerfish. I'm naming that one Howard. You name one. Uh, Leviathan. Love it! The Earth is bigger than you think. 95% of the Earth's oceans remain unexplored and could be the next frontier in human habitation. It's weird to think how little we know about our own planet. Thanks for bringing me. I've never been here before. Gotta love that student discount. What do you think? This dive suit is one of the first developed in the early 18th century. The first pressure-proof diving suit was developed with salvage work in mind. Today's suits such as these are used by salvage workers, scientists, and explorers. Think they'll let me try it on? Would love to see you try to walk around in that thing. Can't be worse than those shoes you wore to the spring dance. Oh, come on. Yours were at least an inch higher than mine. Let's go to the main hall. Special exhibits upstairs. There's the elevator. We've got time to look around first. Did you call the elevator? He's gonna meet us at the restaurant. Since the subway's backed up all the way to come. Using a shape memory alloy, or memory metal, Oscorp scientists created this prototype of a metal that could change its shape while maintaining integrity. One day, memory metal could be used in many types of machinery, and even in your own home. Whoa, check it out! Metal that changes shape. I like the idea, but it looks kind of basic. Bet it could be improved. This model proposes a terraforming and housing initiative on Mars, our closest neighbor it's in like the solar system. like a whole community on Mars. This community it's is designed coffee shops. to draw on abundant and street art. and counteract low temperatures, making human life possible on the Red Planet. Architectural innovations are the key to human survival on extraterrestrial planets. This model home would protect human inhabitants from the low temperatures on Mars. Check it out. You want a house on Mars? Sure. If I could bring my mics, audio setup, sampler. They won't let you take all that. They will if they want good music on Mars. Gotta play. Oh, come on, it's just button mashing. So you admit defeat? Never. Oh, faster! Come on, rocket buddy! Go, 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 This Oscorp rover 
Adapted to models currently used on the moon, can be operated as a man. Scans for minerals, carries people across to toxic wastelands. What can't it do? Can you imagine driving this thing down, bitch? Move, pedestrians. <laughs> Portable shiny. You could. Only if my family came to. I would. One in five. Chance to start over. Make a name for themselves. Government and privately owned spacecraft explore our planet, solar system, and galaxy. To communicate with them, scientists use radio antennas to send and receive messages across local and interstellar space. <sighs> I bet the sound quality on these are dope. Not from space. Do you have tickets for the special exhibit? Oh, um, our project is on display. Didn't think we needed tickets. You do, and we're sold out. Can't let you go upstairs. Thanks anyway. So we need another way in. She said there's no more tickets. Right, but see that door? The hallway behind it wraps around to the elevator. Can't just break in. We have to. They're taking down the exhibit tomorrow, and then we'll never see it. Locked. I recognize that kind of lock. If you shine a light at it, it'll open. The flashlights on our phones would work, but they won't reach. They will if we find a way to slide something reflective under the door. Something reflective. It'd be nice to find something mutable. Mutable? You mean change its shape? Look at you breaking out the fancy vocab. <laughs> Shut up. Solar mirrors. And sticky on the back. Perfect for tricking a light sensitive lock. Now we need something we could slide under the door. That's cool. Something long and flat. Something that can be both. Shape memory alloy. I could change the shape on the museum app. This stuff is crazy. Think it's a meta material? That's it. Take it. Don't let anyone see. Got it. Let's go. Whoa, oh, man. Oh. Sorry. All good. I'll attach the sticker. Let's get that door open. Look how the external tools interface directly. This is either genius or really, really stupid. If we open our own research lab someday, that's what I'm naming it. Genius or really, really stupid. For all your R&D needs. I've got the light. Tell me when the sticker's pointed at the sensor, and I'll turn it on. No one's looking at us yet. Gotta hurry. We gotta try again. We need something else. That worked! We did it! Come on! Our project awaits. That was awesome. I'm gonna miss doing stuff like this with you. What are you talking about? Uh, hello. You'll be at Brooklyn Visions next week. I won't. I'm not gonna vanish off the planet. We'll still hang out. You'll be busy. 
Not that busy. I'm gonna make time for us. Seriously. Okay. Ugh, this is getting mushy. Come on, let's head upstairs. Hey, Dad. Hey, Miles. Hi, Mr. Davis. Finn says hi. You kids having fun? Make sure you get a picture of your project. Dad, it's not a big deal. It's totally a big deal. Okay, okay, we'll get a picture. Love you, Dad. Bye. This is it. Our project's in the back. Think they got a converter all hooked up? Otherwise, what's the point? They'll need to feed biomass in, though. Maybe hook it up to a trash can. The Oscorp Science Station, positioned at one of two stable Lagrange points between Earth and the Moon, could one day be a permanent. Man, home it'd be so cool to live on a space station. Explorers. future as we explore interstellar space. Fuel efficiency and transportation will be vital components in reaching and settling planets at the far reaches of our solar system and beyond. Oscorp nuclear reactor. Rick's working on something that's supposed to make nuclear energy obsolete. Do we get to know what it is? Nope. Roxxon's keeping it super secret. Cultivating agriculture in nutrient-enriched fluids. Wonder what if they can grow flowers in space. They're probably more space interested in food. Why? You trying to impress someone? I like to be prepared. In case I get a crush on a cute astronaut. <laughs> okay. One of humanity's greatest accomplishments came from the Apollo space program. We reached the moon. Since then, scientists have dreamed of traveling beyond, and someday, Settling our solar system. Lunar module from the Apollo program. Hey, we can name our time capsule after that. How many Apollo missions were there? 16... 17, I think. Apollo 18. I like it. Our project. Oh, ho, ho, wee! Would you look at that? Genuine award-winning scientists. No one told us we were in the special exhibit. Ticket only. How'd you get in? Uh, I bought a ticket. How'd you get in? Not important. <laughs> hey, huddle up. We need a picture. You gotta be in it too. You helped us get it working. Okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. Scoot over. All right. Say alleles. I am not saying that. Finn, you need to know. I'm done listening to you.
forth in the barbershop look okay. But I need to push the fighting away from here. Camila! Are you with Caleb? Are you okay? We're with Gloria, my kid. This is bad. This is the crisis all over again. You won't get that far. I won't let it. Keep your heads down till I secure the street. Gloria! You safe? It's beast clear. Yeah, everyone made it out. Sounds like you did it. Where are you, Miles? I'm near 125th. Looking for my mom. Where is new Spider-Man on the keys? He'll protect them. You protect yourself, okay? Get out of there. Okay. Yeah, I'll leave it to him. Stay safe, Gloria. You too, kid. Please don't burn down. Miles, Get lost in the you blizzard. Hear me? We need to head toward the gunfire. Hiding in Tails Bodega. We took really bad. You gotta get to the They're in Tails Bodega. I'm close, but I need to take care of Rock Sun and the Underground before the streets are safe. Out of here, but I can only carry some of you. Oh, she started already. Spider Man sighted. Get out of here, young blood. You've got more important things to do. He's right. Go. We'll get people clear. I'll be back. I know. Okay, people! Check every door! We don't leave anyone behind! You don't know what you're doing. They deserve what's coming to them. No, the reactor. Krieger changed the specs. You're not just going to destroy Roxxon Plaza. You're going to vaporize all of Harlem. I'm not going to let you lie to me again. <laughs> You're too late. I'm telling you. 
you the truth. Not the first. I shouldn't have lied to you about getting into the underground. If I could go back, you can't. I don't want to fight. We'll talk. After I disable the reactor.
Get them far away. I can't hold this in much longer. Get out of here, kid. We'll take care of them. Did you see his face? You did good, Spider-Man. Thanks. Who is he? That guy? <sighs> He's our Spider-Man. are clearly deep fakes. They're deep fakes. You understand me? Do you have any idea who I am? I will own you. Yeah, will... yeah, we know Ow! who you are. I'll own you. Do you hear me? That's right, friends. Simon Krieger is in prison. Aaron Davis, aka the Prowler, flipped on him and Roxanne. Davis will serve time, but could get a reduced sentence. I think we can all learn something from what happened in Harlem. Together, we're stronger. And that having your own neighborhood Spider-Man is pretty great. Looking good, Haley. Can't get over that suit. So cool. You gotta be me. Yeah, you do. Pete, does this job ever get easier? Some of it, yeah. Some things never get easier, though. 
Roxon did this uptown because they saw us as disposable. Me, Rick, Finn, all of Harlem. But I think part of our job is making sure they can't get away with it. We'll add it to the Spider-Man oath. Go time? Go time. uprising of the group known as the Underground. While the Roxxon Corporation deals with a rash of lawsuits, newly elected city councilwoman Rio Morales addressed the media yesterday to make a plea for additional public funds to assist with the... Vitals are good, circulatory system healthy, um, brain activity normal. He's been in there long enough. Mr. Osborne, I understand he's your son, but his I disease want him could... Cut. But we may be underestimating the potential danger. I said, get him out now. I'm working on a college application, and it says I gotta tell them about myself. More like sell yourself. That's the worst. You got any advice? Well, take me. Hi, I'm Peter Parker. I'm 25 years old, I have a bachelor's degree in biophysics, and I'm in love with the greatest woman ever. <laughs> Humble brag. Who is the best journalist in this city? Word. Go, MJ. I try to live up to the example set by the other greatest woman ever, my Aunt May. Humble brag again. Damn. And a while back, I was bitten by a radioactive spider and got superpowers. I, I can't put that in my essay. Hey, I'm laying the track as I drive the train. <clears throat> I've used my powers to help the city and stop a lot of people who wanted to hurt it. Like my mentor, Dr. Otto Octavius. His lab got shut down by an old colleague, Norman Osborne. Otto retaliated by releasing a bioweapon. In the end, I managed to stop Otto. But not without great cost. That was pretty good. But I'm no Peter Parker. Exactly. You're Miles Morales. You're 17 years old and a student at Brooklyn Visions Academy. What else? I guess I <clears throat> help out with my mom's work in Harlem every now and then. Uh, she's Councilwoman Rio Morales. And there is a girl I like who's spectacular and inspiring. And I think he's one of the best artists in the city. And I also got bitten by a radioactive spider that gave me superpowers. I learned how to be a Spider-Man from the OG. But I learned how to be a hero from my dad. He was killed by Martin Lee in the City Hall bombing. The good I try to do every day is the good my dad planted in me. But it's been hard. Even with superpowers, sometimes we can't save the people we love. No matter how hard we try. A hero is someone who doesn't give up, though. And I don't plan to. I don't know, man. I can't talk about me without talking about Spider-Man. Sure you can. You just have to... Uh... Yeah, why don't you just start another draft? Me something. 
Anything. If this doesn't work, take me out. It'll work. I don't have a lot of time left. I want a chance to say goodbye. I'm not going to lose you. I will never let you go. Have a bell for a reason? Take your seats. I'm here! Good morning, class. We have a new teacher joining us today. Hi. My name's Pete, my, my, my Mr. Mr. Parker, uh, and we are all very lucky today because this is physics class, and physics is awesome. <coughs> Ever wonder how some insects and uh, birds and reptiles can just run right across a pond? Two words, surface tension. Bathroom. OK. Now, surface tension is all about cohesion. Hmm? Okay. Now, in equation form, surface tension, gamma, can be calculated as the force exerted parallel to the surface of a liquid. F divided by the length, L, of the line over which the force acts. Can anybody? Uh, I, I, I need your help. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Mr. Morales, is it? Uh, are you sure this isn't something you can handle yourself? I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> okay, class, uh, read chapter four or five or whatever. Miles, I need this job. If the principal comes back and sees I'm gone, I'm gonna get fired. I know, but you gotta see this. Day. I'm so getting fired. Principal Evans already hates me for being late this morning. Bro, I told you to be on time. It's fine. We'll be back before we know it. Good, because I have my college application review with the school counselor. Oh, you finished your essay? I haven't started. Oh, well, let's get to the city and take care of Marco quick then. Hey, MJ. Hey, guys. You might want to get downtown fast. Swing it through Brooklyn. Jameson have you on the ground for the bugle? I still can't believe old Triple J is your new boss. <laughs> really loving the new regime. You'll whip him into shape in no time. So, what's up with Marco? It's been years since our last showdown. According to witnesses, he was running down Broadway yelling nonsense. They say he seemed angry and paranoid, delusional. He just exploded. Man, hopefully we can calm him down. I've seen people lose control like this. Be careful. Good thing there too, Spider-Man now. Good luck. Thanks, MJ. Might need the new tech we've been cooking up too. No way. They're untested. Barely prototypes. But you brought them, right? No comment. I think 
we found him! Marco! MJ wasn't kidding. We gotta help him before he hurts someone. Or himself. What's the plan? Keep him busy. I got an idea. Oh, crap. Still angry after all these years, Marco? You should try yoga. Must be more of a Pilates guy. That was your idea? Never said it was a good one. It was supposed to be a normal day. Teach physics, have awkward conversations in the teacher's lounge. Everything's gonna be okay! Gotcha. Spider-Man! Think you can sign for this delivery? It's coming in hot! I'm there! Mini Marcos? I wish I could do that. Set Mr. Air stick down. Not before he barked on my suit. He's not the only one. Sandman just puked out some new friends. What the? He can do that? Apparently. I need you now. Mr. Parker? I'm sorry, who's this? Principal Evans. Of course! Principal All Evans! students have evacuated their classroom. Where are you? Uh... Mr. Parker! I just... I forgot! Something in my car! What was that? Nothing! I'm just... It worked? I mean, uh, I'm just running back right now! Get back here and supervise your students, or else. That does not sound good. Otto's old research really came through for these arms. Almost there. How are you holding up? Uh, Miles? Principal Evans called. Man, am I getting expelled? Hey, you're just cutting class. I abandoned students during a citywide emergency. Yeah, you're through. Zen Man! I always hated that name. I know you're angry at me! This has nothing to do with you. Leave me alone! I want to help you. But it's gonna hurt first. No! 
that easy. Dapper can't get to work his magic. Yankee, you there? Not. I know, man. But listen, we need a big water source by Wall Street. Well, let me check the grid. Stay safe, dude. You too, Mr. Parker. Will do. Wait, what? He knows? Yankee knows all. Plus, we were super weird in class earlier. I knew I never should have taught at a gifted school. What? Don't like your old face? Give him today's forecast, Spider-Man! 100% chance of rain! Got him right where we want him! Guys, the water tank on the Matheson building should do the trick. We're talking 10,000 gallons here. Got it! Thanks, Genki! <laughs> Should have stayed away, Spiders. Still think we got him right where we want him? I think that I may have spoken too soon. And he's definitely getting bigger. Keep climbing. We're so close. The water tank. Spider-Man? I just wanted to live normal. Like everyone else. This isn't the way, Marco. For a guy like me, there is no other way. This is getting out of hand! Pete! What happened? I ended up outside! Just keep going up, I'll meet you at the roof! This water tank's our only shot! Where are you, Pete? Get back here. Stay inside! I guess he's busy. It's gonna be a long day if we don't... Just make sand castles instead. Yeah! Ma, everything okay? I'm a thief. I know. You're on every channel. I'm heading downtown to help coordinate resources and supplies. Is Genki covering for you at school? He is. But I got this meeting with my counselor later. And the principal thinks Listen, that I'm... I can talk to your principal. But New York needs you right now. Coolest mom ever. And please, be careful. Like my said, can't let New York down. They're only making it worse for yourself, Marco! I don't care. I'd get into any college I wanted. Or Spider-Man would. Like, brainstorm later, Miles. Focus. How's it going, Spider-Man? Almost there. The water tank's ours! Actually, it's his now. Hey, sorry, what I miss? He's trying to eat me! Give him a drink instead! Did we do it? Nope. 
got the new toys. The suit's last software patch wasn't stable, but here goes nothing. <laughs> the web wings? They're flying, but we're not out of this yet. Marco's in Pier 4 Beach. What happens if he gets all that sand? I think he just did. I'm gonna need you ASAP, Miles. Yeah, I see him already. I'm right behind you. Myself into. You've got to calm down, Marco. Innocent people are in danger. I care about them, but not me. They wouldn't listen to Marco, but they can't ignore Sandman. It's gonna be okay. I haven't been okay for a long time. If you need help, all you have to do is ask. You're the ones who are gonna need help when they come for you.
grow slow in your old age, Sergei. A fate you will not share. I've been in your shadow for hours, but you sense nothing. Pathetic. for an equal. And this is what you find. Sir, perhaps a new hunting ground. Light the fires. The great hunt begins. Seeing this? Hold on a sec, Miles. I got it. You're gonna be safe. Yeah, same here. Hey, Genki? I know, I know. The whole city's telecom network is down. What's happening to the requests that are coming in? They'll all get queued, but... Wait. Uh, I'm gonna try a workaround. Work fast. <laughs> right before the app went down, I saw a request for help at Liberty and Broadway. It's headed there now. What a mess. Marco, what got into you? There they are. I've got you. Hold on. You okay? I am now. Thank you. Spider-Man! Chief needs your help! Well, one thing's for certain. We got more. Spider-Man, got a minute? Got a call with the precinct up ahead and the line cut out. We gotta get through to set up triage. On it, Chief. That did it. Uh, Mr. Parker, I need your help to get the app back online. What do you need? Get to the roof of the building on Worth and Lafayette. What's the plan? It's gonna be hours before the telecom network's back up, so we're gonna create our own network. That's a big job. How long have you been planning this? Well, dreaming about it since seventh grade, but planning, uh, for the last two minutes or so. There should be a launcher around there. What is all this stuff? environmental study by a new startup. The launchers for high-altitude weather sensors. And this startup gave us permission? Yes. I checked with the head guy. Super nice. Seemed excited about helping out Spider-Man. Okay. Tell me what to do. You still got that 3D printer built into your web shooters, right? I need you to build something real quick. Just sent you the blueprints. Got him. This looks like a drone. We don't spy on people, Genki. Oh, no, no, no. It's all opt-in. Just New Yorkers sending messages to the app, which gets routed through these drones, which I call Focused Relay Neighborhood Data Spots. F-R-N-D. Did I just make a friend? You did. <laughs> 
Seventh grade me was so wholesome. Okay, now, how do we get this thing airborne? There's a lot of competing signal traffic, so try to follow the path I marked on your visor. It'll give us a clearer signal. should be online. Let me notify the app users. Reports should start coming in any minute now. We did it! Back in business. Crime report just came in. Back it up! Let's go! We got plenty of time. Cops are busy with all this sand stuff. Well, let's clear this place out. Come on, load them up. Here! Smash him! Stealing weapons? Not on my watch! Who thinks this is a plan? Get ready for more pain! Whose idea was it to have a gun club in the city? I think I'm gonna start a petition. Replace all the gun clubs with something better! Like a compliment club! Compliments don't hurt anyone, and they're free! For example, you take a punch really well. Good job. Hey, I think I'm on to something. Less guns, more compliments. It's time to fight. That was a big crew, taking advantage while the city's covered in sand. Wish I knew what got into Marco. More of them coming. Let's give him a warm welcome, Spidey style. Get it out, way. Yeah, it's one of my superpowers. Hey guys, my app is still down. Uh, no, I'm trying to innovate here. Give me a minute. I'll call you back. Man, think he's mad at me? Stress masquerades as anger sometimes. Just keep looking for people to help. Now you sound like you're angry. I'm not angry, Miles. Just focus. That's what my mom always says when she's angry. Come on. You've known me for a long time. What have you ever seen me angry? Uh. I'm thinking. It was a rhetorical question. Got it. That one time we were playing a board game at your place and you kept losing. I wasn't angry at you. I was angry at the universe. Where'd they get you? app is compiling. I figured as long as we're at it, we might as well give it an upgrade. We don't need anything fancy. We just need to see citizen reports. Totally. While the patch is updating, we should widen the net. Let's check in with Miles. Over there. She was having trouble breathing. Miles, you busy? What do you need? Get to the roof of that building nearby. Yo, you sounded stressed earlier. You doing okay? Yeah, 
there's just a lot going on, and I'm hungry, and the vending machine only has those plain low sodium table crackers. Oh man, that sucks. I'll manage. Hey, so I'm finally doing that app upgrade I've been talking about with a little help from my friend. <laughs> that's that's a brilliant pun that doesn't make sense to you yet, but it will in a minute. Okay, I'm here. There should be a launcher somewhere around there. I don't see anything that looks like a launcher. Maybe it's under the sand? Okay, I see the launcher. Now what? You're gonna 3D print a friend. I get it now. F-R-N-D. Let me guess. Friendly Relay Network Drone. Close, but it doesn't really matter. What matters is that it uses spatial and temporal correlated signals. Over-the-air computation? You're a genius, Genki. No, oh, you. I marked a path for optimal network stability. If you stay in the path, we'll get a stronger signal. Network is connected. New crime report. I see it. On my way. Boy said Spider Man was at the gun club. We've gotta move before he gets here. <sighs> Hey, need a hand? Lost your keys? There's a locksmith up the street. All of you guys are for one armored car? Seems like overkill. What if instead of stealing you, I don't know, tried to help rescue people? You okay? See? I'm downtown helping Gloria at Feast. Have you met with Mr. Suja? Uh, no. Elihimo. Spider-Man isn't going to get you into college. I'll make it, Ma. I promise. Gotta run. Enough of this. Bring in the big guns. Big guns? work new requests just came in Yankee nice work on the app this will help a lot of people thanks miles let's hit these last requests and get back to school Crystal? I'll check it out.
Is there a sand crystal thingy near you? Yes! Okay. The doctors say Marco's mind is broken. Literally shattered into pieces. Freaky! So why are these sand dudes attacking me? Probably bits of his subconscious trying to protect whatever's in that crystal. But listen, if you can find all the pieces, they say you might be able to make him whole again. Being a sand person sounds complicated! <laughs> Okay, Marco. What was your subconscious protecting? One minute I was with you, and the next, you were gone. A talking crystal? Okay. Seems like it holds a part of Marco's memory. MJ said that there were more crystals scattered around the city. Gotta keep an eye out. Hey, you wanna grab that last request? Looks like some VIP stuck in a limo. On it. Genki! Is Mrs. Sumita still there? Yeah. He's with Haley right now. She's trying to stall him for you. Nice. Hopefully he's gonna tell me how to write my college essay. You're not done with that yet? You know, since I already got into ESU, I can help you. Nah, you do too much already. Plus, if you help me get into college, you never shut up about it. Yeah, that's true. Hey, stay away from that limo. It's the spider, get him! Well, paparazzi's bad enough. The paparazzi was done? Why try when you've already lost? Y'all are the worst, you know that? Why can't we all just let people be people? Let's check on that person in the limo. Gotta come see who the VIP in the limo was. I shudder in anticipation. Sealing a hydrant, then I'm on my way. Mr. Jameson, it's Spider-Man. Are you with me? Flying in. On your left. Hey, Spider-Man. Look who it is. What? Uh, where am I? Spider-Man! Jonah, my sunshine. You okay? Uh, help! I'm good! I'm good! What? No! I, I, I'm helping you, man! Someone get a photo with us! Mass criminals kidnap beloved newsman! Some things never change. Just be nice to the doctors. No, oh, they kidnapped me. I did not consent. I... I... Oh. Uh, menaces. I'm surrounded by menaces. But J. Jonah Jameson is not going anywhere, you hear me? I'm not going anywhere! Wait, where am I going? Where am I going?! Mr. Parker, where are you? Uh, Principal Evans. Hi. Yes, this is me, Peter Parker. I, I'm sorry. There was an emergency, and I... I'll, I'll be there soon, I promise. I better see you in ten seconds, or... Oh, no. Um, are, you're uh, breaking up. I... Well, soon. I can't believe I just did that. Where's Mr. Sumida? Oh, he just left. Something about 
going on vacation? What? That's incredible, Haley. Also, while you were gone, I found out that I got the Rand Scholarship. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. Bro, that's like a full ride. Well, big day for everyone. I'm really missing out. Oh, man. I can't watch this. But I also can't look away. Hmm. Principal Evans. Yeah. Guess who decided to show up today? I, I know this looks terrible. Looks? And I, I, I'm, I'm so sorry. It's more than looks. No, I know, I know, I know, I know. This and is this is the last ridiculous. thing that I wanted to happen, and it'll never happen again. I've had enough of this. No, I look. No I, more excuses. Your job is to protect these students, not to abandon them. You're fired. Dude, you being Spider-Man must be so hard keeping a job. Uh, but I'm sure that you're gonna figure it out. about the job. You weren't the worst teacher we've ever had, if that helps. Think I can put that on my resume? Well, listen. There's an open photo call at the New York Bulletin. I just sent a shot in yesterday. It's not much money, but it's money. That's Robbie Robertson's paper. We used to work together at the Bugle. I think I know just what he'd like. Thanks, Miles. No problem. I might send him a few more shots, too, if I have time. Robbie always said, don't show me the city. Show me New York. Ain't that something? There. Now to submit and... Peter! How you doing, son? Robbie, hi. I know this is out of the blue, but I wanted to let you know I just sent in a photo for your open call. Wonderful. We can definitely run this. I gotta duck into a meeting, but if you find the beating heart of New York anywhere else, send it my way. It's good to hear from you. You too, Robbie. Thanks. Your sidewalks. This is the furthest I've walked in. Well, forever. That's perfect. My grandma always talked about going here. She'd walk across the bridge every Sunday to get the freshest vegetables in the city. But one time, she was late, and the guy in front of her bought all the tomatoes. And that's how she met my grandpa. You might want to bring a jacket, which you won't be carrying in this heat. I'll be honest, folks, Taylor doesn't have AC, but the airflow is very pleasant. And when that door opens up, you get that gust of wind carrying the smell of fresh. How does it look? Was that good? If it's great, post it. If it's not, let it die. Okay, you can send it to me. And also, am I prominent in the picture? I do represent a larger customer base. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> the bodega beef. It was already a rivalry for the ages when it was just David versus Goliath. But when Tails had to deal with the bodega copying his success by using the exact same mascot, it stepped up to a whole nother level.
That should work for Robbie. Is that? Oh, 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 man. I haven't been there in years. When we were at the Bugle's old office, we'd hide out here whenever Jonah was about to blow. <laughs> I finished a lot of assignments sitting at that bar. And a lot of grasshoppers. <laughs> <gasps> So just, uh, just relax, okay? I don't know what we're gonna do. We're gonna call the insurance? All right, look, I, I didn't pay you insurance, all Let's right? Talk to the I, I didn't pay you bad. I don't know. Maybe, 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 maybe. <laughs> you know, for a place where everyone's comfortable calling out when something's wrong, people here sure hate admitting when they're wrong. The writer in me does love the irony. Hey, Mr. Robertson, the photo went through. I tried to close my submissions out with a banger. You can call me Robbie Miles. And yeah, it's fantastic. But I'm a bit surprised just stopping now since you left out two of the biggest parts of New York, the Spider-Man. You really think so? Everything I see in these photos, all the stories and history and life, none of it would still be here if it wasn't for the Spider-Man. I hope they know that. They probably forget it sometimes, but I think they do. Well, thanks for the photos, Miles. You're a natural artist. That means a lot. Thanks, Robbie. Hey, it's another one of Marco's memory crystals. Should take care of that. Warn a guy next time. Sheep! Let's see what this crystal has. Someone's watching us, Kimia. But I don't want you to worry. That's my job. Someone was keeping tabs on Marco. And who's Kimia? Crystal's mine this time. Sorry, guys. Didn't mean to wake you up. Crush this crystal. Maybe I'm being paranoid, but everywhere I go, I see them too. Work, the corner store, in the park. They're tracking us. Marco was really freaked out. Wonder if whoever was following him is still out there. It's not my birthday, guys. No need for the surprise. All this trouble for a little crystal. So I tell the cops that someone's out to get us, but they don't listen to me. No one ever does. Time to take matters into my own hands. No one has seen Marco in years. I would have been there for him if I knew he was in trouble. Hey, I was just talking to my source at the raft. Marco's been belligerent and incoherent since he got there. But they said he's starting to show signs of improvement. Whatever you're doing with those crystals, Keep it up. Marco's memory crystal. Let's get it. You guys waiting around for me? Check out 
this crystal. It's my turn to follow them. Figure out who they are. I end up at this abandoned school in Harlem. And I'm already beginning to regret this. Marco thought no one else could help him. Feel for the guy. How's it going, my sandy friend? Sand Crystal has my name all over it. I find them, and they're waiting for me with all sorts of weapons. What the hell have I walked into? Waiting for them with weapons? They knew who they were dealing with. Okay, let's see what we got. They're circling me, Miha. Oh, wishing I'd just stayed home with you, Kimia. Helped you with your homework. Made you the one meal that I know how to cook. But it's too late now. Kimia's Marco's daughter. I had no idea. Check back in on Marco. He's steadily improving, making more and more sense. He's even eating again. Doctors are hopeful. Good work. I should check out that crystal. Okay, guess I can use the workout. I'm sure they left a present for me. I ask them what they want, and all they say is... The beast inside me. But that ain't been me for a long time. Just like I promised you. He tried to do it right for his family. Respect. One of you is in charge here. Now, where were we? Tell them to leave us alone, but they don't care. They shoot me with a net, try to hold me down. And I was sad before I knew it. I'm so ashamed, but I had no choice. I gotta get back to you. Sorry it came to that, Marco. It sounds like it was the last thing you wanted to do. Beach 
day is camp. That sand crystal's all mine now. I lose the grapes at the school and come home. Walk through the front door. But you're not there. They are. What have they done to you, Kimia? He went after his kid? Doesn't get much lower than that. I gotta find more crystals to figure out what went down. Marco's memory is returning and he's agitated. The doctors are piecing together what happened. It, it sounds like it's not all his fault. I'll let you know if I hear more. The sand crystal! Cleanup never ends! <laughs> So many of you! to bring Sandman down. Can speak from experience now. But what happened to his daughter? cells around. You're not here. But are you okay? Marco must have felt so helpless. Trapped. With no idea where his daughter was. <laughs> Didn't your mom ever teach you not to steal? Spider-Man! Did I just step on one of you? My bad! Those sand marcos are exhausting. is coming soon and that he wants to meet me I'm not waiting around sorry to break our promise Kim but I'll tear this city apart to find you Marco was worried something happened to his daughter no wonder he went nuclear Marco never got the chance to find her I gotta make sure she's safe Maybe there's another crystal over by where Marco's memory shattered in the first place. Found another crystal. But 
where are my sandy friends? calling you. My source at the raft told me Marco keeps repeating some address in Queens. Sending it to you now. I think you should check it out. Her mom's. Maybe that's where Kimia is. Thanks, MJ. Any chance you can get a line to Marco at the raft? Hang on while I look into it. <clears throat> okay, all set. Patching him through now. Spider-Man. Sorry for my... Welcome mess. Thank you. You helped me get my mind right. I'm sorry you got roped into all this. I think your daughter might have made it to her mom's. Hit her there now. If she's there, do me a favor. Give her those crystals. Something to remember me by. You got it. Hope you get that normal life you wanted soon, Flynn. She's okay. Wish I could do more, though. Maybe Pete's lawyer friends could help bring this family together again. <clears throat> Let's go. MJ. Hey, I'm headed to your place to drop something off. Is the back door unlocked? Uh, I don't know. Left in a hurry this morning. I'll just meet you there. Okay, cool. You and Miles get back to school, okay? Yep. Yep. Quite a first day for you. Hopefully tomorrow will be quieter. I am sure it will be. I'll see you in a bit. Ugh, it's worse than getting fired. Telling your girlfriend that you got fired.
traffic was awful. Tan Man really made a mess. Seems like you're getting the hang of that thing. <laughs> well, it is convenient in the city, but I'm not convinced I'm a bike person. You convinced me. What's wrong? I got fired. so excited about this job. I know. I had the whole semester planned out. Next week, we were gonna make a potato-powered helicopter. <sighs> I'm so sorry. I might be joining you in the unemployment line. Jonah already cleaning house? Sort of. He's instituting a radical meritocracy. <sighs> Yikes, what does that even mean? It means that whoever doesn't write a front-page story in the next week is fired. Oh, well, you'll be fine then, because you're the best reporter they have. What you got in there? <laughs> Unsold some Karyat books. Running out of storage at my place. But you got great reviews. I sold 14 copies. Nobody wanted to read about some Karya. The Bugle is the biggest outlet in the city. I can make a difference there. But if I get fired, I don't know what I'll do. Do you even need the Bugle to do what you want to do? I tried making an impact from the outside and... 14 copies. Now I... I need to change things from the inside. I haven't had time to clean. <laughs> Back room? Yeah. I'm just gonna tidy up a bit. May mortgage the house to keep Beast afloat. And now I'm sinking. Teaching thing didn't work out. What's next, do you think? I don't know. To be honest, I'd like to take some time off, but I can't really afford to. What about selling the house? I can't. I mean, I could, but I can't. If you need time, I can cover the mortgage. No, no, I can't let you do that. Plus, you said Jonah might clean house. I won't let him fire me. I know how much this house means to you. We'll figure it out. I don't deserve you. Hey, so, have you thought any more about moving in? We talked about this. I need to be in the city, close to where the action is. But think of all the romantic dinners we could have here. When was the last time you were home for dinner? Fair point. Hey, what's this? Is all this May stuff? Yeah, I need to donate it, but not just yet. What are you looking at? Some pretty cute old photos of you. Man, I haven't seen these in a while. Huh. I think that was in my bedroom. Why did she take a picture of that? Balance. What does that mean? Wonder if this is still there. I'm gonna go take a look. Let me know what you find. I'm gonna keep looking at these photos you've never shown me. Ugh, adorable. Don't worry, me. I'll keep your wheat cake recipe alive and well. could use some candles. People put candles in bathrooms, right? Oh man. It's you like a rogue wave sometimes.
Where was that hole again? I thought I, I heard a, a rat in the wall. Hey, what's what's wrong? It's nothing. I, I was just... When I was your age, I was head of the debate club, captain of the soccer team, and second violin in orchestra. Every year, I wanted a new feather in my cap. But when I tried to add honor roll student on top, I fell apart. Instead of being good at a few things, I wasn't good at anything. So, I scaled back. Balance is a process, not a destination. I'm still working on that. Oh, come on. Come on. Maybe May had a point. Can't take too much on. Something's gotta give. I should go check on MJ. Just got a tip. Raf's moving a couple of inmates to Ravencroft tomorrow for evaluation. They say who? No. But I'm going to find out. <laughs> MJ! <laughs> Whoa. Doctors haven't cleared me for MJ hugs yet. Sorry. <laughs> Harry. I missed you. I missed you, too. I heard about May. So sorry. So how was Europe? Yeah, sorry about all that. I was being treated in isolation here in the city, and I, I didn't want you guys to worry about me. Is it the same thing your mom had? It was. Past tense. We think it's in remission. Harry, this is... <laughs> I can't believe it. You look great. I feel great. I have to get to work. Dinner tomorrow? Coney Island? World time's sake? It's a date. <laughs> <laughs> That's new. That's a little skill she picked up when we were in Sakaria. Sorry for coming by unannounced and all. What? No, are you kidding? You want to come inside? Actually... I was hoping you might have time to go for a ride with me. Sure. I'm surprised the frugal flyer is still on the road. I was thinking we might roll like we used to. Ooh. Is that my old bike? Nah, I, I found it on the internet. It's a close match though, right? Wow. Yeah. It's even got the same stickers and everything. You sure this isn't my bike? You ready? Yeah. Where are we going? You'll see. Come on. Try to keep up. You sure you're up for this? Oh, yeah. I'm feeling good. 
I was using the cane just for insurance, but I don't even need it. I think you have more energy than I do. So, tell me everything. What's been keeping you busy? Just substitute teaching in between getting fired. I've also been tutoring a high school kid. He's special. Reminds me a little of me, actually. <laughs> Lucky kid. I never would have passed honors calc without your help. Hey, I read about your old boss, Dr. Octavius. That must have been crazy. That's one way to put it, yeah. I wish you'd been around. Harry, why didn't you tell me you were sick? I'd have been there in a shot. You wouldn't have liked what you'd seen. The treatment was horrible. I was floating in a tank with a healing agent. It gave me awful nightmares. A tank? Wow. Experimental stuff. That's intense. I'm really sorry, Harry. Wait, we're at Midtown High. Is that actually where we're going? We neither confirm nor deny. Uh... This place looks exactly the same as it did 10 years ago. Oh! Come on. Why'd you bring us here? We both hated high school. Remember that time Flash and his buddies cornered me and broke my laptop? We lost that presentation. For the Young Entrepreneurs Competition. We'd worked for months on that thing. And the state meet was the next morning. I had a backup on a USB. But it was in your locker. We called the school begging to let us in. But they said no. It was after hours. We were so desperate, we walked around the entire school, <laughs> trying every door. <laughs> Until... We got to this one. Wait, what do you... I remember we had to jimmy it. <sighs> Shall we? The coast is clear. Come on. You sure the drive is upstairs in your locker? Pretty sure. What? You said you were sure. I was. I mean, I am. Uh, why are you asking now? I don't know. I'm nervous. Don't worry, it's there. Next up to bat is rookie all-star, number 12, Hold up. Eric Monticelli. It's right field Rick. Monticelli What's he doing here on Friday night? Season. Listening to the game? RBI. Show us that rookie of the month stuff, kid. You're gonna be on this team forever. Let's make a run for it. No, wait, he'll see us. Double. This guy is the real deal, folks. We're gonna see him around for a lot of years. The fans are putting the pressure on this. Just aim it at something loud. This recent home stretch, and they're rising Bucket. to the occasion. Nah, too messy. Hey, oh! <laughs> Ash, get ready nice to be tackled. This is what criminals do. Am I a criminal now? Hey, forgot to tell you I showed our presentation to my mom. She thought it was really great. She had one critique, though. The name. She said we should rename it Heal the World. Holy cow, that's perfect. Right? Once we get to the top of the stairs, your locker's right there, right? Get down. I'm back at the gym. Hey, who's that? We're in trouble. We're in trouble, Mayday. Someone in here playing tricks, huh? I could really 
use a refill on my web shooters. Wait, I think I have extra web fluid stuff in the photo lab. Definitely a kid. No Eating vents. Ghost. The spider's best friend. Okay, where did I leave my web fluid stuff? I'll admit to a little bit of hero worship here. should figure out how to increase the capacity of these things so I don't run out. Now to meet Harry at the gym. Oh, the gym is on the other side of that fan. Gotta get past it. Old backpack. I forgot I put that here. Gotta start keeping track of these things. I can't get away from this guy. Gotta distract What's him so that? I can get out of here. This is me making a break for it. running away I bet Harry's already at the gym I gotta hurry this game is gonna right field Rick gotta move him away from that door sorry for the mess Rick okay now you can't tell me we don't have a damn ghost. Just a spider. They're looking a little rusty out there today. Dude, I thought you got caught. We gotta grab that thumb drive and get out of here. Let's cut through the gym. It's all coming back. That was crazy. Well, this place looks the same. Except no security guard on our tails. <laughs> Which gives us a minute for some hoops. Are you sure you're up for this? Question is, are you? Oh, let's see it, big talker. A little rusty, no biggie. All you? I am so happy you're feeling better. Seriously. Thanks. Hey, I didn't get a chance to see what you did with May's house. Nothing yet. I've been busy and... I don't know. It feels weird to change it. I get it. That must have been really tough, Pete. No rush. Okay, here we go. Well, when MJ moves in, maybe she'll help with the house. I don't know. You don't think she'll help? I don't know if she'll move in. Oh. Huh. Well, I mean, it seemed like you guys were doing good. She was at your house? We'll figure it out. We always do. Eventually. What's the score? I have no idea. <laughs> me neither. <laughs> Thanks for bringing me here. I needed this. Me too. But 
We're not done yet. <laughs> I know that look. What are you up to? Still think you can find your old locker? Where do you think that security guard is? Probably still in the East Wing. Then let's get that thumb drive out of your locker and get out of here. We gotta make Flash pay for breaking your laptop. Just let it go. We can't just let him get away with it. He's captain of the football team, and I'm a backup singer in Glee Club. He's gotta get away with it. Our best revenge is to win that competition tomorrow. <sighs> Finally. Quick, get under there. Gotta get him back in that elevator. I uh, checked this floor three times already. This is a damn goose chase. Somebody in there? What's going on? Touch is uh, this guy part of all this too? Nope. <laughs> Run. Hey! Dude, we're gonna get arrested. Not if he doesn't catch us. <laughs> <laughs> this is not the kind of nostalgia I like. You still got that thumb drive? Yeah. Gotta make it to those doors. Almost there. Open up, it's the police. I called the cops. You're in trouble now. No, but hold them off for just a minute. I got an idea. What should I do? Don't get caught. Wait, I keep forgetting. Us? Yeah, they're in here somewhere. All right, if you two spread out while well, we get this guy's statement. Now to get the guard alone so I can get the thumb drive back. They're in here somewhere. The guys are looking, and we need your statement. Tell me what you saw. Well, uh, right field brick. Uh. Oh! Yeah, actually seen. Well. Sometimes these things pop for no reason. Nice. Now I just have to distract this last guy. Don't move. I'll be right back. He's alone. Now for something I like to call the upside down pickpocket. Warn that tea I like. But no, I gotta chase some more. Huh? What was that? How am I supposed to get out of here? I huh? just want to tell you how I'm feeling. Damn it. Gotta You're in the make office. you understand. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Okay, gotta go. <laughs> you good? It's not the cops. It's my dad. Dad, I told you I'd call you when I got home. It's your mother. What happened? Uh, Peter. Would you excuse us for a moment?
Harry, what is this? You know, I still think we would have won state if we'd presented. <laughs> Lots happened in the last 10 years. It's a miracle I'm even sitting here now. I got a second chance. And I'm gonna take advantage of that. But I need you with me, Pete. Wow, this is uh, a lot to process. Why don't you come by the lab tomorrow? Check it out. You have a lab already? I'll show you some of my ideas, and we can talk about it some more. Deal? Sure. Pete, we're gonna heal the world. You busy? I need whatever it is. I'm down. Need some help with a babysitting mission at the rest. Sounds fun. Fill me in on the way. How's the essay going? It's it's going. Uh, I'm gonna head out though. Pete, call for some backup. We're just. It's better if I don't know the details. I'll be fine, Ma. Espera un momento. Um, you know how there have been a few nights recently where you've been working late, and so I also worked late. Well, I wasn't working. Don't give me that look. I'm not in any trouble. It's just, um, I've been going on some dates. Dating, actually. Oh, right. And there's this one guy. I've seen him a few times, and it's, well, it's going well. Ma, what are you asking me? I'd like to have him over. For Barcelona. I'm sure there's some spider stuff I can be doing. I can give you some privacy? No, I'd like him to meet you. And I'd like you to meet him. But if you're not comfortable, I totally understand. Ma. Look, you had me a pate alone. <laughs> I'll see you. Okay. Después. Better head to the raft. Maybe these wind tunnels can give me a boost. <laughs> Here's another one. 
love a windy day. Hey, Miles, I'm just getting to the raft. You on your way? Wouldn't miss it. Who are babysitting? MJ got a tip yesterday that Scorpion's being moved to Ravencroft. Not enough resources for him since Sandman became his roommate. Scorpion can definitely throw a tantrum. I'll be there. Hey, man. Glad you could make it. Looks like I'm just in time. Keep it moving, Gargan. <laughs> Ready for the next one. Next one? Thought we were just babysitting Scorpion today. for fireworks. We gotta go. Should have stretched. Your head will make a fine growth. Got him 
on the ropes! I took the little one! Little one? You better be talking about the other Spider-Man! Because I'm a half inch taller than him! At least! Why didn't we know the raft was moving Lee? Doesn't matter now! Let's just focus on taking these guys out! Whoever they are! Now. We gotta get the ship free. Civilians on the way. It's bad, man. What happened out there? Did those guards get to safety? Hello? Signal. Better hurry up. Whoa! It's getting worse out there. energy. Thanks a million kids. But I saved you. Oh, really? <laughs> We 
have eyes on Scorpion. all of them.
Spider-Man, things just went from bad to each river on fire bad. That's... Well, okay. I'm on my way. We'll deal with Scorpion later. Come on! Come on! It won't start! I got you! Hang on to something! Responders are on site now, at least. <laughs> Police are still fishing, but there's no sign of them. Any luck up river? Nothing but debris. Who are those guys? Whoever they are, they're packing some serious tech. And now they got all that, plus Scorpion and Lee. Hey, whatever they're planning, we'll find them. We'll stop them. Yeah. Pete. When I saw Lee inside that ship, my powers, they... You think his energy got entangled with yours? I don't know, man. But it feels volatile. 
Wherever Electric Blue came from, it saved the day back there. Hey. We'll put Lee back where he belongs. Promise. Don't leave me hanging. I'm trying to soak over here. Not on my watch. Come on. <laughs> You're too much, man. used to hearing that voicemail of yours. Dropped you a pin. Wanna come through? Hey, Uncle Aaron. What? Too busy to visit your fam? Nah. I was just giving you space after you got out. Don't need it. <clears throat> Besides, we gotta settle some things. We do? See you soon, kid. Just go see him and get it over with, Mouse. Then we focus on whoever took Lee and Scorpion. Something tells me they're planning something big. We really gotta do this with the mask on? Depends. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. Your dad used to give me that exact same look. Kid? Martin Lee. Someone got him out. I know what you're thinking, Miles. This is not on you. We can't let him live up here. It's just another kind of prison. It's not that easy. Never said it was. But sometimes you gotta push the past away so you can make room for the future. That's actually why I call. Need your help getting something. Could get it myself, but parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I gotta get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. Yeah, I know the one. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? Behind us. You getting some? How did you... And Miles, that Lee business? Don't be stupid. I'm serious, Miles. I've heard this dude can turn your brain into scrambled eggs. Leave it alone. Now, what else is going on with you? Our school, college, anyone you like? I don't know. So there is someone. I'm here. What am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. Uploaded some Prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code from my suit. Last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. Don't cheat. Take your time. Done. Not bad, kid. Another gate. Pull it open from down here. You would have made a decent prowler. You should be seeing how to get inside now. Yo, this is next level, man. Hit this whole room in plain sight.
Got it. You wanna finally tell me what this is? All suit prototypes. Feel free to keep it. Some good tech in there. Cool. Could definitely use this. Listen, this isn't the only stash. Unk. Whoever freed Lee sounds like my tech is right up their alley. Don't want it falling into the wrong hands. You're the only person I trust with this. Okay. I got you. Coordinates are in the mask. Thanks, nephew. Don't be a stranger. Wonder what Ma's gonna say about this. Oye, Miles. Me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer y con... Está bien. Sí, Ma. Todo bien. Estaba ayudando a Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah. ¿Y cómo está él? Está tratando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. And before you ask me again, estoy bien. Te lo juro. Te quiero. Let's head out into the city. See what's going on. Maybe even find Lee while I'm at it. Someone's playing with fireworks? Bad idea. And here we are. Skyscraper. Ever heard of the Braxton Heist? Uh, no. Exactly. It was my debut score as the Prowler. First time working with a crew, too. We went in to steal prototypes from Braxton's secret tech division. But this kid double-crossed us. Who? Never got her name. But she was good. A pro. A thief in the truest sense of the word. Wasn't mad, though. It was a valuable lesson. Starting to get why you were dad's toughest case. <laughs> Good looking out on the stash, kid. Wonder who got the best of Uncle Eric. How many people can do that? That opened the stash. Stash by the stadium. Now that one's my favorite. How come? <laughs> Let's just say I had a New York City that no one else knew about. I used to tap into the stadium's mainframe and watch the games through my prowler mask. What? No way. It was like sitting courtside for $3.99. Maybe we can hold on to this prowler discount. You know, at least during the season. No can do, Miles. Gotta get our nosebleeds like everyone else. The tortures are finally good again. Mask is pinging the prowler stash in the area. Hmm. Hey, kid. You get my stash by the cage? The cage? Thought it looked familiar. We've got a great view of the hoops on the west side of the building. One of the most legendary street ball courts in the world. Before I started stealing, most of my fights with your dad were on that black town. No way! You and Pops used to battle? Nah. We go to war. But when it was two on two, we put it to rest. He was a bully baller, and I was a trash talker. We were undefeated. How about we come back after your parole? Play a little pickup? Trust me, nephew. You don't want to smoke. Come on. My room can use another poster on the wall. <laughs> Later, Rump. my stash at the old radio station. I was wondering where I was. 
That station was the hottest ticket in Brooklyn for up-and-coming hip-hop artists back in the day. You and Pops get any airtime? We got close. But they bumped us last minute for this next level group out of Staten Island. I still got your beats if you want them. <laughs> NYC ain't ready for a prowler spotty mixtape. Take it easy, kid. Hope Unk starts making music again. It'll be a good distraction for him. Can't hide from me. stash at my old place. You lived in that penthouse? Back in the early prowler days, when I was on Fisk's payroll. Fisk? Yeah, I know. Still remember when I got the keys. I wanted to impress my big bro so badly, but he was ashamed because he knew how I got it. Whatever Dad felt, I know he always loved you. Appreciate that, nephew. Maybe one day I'll believe it. Still a lot I don't know about Uncle Aaron and Dad. Wonder what other stories they had. Don't mind if I do. Unauthorized access attempts for my stash in the shipping yard. Yeah. That group that took Lee showed up. They must be real good if they found it. Even your dad wasn't able to. Dad? It was the first showdown between Officer Jefferson Davis and the Prowler. Had to hide in that shipping container for hours just to lose him. Almost wish he'd caught me right then and there. Never wanted him to get involved. Well, I'm glad you're out of the game now. Stay safe, punk. Same, man. We'll do. Hunk's been watching way too many bad spy movies. No way Prowler crawled through those lasers without a fail safe. Something here has to deactivate that laser field. There you are. my stash out in Hunter's Point, Prowler's first training ground. Wait, really? I had to test out my tech somewhere secret. How'd you get the hang of your powers? I actually did the same thing. <laughs> Maybe we all related out. Yeah, except you stole your tech and I got bitten by a radioactive spider. You know, you still owe me the whole story there, because I've had a million spider bites. Never ended up walking on walls. <laughs> Sorry. Spider code. Fair enough. Thanks for grabbing the stash, kid. Hmm. Looks like that's all the stashes. Wait. 
My suit sink into another one? It's right by where I met up with Funk. Maybe his cold's buggy? Should go check with him. Unc? Uncle Aaron? Where'd he go? He did have a stash here. this dash for These are blueprints to my apartment building. He wouldn't plan a heist there, would he? Better get home quick. What are you doing, Uncle Aaron? Really hope this isn't what it looks like. Uncle Aaron? These pictures of Dad and Uncle Aaron when they were kids. record player is gone. Did he steal from us, too? That's one of Dad's records. Christmas Baby. I really hit the jackpot here. Go, Aaron's still here? Can't let him take any more stuff. I knew I couldn't trust you. Miles? Don't miles me. What are you doing here without breaking parole? You said you were retiring the prowler. You lied to me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow down there. Mijo? Mom? We were going to surprise you, but... Okay, what's going on here? When you started helping out your uncle, I was inspired. Despite all the things he did, you forgave him. So I decided to do the same and help him out by co-signing the lease on this apartment. Thanks again, Rio. <laughs> It'll be nice to have family close by again. I meant what I said. Prowlers in the rearview mirror. I want us to have a future together. Be a family. I also said I'd find a way to thank you, didn't I? What is it? Some tech I was prototyping before I got caught up with Roxxon. Could come in handy. Guess Uncle Aaron really is making room for the future. One floor up. Can't wait to try this tech out. All right. New reproductive technologies are on the horizon. Check it out on this brochure. We've got preventative contraception information. Please consult your parents and your primary care physician. They'll help you find what's right for you. Yes, those are free. 
Remember to stay safe. Hey, Miles, over here. Hey, you made it. I want to talk to him about that computational physics program. We got your missing person report half an hour ago. What happened? That's just it. We don't know. He must get something from her car and then never came back. I just heard two words. Missing in person. So I'm gonna say yes. Go ahead. We'll save your seat. I gotta catch up to the principal. Maybe I can find out more. Do you have any of her personal items? Yeah, she left her phone behind. Is it unlocked? Have you seen any texts coming in or anything? Here we go. Just some notifications from her fitness tracker. It's counting her steps, wherever she is. The students adore Miss Ferguson. I hope she's all right. Please find her. We'll do our best. Miss Ferguson's missing. Oh, man. Sounds like she's still wearing her fitness tracker. Wonder if I could find that signal. All right. Let's see where this fitness tracker is. Last known location, Dawson Harbor. Beginning text-to-speech call with Haley Cooper. Miles, Mr. Atlas just got here. ETA? Oh, man! Gotta find Miss Ferguson first. Be there when I can. He's handing out scholarship applications right now. Uh, can you get one for me? I'll do better than that. Send you a link. Thanks. Good luck. And hurry. Hey, yo, Miles. What's up, Genki? Can this wait? Not really. I've got Mr. Atlas here. I told him how you were missing the fair for volunteer work, and he asked for a phone call with you. Is uh, now a good time? Thanks, Genki. Now is definitely not a good time. Here he is, Mr. Atlas. I know you've got a flight to catch. Genki! Hi, Miles? Uh, yeah. Hello? You're whispering. Is now a bad time? Uh, no! I'll make it work! That's me! Great! I heard you're interested in our music technology program. So, tell me about yourself. What do you do for fun? Fun? Uh, well, I used to do music production, but it's been hard to find time lately. Yankee here showed me some of your samples. Good stuff. Particularly your song called Swing. What was your inspiration? Uh, yeah, I was, uh, just swinging one day and, uh, thinking. The tone just kind of... Sorry, gotta go. Um, I'll call you later. Or email. That could have gone better. Maybe I can make it back to BV in time to meet Mr. Atlas in person. And clarify some things. All right. With those guys out of the way, let's see where that tracker signal leads. There she is. This glass looks pretty breakable. What makes you think I know anything about the RTX 35? It's the same six-step lock tech. Now help us unlock it, or we'll have to do this the hard way. You kidnapped me and tied me to a chair. How is this not already the hard way? Don't make me have to show you. Now, we know this thing has six steps. What's the first one? Open the... I got you. Are you okay? I'm fine. But who are these people? How do they know I work for Rand? Let's figure that out when we're not in the hostage situation. Time to squad. Spider. You hide. I've got these guys. You don't want this! <gasps> 
Get me out! Messing up my operation, Spider Brat! Your operation involves kidnapping! How am I supposed to let that slide? <laughs> By yourself? It's in my job description. Ready to go? Are you going to carry me? Sure. I've carried people before. As long as I can get verbal confirmation that if I throw up on you, you won't sue me. Uh, consider this confirmation. Just try to tell a brother uh. first. Thanks to Spider-Man, our treasured teacher, Miss Ferguson, is back with us safe and sound. To show our gratitude, it is my honor to declare Spider-Man the official hero of Brooklyn Visions. <laughs> you are always welcome here, Spider-Man. Thank you. And now, back to the quad. We've got a robotics demonstration to do. Much time. Hi, Miles. I appreciate your dedication to interviewing, but I could tell you were clearly busy with something important. Mr. Sinclair put in an excellent word for you, as did Principal Evans. So let's do this right and meet this week on campus, in person. Got a few app requests popping up on BB's campus. Thought I'd call you directly. Oh, man. Seems like you might need some spider help. Yeah, I had everything planned out. The clues, the screens, the art, the people, everything has to be perfect. Whoa, 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 okay, I got you. Can you explain a little slower? What happened? <sighs> okay, I want to ask someone to homecoming, but he's special. I couldn't just do flowers or chocolate. I got some screens and I want to light them up with the message. But the generator's busted. Guy who rented it out to me won't answer. What a scam. I think I can help. Thanks. I rented the generator from Reynolds and Company Rentals. I'll send you the address. On it. Generators are going for a lot these days. This baby's ours. You understand? That's no ordinary rental transaction. takes care of these guys. I should check on the salesperson. Thanks, Spider-Man. Glad to help. 
Your client asked me to look into a delivery delay. I guess we got our answer. Yeah, about that. I'd love to deliver this thing, but those idiots already did so much damage. If she's salvageable, it'll take weeks of repairs. Mind delivering the bad news for me? Can do. Better call Vijay and give him the bad news. Tell me some good news. Well, it's news. Generator's busted. Wait. Okay, I'm not out of ideas yet. Just come back. I've got something else in mind. Since the generator's no good, does BV have any backup ones? I know they keep generators on the roof, but they're all overpowered for my setup. We'd blow a fuse. Unless we find something underpowered. I should be able to pick up that low voltage frequency. And your electrical powers would fill in the rest. Theoretically. Worth a shot. Or a shock. I've got a friend who would love that joke. Thank you, a million. Oh, maybe you should call yourself the Great Electric Spider. Thanks. I like Spider-Man just fine. Oh, just got a text. He's on his way. Uh, don't go just yet. I could still use your help. Just hide. Vijay's texting me. What? A whiteboard? <laughs> oh, Vijay, what are you up to? Mm. Wait a sec. That's the equation he helped me with on our first date. Study session. Mm. Study date? Spider-Man, that's the first clue. Mind flipping it? <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, looks like I'm going this way. <laughs> okay, what is this? Aw, oh, that's the movie we saw when we had our first kiss. Look, braces, lip balm, and all. <laughs> but still, best kiss ever. Spider-Man, the poster is stuck. Can you give it a tug? Oh! <laughs> Vijay must be in the quad. Time for the big reveal. Find a seat and grab some popcorn. Vijay? This whole thing has you written all over it. I've always known you're a special guy. And I'm lucky you're my special guy. I love you, Lucas. Will you... Will you... Uh... Home? Ah, uh, not exactly. Oh no. Gotta be something I can do to help here. <laughs> Homecoming? Oh, Vijay, of course. Matching sequin blazers? Hell yeah! Phew! That was close. Spider-Man! Come down so I can thank you properly! Thank you for making this possible. Holy crap! You really got Spider-Man in on this? Best day ever! Anything for love, guys. Happy for you both. Enjoy homecoming! Lost drone at... Uh, somewhere o'clock. Can't be too hard to find. Don't they have tracking chips in them? Yeah, except this one stopped responding. It might be tougher than I thought. All right, be there soon.
No, she'll never go for that. Hey, I heard you lost a toy drone? It's lost, but it's not a toy. I was using it to gather aerial footage for my senior project. I'd look for it myself, but it lost communication at... Uh, 300 feet X and 140 feet Y. That's the Northeast building. Can you help? Our senior projects are due Friday. Oh, right. Wait, you knew that? I, uh, get around. Here are lots of things. I'm Spider-Man. Oh, okay then. So you'll look around for me? I'm on it. It must be stuck on a roof. Check the tall building on the northeast corner of campus. Hey, the data's corrupt. Can't turn the camera on, but it's rebooting. Thought so. Thanks. Well, since you're up there, would you mind snapping a photo of campus for us? I can make that happen. We'd like a shot of the sky bridge from the rooftop. Could you take it? Perfect. Look at that composition. And that lighting. You've really got an eye for this. Could we get a couple more? A shot from each of the other two super tall buildings around campus would do it. Okay. Get to the tall buildings, snap a couple of pics. I can do that. Recruitment office? <laughs> Is this senior project part of this year's AV Club recruitment video? If this shot doesn't wow the new kids, I don't know what will. The students on campus will love this! <laughs> shot of the quad. Best lunch spot, hands down. Okay, so next. I forgot we need to capture students in their daily life. Just, just three shots of that and we're golden. We want to capture the esports team, the drone club, and the greenhouse. Cool. Nice action shot of the drone. You capture their movements. Beautiful. An impromptu shot of ponage in action. I'm not a gamer. That's perfect. One of my favorite thinking spots on campus. The plants make great company. Hey, while you've been up there, I've been tinkering with the drone. Camera's still busted, but at least it still flies. One last favor. It's the last thing we need, for real. Could we get a tour of campus in one continuous shot from the air? You can meet us up on the rooftop to start the fly-through. All right. I'll get something nice for you. You can swing through it or fly. Either way, let's keep the shot off the ground. In the air. Got it. Here I go. Thing is fast. Oh, that way. work that'll do it thanks to you this recruitment video is really gonna shine don't suppose you'd be down to do 10 hours of editing for me better let the master cinematographer handle that part I've got a report that Lance was kidnapped that Lance can be anywhere. Who took him? No clue. 
But if anyone can find him, it's you. Uh, not the wildest thing I've attempted all week. I'm in. Everything okay? Lance! He was kidnapped by Midtown. Don't you guys have, like, a huge game against them tomorrow? That's the whole point. Look, they explained it in this note. Pretty sure that note leads to the Stewart building, but we can't access the roof. See why we called you? Yeah, I'll look around. Mm, that RJ kid. I knew not to hold the door for him. Wait, the Stewart building? Wonder why the Midtown kids took Lance there. Did you find him already? Not quite, but I have to know. Why the Stewart building? A BB kid won a robotics contest against Midtown at Stewart Robotics and Engineering last year. Midtown lost. Sounds like Midtown is super bothered about it. They'll be even more bothered when we get Lance back. <gasps> it looks like the right place. Midtown Science Club is legendary for their pranks. It looks like RJ left another note. Okay, if I want to find Lance, I'll need to shine the UV light on the mural somehow. Hidden message. I knew it. We BIPOC artists are birds of a feather. To find the next clue, all a band together. Hmm. BIPOC artists. Haley's the art expert. Let me give her a call. I heard you're looking for Lance. Did you find him? Not yet. Midtown's making us work for it. But I could use your help, sending you a pic. BIPOC artists. Birds of a feather. Hmm. There's a bunch of BIPOC murals at Rodney and Third. Don't know what Aliband means, though. Thanks, Haley. I owe you one. That thank you is plenty, but I'm always down for coffee. You got it. Ton of murals here. Gotta be a hidden message on one of them. How are we doing? I'll find Lance soon. I think. Midtown's hidden messages on murals around town. Right now, I'm at Rodney and Third, trying to find the next clue. Where Anders Oliband's painting is? <laughs> Makes sense. Oliband? Midtown mentioned him in the clue. But who is he? BB's own premier art prodigy turned research fellow at the Musée de la Vie in Paris? Maybe Midtown's jealous they don't have an alum like that. The competition is stiff, but your tactics are stale. The greatest in the region shall soon prevail. Hey, Haley, got another clue for you. I sent a pic. Hmm. Greatest in the region. If it's about another mural, you might want to try North Williamsburg. Didn't BV and Midtown have a chess match there last week? Yes. Regional. Ended in a stalemate. Aha! Uh -huh. That explains why Midtown's so bitter. I'll check it out. Two murals this time? Man. Midtown really doesn't want us to find Lance. Good thing Brooklyn Visions has Spider-Man on their side. Red and blue flags? Could there be two paths? How'd they even have time to set this up? So there are two paths then. Gotta hand it to Midtown. Main. As in Main Street? Main Street has hundreds of locations. I need more details. Wait, why didn't the second one light up? There must be more to do.
I guess if I have time to be Spider-Man, they've got time to set up an elaborate puzzle around the city. One, one, two, one. That must be the street number. Finally. Okay, what's it say? One, one, two, one Main Street. That must be where they're hiding Lance. Hey, Miles. Speak on it. I think I found Lance. 1121 Main Street. Knew I could count on you. Lance! You around here, buddy? Lance the Lion. Time for you to head home. One of you must be RJ. Spider-Man? No fair. Brooklyn Vision's cheated. Whoa, Spider-Man? Guess BB couldn't figure it out on their own. Thanks for the fun and games. But I've got to get this guy home. <laughs> Any luck? On my way back. And I'm bringing a fluffy friend. Lance! You found him! Is he okay? Did they hurt him? Looks safe and sound to me. They had him in the garage. It was kind of dusty. He might need a bath. Anyway, hurry back. We're all ready for him. On my way. You found him! Lance! <laughs> Lance is back! Spider-Man got him back! Thanks for getting Lance back safe, and just in time for the game! Hey, Haley, what's up? So all that help you gave folks at Brooklyn Visions, they banded together to make you a thank you gift. That's sweet, but Spider-Man can't accept gifts, unless it's hugs. Haha, -ha. hugs are great, but I think you'll put this gift to good use. Swing by the rooftop garden when you get a chance. Aww. They didn't have to do this. Yeah! He's perfect! Brooklyn Visions is the best. I'm gonna miss this place when I go to college. <laughs> hey Pete, you ready to come by the foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from MJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah. Whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest-looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. was. That 
It's Emily's tree. This is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place... Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... We got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Today. Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Yes, Jean. Here, follow me. They're both doing great. Really, the data does not cross tabulate with the AI learning project during the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. The carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Whoa, this is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that we're training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Oh, nice! Yes! Yep, you're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay, flying home. Welcome to entomology. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance it can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm-hmm. 
Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh, yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. Wonder how it ended up here. Organic life forms have arisen from non biological chemical compounds. Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules, considered the building blocks of life, may provide a potent clue. Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra-efficient batteries, charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road-ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. show complex group decision-making and group locomotion. Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and splits. The Emily May Foundation has discovered that specific changes in the honeycomb's vibrational spectra precede a primary swarm. This research will help beekeepers support healthy swarming without invasive observational techniques for optimal health and reproduction in our beleaguered bee population. Drones. Yeah, uh, doing a little cross-collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultralight drones, using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. medical organ transplants far outnumbers available donors. An innovative solution uses 3D printing technology to create custom replacement organs, decreasing the likelihood of transplant rejection and increasing the chances of a successful outcome. Here at the Emily May Foundation, this cutting edge work is being put to use saving lives. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. 
Oh yeah, that would take a while. I'm not sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here! What's this? A reminder that the Some kind of radiation treatment, maybe? I wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment. Looks like Connors is putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. Wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. It must be unnerving walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. Imagine coming to work here every day. It's almost too good to be true. Could start paying off the mortgage. Uh, but what if... Spidey work gets in the way. <sighs> Gotta think this through before signing on. How long have you been here today? Did you hear about Roger? He's sick. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. Where are we heading now? We're up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Really? Even before high school. To middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? Yes, that was so great. Interesting research project. And lowers the old cortisol levels, too. Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. This way, dude! Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized, but ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Beautiful work, Peter. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. 
I know a rooftop you could use for a real-world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. It might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. -y. Your office. Or is it our office? Oh. Harry, now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. Go ahead. Swipe. I really think we need more security. Wow. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Yeah. But Coney Island later, yeah? <laughs> you bet. I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on, don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. Hey, 
What's up? Just wanted to let you know that I talked to Gloria, and Feast is gonna send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with... Uh, everything. I'll call him right now. But don't push yourself too hard, Parker. I'm serious. Hey, you know I'd much rather be curled up next to you with the latest physics journal right now. <sighs> Especially that French one. Sometimes you're just too romantic. I'll talk to you later. Got here. Hello, Peter. Welcome to the real world trial for our ultra efficient battery bicycles. Nice. We'd love you to take a bike for a spin, passing through 10 checkpoints to measure real world battery metrics. Head to the bike rack in Central Park and hop on. Your badge will grant you access. No need to make headlines. This is a job for plain old Pete. Now to grab one of these sweet state-of-the-art rides. Okay, let's head to that first checkpoint. Get in at the checkpoint. Woo! <laughs> Phew, that was a close one. The battery will safely drain, but I've got to tell Dr. Wynn a short circuit seems to have caused thermal runaway. If it didn't happen in the lab, I'll bet fluctuating outdoor temperatures are the culprit. I've got some ideas for better thermal regulation. Peter, thank you so much for helping us out with our machine learning trials. Similar to what you did in the Emily May Foundation, we're now teaching our drones what to do in the wild. Once you get yourself set up, this recording will continue. Okay, let's get up and running. This is a two-part trial. First, you need to teach the drone what it should target to protect our bumblebee population. Great. Let's train some bee drones. Oh, and you need to do it before the drone depletes its charge. Sorry, we're working on battery life. Got it. Let's go. No thanks, bee-eating wasps. Who knew rats ate bees? the data set. Now, in the second part of the trial, you'll teach the drone to identify and mark optimal nest sites. Be real estate, here we go. Look for the flags. These are ideal relocation spots. Here we go. Bingo. You've completed the set. The drone will self-pilot home and upload the data. Thank you, Peter. That should be some good stuff for the AI. Hope Dr. Young finds it helpful. Hope Dr. Foster doesn't mind if Spider-Man helps Peter out. Easy enough. Collect some samples, splice some genes, feed the people. I think I can improve on this. 
Let's look for the best samples. There has to be a healthy looking plant around here somewhere. This one's technically a weed, but the hardiness could be helpful. Okay, got some great samples. Time to bring them together. that EMF is making these GMOs open source. Profit shouldn't be part of the equation when it comes to basic human necessities. Let's see. Can't wait to see this grow. This works. These plants will be growing faster and bearing more fruit than ever. Just imagine what Feast could do with all of that. Okay, made some great new hybrid seeds for them. Just gotta get this place ready to plant the seeds. Let's optimize their water. <laughs> Yikes, gotta patch this up. Seems to be multiple leaks lowering the water pressure. If I don't find them all, the system won't work. Just a few more to patch up. Ugh. Gotta take care of those boxes. <laughs> Would be counterproductive if I drowned all the plants. May used to have a green thumb with her tomato plants. Maybe I have green webs? I think this should do it. Dr. Foster will be pleased. He doesn't need to know Spider-Man helped out. I wonder what other field projects the EMF is working on. Hey, Pete, you got a minute? I could use some perspective on our mutual friends. What Jonah do this time? Usually I can deal with him, but lately it's like he's determined to get under my skin. You're a veteran. Any advice? With Jonah, it's a never-ending war. Trust me, pick your battles. You'll learn how to tune him out eventually. I'm not sure I have that superpower, Spider-Man. I know I can't die on every hill, but... Mm. But you're Mary Jane Watson, defender of truth. A much cooler superpower. <laughs> But maybe you have to give an inch to get one? Ugh, I don't know. I'll think about it. Thanks, Parker. Anytime, Watson! Huh, these don't look like happy plants. Peter, I'm so glad you could help. Clearly we've got a failure to thrive, and we haven't yet been able to diagnose the reason. Can you sort it out for us? Thanks. These plants should be doing much better. Something's making them sick. All right, my little plant friends. What's got you feeling so sick? Hmm. Got it. Hmm. Nice. Don't worry. I'll get you all healed up and ready to feed the community. Let's see. Got it. Huh. 
looks like this pathogen usually affects plants in the river. But fish are immune to it. I think I just found our cure. Let's splice some genes. With a little genetic engineering, I can make you guys immune to this pathogen just like these fish. Now I just need to get a cooperative sample. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Where are you? I promise you'll be back in the water in two shakes of a fin. This one won't work. Gotta catch another. A perfect specimen. That's one slippery sample secured. Now to take it back and splice it with the plants. All right, my leafy greens. Let's get you feeling better. Just gotta fire up that GMO splicer. Need to insert this fish gene. If I splice this fish gene into your plant genes, I can give you guys immunity to this pathogen just like them. I know you can't understand me, but trust me, it's pretty cool. You're gonna make our community a whole lot healthier. Okay, Feast should be able to work with these. Can't wait to see him thriving. He'll be feeling better in no time. All right, let's help out EMF. Here's that kiosk. Hello, Peter. As you can see, these cassava plants are alive and quite hardy, but grow too slowly for food production. We want to hybridize them with a more productive variety and would welcome your help. Cassava plants growing too slowly, huh? Better head to ESU. A professor there just discovered a new variety that grows impressively fast. They'd make a great hybrid. Their rare variety of the Asian cassava plant grows like crazy, and I'll only need a single leaf to splice with ours. The professor is always looking for practical applications. She'll be super into doing a collab. Oh no. No. Someone stole the cassava? I've got to track down the thieves before they get too far. Maybe there are some traces of pollen still in the air. Got it. Glad this plant is a wind pollinator. It releases so much pollen, I can see the path they took. Now let's see where these pilfering plantsmen went. Good thing this pollen isn't triggering my allergies. Total coincidence. I refuse to be allergic. There it is. That's like a rock star plant with all that security. Exactly. Smithers said it could be used to make untraceable plants. All I know is he was more than willing to pay. Definitely not trying Man's to feed out. the community. Revenge time! <laughs> it's Spider-Man! I've got something to plant! My fist in your face! <laughs> I need this plant for an experiment to help feed New York if that means anything to you. No? Really? I think it's called the back to jail plant. Now where is that plant? Couldn't have walked far. All right, buddy. 
One quick stop at feast, and then we'll get you back home. Glad we nipped this nefarious plan in the bud. See what I did there? Yeah, I knew you would. Wait, your name's not Audrey, is it? Parker, stop talking to the plant! Okay, now to borrow a bit of your super special genetic material to help your cousins grow faster. Okay, so we want some extra growth genes from our guest plant. Must be really special to you. He did that machine thingy. Spider, so smart. Did I say that? We just followed you straight back here. Pretty dope. Stop! Not the ball. Let's try that again. go. The plant will be secure in this workbench until ESU can buff up their greenhouse security. Feast will really be able to improve their crop yield with these new hybrids. That's a lot of nesting boxes. Good beel estate. Training the drones to identify predators like rats and beetles, so they can guard the bees' nesting boxes. Okay, let's get things booted up. Time for target practice. The Bodyguards, Queen's Edition. Giving new meaning to Queen's Bee. These are Queen's Bees. But not to be confused with Queen Bees. Unidentified predator detected. Uh-oh, what's that? Better go check that out. Whoa! That bird! It's going after the nests. Trying to eat the bees. Aha! Neuropody albicollis. The white-throated bee-eater bird. It's right there in the name. I need to shoot this bird back to wherever it came from. I wonder if this drone has a real-world mode. Cool. Then I can really encourage this bird to get going. If I can find out where it came from, I can see if there are others. Gotcha, Birdie. Can't have you eating up the bees of queens or the queen bees. Huh, so this is your home. You must have escaped from here and gone out for a snack. Got it. Okay, I think I'm done for now. The drone will pilot its way back to home base in no time. I'm not sure bee-eating birds are a citywide threat, but I'll mention it to Dr. Young. We should definitely program the drones to look for outliers like that. Okay, Dr. Young, bring it on. training session. You know the drill. Help the drone identify predators as well as optimal nesting sites. Just gotta boot up the drone. Let's do some target practice. Gotcha! Another one down. I love Prospect Park. Let's mark those nest sites. Yeah, let's get it back to the garage. What? What just happened? Did someone steal the drone? I'll head to its last location before it went dark. 
See if I can figure out where it went. Huh. No sign of it. Or anyone. Those guys said something about a garage. There's a few close by. If I can find the right one, I should be able to reconnect to the drone from the roof. Bingo. This is the place. Let's connect the video signal. What is this place? And more importantly, how do I get in there? Lots of cages in here. More bees. I don't know why these guys are collecting bees. I know they don't belong cooped up in here. I'd better turn on that sonic laser mode. Let's kill two bees with one shot. I feel them and then the oh, They're all over the place! There's war there! Get me out of here! Hey there! Let's meet our new contestants on. Look to the face! Spider-Man! Drone! Oh. Safety mode! Fly home! Spider is over! <laughs> Alright guys, you gotta tell me. Bees? Yeah, what? You never heard of niche markets? Yeah, but this is like niche niche. Stop. We're not taking no from a guy dressed like a spider. We have to win. A bee-lated arrival. Get him! Come on, fellas. There has to be an easier way to make money. I do not even care about some bees. Do you know how many plants exist because of bees? They play a critical role in... You don't care. Whew, that's all of them. I'll definitely let Dr. Young know about this poaching operation. It's no good for the bees, real or troll. Okay, let's see what's the latest greatest in energy research. turbines are tiny but mighty. Once deployed on high altitude currents, they are a potentially self-sustaining source of clean power. Eventually, they'll shuttle back and forth to a dock. But right now, we're looking for a way to place these for an initial test run. I think I can get these up to the right altitude with the web wings. They don't call it Brooklyn Heights for nothing. Here we go! Huh. Web wings alone aren't getting me enough lift. I need a little push. The intersection of Court and Montague is super windy. I've certainly lost enough papers walking through there. Let's use that as a natural wind tunnel. attacking the turbine. You've got to stop them. this turbine back in place. There. All up and running. I should make sure Dr. Wynn sets up some turbine security for these. Huh? 
Don't see any bad guys. Maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong? Hey, I'm at the bridge. But there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Ah, oh, man. We were sure it was there. Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find him. Littering? Come on, man. some answers. Okay, birdie. Take me to your nest. I'm gonna miss these chases when I'm an Emily May. The adrenaline going through the city like it's an obstacle course never gets old. Getting to do real science, though. For actual money. Oh my god, finally did it. I have a stable career. Okay, cool it, Parker. Daydream about those fat science stacks later. Time to chase. Up, up, and you won't get away. Uh -huh. No, 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 no. Nice cloaking tack. Mind if I take a look under the hood? I'll take that as a no. That's two cloaks now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. You are not worthy of his attention. But Scorpion is? Okay. You know, I've got nothing against Garden. I'm just saying I've kicked his butt a few times. And yet you always held back. By not killing him? Yeah, killing really isn't my thing. Bring him down! Now, where's your boss? Another robot. Maybe I can test something out. Okay, let's see. Sorry, Birdie. This is just as awkward for me as it is for you. There should be a... Yep. Oh, is that your home? Send this location to MJ. Maybe she can take up some building records. Where are we going now? Hey, MJ, did you get that location data I sent you? Yeah, it's an old food market. Owner died last year, 
Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait. This buyer. There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city. Like, whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just... vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? I'm gonna find out. Good luck. Need to take these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. We're ready. What a city to hunt in. Gotta drop one of them away. Find something? Two things. This armed group calls themselves hunters. And they've got a lot of accents. Hmm. International mercenaries? That's what I'm thinking. Could be front page material for your article. I'm writing it up now. Thanks. Oh, and speaking of work, I accepted Harry's offer. That's fantastic. We should celebrate later after you're done with your current work. Totally. Talk soon. That's... Of gear. It's like they're prepping for war. Now, what were they up to? Hello. Surveillance video from the blind I was just at. Looks like they've got others. All around the city. I'll send this to Ganky. But he could help pinpoint these. What's Craven hunting? Why? Yes, it's loaded. We're going to soon. Just make sure the beasts have the right scent. What's in the You hungry too? You could use a break. Aw, for me? You shouldn't have. Oh. oh, sturdy and flexible. Hmm. I wonder. Nice. Time to take my shiny new toy for a test drive. Surrounding bases are online. Remaining blind secured. Blocking fields operational. Good. Beetles, talandrons, ammunition, rations. Hmm. Still missing some shipments. I'll have to pay that yardmaster a visit. But otherwise. Wait. What's this? <gasps> are better equipped than most armies. This Craven guy must be rich or well-connected. Nap <coughs> <coughs> time. Where'd they go? to next. A research lab? Aunt May was so proud of her work at Feast. Lee broke bad in a big way. I just hope that doesn't mean everything he ever touched was corrupted. An inner demon mask. Lee's old superpower gang. Craven better not be trying for the same with his hunters.
even studying Lee's blood? Maybe he's trying to figure out where his powers came from. Or how to get them for himself. Hallucinogens. Probably the worst part of Scorpion's poison. If Craven's adding this to his arsenal... Ugh. That's... the Tiara Abitahi. One of the rarest flowers in the world. Its extract has some pretty powerful medicinal properties. I tried to get some years ago to counteract Scorpion's poison, but couldn't afford the flights to... Riotea? Guess Craven could. Dr. Farley Stillwell? His genetic experiments gave Scorpion his abilities. Craven sure does his research. Were they testing their weapons on that armor? Whoa! And not a single scratch? Almost an exact replica. Must have been probing it for weaknesses. Can never be too careful with Scorpion. Wait a sec. some kind of hunt. Craven the Hunter. What's he hunting? Whatever it is, it definitely involves Scorpion and Lee. Mind looking into this Craven guy in the meantime and letting Miles know what's up? Already on it. Stay safe. How many more fires must we light out in the city? As many as we need to. Craven said they surrounded him in his dream. But if he's dream, then the fires are fated to happen anyway. Why not wait for him? I will hit him with these, not fights. Sleep tight. This morning I wasn't impressed. Relying on hallucinogens and playing with your prey. It's just not the way I hunt. Someone check on the Lucas radio. I've got no response. He was molded into one after all that mad. Just be quiet. We are stronger together. I could really use some answers instead of questions right now. That looks promising. All right, Craven. What are you looking for? Wait. I get bringing Scorpion and Lee on a hunt, but Black Cat's a thief. I don't... Never gonna win best in show with that attitude! Nice doggy kitty robot! Those teeth are no joke! If someone just filled me in! Crazy what man fears most. That's all you need to know. Oh, so he's hunting failure? Intimacy? Clouds! It's clouds, isn't it? Good riddance, I say.
Scorpion, Martin Lee, Black Cat. This Craven guy's putting together quite the team. This the best you can do. They said you were a killer. Imagine my disappointment. Are you? Estás listo? For what? En serio? My date's almost here, and you're surfing the web? Ma, no one says surfing the web anymore. Uh, can you just please get dressed? Okay, okay. I see, you got your good lipstick on. <laughs> you must really like this guy, huh? Miles. I'm sorry. Next time, I promise. I, Miles. I love you. I found a base belonging to those safari pirates, or hunters, as they call themselves, and learned their boss's name, Craven. And he killed Scorpion, and he's got a whole hit list of supervillains. Wait, what? Does this mean Lee? Not sure. Come to think of it, these hunters must have been who Marco was so afraid of in his memories. They went after Sandman. No way. And Felicia's on their list, too. Black Cat? Your ex? Exactly. She won't listen to me if I say she's in danger. But maybe she'd listen to someone she doesn't know. If MJ reached out to you with some addresses, would you be up for taking point on this? I got you. Thanks, really. I gotta clear my head for a bit, but call me if anything comes up and... 
We're going to find Lee Miles. I promise. <sighs> Guess I've got some time until MJ calls. What's going on in the neighborhood? <laughs> Like Pete was right. This is definitely a hunter blind. Maybe I can find out if there's a base nearby too. Did one of you call reinforcements? Cause I'm not cool. Get down, What were they guarding? Come here, Birdie. Tell me a story. A map of a base. Any chance you can show me what's waiting for me there? If I disable that relay, they won't be able to call for backup. Nice. So you've been to two other blinds around Harlem, huh? Better scope out the other blinds. Maybe they'll lead me to a base. Hey, Miles, I have those addresses Pete mentioned for a few of Black Cat's safe houses. Head into the first one now. Thanks for offering to do this. Pete can get kind of blindsided by Felicia. I know you're busy with your college essay. It's cool. I always have time to Spider-Man. Sounds like you're as good at work-life balance as I am. I'm scrambling to finish my Hunter story. Might save my job. But you guys... What happened to Scorpion and Lee in the wind? I can't focus while he's out there, MJ. Don't. Don't let it eat you up. It might be best to just focus on the task at hand. That's not all. When I face Lee, I got some new powers. They're blue and weird. Uh, I mean, I'm no expert on spider powers, but... C could it be from stress? What you're going through, it it's a lot. But you're not alone. Even Pete and I, we're still figuring it all out. One thing at a time, right? We'll find him. I know. Thanks, MJ. And Miles, be careful with Felicia. You can't trust her, no matter what she says. Warn her about the hunters and get her out of the city. Understood. Let you know when I get there. Gotta get in there and... My Harlem? Hunter's about to find out there's a new Shogun in town. Oh! That's the abandoned school that my mom keeps trying to get repaired. That's their base? Someone has to let them know school's out of session. For good. Ready to enroll for classes at Hunter High? I'm gonna take them to school. The school of hard knocks. Oof. That's bad, Miles. Sorry. It was part of my spider training. Bad day to be a bad guy. Hunters in this area, but the base isn't clear yet. data you got from the blinds shows another room here. Maybe it's got some intel about the hunters we can use? Yeah, 
I can work with this. Uh, let's see what... Oh, there's an encrypted file. Sasha, give up this obsession. Come home to me while we still have time left. Our time is over, my love. And your children? They will draw blood for control of our empire. The cubs must earn their place. Like anyone else. They will see me as an obstacle. Then you must strike first. Craven's family? They sound... cool. Could be trouble down the line. We should take care of all their bases then, in case they show up. What do we got? Place looks like it was ransacked. Perfect chance to use the AR tech Genki upgraded. marks huh. any sign of her found some scratch marks with traces of metal I'll run it to see if it matches her claws just have to isolate the molecular components of the metal filings I found nice tungsten a match Must have scuff marks from her shoes. She was grabbing something from that box on the wall. Looks like an emergency stash box, but it's empty. Hunters. That should be enough to reconstruct the scene. They attacked, but she's on the run. They're already on to her. This is exactly why the city needs to be warned about the hunters. She could have... Keep me posted. Whoa! Well, that's gotta be her. Well, this went from a friendly warning to a rescue mission pretty quick. I just hope I'm not too late. Alicia's resourceful, but everything we've seen from these hunters has me kind of worried. You worried about your boyfriend's ex? That's compassion! <laughs> Looks like I just missed them. Any signs of where they went? Let me scan the area and see. An electrical node. I bet there's more. Another node down. Line was damaged by the explosion. Wonder what it powers. Another stash box. This one's still locked. She risked her whole life to get to it. Gotta open it, but the power's disconnected. If I tether my web to the generator, I can get into the box. Nearly there. MJ, how's your French? Non-existent, but send me what you got. Okay. There's some instruction manual for a Wanda Watoom. Watoom? Hmm. I'll do a search. Give me a sec. Hunters. Wherever they're headed, I should follow. Yeah. According to a translation of the Mystic Arcana, that wand is old. We're talking BC old. Supposedly, whoever wields it can create portals to pretty much wherever they can think of. Like magic? If she gets her hands on something like that. I can think of some uses for it. Miles, let's just stick to the plan. in position. She's ours. She's definitely inside. Gotta clear these hunters out. Whatever that wand does, it does it brightly. I've got like this. We should rush. 
crush the Sanctum Centaurum. Thanks for your cooperation. Cat's doing magic in there, or I'm missing out on a hell of a rave. I don't like this. What is she up to? We should rush the Sanctum Centaurum. Drag her out. Uh, I've heard rumors of weird things going on inside this building. Looks like the rumors are true. Here's that nap time you ordered. French from that postcard translates to my reason for living. Time is short. A new partner? With Felicia? You never know. This is all a dream. Tout va bien par là. Spider wants to play, huh? Why won't you help me stop this guy? You're Spider-Man. You've saved the city before. You'll do it again. Spider-Man was right about you. You only care about yourself. Look, kid. Not that it's your business. My girlfriend's in Paris. And I got her into trouble with some bad people. Have you ever done something for love? She needs me now. If only I could figure out how to go more than 10 feet with this thing. MJ said not to trust you. <gasps> Red's a smart one. But you gotta make your own choices, kid. There's a cat! Take her alive! She lies! You should go! Portal out of here! The instruction manual for this artifact was not clear! You seem to be getting better at it! Not better enough! 
figure it out. Together. Damn. Lucky attitude, kid. It's Spider-Man, not kid. Thank you. All right, Spider-Man. Let's see what you've got. She's everywhere. I cannot catch her. Get him down. More of them. On the roof. Hey, use this portal. Felicia. Thank you. Show me Lee. What's up with Felicia? She's safe, for now. You finish your story? Just send it to Jonah. Wish me luck. You got this. Dude, head to Coney Island. Why, what's up? You know how Mysterio just got out of prison? <laughs> well, he's opening a new attraction there. He could be the hunter's next target. Good call. And guess who else is at Coney tonight? Hint, you've crushed on her for like over a year. Come on, bro. Don't bro me, bro. You and Haley are made for each other. If you don't ask her out, you're violating laws of nature. We'll see after we check on Mysterio. <laughs> Gotta change it to Miles first. Then I'll scope out the park, incognito. I don't see any bad guys. Hmm. And should we take a closer look? Hmm. 
Hello. I'm Quentin Beck, master illusionist. And this is Betsy, my business partner, and Cole, my technical advisor. And this... is the next generation of entertainment. <laughs> no way, dude. Excellent! Cole, a brave young man, ready to experience the future firsthand. Is there anyone else out there with courage in their hearts? Come on, come all, and experience the future! There's a kiosk up ahead. Just keep moving. If you enjoy your experience, please tell your friends and feel free to visit one of the many Mysteriums now open around the city. Our free trial ends soon. Thank you, Betsy. I'm sure he will. Now to customize your experience. As you look at these images, I want you to think about your future, your hopes and your dreams. Ah, yes, I'm getting good data. And we're done. No way! <laughs> Enjoy the show. Don't worry, I'll be watching and listening. If at any time you begin to feel uncomfortable, just let us know. Enjoy your dream come true. All right, let's get it. Oh, nice!
not function. Obviously! I'm sorry, we cannot see you. Can you describe what is happening? I was rocking the club, then a bunch of bad guys showed up. Now they're trying to rock me! Oh, dear. I hope you're not hurt. I can hold my own, but can't you just pull the plug or something? It's not that easy. But we are trying. We're almost there. Are you still uh, holding your own? Barely! Sit tight. Just a few more moments. Beck said this was my custom dream come true. Maybe more like a nightmare. There's the mixer. Get to it. Fast. I think if you finish the song, you might hit a break point in the program. There. You should see an exit. Make your way to the... Are you okay? Yeah. I, I am very sorry. We will do our best to find out what happened. But until then... Miles! <laughs> so, uh, what's up with that? Oh. <laughs> uh, the future of entertainment still has some bugs to work out. Hi, Pete. <laughs> cool shirt. <laughs> cool shoes. Uh, really cool shoes. Cool everything, really. Hey, Miles. Thank you. Uh, guys, this is my best friend, Harry. Uh, he just got back from overseas, and he's starting up a new research foundation. You mean we're starting up a new research foundation? <laughs> hey, good to meet you. Uh, new job, huh? You still gonna have time for tutoring? We'll figure it out. Shall we? Actually, that thing back there really messed my head up. Can we dip? Okay. Nice meeting you, Harry. Yeah, you too. You... you good? Yeah. Actually, uh... I'll catch up with you later. Hey, we should really check it on Miles. Make sure he's okay. Yeah, I will. Okay. Well, they seem nice. <laughs> Not too bad they're gonna miss out on the best night of our lives, huh? <laughs> All right, here's the plan. Tonight is the greatest hits album of our childhood, and the top three singles, each of our favorite attractions. Welcome! All right, let's do this. Step right up. You have no idea who you're up against. <laughs> Good luck. You'll need it. Now, Pete, you got this. All yeah, right, players. Fingers on the trigger, let's eyes go. on the target. And our returning champion keeps his crown. <laughs> Hold up. You guys want your prize? Oh, we're good. Thanks. I look good in the crown. <laughs> Next on our top three, MJ Watson featuring the Speed Demon. <laughs> yes. Let's hit the other rides and games on the way. Hold on. Let's do this one. How did I let you talk me into this? Ah, stop and smell the popcorn. How can you think about food right now? You know me. I have many talents. Well, with the sure. spinning vertigo ride out of the way. <laughs> I forgot how much I love that one. Anyway. <laughs> yes. Let's hit the other rides and games on the way. If we do enough of them, we can win something from the prize no, pool. You want to play? I knew I read that somewhere. Yeah, let's go! Another stamp for our ticket. Right behind you. You two go get declared soulmates. I'm gonna fly solo. See if I give off Casanova vibes. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> soulmates, huh? No pressure. What does this thing know about us?
Maybe that you should move in with me? Or maybe that everything's too up in the air to think about it yet? Yeah, maybe. Whoa, that can't be right. What is this thing reading anyway? Our body temperature? <laughs> or our skin's pH? Highly doubt it's that sophisticated. Over here, let's do this one next. Just three left. Go-karts, anyone? <laughs> With your driving? Hard pass. Come on, you two lovebirds. We've got more park to explore. <laughs> doing here looks like he's a mechanic and saving the day <laughs> thanks for pulling me out man that could have been really bad maybe we should try the roller coaster <laughs> excited I'd be to ride the speed demon again. How's it feel? Weirdly high. Or do you mean being this handsome, this charm? Being Peter. Being Peter is nice. I think we could both use more nights like this. Yeah. We always say we will, but... Let's pinky promise this time. Just not right now. Too high. All right. Postponed pinky promise. Ah! <laughs> huh, needed that. It's so relaxing up there. <laughs> I want to go scope out the popcorn situation. You guys want anything? Caramel corn would hit the spot. On it. Good to be back, Pete. Can I ask you something? Being gone, I've missed a lot. You just lost your job, MJ's got work woes. Are you both... okay? Yeah! Yeah, we're okay. Everything's great. I mean, especially with EMF. We're gonna change the world. <laughs> yeah. Did you have a bag like that? Over there, the guy in the blue shirt. Oh, no, that's uh, a knockoff. How can you tell from here? Ah, oh, print's too big. The wrong shade of red on the piping. You can see that? Well, it's candy apple. You can see it from the top of the big wheel. Yeah, that is pretty bright. See? I know things. Looking good, Pete. You know I'm never taking this off, right? You're gonna wear that to the office. Co-founder approved. <laughs> Such a gentleman. You doing okay? I'm really nervous. Don't worry about it. Chances the person Harry gave his prize to would be the single rider sitting next to him. I mean, it would be one heck of a meet cute. Should we tell her? Tell her what? What are you two whispering about up there? <laughs> Just reminding MJ to keep her hands inside the vehicle at all times. Woo! That was epic! <laughs> right? <laughs> I needed that. <laughs> <sighs> All right, fearless leader, what's next? Our last showcase of the night. The muscle up. Oh, you know it, baby. Never did hit that bell. But the dream always kept me coming back. I think this will be the year. <laughs> Sorry, in a hurry. Wow. Oh, 
Miles gets to see these. Haley's got some talent. Expert color theory at work here. Feels familiar, yet modern. Well, somebody remembered a thing or two from AP Art. Muscle up. Muscle up. Muscle up. Muscle up. Muscle up. Muscle up. All right, all right. It's so nice to just wander around. People watch. I honestly don't remember the last time we let ourselves relax for a night. Seems like it's been forever. Stuff just always gets in the way. Man, Pete, you must have had one packed tutoring schedule. <laughs> yeah, so. You two have always had your noses to the grindstone. Sometimes you gotta stop and smell Welcome. the roses. Who's up first? Pete, come on. On, man. <laughs> nice! <laughs> Take it easy, Harry. Don't hurt yourself. The only thing that's gonna hurt is your Parker pride. Boys, boys. You're both pretty. Here. Harry, that was something else. <sighs> yeah, I have no idea how I did that. Okay, how about we do something more chill? Looks like the Ferris wheel line has died down some. Is that a dunk tank? That's new. Uh, thanks, but it's gonna be a hard pass for me on the boat. Really? You used to be really into swimming. Didn't you win state? It's like you said, MJ. People can change. Thanks, Pete. Coming through. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna let you two go ahead and be cute together. I'm gonna go see if I can win a couple more unicorns. It's funny. Harry's getting a second chance, but I feel like I'm getting one too. You two are gonna make a hell of a team. <laughs> the bugle posted. Did Jonah put you on the front page? Oh, you're gonna be an editor. I should have brought champagne. Hunters and scorpions and explosions, oh my. Jonah posted the new guy story. Oh, MJ, uh, yeah. It already has 5,000 views. <sighs> I've got to write a different kind of story. Win his trust, somehow. Hey, you come up with something. You always do. And hey, if you need some help from your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man, I'd say we make a hell of a team too. Even if I do forget the champagne. Next time. Huh? 
What super villain are you hunting this time? The stereo? Tombstone? Don't let the spider get in our way. Get him out. Didn't expect to see me? Well, the feeling's mutual. One night off. That's all I wanted. But no. He won't fall close by. Tombstone can handle himself. He can't take on all of us. Can't let them hurt anyone who hasn't gotten out of the park yet. Oh no, Harry! It's inside. Come on, Harry, pick up, pick up. Hey, it's Harry. Leave a message. MJ, Harry isn't answering his phone. I've got my hands full with these hunters, and I don't see him anywhere. There is little pot about to catch down. I'll make sure he's safe. And you stay safe, too. <laughs> you know I don't go anywhere without my Simkari and Sidekick. Is that what you call your sable stingray? Still workshopping it. I'll let you know when I find Harry. <laughs> Moving in on the raceway. That's where Tombstone was working. He's tough, and so are these guys. Hunter, start your engines! You may the best spider win! I knew he'd win the race. MJ, you found Harry? Not yet, but I saw Mysterio. Kraven's Goon Squad doesn't seem to be interested in him. Like, at all. And they must only want Tombstone. Thanks for the tip! Yeah. I'll keep looking for Harry. Could you come back later? Now isn't really a good time! The spider is down. Go get Tombstone.
I'm sorry! Sure do. Spider-Man? I know, I know. But first, what are those things coming out of you? I think it's my treatment. <laughs> Dr. Connor said it's some kind of self-learning exosuit, but I had no idea it could. Wait. You know what this means, right? We both have superpowers. Just think about all the stuff we could do to heal the world! Sorry. I, uh... Guess I still gotta figure out how this thing works. Well... It's a real shame neither of us has a state-of-the-art science lab to run some tests. I'll go make sure the coast is clear. Meet you there? Give me a call when you're ready. Coney. What was that? Well, uh, remember my friend Harry? Yeah? That was him? How? Honestly, no idea. I think it's this treatment he's been... Oh, that's Harry. Gotta go. Hey, I cleared out the foundation. All right, I'll swing by. <laughs> swing by. Man, how many times have you said that in minute, literally? See what else this thing can do. What are you doing? Science, buddy. I'm doing science. <laughs> so, Spider Man, you told MJ, but not your best friend? To protect you. I, I wanted to. Right. Yeah, I get it. And that kid you're tutoring, he's the other one? Uh, a lot happened while you were in that tank. Trust me. I know. <laughs> nice and gentle. Whoops. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna make some coffee. It looks like it's gonna be a long night.
What the hell happened here? Um, we were, we were just, um, doing some experiments. Where's Dr. Connors? Uh, maybe he took the day off? No. He doesn't take days off. I'm gonna go. Yeah. Yeah, I'll call you later. I need a minute. Harry's got superpowers? This is all happening so fast. Wait, what's that? Hey, guys. I'm getting a strange spider bot signal. You got that too? Uh, Genki, you testing something? I was just about to call you guys. A bunch of them just pinged the network out of nowhere. They're using some funky wireless protocols. I'll check it out and let you know what I find. Sharp. Uploading info to the Spidey server. Got it. I'll keep an eye out for more. Send me the data when you find him. I'll try to track down who made it. Hey, long night? Hey, MJ. Harry and I stayed up doing tests on his suit. And we may have had too much pizza. It was really nice. <laughs> Just like the good old days. So I gotta know. What's Harry's radioactive spider? I've never seen anything like this before. It's some kind of exosuit that completely eradicates any trace of his disease. Dr. Connors really outdid himself this time. That's incredible. And great timing, considering what happened at the park. Any leads on where they might have taken Tombstone? Not yet. But if I hear anything, you're my first call. Oh, you're the best. Yeah, I know. <sighs> Spider-Man, over here! Hey, Chief. Thanks for... We've managed to set our explosives in every zone except the last one. The demo crew's in there. There's four of them. I'll find them. Just keep your radios open. And make sure nobody touches that detonator. No. Spider-Bot can search faster in there than I can. Your time to shine, little guy. Make Spidey Daddy proud. All right. I find the people, Clark gets them out. Is anyone out there? Help! Is that a robot? Hey, it's Spider-Man. I just relayed your location to fire and rescue, so they'll be here any minute. It's gonna be okay. Spider-Man. Thank you. Hey, Clark, did you get the location I just sent over? Our team's moving in now. Thanks. Spider-Man's here. It's gonna be okay. Help! I'm, I'm coming. coming! Just hang on! <coughs> you should have enough traction to pull him out. Fire and rescue's on its way. Are you okay? Oh, I'm good. But I saw somebody up ahead a few minutes ago. Purple jacket. Make sure you help them. Hey, Clark. I just sent a new location your way. But this guy said someone else is still trapped in here. Really? I'm not missing anyone else. But if you can find them, we'll get them out. I'm on it. I think they had a gas mask on.
about the intruder that's been skulking around? They can't stop all of us. Now keep looking for supplies. We'll need them in the days ahead. Ah. The flame is disappointed in you. What are they? Oh no. I didn't say anything to the police. Never, never even mentioned the flame. I just, I just wanted out. Then you should have remembered we all go out the same way we come in. Painfully. Get out of here! Oh, the fool's speaking! The prophecy said you'd face us eventually. Prophecy? Oh man, I've always wanted to be in one of those! Not crazy about the nickname though! Whoa, guys, can we take this out? Is everyone okay? Besides me knocking you out, obviously? We're better than you can be. Eternal. Thanks. So what's your deal? There you are. Hey! You never did like my smoking. Yuri? Little life's call me Wraith. Fits pretty well, I think. I tried... Where have you been? No time. What about them? They made their choice. This will be a new record? And they said it couldn't be done. Looks like Yuri took off. I thought she'd just need some time after what happened with Hammerhead. But coming back with that suit and a name like Wraith? I should keep an eye on her and the other on these cultists. I need more eyes. Hey, spiders. Got something for you. Head to this location. Felicia? Hey, Felicia. Heard some chatter about the steel foundry in Williamsburg off a radio I swiped from those hunters. Sounds like tombstones there. We could use your help. Thanks. Glad you're all right. Did you make it to Pierce in time? Yeah, I did. Figured I owed you one. Both of you. Even if the other Spider-Man couldn't be bothered to make an appearance. Uh, yeah. About you can save the explanation. We both moved on. He's a good one, by the way. He really is. Well, thanks for the tip. I'm not sure I'd be able to find Tombstone in time without you. Yeah, thanks. Take care of yourself. Those fashion school rejects won't be getting the drop on me again. Ta-ta, spiders. Miles, let me take this one. You're gonna miss your essay deadline. But what if... If Lee's there, I'll take care of him. Spider-Man can wait. Miles can't. All right, just keep in touch. Hope Felicia's lead was right. Gotta get to Tombstone before Craven crosses him off his list, too. Hey, Yuri! I tracked the followers of the Flame to an abandoned clinic in Chinatown. If we go together, maybe we'll find their boss. So you can leave them to die, too? Not unless I have to. Look, this cult needs to be stopped. You want to come along, it'd make things easier. But I don't need you. If I went, I could keep an eye on her. She 
she go inside? Nope. How is this going to work? Just team up like normal or... How long you been tracking these guys? A few weeks. Heard rumors for a while. They leave bodies in their wake. They care a lot about the Crimson Hour, whatever that is. <laughs> the hot new club in Hell's Kitchen? Wow, that just popped out there, huh? Who says stuff like that? Not me. Let's all mine. We shouldn't have to wait much longer. The new recruits will be here within the hour. I just hope they're stronger than the last group. So many of them. Nice form. When we find their boss, how will we know it's their boss? Something tells me these people aren't fans of subtlety. Let's look around. Up here. Take out the cultists and keep moving? Sounds good. So, it's been, what, a year and a half since... How have you been? We don't have to do the small talk. We're here on a job. You're on the end. What did you think of the Book of Play? Incredible. I'm seeing the world in a whole new light now. It's not small talk for me. I was worried right about you. There? I'm fine. I was angry before and sloppy. But I'm better now. Steady. No signs of their boss yet. Let's keep going. Uh, it's locked. And I bet forcing it will trigger an alarm. Doesn't look like it takes keys. Must be a way to unlock it around here. Looks like the cult uses tattoos to show off their ranks. Seems like new recruits are always paired up when they join. Good way to keep an eye on everyone. Wait, I've got an idea. You want to share with the class? Just watch. That's it. The door only opens when it sees the correct pair of tattoos. I've got mine. You see anyone with a Hephaestus tattoo? Is this supposed to be a good thing or a bad thing? How does any of that look good? Please, please don't wake up. And not the tattoo I'm looking for. Great. There we go. Second time's the charm. Ugh. So, you got any tattoos? Just the one of Spider Cop's gravestone. Really? If you run away again, he won't be so forgiving. Trust the flame, for everything burns. <laughs> for everything burns. You hear that somewhere before? <laughs> Show off. Let's check on the prisoners. We're gonna get you out of here as soon as we can. Please. I'm not supposed to be here. We'll find a way to get you out. If the flame lets you. Hey, you okay in there? Hello? We're here to help. Don't be so loud. Someone's bound to see us if we go through the doors. If they're the followers of the flame, is that the flame holding court down there? I don't think so. 
trust in the flame, for everything burns. Since time began, there has been no clearer truth. So let us remember it now, because the Crimson Hour is coming. Hello? I still have someone there? Up. I've given hey, everything to up. the flame, except your trouble. <laughs> See the door controls anywhere? I'm not sure. The wiring for the cells leads right here. Clubs again. Love is not a trick. None of this is love. I extended my hand when nobody else would. I doubt you, nor the fool's beacon there, would have done the same. But what would it take for you to love me? Tell me where you're hiding and I'll show you. hospital north of Astoria. Stop by any time. If you're both worthy. You knew who the flame was this whole time? No. I had my suspicions, but I wasn't sure until I saw it. You won't let him deceive the How do you two know each other? You ran another group like this when I was a cop! I shut them down! He got away! The flame's not even here. We have to go after him. After we help the prisoners get out. Wait here. We'll make sure it's safe. You want to handle the door? Why not? Now let's get those folks out of here. Shouldn't take us long to get to the hospital. Yuri! This is the most obvious trap I've ever seen! And I fought Trapster. We can't wait on this one. You don't know him. I do know that we can't help anyone if we rush in there and get killed. We need a plan. I'll scout out this hospital base of his and make sure everything's safe. Happy? That's one word for it, sure. Another word would be slightly less stressed. The reports coming in from Brooklyn are to be believed. These Spider-Men have grown more powerful than we feared. Magic portals, subway cars disappearing off the tracks, fire engines flying through the night sky, and the newer Spider-Man 
at the center. Welding and property damage weren't enough. Now, we add mystical arts into the mix. Does their desire for destruction know no bounds? I almost feel sorry for this lost soul. Groomed for a life of criminality and degradation. Speaking of it, it seems Spider-Man was cohorting with notorious thief, the Black Cat. Their costumes must be cut from the same corrupt cloth. If their entanglement doesn't paint a clear enough picture of Spider-Man's intent, then here's a little story for you. The Spider-Men show up, and the group we now know as the Hunters follow. Clearer now? These Spider-Men are magnets for malefactors. Now, the Black Cat seems to have vanished. Good riddance! If magic is indeed real, then we must hope upon hope that someone out there is using it for good and will erase the stain in our city known as the Spider-Men. May we go one day without another spider incident. Through an abandoned foundry, this place sure is active. What's taking them so long? Extra precautions. Tombstone has proven challenging. Right. Stay ready. Hunt to live? Live to hunt. Need to clear these rooftops and find a way in. It's lousy with hunters. If it's all for me, I'm honored. Hey, finally finished with my dad. Still no clue where Dr. Connors is. I haven't seen Dad look this stressed in a while. We'll find Connors. Why don't you call MJ and ask her to go swing by his house? Yeah, good idea. I'll meet you back at the Foundation once I'm done here. What are you up to? Need a hand? In Williamsburg, at the old steel foundry. Sounds like they're holding Tombstone here. Sounds like a job for the Spider Pals. That is not what we're calling ourselves. Well, what do you and the other guy go by? I don't know. Spider-Men? Spider-Mans? That's... confusing. I should go. This place is crawling with hunters. So you do need help? No, do not come here. These people are deadly. Can't risk you getting hurt. Talk soon. We must not fail to play the game. Keep your guard up. No one gets inside. Stay down. Please. This smokestack looks like my ticket in. with MJ. She says you'll head over to Connor soon. That's great news. Yeah, just making sure. You said the steel foundry, right? Yeah. What are you doing? Guardio. Get back to your workout. I have to find Tombstone quick before he ends up like Scorpion. We lost communication outside. Tighten security around Tombstone. Calling reinforcements. <laughs> Relax. Look out. I think that's the last of them. just can't make it easy. <laughs> Harry? What are you doing here? I'm helping you out, Spider-Man. You're welcome, by the way. I was hoping to do this quietly. Is this my fault? You go left, I go right. Let's do this. <laughs> Kinda hope to start you off with something easier! What better way to learn than on the job training? Uh, Unstoppable! Uh, you're getting good at this! Uh, Who's ever felt so strong? Don't let it get to your head. We're not invincible! Uh, 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 you feel like this 
all the time? It's not all punching bad guys. I've had to make some hard choices, too. That's the gig. Rescue a supervillain. Reformed supervillain. But still a guy who's tried to kill you a few times. He's trying to change. I want to help him. Man, you really do believe in the best of everyone. All right, let's. Come on! Gotta hit them before they hit us! Oh, here we go again. And another one? Get it! Love your enthusiasm, but I like to work smarter, not harder. What's the matter? How have we got this? We do until we don't. Understood. I won't let you down. You okay with all this fire? Yeah, actually. Not even breaking a sweat. Lock on. Let's do this. If we don't move, it won't see us. Well, that was wishful thinking. They're here! What was that thing with your suit? I don't know. The alarm really messed with my head. Just glad you're all right. Arrows, machetes, rockets, now robot birds? Don't forget the robot dogs! What's gonna try to kill us next? Any other tankers? Nail! Shoot him! Don't let him hit you! This is getting intense! Where is this guy already? Something tells me we're close. Starting to feel out of my depth here. 
Sure we can do this? Of course. We're the Spider Pals. All right. Yeah! There's our guy. What's the plan? I think we should get him. I'll run a distraction. See if you can break him free. On it. They grow up so fast. I'm gonna break you out of here, okay? You can't. They rigged this whole thing. Then I'll derig it. What did I just tell you? Sorry, it's my first day. Gonna need a hand here! Be right back. Are they getting bigger? Let's get them! One more time into the fire? You're making jokes at a time like this? Part of the job. Ironic, uh, the spider come to save me. Hey, you owe me one. <laughs> Let's see if you make it out. Where do they keep coming from? Some sort of booking agency? We have to turn off this furnace. There! If we can overload the machine with a coolant, it should shut down. Just in time to shut down the furnace. All right, this should. You trying to kill everyone here? What's the plan? Sorry. They don't quit. Well, neither do we. It's getting hot in here. I think this suit is fireproof. Lucky you! Open fire! We don't have time for this! What do we do? Hunt faster! That I can do! We gotta get Tombstone out! Maybe we can weaken the cage! There! Pull out those supports! Call me crazy! This might be one of the best days of my life! We really need to get you out more! Only two left! What's this thing made of? I don't know, but this place is falling apart! Keep trying! It's not working! Just hang on! We need to pull those supports down! We got this!
stressful? Yoga's done wonders for my mental health. You trying to die here? Move it! No, 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 no! We lost him! Don't panic! Quick, this way! Harry! Harry! Gotta keep moving. Hold up! Can you see if we were followed? <sighs> On it. Only downside to going straight. The game keeps you in shape. Glad we got to you in time. Some of the others weren't so lucky. <laughs> they couldn't have off me if they tried. Sides, they were waiting for their boss to do the deed. You have someplace safe to go? Yeah. They come for me again, I'll be ready. Tell your friend thanks for looking out for me. See you around, Spider. Yeah. Looks like they split. We should too. Yeah. Hey, good job back there. Really? I was pretty sure I was just messing everything up. You were, but in the best possible way. What are you... Hold on. No! <sighs> Sorry. I'm still figuring out how this thing works. <laughs> nice design. What do you mean? Didn't you just... Huh? <laughs> I guess I did. <laughs> Would you look at that? I guess we really are spider pals now. <laughs> I think I'm gonna head back to the lab. See if Dr. Connors has showed up yet. Good call. I'll catch up with you soon. Incredible. not be because you saw a millipede again. Better check in with Pete first. Hey, Miles. Yo, man. It's been a minute. You need any spider help? Actually, we're all good. We managed to rescue Tombstone before Craven could get his hands on him. We? Oh, long story short, my buddy Harry, he has some sort of power suit. Kicked all kinds of butt with it. He's gonna be a big help with these hunters, that's for sure. Wait. Is he one of us now? Sort of? It's all happening fast, but we'll talk later. Gotta run. Talk later. He says that a lot. Okay. Better see what's going on with Ma. <laughs> this is always a handy place to change. make such a difference for the community. Thank you so much for your support. Okay. Bye-bye. Miles. Hey, Ma. Mm. Ben. Siéntate. <laughs> I just wanted to check in. See how you're doing. Todo bien? Mm. Fine. Everything's good. <sighs> okay. It's just a lot right now. So much to take care of in the city. <sighs> Super stressed about my college essay. Pete's busy doing other stuff. And Lee. Lee is still out there. Doesn't that bother you? Of course it bothers me. But I'm committed to making this community better. I've got to let go of things that don't serve me 
and focus on where I want to go, not where I've been. ¿Entiendes lo que te digo? Yeah. But Lee? I can't just let him go. Angela, I'm gonna have to call you back. No, how can you be locked out? You have a key. Oh. No, no, I, I understand the urgency. Uh, let me make some calls. Okay. Mom, do you need me to go? Didn't you just finish telling me how busy you are? Yeah, but I always have time for my community. Okay, Ma, where am I headed? Harlem Cultural Center, 116th and Convent. That was my friend Angela on the phone. She's the curator, and she's trying to give a prospective donor a private tour. But the security system locked her out. Whoops! Awkward! Angela lined up a bunch of items for a new music exhibit. Funding fell through. And if this donor doesn't cover the costs, the museum might have to close. I'll make sure they get in. I'm passionate about preserving the musical heritage of this community. But how can I donate to a museum where the security system isn't even functional? Darren, I hear your concerns, but I assure you this museum will be... Spider-Man. Oh, thank God. The system's locked us out, and it's not responding to any input at all. Let's see if I can figure out what's wrong with it. Need to find the control panel. Relays are overloaded. Try to get inside the walls to fix them. Let's patch things up so Angela can give that tour. Who are these guys? I'm sure the alarm will go off. EMP took out the whole system. We're all alone in here. Just need to break this padlock and we're in. So if that's how Angela got locked out, better reset the system so I can get in there and stop these guys. Hmm, not too bad. Let me fix it up real quick. Got it. Hey, Miles. I checked in with all the feast shelters. No one has seen Martin Lee. Thanks. I can't believe I let him get away when I could've... You know? Could've what? Made sure he didn't hurt anyone else. Right. Well, don't worry. I'll keep looking. There must be some valuable stuff in here. These guys seem like pros. Get this back online. Who's that? Yo, Doug, that better be you! Everything okay? I'm going to a snag, but I'm handling it. While you're there, check out some of the instruments. Get you ready for college. Ma, I'm going into music tech. Computers are my instruments. Music starts with a human, their instrument and their soul. When you're mixing or sampling, you have to listen close and capture that soul. Computers can't do that. You know how old you sound right now? Old and wise? these guys don't get away with any of this stuff. Abort! Let's roll! Nice work, Spatterbot. Now it's my turn.
Spider-Man, the front door's finally open. But there is a bunch of stuff missing. It's all up back in the loading docks. And I'll make sure it stays there. Let's get out of here, quick! Go, go, go! <laughs> Maybe I should move to rendezvous point in an hour. Not today. <laughs> Gotta stop those trucks. <sighs> Gotta pick one for now. drummer. They only recovered items from one truck? What a mess. Sorry, Angela. This is a deal breaker. There goes our best hope for a big donor. There's still the fundraising gala. If we don't find that second truck, there is no exhibit. Without an exhibit, there is no gala. Without a gala, the museum will have to close. That won't happen. I promise. Here. <gasps> this? belong to Clyde Stubblefield. Oh, the original funky drummer. <laughs> Do you know how often his rhythms were sampled? <gasps> he was so influential, a direct line from funk to hip hop. <laughs> Thank you. And don't worry, I'll find the rest of those items. Thank you. I should check in with Pete. calling. I have to take this. Catch up later? Oh, uh, sure, man. Later. Hey, Pete. I'm at EMF. No sign of Doc Connors yet, but I could use an extra set of eyes. On my way. Have you heard anything from MJ? You said she's stopping by his house, right? Nothing yet. She told me she'd call when she got there. Let's hope he's just taking a sick day. Yeah, definitely. I I'm gonna check her office. Just come by when you can. Spider-Man, thank you for coming. I'm looking for my Grandpa Earl. 
He kept talking about meeting someone here, and now he's gone, and... Can you please help me find him? Any clues on where he might be? Just this picture. He was staring at it all morning. Oh, this looks familiar. Some kind of exhibit. Looks like this was taken 60 years ago. Around the same time of year, too. I'll find him. Don't worry. Please hurry. He gets confused, and I just don't want him to get scared or hurt or... This is the place. No grandpa. Let's see. Did you leave any hints behind? Someone put a flower arrangement by the sea lion pool. And what's that? Is that his note? Yep, addressed to the man himself. Hey, he's not at the zoo, but I found a note addressed to him that says something about a botanical garden. My grandparents used to take weekend walks through the botanical gardens. That has to be where he is. This is Grandpa's inhaler. He probably needs it. That hat on the bench. If that's Grandpa Earl's, he's definitely got style. The substance analyzer should do the trick. If I isolate the compound, maybe I can create a trail that will lead to Grandpa. He isn't at the gardens either, but I found his inhaler and was able to science my way into creating a trail I can follow. I'll let you know when I find him. Oh no, really? Please hurry, he needs that thing like he needs lungs. <sighs> Lately I've been so busy. Sometimes taking care of him felt like a thing I had to do. But the thought of losing him, all I want is to sit with him. Me. Don't be so hard on yourself. It's hard to balance your own personal life with other responsibilities. Believe me, I know. We all do what we can. I found your grandpa by the lake. I'll sit with him until you get here. You did? I'm on my way. Stay right there. Hey there, sir. Spider-Man? Whatever you think I did, I didn't. <laughs> Your granddaughter asked me to find you. Granddaughter? Huh. Well, tell her I'll be back in a minute. I propose to my wife here. Right here, where we sit. Wow, really? I have to ask, how do you propose? First off, we had to go to the zoo. Never met a soul who loved animals more than that woman. I was terrified. I meant to ask her at the meerkats. <laughs> she said they reminded her of me. But my knees were knocking, man. I couldn't see straight. We left the zoo and just kept walking. Ended up here. She... <laughs> if you saw her, man, just... Perfect, but clumsy. Nearly fell into that pond there. <laughs> Face first. You ever been in love, Spider-Man? Yeah. Yeah, I have. It's beautiful. Nothing more beautiful. Can I tell you something, Spider-Man? I know I'm fading. It's scary as hell. Thought I'd be ready, but nothing gets you ready. Nothing. When I'm here, it's like she is too. Like I'm living it all over again. All nervous and sweating and whatnot. Then I look into her eyes and it's like I'm home. I was so nervous that day, Spider-Man. Almost didn't even ask. It's like I blinked, and she's gone. I'm sorry. You said my granddaughter was looking for me? Let's go see her.
I should have guessed you'd come here. Sorry we lost track of each other. It was my fault for wandering off. But Spider-Man took good care of me. Had a nice chat about your grandma. Oh, yeah? She used to love this spot, huh? I feel like I spent every weekend here with her, feeding the duck. <laughs> Hey! Gotcha! Hello to you as well. Ah, uh, I wanted to get a candid shot. I want to be a real photojournalist, you know? Document the city as it is. Like this photo, captured by Peter Parker. That was his first cover photo way back in the day. I want to do that. Oh, wow. Can't believe you have this. First cover. I think I actually remember when he took that. Mr. Jameson? It's Peter Parker. I called about selling you some photos. See, my uncle just passed and our mortgage is due and- Parker, I didn't ask for your life story. Sorry. I'm sitting outside the bugle finishing my coffee. If you can get here before I'm done, I'll look at your photos. But I'm warning you, I drink fast. I'm Mr. Jameson. I'm biking down Fifth. The traffic... If you want something, you go after it. But... Tell me something. Are you a New Yorker or some slack dog tourist? Um, New Yorker? Then when something's in your path, you yell, Coming through! And if something blocks you, go around. New Yorkers always find a way. gotta get to work. You know why people live in this town? Is it the cheap rent? The low cost of living? No. This godforsaken hellhole is the greatest city ever created. Oh no! Fish! Stop looking for an excuse and keep going! Ugh, the smell! Oh no, construction ahead. I'll never get it. Eyes on the prize, Parker! Excuse me, can I come through? You're a New Yorker! Tell them you're coming through! Hey. Say, look out, halfwit! These are my streets! Hey! Halfway! No, sorry! Excuse me! Scooting by! Uh, Parker? Pathetic! Be a man about it! Show them your manhood! Yes, sir! Wait, what? Almost there. Hook up through Washington Square Park. I'm a few steps away from killing this coffee, Parker. You better haul ass. Kid's gonna get himself killed. Thanks! Stop sounding so timid! Sorry! And stop apologizing! Sorry! I mean... Focus on the road! But you said... Focus! Is that guy getting mugged? Happens all the time, Parker. Act like you live here! Be a New Yorker. A million people in this city, sweetheart. Spidey ain't coming. Hey! Leave him alone! What'd you say, you little toothpick? Hey! What are you, a tourist? Just kidding! What you say, you little punk? That's it. He's going down! Gonna tear you apart, you little nerd! You want some dirt in your face? Like both eyes! That would really hurt! Oh, look at this feisty little stick figure! I did it! And it was fun, even. You okay? I am. Because you stopped to help. Thanks. Looks like they roughed up my bike, too. How will I get to the bugle in time now? Uh-oh, my photos. All but one of them are ruined. May needs this money. And I need this job. I can do this on foot. I have to. Out of the way! I'm a New Yorker! Come on, come on! Where is he?
Mr. Jameson? Peter Parker. You're late. I have something you're gonna want to put on the front page of the Bugle. Cocky little guy, aren't you? Just trying to wear my confidence on the outside. Like a New Yorker. Parker, this is terrible. Your lighting is flat, your composition is awful. God knows why you're shooting on film like some kind of caveman. And your nose is bleeding. But you're in luck. I need a picture of the spider creep for tomorrow's front page. Congratulations! You're officially a Bugle photographer. Really? Thank you, sir. You won't regret it. Are you okay? Because you've been staring at that for like five minutes. Yeah, yeah. So, can you tell me how to meet this guy? Peter Parker? You don't want his career. You want yours. But what I can tell you is that he learned to go after what he wanted. And if one route didn't work, to find another way around. Okay. I'll find another way. Give me an action shot I can bring to the Vuga. Oh, well, sure. This good? Yeah, and when you jump, angle left so I get your silhouette. I... I will. You got it. Ready, set... Jump! Go, Spidey! See you next time! Fireworks? Probably without a permit. I should warn those folks that that's illegal in New York. Whoa, yeah! Whoa! Hey, guys. I'm assuming you don't have a permit. Oh! Oh! Mike! Mike! He's still breathing, but I can take him to a hospital. I knew those fireworks looked shady. Is he gonna be okay? If I had to guess, he's only unconscious. But I better move fast just in case. Ah, where am I? S Spider Man? You're okay. I'm just taking you to a hospital. And feel obligated to point out that personal fireworks are illegal in New York. Uh, well, we didn't know. They're for our brother, Lex. We, we lost him a few years ago. and. He always loved them, so we try to launch a few around his birthday. I'm sorry for your loss. Spider-Man? Wow. Now just sit tight and let the pros take it from here. Thanks. Actually, wait. If those fireworks we bought were sketchy, maybe you should check where we got them from some docks north of us between those two bridges. I know the spot you're talking about. I'll check it out. Hey, your brother's getting checked out now. He suggested I take a look at where you got your fireworks from, too. The dock guys? That's a good call. But watch out. I know I saw two of them with guns. Like serious guns. Good to know. Thanks. Bro, watch it next to that barrel. We can't make any money if our stock blows up. You want to do this? Get back to checking the guns and let me work my magic. <sighs> Two cups of gunpowder seems right for these. Is that guy okay? Uh, screw it. I'm not making fireworks for babies. Spider-Man! Hi! I'm in the market for some poorly made explosives! Think you can help? Fireworks are lit. To the river they go. Crap, the sparks lit two more. 
Just one crate left. Get that. Happy birthday, Lex. Was that you? Oh, man. I hope Mike saw that from the hospital. Lex would have loved it. Just disposing of some illegal items. You guys take care. Heard someone tagged your shop. Yes, it was hideous. Until someone else showed up and painted over it. Such detailed work. Best thing to ever happen to me. Business has never boomed. No, bloomed like this. <laughs> that is gorgeous. Well, when you see them, tell them I said thank you. Hmm. Oh, here she is. You can thank her yourself. Hey. Miss, thank you for your services.
Wow. <laughs> You're amazing. You know that? Wait, 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 wait. I thought you were here buying flowers for them. Enjoy the autumn sunshine, Bouquet. support what you do for them. It's really cool. Thanks. You're really cool. Later, music man. Okay, Pete, what's next? Any sign of Connors? Nothing yet. It's MJ. Bad news. Connors' house is crawling with hunters and the doctor's MIA. Good news. I think I know where to find him. Somewhere across the river. Maybe around. Let's move. He's waiting. Sable paid off sooner than I'd hoped. The zoo. Connors has to be around here somewhere. I have to tell Pete. The light. Where is that man? They've been studying Dr. Connors. Oh God, they want to hunt him too. What is that up there? Oh my God, Vulture. Did they? I need to find Connors. Another night tainted by the silence of death. I wasn't sure I could clip his wings. Perhaps that would be my weakness, but no, not even that could save him. He's dead.
on her cell phone. Oh, please don't die. Harry, it's MJ. I'm at an abandoned zoo in Jersey. It's... I don't understand. to get in the cage and Connor's shackles need that key just have to find them my blades grow up <laughs> Hello, Garin. Simkarian poetry. Must be her first language. Vegre, you're here. Her Simkarian is perfect. Hopefully mine is convincing. Some kind of ranking system. <laughs> Guess she's Garin's boss. Good for me. Vika. Angus Bojo. Barasoy. Come on, MJ. Your Simkarian is still good. Enough. Just answer. It Vika. Vika. Monguznok. Vika. The tech voice. Garin, elegem van a hiva saitból. Hol vannak a kezülékez kódok? A kódok. Sorozaton az információs táplán van. Tudhatnád? Te pedig azt tudhatnád. Milyen hangon beszélhetsz velem? Ne hív többet. Nerta feyed be kerulhet. That felt kind of nice. All right, better move before he comes looking. Where's that whiteboard? There you are. Codes for the enclosure. Got the code. Now for the key. Sounds crazy, but I can feel them here with us. 
If the spirits of the dead are so concerning, maybe you should seek another one of work. Are they judging me? Or even... Cut the keys. Time to get out of here. Stench in this city is nothing else since this. More hunters. We will have our victory. No matter the cost. <laughs> This beast. His name is Kurt Connors. He's a good man. There's a lab in the atrium. Might have a serum. Serum! I don't have much time. Then we'll buy you some. Right up the hill. That glass building. Please, hurry. We'll clear a path. Keep your heads down. Don't worry, Doc. We'll get you to that lab. We're not turning tonight. I don't target. These hunters must have a death wish. First tombstone, now the lizard. Seems like they're just doing their boss's dirty work. Their benefits must be crazy. Now look who's joking in a bad time. You're learning. How are things looking? Just keep your busy. Don't let you get hurt, sir. You'll be okay. I can't do this again. Spider-Man! I'm sorry, but we need to hurry. Red hair. my Get to work! We'll cover you! This, 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 I can use this to make an antidote. He's here. Come on. 
get you out of here. This what feels do do not great. Ah! Just think, this will definitely be your coolest scar. <laughs> yeah. MJ, I don't think. Am I breathing? I'll kill you! Harry! Do it then! Look out! nothing. I remember in fifth grade when you... No. No. You gotta stay awake, buddy. Wait. No! MJ, get him out of here. I'll handle this. MJ, I'm on my way. What are you? Track the lizard. The spider is mine. Stop hovering. I'm fine. Maybe some water. Water. On it. So... The suit cured your... Yeah. Which means without it, you... 
Yeah. Okay. We gotta figure out how to get this back onto Harry. How did you give it to me? I... I, I don't know. It just... sort of happened. Okay. Uh, let me try. Pete, there's something in here. What? Uh, uh. Okay, not what I... What the... Are you okay? I'm fine, I'm fine. Let me try it again. Dr. Connors. Except he's a drilling reptile right now. Craven. The serum. He had it around his neck. That's what he used on Dr. Connors. If we find that serum, we, we could analyze it, use the equipment here to, to engineer a cure. And bring Dr. Connors back from the land of the lizard. I'll start tracking down Craven. He's probably already cleared out of that zoo by now. Well, lucky for us. He left a piece of himself behind. There's this pawn shop in Little Odessa that specializes in rare artifacts, just like this knife. Let's start there. Good thinking. Weirdly enough, I feel energized. It does... did that for me, too. How does this thing work? Honestly, can't explain it. I just think the suit listens. Okay. Maybe it'll help with finding Craven and his serum. Just don't get stabbed this time, please. I usually try not to. I'll be fine, I promise. So the phone number on the impounded truck was the pre-1970s kind with letters. Harlem 7, 4321. Did the truck that got away have the same one? Yeah. But I'm not sure I'm following. <laughs> Pre-1970s trucks were terrible polluters because they had no catalytic converters. My office did an initiative to get them off the roads. So there are now very few old trucks in this neighborhood. Si tuviéramos alguna forma de localizarlo. I got an idea. Nice work, Ma. Back in business. Dude, if Ma's right about those trucks, they probably left behind some kind of residue. And it ruined my night. Hey, Miles. I heard there's a star-studded gala at the museum. If I find the missing pieces, yeah. Never been to a gala before. Do you want to go? Thought you'd never ask. What should I wear? Here's black with the lamp. Bro, let me focus. Right. Uh, good luck. I can't believe people would do this. I was so excited about this exhibit. The whole museum, really. Look, this is an unfortunate situation I'm in here. I mean, you know how much I care about protecting the collective history of this community. I do, which is why I hope this won't derail your support. Okay, let's see if those trucks left anything behind. Spider-Man's here. Spider-Man, any news? Working on some new leads. I'll let you know. Well, I've got business to attend to, but you know my feelings. For me, it's about preserving the history at all costs. Hey, Spider-Man. You know you're helping on this. You're good. Thanks. This looks like it could be something from a prehistoric heist truck. Ugh. Smell that sulfur. 
Definitely from an old engine. Maybe I can isolate it further. To identify the substance, we need to get rid of the contaminants. Aromatic hydrocarbon. This will never make it through a catalytic converter. Hey, Ma. You were right. That truck was so old, it left a unique contaminant in its wake. Fantastico. Can you track it down? Honor that we speak. I suddenly have hope we might really be able to find everything, pull off the gala, and save the museum. Whoa, 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 whoa. One thing at a time. Okay, I know. Well, be careful, and let me know what you find. Sorry, couldn't hear you. Anyway, we delivered everything we had. The rest of it fell off the truck. You better freaking find it! I understand, sir. We'll keep looking for the last item. He's stiffing us. What did I tell you? No. Hmm? He'll pay when we deliver the saxophone. No, the saxophone. I think you know where. Settle down, idiot. The guy's loaded. Just need to make him happy. Oh, I am done. I'm gonna go find that guy and take my money! They're gonna blow the whole deal! For all of us! I'm with him. Let's go find him and demand our cash. You guys have no patience. Uh-oh! Where's Spider-Man? Spider-Man! Did you really think you seen the last of me? How the hell did the spider find us? More friends? Let's go! Uh, got a gift for you, Spidey! <laughs> That's all of them. Let's open up that truck and get the rest of those museum pieces. Empty. They must have already given their boss whatever was in here. All roads seem to lead to that guy. Sounds like somebody's phone. Okay. So there's something out there they're still looking for. So I found the second truck, but it was empty. Oh, no. But they lost one of the pieces somehow. Charlie Parker's saxophone. Oh, Miles, head over to CJ Walker Park. Okay, why? One of our interns said she heard a guy talking about a saxophone he found. I didn't believe her at first. She's kind of a... If it's the one these guys lost, their boss seemed really interested in finding it. As he should be. Charlie Parker's a legend. That saxophone is priceless. Who should I look for at the park? I don't have a name. They said a trumpet player was talking about it. Trumpet? Got it. Thanks, Nyarañita. Let me know what happens. Te quiero. Change clothes first. Don't want to disrupt the festival. Okay. Where is this trumpet guy? This place looks a lot better today than it did when Fisk and his crew took it over. Hey, Miles. Steph, what's up? You here with Gloria? Nah, she's working. I just got here. Was looking for a trumpet player. You seen one anywhere? Yeah, Teo is here, playing his trumpet. Teo plays trumpet? Mm-hmm. I think he was over near that far gate. Great. Thanks, Steph. And say hi to Gloria for me.
Thanks, everyone. Hey, Spider-Man. Hey, Miles. Tayo. Sounding good, man. Wow, I didn't know you played the trumpet. I dabble, I dabble. Hey, I was actually gonna call you. When I was in keynote music this morning getting my horn fixed, some kids brought in a sax they found on the street. I was thinking it could potentially be the one from the museum. I don't want to get anyone in trouble. I'm trying to do the right thing. Yeah, 100%. You talking about keynote on Cathedral? Yeah, talk to Eugene. Thanks. Headed there right now. Trumpet sounds great, bro. Hey, Ma. Found the sax. On my way to pick it up now. Ay, bendito. Angela will be so relieved. This just might save the museum. Hey, did you know Teo played the trumpet? He's pretty good, too. Had an audience and everything. The whole park was bumping. Precisely why this museum is so important. Music enriches our community and brings it together. Is that my mom or Councilwoman Morales talking? It's both. Ten cuidado, mijo. Uh-oh. This doesn't look good. Hey, Spider-Man! I was about to put an alert in your app. What happened here? A couple of creepy guys just dragged Eugene out of here. Definitely wasn't right. They went that way. Thanks. I'll check it out. Let's scan for any clues here. Scuff marks. Looks like Eugene might have been dragged that way. We know you've got that saxophone somewhere. I don't know what you're talking about. Come on. Just tell us where it is. Stop making this difficult. Why would I have Charlie Parker's sax in my little shop? That should be in the museum. We know you have a sax. Tell us where it is. I swear on my life, it's not in my shop. Maybe if we turn up the pain tempo, you'll revisit it. Hey, fellas, you want to learn to play music? There are better ways to do it. It's the fighter! Get him! Man, here comes the rest of the band. You have you guys long enough? Get the fighter! Spider-Man. You okay? A few bruises are okay, as long as they left me my keys. Here, take these and open my trunk. Charlie Parker saxophone. That's the real deal right there. I was getting ready to return to the museum, and those guys busted in. He used that to record his masterpiece, Ornithology, 1946. You a bird fan? <laughs> My dad was. I don't know much about old music. Mm, mm, oh. <laughs> when you hear an MC today, you syncopated accents, stress the offbeat, flow in and out of the rhythm. Hey, number bebop. I'll have to listen a little closely next time. I'll get this back to the museum right away. Then I gotta call my insurance company. Okay. Thanks, man. Alright. Hmm. If I could get into the phone these guys were using to communicate with the mastermind. <laughs> All zeros is a number equivalent of password as a password. Just a midnight rendezvous with a criminal mastermind. No biggie. Who's this? 
Time to take down the boss of this operation. Find the rest of those museum pieces. No one here yet. I'll just hang for a bit until the party starts. You were supposed to pay us on our last delivery. You'll get paid when I get everything. Where is it? Where is what? Lewis said you were bringing the saxophone. Lewis said? Lewis got picked up by the cops. He don't got no saxophone. You set this meeting up! No, we didn't. Now where's our money? Where is the saxophone? Aaron? The big donor from the museum? I better bust up this party and have a talk with him. I should get the whole bunch wrapped up before they hurt someone. We're fed up with you not paying us. We don't work for free. I think maybe we need to show you how we feel with our fists. Uh, yeah, hang on now. We should have never trusted you in the first place. What are you even doing here? If you're not gonna pay us, we're gonna steal that stuff back. Okay, okay, let's talk about it. We're not talkers, we're doers. It's our turn to run this show. You've got some... What's he doing here? We need Leon with the big gun. They're still on the way. Spider-Man, help me. I was just trying to get the stolen things back in the museum. That's not true. I can explain. That's gonna have to be a longer conversation. Fighting us. Well, that seems to be all of them. Let's get to the bottom of this with Darren. <laughs> oh. Thank you, Spider-Man. And I assure you, there's a very reasonable explanation. That seems extremely dubious. Wait till Councilwoman Morales hears you were involved in this. Leon, here! Time to exterminate a spider! Darren, stay back. Darren? Are you kidding me? He was right here. I still have his number. Sounds like he's close. That guy's on Darren's tail. Can't blame him. He wants their money. Who is this? Is this Lewis? Darren, stop the car! Spider-Man? Can you at least stop these guys chasing me? You weren't trying to retrieve those things. You were the one behind the robbery in the first place. I care about these objects. You pretended to care, and then stole from the museum. It's this community's history. It's my family's history. I don't expect you to understand. I don't think I'm the one who doesn't understand. Let's get these other bad guys out the way first. We gotta stop this and put all these guys behind bars. Including Darren. Police are on their way. I gotta catch up to Darren. Oh, are you still there? Look, my father was one of the most successful music producers ever. He produced half the artists in that museum. Good for him. Now stop the car and tell me where the rest of the pieces are. Not today, Darren. <laughs> Glad I remember which one was the break. I should probably get my license one of these days. Just so I get this right. All that talk of supporting the museum. All Angela's time you wasted asking about operations and security. 
All lies. So you can learn how to steal the collection. But my family... No. I'm sure you do care about this music. But those things don't belong to you. They belong to this community. Let's go, sir. You're under arrest. This event would not have been possible without our wonderful curator, Angela, mm -hmm. and this entire community. The way we pulled together to recover the stolen items is nothing less than amazing. Okay, okay. Thanks to every one of you for saving the museum. And thank you, Rio Morales, our city council person, who championed this event so tenaciously. Rio was a lesson on a and I'd say she's off to a stunning start. Yeah, those are some funk beats. Gotta study up on this guy. I think Abuela had a book about her. Gotta take a look when I get home. it all worked out. This museum is fire. And so much music I want to go listen to now. <laughs> right? Bro, it's so inspiring. Hey, you want to have breakfast tomorrow? I can tell you all my new music ideas. Let's do it. I'm going to keep checking this out. Miles, isn't this place awesome? I'm embarrassed to say I've never been here before, but after hearing about the robbery, I thought I'd better come check it out. From what I heard, that guy convinced himself all this stuff rightfully belonged to him. Crazy what some people can convince themselves is true. Hey, I heard you helped find the missing saxophone. Yeah, I got to hold it. Bird coaxed miracles from that hunk of metal. My dad was a big Charlie Parker fan. He'd be happy to know the sax is here for everyone to appreciate. And maybe lead them back to the music. Music hmm, is magic. Ay, we were hoping you'd be here. Oh, wow. Your mom is something else. That she is. Can you believe that guy pretended to be a donor and then robbed the place? Thank God he didn't get away with it. I agree. This stuff needs to be here. Not in some guy's penthouse where he's the only one who could see it. <laughs> it's so cool how other people have been able to do music and save the world stuff. Angela, I'm Miles, Councilwoman Morales' son. Miles, she talks about you all the time. Congratulations on the exhibit. I'm glad it all came together. Thanks to your mom and Spider-Man, of course. Whew, this neighborhood is blessed to have them both. Finish looking around before I go talk to Ma and head out. Thank you all. Thank you so much. <laughs> Angela told me the museum has a record number of new memberships. Seriously? They're gonna be okay. <laughs> Couldn't have done it without you, Ma. Now hear me out. What if we really teamed up on the next one? 
can get my own suit. My. Maybe. Algo con brillo. Ma, stop. Stop. <laughs> stop it. Get out of here. <laughs> Dance with me. Some hands up. Need some help? The Mysterium is infected with a virus or something, and it's trapped someone inside. If you execute the breakpoint condition, the system should reset. Just try not to get hurt in the process. How would I get hurt if it's just an illusion? That, my friend, is what we're trying to find out. why they call you a superhero. First things first, we have to put together a pitch for investors. Wait, Cole, are you recording? Yep, we're rolling. I don't understand why we have to record all this. Because we're all going to be famous one day. And our fans are going to want to peek behind the curtain, so to speak. Ugh. Okay. Well, for the pitch, I can put together a prototype illusion that will blow your mind. Great idea. We also still need to come up with a name for our attractions. How about... Mysterians? No. No, no. We will not use the name Mysterio in any way, shape, or form. People are going to call you Mysterio, whether you like it or not. But I am not Mysterio anymore. I am Quentin Beck, Master Illusionist. Beck didn't want to be a bad guy anymore. Good for him. Welcome to my Mysterious! Get me out of here! Help! I'm working on it! Move fast, Spider-Man, or you'll never escape. Can't let him hit me. Hey, Miles, remember, everything's an illusion. Even that fake Mysterio. That was the last one. No! Thanks, Spider-Man. You're all right. Take a breath and try to relax. Okay, let's talk image. We'll want to assure investors you're not the criminal you once were. I've done my time. Shouldn't that be enough? Unfortunately not. Let's talk about your origin. What led you to become Mysterio in the first place? I... <laughs> Is this really necessary? If you want to be successful, yes. I... I guess it was ego, mostly. We all have egos, Quentin. Oh, not like mine. Former supervillain has a big ego. Go figure. Let the mystery begin! Get me out of here! 
That's the plan. Be sure to look both ways yeah. before crossing, Spider-Man. Yeah. However much time you need, you're safe. Why are you recording us having lunch? I figured our fans will want to know a little about you and how you got to know Quentin. He was my neighbor growing up. We played together sometimes, but then he went to a different school. He was way more advanced than the rest of us regular kids. I can totally see that. Was he always so creepy and weird? Cole, that's... <laughs> that's not nice. I mean, don't get me wrong. He's harmless, I think. But if I could find another job, I would. You're making the right choice to stay. He's a genius. As soon as the world sees what we're doing, we're all going to be very, very rich. Betsy knew Beck from way back, and she's all in. But it sounds like Cole has her doubts. Hmm. Looks like I got a message. Spider-Man, Betsy here. Quentin and Cole are scrubbing through all the very helpful data you provided, and I was thinking, when the Mysteriums are back to operating safely, it'd be great to get a Spider-Man endorsement. Pro bono, of course. <laughs> We're running out of capital here, and it's making Quentin quite anxious. Anyway, just a thought. No need to call back. Um, bye. Sorry, Betsy. We have a firm rule against Spidey endorsements. Might want to rethink that business plan. Reality behind. Help! Gotta find her. Fight for your life, yeah. Spider-Man. Yeah. I did it. I was there right I saw the thing for Tanti da fare. I got some bad news. Our pitch was rejected. By who? Everyone. Ah! Uh, idiots! Can't they see how we're creating the future of entertainment? Oh, they love the technology. Just not the talent. You mean me? The ex-con. Let's come up with a different strategy. We've got something amazing here. We can make this work. Somehow. I feel bad for Beck. Gotta be tough trying to shake a reputation like that. This is Bane <laughs> Wait, wait, don't leave. Wait. wait. Just hold on. I'm coming! Time's not on your side, Spider-Man. I know this is all an illusion, but it feels so real. It's the witching hour! Okay, safe and sound. Gather round, team. 
Got some good news. We got our funding. Finally. Who's the investor? Me. I secured a business loan with some appalling terms, but at least it got approved. Betsy, I'm flattered you'd put so much faith in me, but... Not just you, Quentin. In all three of us. I have full confidence we will make this venture successful. Betsy went all in on Beck. She must really believe in him. Hi, Spider-Man. Betsy here again. I have Cole here with me while Quentin is off doing some focused work. You mean off being all weird and moody? <laughs> Dude needs to talk to someone. Yes, well, I'm working on getting him some help. We're all a little stressed. Which is why I'd like to ask if you can expedite your work on the Mysteriums. The sooner we can fix this, the sooner Quentin will return to his usual brilliant self. Sounds like Beck is taking this hard. I feel for him. Now the fight really starts. Spider-Man? What is this? Help! Hey! Where'd they go? Think you can defeat my most commanding illusion? I got it. You'll be safe now. Quentin, we need to talk. As you can see, I'm busy. I'm sensing some emotions from you right now. Emotions? You know, when I was in prison, I learned a lot about emotions. How to control them. I know you're upset about the whole Mysterium thing, Quentin. But you need to get on board here. The Mysterio name is marketable. Quentin Beck is not. Without Quentin Beck, you'd have nothing to sell. So it seems like you need to get on board with me. And my emotions. Sounds like things were getting spicy between Betsy and Beck. You're bleeding. Yeah, I know. What the hell, man? It appears to be a minor injury. Wait, these illusions are just illusions, right? I think I cracked a tooth. Well, the illusions should be harmless. Unless someone's doing something they shouldn't be doing. Right, Cole? Uh, don't look at me like that. This was not my fault. Well then... 
This is quite the mystery. Was Cole hurt in an accident? Or did Beck do it on purpose because he was salty about having to use the name Mysterio? Let's see what she had to say. Hello, Spider-Man. Um, I just wanted to let you know that Quentin has agreed to enter some court-monitored counseling to help him with his post-prison transition. Finally. Cole, please be respectful. He's been through a lot. Sorry. I'm just... I... Just glad he's getting help, you know? Anyway, Quentin asked me to pass this along. He thinks he's close to figuring out what's going on. So just keep up the good work, Spider-Man. Good on Beck for going into counseling. We all need help sometimes. Oh, man, man, wait, wait. <laughs> Is that Spider-Man? Help! Help! Don't worry, I'll find you. Destroy them all! Make Mysterio's getting on my nerves! I wonder if this is how Beck acted back in the day. That's the last one. Next time, you're the day. That was a nightmare. Well, the nightmare is over. You're safe now. I wish we had had that horrible with you. You know? Quentin, we have to talk. You seem to want to talk a lot. But what is it that you actually do as part of this? Endeavor. <clears throat> Cole discovered some hidden routines in the Mysterium Code. We can scan bank cards in our customers' pockets? A 21st century parlor trick. We use that information to look at their purchase history, browsing history, create a bespoke world that makes our audience believe in the unbelievable. But if it gets out that we have people's bank information... I'm the only one with the encryption codes. And I haven't told anyone. What about you? No, of course not. Then as long as you and Cole keep it to yourselves, our secret is safe. Right? Right. Beck was scanning people's credit cards to customize his illusions? Sounds like something the old Mysterio would do. I, I feel like we're the only ones. <laughs>
changed forever. Let the agony begin. I don't know where I am. Help! Just sit tight. I'll find you. My illusions will never die. But you. This is crazy. Someone's got to be messing with these Mysteriums. Based on that last call from Betsy, seems like Beck and his crew have it almost figured out. Listening. He has his tricks, you know. No, we're safe. Oh, he's acting very weird. You mean weirder? He's gone quiet all of a sudden. Won't speak to me. Do we have a way out in case he gets violent or something? We'll be fine. Here it comes. Let's talk more later. Sounds like Cole and Betsy were scared of Beck's change in behavior. Another call from Betsy. Spider-Man? Cole and I are a bit concerned. He said he was gonna kill us. Please, Cole, don't panic. <sighs> Spider-Man, we found out Quentin lied to us. Instead of going to counseling, he went somewhere else. When we confronted him, he said some threatening things and then left. Hopefully he just needs to cool off, but if you see him or hear from him, can you let us know? Thank you. Uh, this just went from bad to worse. Hmm. Got a new voicemail. Spider-Man, we need to meet. Come to Coney Island. I have an urgent matter to discuss with you. Well, that doesn't sound like a trap at all. Just hope he hasn't hurt Betsy and Cole. Okay, where's Beck? Welcome, Spider-Man. If you're looking for Betsy and Cole, they are no longer with us. You killed them? Don't act surprised. You've known from the beginning who you're dealing with. What the? I'll show you. 
Nice try. Clever spider. Time to get out of here. The sin is down. Get it back. I'm trying. It was Quentin. He made us do this. Where is he? questions. start looking at the people behind the masks that things get messy
think he's on to us. If so, there's only one solution. We need him alive. What do we do, just tie him up or something? Yes, good idea. We set him up as the fall guy in case anyone catches on. Yeah, like tell everyone he went full Mysterio? Exactly. He would be the one most likely to steal money, not the two women who aren't former supervillains. Now we just need to figure out how to get the richest people in the city into these Mysteriums. Okay, but there's still some code that I haven't figured out and the Spider-Men will help us with that. Ha, <laughs> that's brilliant. Heroes always looking to help. And if all goes to plan, we'll have millions in the bank before anyone catches on. And when they do, Quentin goes back to prison and we retire in style. Looks like the biggest illusion was Betsy and Cole's innocence. Wonder where Beck is going from here. <clears throat> here we go. Hunters. They've been coming through here for days. <laughs> Sorry I wasn't here to help. Nah. Could you tell me about this antique I found? It, uh, almost killed me. I cannot help you. I've seen this symbol before. Please leave. Wait! I can protect you from the Hunters. I'm not worried about them. I thought I left this behind on Volgograd. The flames have been lit. This is his jungle now. Craven? Craven off. The flames have been lit. <sighs> Dude! MJ told me you almost died! You okay? Hey, Miles. Actually, never felt better. I should've been... Wait, really? Positive. Hey, let me call you back. Got some bonfires to crash. Uh, okay. Do you think Craven will be at the feast tonight? Hey, it is more for us than it is for him. But who knows? A gathering of people that goes back to the very first. Spider-Man! Uh, you will not escape! What's this I hear about lighting some fires? Uh, <laughs> What were they doing up here? Vodka from Volgograd? It looks like it's for some kind of party. Wonder what they're celebrating. Pretty rude of Craven not to extend an invite. Never stopped me before, though. Shipping in more luxury goods from Volgograd for this... event? These shipments have to be coming in nearby. No airfields here. But what about the docks? Maybe something there can lead me to Craven. Oh, 
don't make me ask again! I told you! I, uh, that's everything! Where is the rest of our ship? That guy needs my help. Don't make me ask again! Help! A lot of hunters for some vodka and caviar. You are brave, still brave. Who is it me? Entertain? <laughs> Better go check on the dock worker. They did a number on him. Easy, easy. You're in pretty bad shape. Let me help you. Hospital. Please. There's one close by. You're gonna be okay. I thought they were going to kill me. What did they want? Some cargo went missing on the journey. Here. They thought I took it. You're safe. Now, where's the drop-off? 718, Kent. Wonder how Harry's doing without the suit right now. Hey, buddy. How you feeling? I'm fine. What's happening? Craven, or Cravenoff, is hosting some party at 718 Kent. Figured I'd stop by. Looks like a social club. Hang on. I'm almost there. Looks like a busy night. Hope our VIP is here. They're more riled up than usual. Just keep your head down and... How are you getting in? Kitchen entrance. You should change. The classic Peter Parker look isn't gonna cut it. Too bad my tux is at the dry cleaners. Huh? The suit could turn into a tux. Oh, never did that with me. Hey, hey, you! Come over here. Take this to Mr. Cravenoff's bodyguard. His bodyguard? Dima, move. Well, sounds like your shift's starting. Yeah, I'll leave you to it. Better go find Dima. Heart is up. How are they eating so fast? I clean up pretty nice. And I'm feeling great. Excuse me. Established this club as our stronghold. Interesting choice. It reminds me of like. Keep moving, I'll break your bones. A 300-year-old sleeping dart will never work. You are so certain, are you? Show me, then. Uh, I'll show him, too. Yes? Take him. <laughs> Let him squirm. Uh, the poison is ancient, and you don't even know how to use that thing. Uh, a true hunter adapts. Sleep well, my friend. Those hunters were nuts. Can't believe the suit listened to me. Wish my suit had a neural interface like this. I could work with Harry, do the hero gig, and take a vacation all at once. Did you see he had the tusks? That's probably the maitre d' by the podium. Has one of the shield bearers arrived? Uh, yes. He is in the other room by the fire. Will Mr. Cravenoff be joining us this evening? Uh, there are some, uh, mm. Quite right. <clears throat> Damn. Craven isn't here. Shield bearer. Huh. Sounds like a bodyguard to me. 
Must be him. <clears throat> Your meal, sir. What the hell is this? Um, I was told to deliver this to Mr. Kravenoff's personal bodyguard. What makes you think I'm him? <laughs> uh, you know, you're, uh, huge. Dima's very hungry. You should leave now. So funny. I was just about to do that. He was looking up at that room. Gotta find the elevator. If that's just the shield bearer, what big is Dima gonna be? It's too scary. I don't want to serve him food anymore. Just drop the plate and leave. Simple as that. See how Coming through. Oh, sorry. Don't be sorry. Move! Coming through! Uh, 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 this... Uh, this mess! If everything isn't perfect, we're all dead! Coming through! No! No! No, wait! Uh, 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 why were you standing right in front of the door? I told you to wait! No, you Come didn't! On. I was just minding my own. Come on! Shut up, both of you. Pick everything up and let's move. We find Dima, we find Craven and his weird blizzard serum. Easy. Something to eat that isn't spider flavored. That raw meat must be somewhere. There we are. Something in that study might help me find Craven. But first, gotta break out the apron. That hunter's right there. A meal fit for a Russian tiger bodyguard. That sounded weird. Hmm. I have to make a few minor adjustments to this meal. Where's that sleeping hunter? A lot of bodies by that sleeping hunter. Anyone hear that? Time for Dima. Snooping time for Peter. If this doesn't work, there's only one other thing on the menu. Me. Hi, Dima. I'm back. With a little snacky snack. Spidey masterpiece. Guess Craven's too cool for his own party. Should look around in case he left the lizard serum somewhere in here. Don't see Craven's lizard serum here. But what are these potions? Wonder if this is how he's so freakishly strong.
Didn't know hunting could be so existential. He's better read than I would have thought. Nothing like some light philosophy between hunts. No serum. These drugs are for late-stage chemotherapy. Are these cravens too? Sophia is only a few blocks from here. Craven has to be there with the serum. Time to move. So Craven has a pet tiger. That tracks. Not what it looks like? Keep him alive. Okay, suit. Let's see what you can really do. Harry did not tell me it felt like this. Gotta get to the chapel quick. That was fun. yet but i think i know where he is how's the suit weird it's like it knows me don't worry buddy i'll take care of everything promise are back. It's you! I knew that was our meat cute back there! I knew it! I'd love to get to know you better, but I got some business to take care of. <clears throat> See, your boss has been up to no good lately. <clears throat> this is my city, not his jungle. Or <clears throat> <Poor> these guys? <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> Enough song and dance. I'm coming, Craven.
Here to pick up a serum order for a Dr. Connors? Save my friend. just got a little intense with Craven. He's somehow stronger than he looks, if you can believe that. Hey, the important thing is that you're okay. And you got the serum. You did great, buddy. I'll start prepping the gear. How'd it really go? It was totally... I didn't want to worry Harry. Craven knows now that the suit malfunctions when it's within range of certain frequencies. How bad is the malfunction? Not pleasant, but I can handle it. Well, I'm glad you're all right, but watch yourself out there, too. Let me know how things go at the lab. Absolutely. Talk soon. Still got it? Let's see what this thing's made of. Okay, I've overlaid the serum with an old sample of Connor's blood. If you can destroy the atoms blocking the lizard receptors, we can make an antidote, and then we're golden. Like a goose. Like a clever goose. There. Huzzah? Huzzah. Wait, does the structure look unstable to you? Huh. If we could beam a few electrons in there, it'd stabilize it, but it's not like we have a... Particle, particle accelerator? accelerator. <laughs> That'd be like using a shotgun for a haircut. Hell of a haircut. The text said it needs repair, but maybe it's okay. Okay. No black holes, no black holes, no black holes. Huh. 
pressure change pops an intersection out of alignment. There's no way to fix it without going inside. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing? The suit will protect me, right? Peter, I don't know about this. Relax and be a good proton. Huh? Stay positive. <laughs> so, what's the inside of a particle accelerator like? Amazing. You've got to crawl in this when you get the suit back. Oh, yeah, it's at the top of my list. What's going to happen when I realign it anyway? If there aren't any other pressure problems, nothing. You can come right out. Harry! It's, it's powering up, but the beams are erratic. Use the magnets to stabilize it. How? Just find the sweet spot. Particle accelerators do not have sweet spots! There, good? There's one more set of magnets ahead. If you can't stabilize the beam, it'll destroy the serum. I got it. Do not wipe my library cards. Don't touch the beam, don't touch the beam! Next! Get it, Pete! We're home free! Come on out! What is that? Probably a static discharge. It means the accelerator's working. Clever freaking goose. Is it working? Lizard and you don't, here we come. <laughs> The suit's got some sensitive ears. Apparently. What happened? More static discharges. The accelerator's still running, though. The serum's okay. Fire. You get that side, I'll get this side. Got it! I can't wet that fire fast enough. There's got to be something else I can use. Good, good. That's the last of them. It worked! <laughs> So you'll power it down, I'll grab the antidote, find Dr. Connor. Not so fast. There are 67 shutdown steps. If you take it out before, then we'll lose the antidote. Oof. Sounds like it's gonna be a while. You hungry? I could go get a pizza. <laughs> Shut it down and get the antidote. I'll handle this. <laughs> no Craven? I thought we had a thing going! You're not his only friend! Lee! Tell me where he is! I thought Craven was only going after super villains. Why are they here? They must have tracked me after I stole the serum! Sorry, Harry! Why are you apologizing? You're not worried, you've got the suit. Kick their asses! What step are you on now, Harry? Diverting the beam into the auxiliary tunnel. What's new with you? Well, I just got an extension on my student loans. Really excited about that! We're making good progress. Only 30 steps left until the antidote's ready. Great! Because I don't think these guys are gonna stop coming! You got this, buddy. It's almost powered down. I'll finish it and grab the antidote. You need to get out. I can't leave. I'm the only one Watch here. Watch out! Quick, 
Quickly! Cover the exit! We're a crib and we have the spider! <laughs> Craven's gonna have fun with you. Harry! in these woods. Okay, before we get down to business, there's something I have to tell you. I'm fresh out of honey. <laughs> Come on, I thought it was funny.
fine. We both are. But the foundation... I don't care about that right now. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah. Get in there and see what you can save. I want a detailed report of the damage. Your dad's right. The foundation doesn't matter. What? This was our dream. And it still is. But right now we have to focus on finding Dr. Connors and getting you healthy again. I got this. You've reached P. Uh, it's good enough. Leave a message. Where the hell are you, Pete? Hey, Genki. Hey, dude. One of the friends got its wires all crossed with an old hunter transmission. Figured you might want to look into it. Maybe it'll lead to Lee. Sending you the source coordinates. Really appreciate it, man. No problem. Everything good? Haley and I are a little worried. It's okay. I just need everything to get back to normal first. I'll make it up to her, though, for missing her exhibit. Okay, dude. Hope the lead pans out. <laughs> Genki was right. The friend picked up a signal from this satellite. Let's see what we're working with. This is no hunt to be proud of. A stain on my legacy. A disgrace. But deadly nonetheless. Find them. Kill them. Craven, how many more people are on this guy's list? The drone. It's using this satellite network to track his targets. Oh, you're not getting away that easy. Picking up some kind of data surge from the drone. If I stay in the slipstream long enough, my still can pull the embedded data and lead me right to Lee. I'm losing it. I'm my only shot at finding Lee. I have the data now. All right, Craven. Where are you keeping Lee? What? All the targets got corrupted into one file. The drone had no intel on Lee. But these people still need my help. Otherwise, they'll end up as heads on Craven's mantle. If there are more birds out there, I can decrypt them to discover the identities of the targets before it's too late. Should upload the data to the Spidey servers. He's gonna want to see this. Harry? Uh, hey, you with Pete? Hey. No. Listen, I saw you chasing that robot bird around on the news. Do you need any kind of tech support? Like, running the app or something? Actually, I got a friend doing that already. Gotcha. Uh, sorry, I'm just feeling useless, and my mom would always say, if opportunity doesn't knock, build a door. Even though she's gone, I still ask her for advice. Is that weird? Nah, it's the same with me and my dad sometimes. Nice to know I'm not alone. Thanks. And good luck out there. You too, man. Maybe some advice will be good right now. Hey, Dad. I could really use your help right now. I'm doing everything I can to find Lee. But nothing's working. I know what you say. A hero is someone who doesn't give up. And I'm not. I just 
just don't know what else to do. Maybe I should just ignore everything else and spend all my time trying to find Lee. No. If people need help, I'm helping. And I'll find Lee. If Pete's too busy, I'm Spider-Man. I can handle everything myself. Wish me luck, though. Thanks, Dad. I love you. So, who needs help out there? data to figure out who this thing's tracking. Almost got a full download. Come on, Miles. Don't lose it. Scrape this bird clean. Now, let's see who this roid rage city pigeon was after. What would Craven want with an engineer? This drone won't be bothering her anymore. Gotta take out the rest. Hey, MJ. Hey, Miles. Just spoke with Pete. He's heading over to Dr. Connor's house in Queens. Stay ready in case he needs backup. Oh, really? Did Pete ask you to call me? Well, no, but <laughs> figured two Spider-Men are better than one, right? Sure. Okay, thanks, MJ. Sounds like he doesn't need me. Maybe I'll go see Haley in the meantime. Hmm. You wanna play? Let's play. The drone's data is the only way I can stop this hunt. Influencer? Maybe Craven just wants some brunch wrecks. Not exactly big game. Why all the trouble for some civilians? I got some time to kill. I got some time to kill. Lives are depending on the data in that bird. Data's nearly there! I'm losing it! No more data in this bird! There it is! Huh. According to the data, this person died two years ago. Probably just an error. Still more eyes in the skies. Can't leave Craven's toys flying around. Just another day in the city. Just another day in the city. I download enough data. These birds won't get near any target. Target died five years ago? 
Don't think these are data errors. Raven's hunting dead people? Okay, now this is getting weird. Err. I need more data to figure out what's going on here. Hmm. Take off in. Gotta squeeze this drone for as much data as possible. Can't let them find the target. Existing data? There's no record of this person anywhere. Are they even real? share the exact same DNA? It's all the same person. But how? Okay. Officially creeped out. I need to solve this. One more drone should do it. solving this whole thing. signal? The satellites for each drone must be sifting through the target's data at a central hub. If I can hack the relay point, maybe the target's location is in the stream. and ears all over the city? Come on. Think that did the trick. Target acquired. Dispatching hunters to the corner of 67th and Lexington. Oh, no. Did I lead the hunters right to them? Gotta get there quick or else. I 
I should check inside. Hello? Sergei, after all these years, how are you? Who's there? Make yourself at home. There's a martini waiting for you on the counter. They think I'm craven? Two olives? In cyanide? So, you have finally come to reunite in New York. Let us hide and seek, like old times. They can't see me. It's a programmed recording with high-tech motion tracking. Hmm. This game's not finished. Checkmate. <laughs> you found my secret. But who lies with me? I'm gonna die down there, aren't I? You call yourself the Great Hunter, yet your trophy is painful in comparison to mine. What the? Is that Pete's old mask? Wait, is this the chameleon's apartment? I thought he was put away years ago. When I fled home, I never thought I would find a place to go home. But I am happy here. Looks like he graduated, too. This tech is insane. Craven's drone snapped a pic of him mid transformation. I knew something was off about Craven's target. Building schematics and hunter logs? The chameleon was keeping tabs on Craven, too. This is the missing persons database. It goes back to before I was born. What did the chameleon do to them? I gave you everything when you were children, and you would not even share your I loved you, and you hated me, but not anymore. I refuse to be hunted. I will see you again, brother, but you will never see me. <coughs> Gotta get out of here! Don't worry, brother. I will do what you could not. <clears throat> Craven and the Chameleon are brothers? That's a family reunion I do not want to crash. Should keep an eye out for the Chameleon. Pete's not gonna be happy he's still out there. Still breathing. But I don't know if the flame is gonna be so lucky. Not after Yuri said how dangerous he is. We have no idea what their Crimson Hour Doomsday event is, and she just runs in. This wasn't a part of the prophecy. Trust the flame and keep watching. She has to leave eventually. He's up there! Spider-Man's up there! <laughs>
to get to her. Close off the try. Don't let her get in. Where are the other embers? Can anyone hear me? Anyone? <laughs> Brooklyn? Is that where the Crimson Hour is supposed to happen? Why Brooklyn? What's Oscorp got to do with all of this? A warehouse? Scrapyard? Parking lot? Library? What's the connection? is cleared as soon as possible. What happened to the roof team? Clear that rubble now! Now! Yuri's behind that rubble. I take out these cultists, I can get to her. And the flame. Wait. They're making explosives here. They're not waiting for the Crimson Hour. They want to cause it. The world will be cleansed. The embers will start anew. <laughs> Now to clear the rubble. <laughs> Who said anything about Oscorp? <laughs> himself as I prophesied yes. no. no I knew you had it in you Yuri <laughs> 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 there that'll keep pressure on it until I can <laughs> <laughs> You get to live out the rest of your life behind bars. And I owe it all to you. Better than this! <laughs> 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 
I've never said I was perfect! Stop acting like it and let's kill him! Yuri! Figure out your priorities. Because I'd rather lose sleep over the one person I killed than all the ones I didn't save. I know my priorities. I... I am not going to let the flame hurt anyone else. I'll find him, somehow. Time to see what they've got cooking. Time to dig deep. <laughs> Map of the Upper West Side. Wonder how they afforded a place here. A base at the abandoned hotel? Gotta get some unexpected room service. Time to head to that hotel. No need to book a room online, right? Hunters in this area, but the base isn't clear yet. Another encrypted file. Vladimir, what is it now? I could have come with you. You are not needed. I'm never needed, it seems. I think you did not want to be outclassed. That is exactly what I want. <laughs> but by you... Is this an use, your father? To steal your children's birthright? The only right birth offers is the inevitable promise of death. You have us fighting over scraps. But I will take back what is ours. What is mine. Vlad sounds like a chip off the old block. Hope he takes the long way here. Seriously. Let's keep making sure he doesn't have one of these bases to call home. You better feed my need for info. <laughs> here in the financial district. Well, with these hunters, it's definitely a bear market. A random skyscraper? Interesting place to have a base. Like spelunking. And me without my headlamp. The data from the blind says this is some kind of greenhouse. Aw, oh, the hunters have a hobby. That's kind of cute. Not that cute. Don't expect any bouquets. Remember, we can alter the sprinkler's source to an herbicide to wipe out what they're growing. Good thing I have whatever the opposite of a green thumb is. Let's kill some plants. Make sure you turn off their relay. We don't want them calling in backup. Hello. This 
shall be good for you, Ledroci. Father, please, end this now. The others won't speak to me. Can you just come home? There's still time for us to, to be family again. I will not die like any other men. What? Well, I, I don't feel safe here anymore. I, I, I don't trust the others. They frighten me. Then cower and hide. You can endure the shame. You won't let them cut me. Will you? Father? That is up to you. Well, that was just sad. Feels ripe for a therapy session. No thanks, I'm all booked up. I feel for him, but he's still Craven's kid. Dangerous. Gotta clear out the last base so we're ready for this family shindig. Speaking of scooping... <laughs> so that's where they are. I'd have thought they would have torn down that old army supply base by now. If you can tether your web from the charging station to a power supply, you'll overcharge them into oblivion. The land in Antarctica. Wilder than heat. <laughs> Think you can dig up some more info on the incoming Kravenovs now? Here we go. What's this? Little Anna. You seek a challenge to feel the rush of fear again. I will give you something to fear, Father. Uh, your brother made such promises. Go on then. Terrify me. Anyone who gets in my way will suffer the same fate as Nedorochi. Is that so? And your mother? She was in the way. I assume Vladimir was no problem for you either. I live for the hunt. If you really are the one. Let us see if you can leave Volgograd unscathed. Oh my god. His entire family. All dead. This whole time we were getting ready for them, and they just destroy each other? And Craven gets to continue his hunt. Good thing we cleared out his strongholds. This is so messed up. The hunters are gone and the drones are grounded. You're pretty good at this. Let's hope Connors is home. And still in control of his green alter ego. Dr. Connors? Dr. Connors! You here? How long has that been going off? Connors' family. Heard his wife left with their son after the first lizard fiasco. Not that Craven cares. His son's room. Animal lover. Doc? Connors was here all right. And if 
fighting for his life by the looks of it. Genetic recombination research? He came home to cure himself. Hard to do experiments in your living room, though. Oh, man. What did Craven do to you, Doc? These blood samples are for a genome analyzer. Does Connors have a lab here? He tore through here. How are you still standing? Hello. No numbers on the keypad. The keys play different notes. Maybe the code's a song? Connors loves his secrets. This lab probably kept him and his family safe whenever he had an episode. Reptile terrariums for Connor's initial limb regeneration tests. I never did find out how he lost his arm. Motion sensor triggered the security cameras about 30 minutes ago. What did he put? He was trying to test his blood. Come on, Dr. Connors, fight it. Oh, no. Craven's gonna pay for putting Connors and his family through hell. Exactly how Craven likes it. Connors is blood. Cover the door. The beast could be anywhere. You have no idea. You are worthy of Craven. Let me tell you how this is all going to go down. Look, you leave Connors alone! He doesn't deserve this! But if you or Craven keep going after him, you'll answer to me! the river. I'm not going to make it in time. <laughs> Is it 1800s? I love the braids. still out there. The city needs me. It's Spider-Man right now. Uh, 
one second. <clears throat> Pete? What's going on? The market? Yeah, yeah, I'll be there. I'm sorry. I'll text you. It's beautiful. The mural, I mean. It's about time Pete called me back. Hey, how's it going with Haley? Had to bail. Lizard's loose. Could use your eyes in the sky. The lizard? Also, Haley thinks I'm crazy for trying to find Lee. Seems like everyone does. We're protecting you. Revenge to- I'm not after revenge. Dad always believed in second chances. But that's not what this is. It's my job to protect y'all, not the other way around. I get it. Okay, let me boot up my gear real quick. Looks empty, but I better check it out. Guess I'll have company after all. Everyone out! Moving! Go, go, go! Change the two, keep it tight. They're using drones to track the lizard. Maybe I can use them too. A passive defense system? Yep, good to know. Gonna keep my distance. Can't let these guys find the lizard first. Gotta clear them out. Spread out. If you find the lizard, don't engage alone. Hey, man. Got your feet up on the battle station. A lot of hunters. Are they using those bird drones to track the lizard? I think so. Why? Got an idea. I'll work on it while you clear the warehouse. Raven does not care for this spider. Also, your prey just ate three tons of dead fish. And he wants to change the menu. So if anyone's prey, it's not the scary lizard dude. I will never get tired of watching you kick serious ass. And we got our birdie. See if your suit can override the drone's motherboard. Okay. I'll give it a shot. Okay, my suit's pairing now. God bless you, Nix. Okay, rebooting the altimeter and... It's alive! How do I look? Like a robot drone, man. <laughs> and a robot drone that's tracking the lizard. Awesome. That was fast. It looks like he's through there. Uh, uh, this thing handles like a tank. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, okay. No, this is gonna be bad. Yankee, you good? Yeah. I think this way's blocked now, though. Don't stress. I'll meet you on the other side. Here we go. didn't make that. What's behind door number one? Uh, yeah. 
Where the hell were you? No idea, but I've seen some things. Same, man. Let's just find this lizard dude. Cool. Yeah. Drone doesn't have a lock on him, though. It's just his skin. Doesn't that mean he's getting bigger? Hungrier, too. New threads? The building's swarming with hunters. Any sign of Connors? Uh, yeah. Genki's tracking him. Hey, Mr. Parker. Mr. Spider-Man, I mean. <sighs> but the date is incomplete. I think I can help with that. Ugh. Is that blood? Hey, wait a sec. Try dropping it in here. Onboard scanner. Handy. Dude, this is great data. Hang on a sec. Okay, I think I got a lock. Gigi, wait, be chill. That wasn't me. Me neither. I don't even have a stomach, so... Let's go! And he's the only one who can help. We won't. You take the drones, I got the jet skis. Spider-Man's here. Well, if I borrow this? This is really, really exciting. Keep it tight, man. Watch out for those drones. Don't worry. They think I'm a friendly. Spider-Man! <laughs> Y'all having a yacht party without me? The East River is not a river, but in fact a saltwater tidal flat. But Spider-Man is fighting on right now! you about going after Connors. Now this is on you. Poison clouds. Is that all you've got? Almost done here. Civilians are all safe. How you looking? This gunship won't quit. I'm right behind you. We'll take it down together. No time. I got you. Time to go boom. Spider-Man, hang on! Over there! The one with the tendrils! Move, move, move! Are you 
guys doing? Trying to take out that gunship! Can't get close enough! I can. I'm one of them, remember? Bro, that's it! Pete! Now you bro three! Come on! Good, Pete. I saved the tracker. Let's go, man, before he gets too far. No. He's mine. Are you sure? He's got big teeth. So do I. Um, he's not normally like that, right? No. He's never like that. Tracker says Connors is in the Upper West Side sewers. Better move. Hey, any luck at Connors' house? No, but tracking him right now. What's wrong? Nothing. Meaning something. Miles was off his game. We almost had Lizard. I'm sure he was just trying to help. Sometimes it's just easier to do things myself. Hey, that's not fair, Pete. We're a team. We just really need Connors right now. For Harry. Okay. Let me know when you find him. I can get into the sewers up ahead. from you in a while. I'm close to finding Dr. Connors. As soon as I stick him with the antidote, this suit's coming right back to you. Okay. Let me know when you find him. Pipes are messing with the tracker signal. Where is he going? What's a security camera doing all the way down here? Huh? Only the lizard could be the sewer worse than he found. Burrowed through to a decommissioned subway line? <sighs> Don't think that was an accident. Connors doesn't want to be followed. <sighs> Seriously? No way. Oscorp has a lab in the sewers? Norman probably set this place up for Connors back in the day. Must be off the books. Don't even want to know what's in these vats. So many old antidotes. Useless now. Hmm. Wonder if this is the same sample Connors used for his original formula. What the hell did Norman have Connors working on back here? This symbol. Didn't know Connor studied ancient languages. Why was he mapping celestial coordinates? I've seen. 
seen this before. But where? Mutualism? Connor's always thought the answers to his problems lied in other organisms. They built a clean room, too? Wait. This is our particle accelerator at the Foundation. Connor's used it to break down some mineral? <laughs> Physical? are involved. Here it comes! 
can't get through his skin! <laughs> Damn it, the needle's stuck! I am not losing this antidote! Whoa! Oh crap! What are you gonna do at the top? Fly away! Nowhere to go! Where did you get that? Harry Osborne. He, he said you designed it. Come with me. It's over here. Whoa, 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 back off. I'm going in for a closer look. It's okay, it's okay. The 
fascinating. Shoot it off! Do it! What is that thing? It's a fragment of a meteorite that landed outside the city years ago. It's where we found that. I'm wearing an alien. We call it a symbiote. It, it bonds at the subcellular level with its host. Uh, in our case, Harry Osborne. He gave it to you? Not exactly. I was hurt, and... And it chose you. Which means it's more dangerous than I could have imagined. We need to call Oscorp. We need to destroy it. Destroy us? You said it chose me, Doc. It makes me a better Spider-Man. Eyes on the target. Pursuing. MJ, I'm glad you called. How you doing? Good. Storing some more boxes at the house. Just checked on Harry. But how, how are you? I saw the news about the lizard chase. I'm great. Connors is cured. The suit's still going strong and apparently is called a symbiote. Oh, and uh, it's an alien, which is pretty nuts, right? Wait, what? You don't sound concerned. I'm a little concerned, but I also couldn't have stopped Connors without it. Peter, the two of you tore through half the city. Like, did you see what you did to the museum? I'm honestly surprised nobody got killed. I'm not. And you know I had to cure him somehow. I mean, should I have just let him keep destroying things on his own? That's not the... I'm gonna work here for the rest of the night. My muse for a new Jonah-proof article has finally struck. Maybe I'll have something to show you if you come back later. What's gotten into her? It must be deadline stress. Some alone time should help. So, in the meantime, let's see who we can help out here. Man, I was hoping to give MJ some alone time, but I'm beat. Time to head home for a little rest. Wonder what she decided for her article. That's the story I was telling you about. I wanted to get your thoughts. Looks amazing, MJ. Can't wait to read it. Wait. You're still in the suit. I thought Connors was gonna help you get it off. What about Harry? Sorry, can we do this tomorrow? Just so beat from Lizard Ragley. Can't go out 
the windows. Downstairs is my only shot. Heading to the back. H2 report. What's the status? Kitchen clear. <laughs> Please don't squeak. <sighs> Thank you. Pete's workbench. Web shooters? Perfect. MJ. I'm on it. Spider-Man! It's me! He just threw a manhole cover at me! 
at me. Are you sure it was at you? Pretty sure. We stopped outside the Queensboro Tunnel. There are hunters everywhere. We're heading over there now. Don't let the hunters chase him away again. You got it. Still in there, Peter. You have to be.
This might sting a little. better than I did, Miles. We searched the whole tunnel. He is gone. For now. But he will come to me soon enough. I end up sleeping on a park bench. And why does it feel like I had the best sleep of my life? Weird dreams, though. Harry left another message. Pete, I really need that suit back. Dad's working on a new cure. But I don't know. Bring it back. Please. Hugo Webelert! New article from MJ! Wait, she published before I could read it? Buddy, how you feeling? I need that suit back. Pete. Um. What do you remember about last night? I just remember I... feeling tired. You're not yourself. That suit is changing you. This suit is the only reason I'm still alive. Yeah, it's pretty great, isn't it? Why don't you pop some more pills and say what you're really feeling? Hey, don't. I'm busting my ass out there trying to save you, and this is what I get? I said don't. I saw your story. 
I tried to tell you about that. Yeah, but you didn't, did you? I can't lose this job. Your job is to write the truth. I did. The truth is, I'm the hero here, not you. How was your visit with Harry? Don't worry, Harry's gonna get better. Thank you. For being his friend. Watching you two grow up together. You're like a son to me. I am so proud of the man you've become. Thanks, Mr. Osborne. Uh, I, I gotta run. A lot of work to do. And as usual, looks like I gotta do it myself. Peter, where is Miles? He didn't come home last night and he's not answering my call. Hello? I'm at my office. Tell him to come see me. Now. Why can't anyone take care of themselves? It's always up to me. I'm sure he's fine, but give me a call if you see him. Thanks, too. Miles! I've been calling you. For hours. Nothing. You know Miles has been hunting Lee. I'll find him. I'm calling the hospital. I said I'd find him! I've got this under control. All Miles talks about is how to be a better Spider-Man. Not school, not his friends. How to help you. Go help him. How did I get here?
place has tight security. There. That cleared a small path. Hello? Are these all prisoners? Would Craven lock me up in here? Kenki, I need you, man. What is this? <coughs> Poison? I have to get out of here. Those generators look like they power the fans. all of them. There has to be a way out of here. It sounded like they were waiting for me. This place never ends. What if the hunters know who I really am? What if they took off my mask? What if... Genki, can you hear me now? Please. Did they... Did they get to him? Uh, more hunters. Craven seems to believe this will be the one. I wonder if he's right. There is an electricity to the air. Yes. After so many have failed, it seems impossible for anything to kill him. an exit. I need to find out why Craven brought me here. Just have to get out of here and call Spider-Man. If he's okay. Okay. What's going on? This is... I expected you sooner. Where is the energy of youth, huh? Fight to the death. Or die here together. So how many people did you kill before I got here? I didn't have a choice. 
You always have a choice. I am done wasting my time fighting weakly. Prove you are worthy of my life. I understand you want to kill me, but I can't let you do that. What makes you think you deserve to live? I won't die as the man that I was. Back off. You don't get to walk away from what you did. The inner demons, devil's breath, the city hall bombing. Don't recount my sins to me. I know what I've done. You have no idea. Did Craven bring you here, or was this voluntary? Save your superiority complex. We're both in this arena. Looks like serving time didn't change you at all. You'll never defeat me. Spider-Man doesn't kill. You never fought this one. working. in the game. I'm not really here right now. None of this is real. What's more real than fear? What are you doing to me? Taking a look into your soul. I see a boy terrified of being alone of failing his family. Keep talking! You're not getting away from me! Uh, you can't it hurt me! Everyone has a breaking point. Even Spider-Man. It's just a matter of finding it. And I have all the time in the world to dig into you. Get out of my head, man! Out of your head. But there's so much to see in you. Oh, so, you named 
Miles. Miles? Who are you really? Miles. Get down here, Lee! Let's dig deeper. Just fight me, man! You wanna end this? Let's fight! <laughs> 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 Hell, Miles. I know this is you, Lee. Yeah, yeah of course it is. Uh, I'm always here for you. I do everything for you. I'm not listening. Yeah, I'm not surprised you'd say that. Because all that matters is you, right? All you do is take. You put me in danger. You put Haley in danger. But for what? What do we get? I, I know I'm left behind. That's all we get. Or we end up like Finn. Kenki! Kenki! I know I said it wasn't your fault, but... I guess I just mostly felt bad for you. I didn't want you to feel responsible. Especially after... No! Especially after your... Shut up! You said when you wanted to, Miles. You're going to let me in eventually. And until then... Struggle. Miho. Miho, where are you? No. I'm here, Mom. I can't do this anymore, Miles. You're always gone. Always in danger. No. You're going to get yourself killed. Won't. And then what? If you can't win, Miles, I should never have let you try. All it's ever done is make me more alone. Put me in more danger. No! I want to protect you! I will! Heard that before. Mean it! Not from you. On the day he died, Mom. your father told me just that morning that everything he does. No! No, no, no! Miles, please! I love you. That's enough, Lee. Oh, Miles. I said that's enough! You're right. That's more than enough. I have everything I need. Hey there, big man. man. Man, it feels good to see you. Lots changed since I left. You became a whole hero. But I couldn't save you. Or Finn. If Spider-Man can't protect everyone, who will? Come on now. You're more than just Spider-Man. You can try and hide behind that mask, but I know who you are. What you stand for. I've been watching you. You have? And it hurts. What happened to the boy that I raised? A coward. Slave my family. You don't mean that. I do. We all do. You're a failure, Miles. Always will be. No! You never say that! None of you would! I'm not. It's time to give up. Give up, Miles. No. Give up! I won't. Give up. Give up. Give up. You're done, Lee. I'm not doing this anymore. You want to know who I am? I'm the kid whose dad you killed at City Hall! What? He died because you decided your problems were more important than all of those people's lives. Jefferson Davis was a hero who saved people from you. No.
I'm done listening to you. Losing my dad? It's not what's holding me back. I was the one doing that. But not anymore. Let them escape! <laughs> Mr. Negatives near Feast in Chinatown. But nothing from Miles. Do you think? Miles is fine. We're out looking for him now. Find me. Miles has to be there too. Has to be. I'll go check it out. He so much as laid a hand on Miles. Hello? It's Dr. Connors. Sorry, I asked Harry for your number. <clears throat> I just... Please, come back to the lab. We need to remove the symbiote. The hold that it's already taking on your mind, it's only going to get worse. I'm busy. No one listens. I left the best parts of me here. I'm not looking for a fight. Craven has the other Spider-Man trapped in an old mansion east of the city. He saved me. Told me to find you. This was the only way I knew how. I owe him my life. And much more. If we hurry... No. You've done enough. You should be proud of him. He reminds me of you. Reminds him of me. He doesn't even know me. Or Miles. A little bit of help now, all of a sudden he's a good guy. As soon as Miles is safe, please going back in a cell. Not now, MJ. Is Spider-Man doing more harm than good? How about now? Now who needs the old Spider-Man? What's so great about the new Spider-Man anyway? He can't even stop some hunters. They destroyed the EMF. Destroyed my life. I'm going to lose May's house because of them and... Craven. Spider will survive. Where is he? Where is Spider Man?
I'm assured that material is unbreakable. But I believe anything can be broken. Just as this is ours! Your followers treat you like some kind of god! But you're just a dying old man looking for a way out! So you know then! Then you know I will not die in a sick bed! Only an equal may taste my last breath! Rip me apart! And parade your achievement to the streets! I hope you're enjoying it. Tonight won't end well for you. I study all of my prey. You are agile, intelligent, vulnerable to emotion. So am I. Do not let the taste of power get to your head.
Sorry about that. I just... It's just, it's just me. You almost killed him, man! What are you doing? You're in the way, Miles! Always in the way. I could have fixed everything! How? By strangling him? That's not what we do! Don't try to mentor me! You're the one! Don't try to mentor me! You're the one running away from your problems! You're the one hell-bent on revenge! My family, protect you! You're not better than me! I'm not saying that! You're stronger than some suit, Pete! Don't listen to it! And what? Listen to you? Yes! Listen to me! What are you so afraid of? I need this suit. It makes me a better Spider-Man. You just want it for yourself. All I want is to save you. I'm the hero. I don't get sick. Why are you doing this? I made you! You owe me! I know you don't mean that! All I wanted was to save everyone! MJ! It's me! Now this city thinks that I'm the problem! You think I'm the problem? But I'm not anymore! I'm the solution! Everything everyone needs me to be. Yeah, you don't even answer my calls anymore, man. And what about MJ? You could have killed her. I know you're hurting, Pete, but you're better than this. I know. I know. But. People in my life, they keep dying. I blame myself for that. They needed a hero, and if I thought some school could save them, maybe I'd be in your shoes now. But this kind of power is the reason they're gone. Not you, not me. Shut up! You gotta be stronger than that. This time, you have to save yourself. You will. I'm not losing you, Pete. I need to use the belt. Pete, come on, man. Just, just focus on me. Come on. I'm stronger than this. You hear me?
these last few days. Miles, I'm sorry. Thank you for everything. That's what Spider-Man do. <clears throat> Spider-Man didn't save me back there. Miles did. <clears throat> what now? I have to talk to Dr. Connors. He said he knows how to destroy it. Wait, what about Harry? Doesn't he kind of need it? His dad is working on another cure. One that doesn't involve aliens. You know, if you need me, I'm just a call away. Well, once I let my mom know this, she still has a son. I know. It's glad to have you back, man. Dr. Connors, I got the suit off. It's contained, but what do I do now? Bring it to Oscorp Tower. There's a tank there that will subdue it. I have to prep a few things first, but I'll let you know when I'm on my way. One thing before we meet. Now that the symbiote is off of you, how are you feeling? Fine. Relieved that it's over. Ashamed at what I did. It's not your fault. There's still so much we don't know. Just tell me right away if you feel any changes in mood, behavior... But it's off me. I'm cured, right? Very likely. Yes. Just do your best to keep that thing contained. Copy that. Hello, ma'am. Who's there? I don't recognize your voice. It, it's Spider-Man? Oh, I didn't realize. Alba, charmed to meet you. So, you need my help? Yes. There's a monster in my backyard. I can hear it at night. Scratching. Could it be a stray dog? Or a rat? My allergies could sense a stray dog half a mile away. And even New York rats don't get as big as whatever that is. Is there anybody else here who might have noticed it? Family member? Guide dog? Just me. No family. No neighbors. No service animals. Allergies, remember? Whatever it is, I need it gone. Got it. I'll look around and let you know what I find. Please, I cannot afford to repair any more damage. Fixed income, you know. Definitely an animal. Well, that's disgusting. Looks inorganic. Even weirder. I can pick up traces of the chemical. Looks like it came from the woods. More gunk. Whatever it is, it's either leaky or slobbery. Yeah. This stuff leaves a real strong trail. Maybe Genki knows something about this thing. Uh, hello? Hey, Genki. That monster in Queens? It's one of those hunter beasts. But it's not attacking. Whoa. A hunter beast? Maybe we can hack it. It could give us some intel. There's something in its side. An arrow? Easy. This won't hurt. Probably. Since, you know, you're metal. Do something! 
should we do with this thing? Is it dangerous? Uh, try fetch? You wanna get the barrels? Are you a happy puppy? Wanna play chase? That's it, good dog, get him! I'll try to access its memories while it's distracted. Man, a lot of corruption in these logs. So, the arrow. Why would hunters shoot their own robot pets? Target practice? Let's find out. Hey, what's your name, anyway? Designation F1D0. Fido. Good to know at least one hunter has a sense of humor. This log is cached to a server. Ooh, dare I? How deeply do you believe in your firewall? Deeply enough to download this audio playback. Get out of my wall, ladies and gentlemen. She's a traitor to crime. You are the traitor. I was doing my job! Oh, defective garbage! Get back here! We've got company! We must have tricked our log access! Easy, easy, stay! Heal, buddy! Heal! Genki, send to the stomp command! I can't access manual override! I always wanted to say that. Focus! I think it's scared! It's definitely acting like it. Maybe that recording scared it! Repressed final memories? Always bad. I think its owner shot it. And covered up a murder! Fido, stop! <clears throat> no, 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 not the church! <laughs> there you are. <laughs> That's all of them. Fido! Okay, don't worry. He won't hurt you anymore. Now, let's take care of that arrow. Okay, let's have a look. A little pinch. Ready? Good boy. You sure this is safe? Hey, if 10 million dog videos can't make you a good boy, there's no hope for any of us. You're a good boy, aren't you? Who's a good boy? Just to be safe, though, I'll wipe its memory completely. Except the videos. And you. Good call. We're back. Spider-Man? Wait. Me? Me and this curious guy. Oh, oh no. My allergies! It's okay. Earlier you mentioned you couldn't get a guide animal? Well, I found you one. He's a dog. I guess. Made of various metals. Very allergy friendly. He's also got a few hundred guide dog videos uploaded to his memory. Really? He's everything I hoped for. I can have him trained at the center. So he can be properly registered. Already so helpful. Thank you, Spider-Man. Adios! Okay. I'm heading over to Oscorp Tower now. Right. See you there. I haven't told MJ yet. Hello? MJ, I got the suit off. And I'm so sorry for... Go on. For treating you and everyone I care about like absolute crap. I'm heading to Oscorp to store the suit until Dr. Connors and I can figure out what to do. Does Harry know? No. But Norman's been working on an alternate cure that's showing real promise. We can still... We will save Harry. Well, it's a relief to hear you sounding like yourself again. Wrap things up. I'll see you at home.
finally got it off. My hero. Harry. We've got to destroy it. It's too dangerous. I don't want you to lose yourself. Like I did. Pete. Please. You don't understand. Connor said it was... I saved your life! And you won't save mine? Do you want me to die? Are you? Oh, God.
with all you can do. Only stand more. Just do. Don't be scared, honey. You finally have the power to do what we've always wanted. We're going to heal the world. How? Let me show you.
I'll find you out there. Our EMF badges were RF enabled. If Harry's still wearing his badge, I can use Oscorp satellite dishes to find him. Please be wearing that badge. Great, getting a strong signal that way. Time to move. This signal is moving around. It's gotta still be on Harry. Ugh. I was such a jerk to Harry when I had that suit. I need to find him. Apologize. We'll try to get through to him. Closing in on you, buddy. Help's on the way. Hang in there. We'll get this thing off you. And I'll work with your dad and Dr. Connors to get you fixed up. Somehow. The signal stopped moving. Stay there, buddy. Let's pinpoint his location a bit more. He's got to be under that overpass. What is all this stuff? Harry, are you back here? Damn, just his badge. Maybe he's still around here somewhere. I know he'll listen to me if I can just get through to him. Yes, there you are. Harry? It's me. Hey, Harry. Can you hear me? Listen, we're gonna figure out a cure. Something better. Miles, I need help with these things. Got your messages. Sorry, I've been looking for my mom. Assume you saw Craven's dead? What? No. You think it was Harry? Maybe. Probably. We've got to stop him. Okay, I've got an idea. When you were under the influence, the certain sounds made you weak. That bell. But we can't just carry it around. No, but I've got this mixing app on my phone. I can recreate the bell sonic elements. Then we can use it against Harry and his army. That's genius. Glad you decided to study music tech. Feel free to share that opinion with the college acceptance board. What's up, Genki? 
there you are. Your mom and we I were are... looking for you. And I was looking for you. I texted you I was okay. Well, I didn't get it because we've been on the subway looking for you. We're glad you're okay. I'll ride with your mom back home. Can you meet us? Got to deal with something first, but I'll be there as soon as I can. Okay. Got to recreate the sound of Craven's bell. What sounds can I use around here? Serious echo chamber. Could come in handy. Perfect. Same shape as Craven's bell. Even if it's a tenth the size. Maybe I can pilot the boat into that hangar. Yes! Recorded it. Echo! Great reverb in here. Need some echo. Plenty of echo in that hangar. There's the engine, but no power. Here we go. Yes, super echo recorded. Almost done. Just need a low frequency boost with a pulse. Something like a helicopter's blades. Gotta get up there. Very funny. Let me transfer these sounds. Hopefully this will help. Come on, come on! Go! Whoa! Where? Nice job, Miles! Now let's save these people! That's more like it! Oh, we did it! I dropped a pin for EMTs. They'll take care of these people. Good thinking. Subway is messed up. The train is totally stuck. I goo on the window. Yankee? For Douglas Circle. There's a bunch of us. Yankee, we're on our way. Great. Get here, mijo. I love you. Love you too. Why is Harry doing this? I'm creating all these things. I don't think Harry's the one doing it. At least not the Harry I know. And who is? The symbiote? Yeah. I'm no expert, but it seems like it's trying to make itself a new home. Find him later. Right now, we need to save your mom and Ganky. Watch yourself! Harry looked a lot different than you did when you had your suit. I think that would have been me eventually if you hadn't saved me. We gotta check in with mom and Ganky. Answering. Doctor Man! 
are stuck. We gotta move these tendrils somehow. You need to hurry. Oh, these tendrils are alive and connected. There's gotta be a central nerve somewhere. Bingo! Let's hit a nerve. He's pulling back, but not enough. They're still trying to get into the trains. There's got to be another nerve cluster around here. Oh, wow. Too big for a single sonic burst. Think we can chain some together? Yeah, but they'll need time to sync up. How much time does it need? Bro, did you hear that? How much time? A minute? Maybe a little more? Keep your fighting sense sharp. This might get wild. But these things really don't want us here. Yeah. Heat, they're near the heart. Get them right on time. Good one. They're getting close to the weapon. Almost there. Just need one more to sink. Kyle, can you hear me? Tentacles coming in the wind of us! He's trapping people! Just hang on! We see you! You can do it! Keep it up! Just a little longer! We did it! Let's get to your mom and Genki. Advice. I let go of some things that didn't serve me. <gasps> Come on. That really sucks. I thought I was gonna die. My life was flashing from my eyes. You're good, man. <sighs> that time when we went mini golfing for my birthday and I got that hole in one to win, I cheated. I could pick up the ball and dropped it in when you weren't looking, and I. You were eight. And honestly, I never liked the sandwiches you traded for at lunch, but I went along with it because I knew how much you loved my mom's banchan, and I'm seeing someone new, by the way. Her name's Andy, and she's great, and please don't kill me, but I just thought of a sequel for Sweet Nanagon, and I... Wait, 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 wait. Andy from Kim? Oh, she's real cool. Thanks for saving us. Look, I'm sorry I've been so busy. I'll do better. Make the time to hang out. Be careful. Genki, let's get uptown. I'll make you something good for dinner. Next step, find Harry. I'll take downtown. I got uptown. Well, I'm looking for Harry. I should check in on some other things. Yankee, what's up? Hey, Mr. Parker. Um, you've been dealing with those fire cult guys, right? The followers of the flame? Yeah. I'm seeing reports on social media say they spotted a few of them on a rooftop in Brooklyn. I'll send you the details. I'll check it out. Thanks, Genki. Is the Crimson Hour about to start? No cultists. Looks like they're keeping watch on that scrapyard nearby. And there's some... Burned up papers about Oscorp. I better get down there. Great, they're still setting up. But this doesn't look like an Oscorp property. What are they. The Crimson Hour won't be long now, my embers. Can you feel it? The unworthy will. Soon enough. <laughs> All those innocent people. Gotta disable these bombs before they can hurt the civilians in those buildings. I can do this. So this is the Crimson Hour. Whoa. 
right? gonna have to make up a new prophecy. <sighs> Before you and I met, one of my embers told me about his work at Oscorp and this treatment that they had discovered. Who cares, right? Fancy suit that can make you big and strong is just another case of the unworthy trying to cheat death and play God. That's what I thought, too. But... When devils attack the city... Like I prophesied! Oscorp sent out some of this treatment for safekeeping. I knew it was meant for me. That's what all this was for. Crimson hour rolls over this earth. It shall bring 
truth. Judgment. Underground, just like last time, but I'll find him. You could have killed him, but you saved me instead. I told you, I'm trying to save the most lives, and you still do that pretty well. You gonna turn me in now? I'll let you know when I find him. We stopped him from taking innocent lives in the process. Hey, Yuri. Do you want help tracking down the flame? Thanks, but I need some time to myself. Besides, we've taken down a good chunk of his operation. So he'll be going back to the drawing board. I'll start checking his old aliases. Archie Abel, Walter Wackman, Cletus Cassidy. But this could take months. Maybe even years. I'll be ready when you've got something. Thanks. I couldn't turn her in after she saved me. Maybe I... <sighs> Maybe Harry's back at his place. Can't hurt to check. sign of Harry. What's that? Happy birthday, Em. They say time heals all wounds. That's a lie. Every day without you is worse than the last. If I lose Harry, I... I don't know what I'll do. Norman's really hurting. I need to find Harry. And save him. Haven't heard from MJ in a while. I should give her a call. I hate this. I love this. You do? <laughs> you hit the nail on the head. Finally! Top story. Everybody's talking about it. This is editor material. Editor? Congratulations. Your first assignment, write more juicy stuff by tomorrow morning. Drama, controversy, just like this. Like this. Get writing! <sighs> MJ. I, uh, didn't get fired from the Bugle. In fact, I think I, I got a promotion. Hey, that's what you wanted, right? Yeah, I, I thought it was. Then that's... Great. Hey, listen. Something's gone wrong with Harry. What... what happened? Well... well hang on, someone's at the door. It's kind of hard to explain. Just promise me you'll stay away from him, okay? MJ? What the hell? 
Come on, MJ, pick up! Hey, it's MJ. You can leave Damn a message, it. but why would you? If it's important, just, you know, text. Please be okay. Spider-Man, how are you feeling? Anxious? Panicked? I meant, uh, physical symptoms. Soreness? Fatigue? Yes. Wait, symptoms? I've been looking through years of research notes. The symbiote channels a... collective consciousness. That hive mind I was in. Was... is optimistic. It may still be inside you. What? Nothing to panic about, but... Perhaps you should come to the lab for some tests. Can't, Doc. Bigger problems. Gotta go! MJ! Where's... Harry. Pete? You look tense. Coffee? We need to talk. You must get tired making the world a better place every single day. But I can help. All you have to do is let me. This isn't you. Wrong. This is the real me. I finally have the power to realize our vision. Are you giving up on me? Harry, we need to get that thing off you. Do not call us a thing. Get 
control you! You always patronize us! Make it stop! Make it stop! Remember your book? You said you want to help people! Nobody read it! Nobody cares! It's not true! If I helped one person, it was worth it! I didn't realize! MJ! You can quit! I can figure something out! I can't trust you! I can only rely on us! No! I'm sorry, MJ! I was wrong! You don't have to trust me! But please, hug yourself! Let me do what I have to do! You're right! I've been selfish! I was so wrapped up in my own life, I never thought about yours! But let's handle this MJ's way! Let me help you fight this! We don't need you! The city needs you! I need you! Don't lie to me! You too. You just want to stay the stronger half. Why? Don't feel special anymore. What? No! You're stronger than me in so many ways. Make it stop. Make it stop. What? No! You're stronger than me in so many ways! You've been single-handedly holding our lives together! I'm sorry, MJ! I took you for granted! MJ is gone! No! You aren't! I'm sorry I caused you so much pain! The house! My job! Our life together! I promised you I'd be better, but I wasn't! I should've listened! I should've been there! We're a team! Me and you! I never want your life to be worse to make mine better! Your dreams are just as important as mine! You're lying! You're just as important! Enough! Just talk to me! We have had enough!
I'm okay. Yeah, I think... I'm okay. You did it! <laughs> Wait. Not yet. Watson! Where are you with my apple fritters? I'm starving, and Jonah? I... Jonah? Kiss my ass. I quit. What's up? You're so cool. I thought I'd lost you. I think I've been lost for a while now. Not just to the symbiote. For months I've been trying to be something I'm not. I'm glad you're back. It wasn't you. And I wasn't me earlier. Pete, I... Pete, it... it was like some kind of hive mind in there. I saw you. And Harry, he, he was going after this... rock. Miles is at City Hall. Go. I love you. I love you. Hey, can you get my text? City Hall is... This is bad, man. Head in there now. Yeah. Sorry, things got complicated. I'll be there soon. Do you think this is Harry? It has to be. I just saw him in Queens. He turned MJ into one of those symbiotes, but worse. What? She's okay. She broke out of it. Luckily, faster than I did. Connors thinks I had the suit on too long, and now some of it is left inside of me. You really meant it when you said things were complicated. One thing at a time. See you soon, Miles. I hear that. See you. Reminds me. I owe someone else a call. Peter? Hey, it's Morales. You, uh, make it home safe? I, I was just... You know, I wanted to make sure... We're fine. We're fine. And Peter, we're fine, too. But next time, answer my calls. Trust me. I'll be on my best behavior. You'd better be. Now go help my son. Mr. Osborne, are you okay? I'm worried about Harry. And I have no one else to talk to. He's, um, not himself right now. And it's all my fault. It's mine, too. Harry told me about his treatment. I knew something was off, but I was just happy he was back. I should have told him that more. You still can. I'll let you know if I hear from him, Mr. Osborne. Okay. I appreciate it, Peter. <laughs> Harry's been busy. Yeah. Well, good thing the cleanup crew's here. This is somehow worse than I thought. No sign of Harry. He has to be here! The Yankees told me there are a bunch of civilians trapped inside. Apparently they were using this place as shelter. We'll get them out safe and sound! Got a report that a window shattered somewhere in the building. Come on, Miles! We need to hurry! Not sounding good in there. We're working on it. Watching your back. All clear. Let's get him out of there. Spider-Man! <laughs> 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 
there's still some of this thing inside him. Oh, I see. I think I can clear it out of him. But only if I go to the source. I'm going in with you. Spider-Man. All of this dark matter should lead us toward him. Alright. On my way. Where are we anyway? We are inside Spider-Man's mind. We've seen what those creatures do to people around the city. Come and get in your head. Twist your desires. Mad they stole your routine? I know you're joking. You're making my point. This thing fears my power for some reason. And I, we, are the only ones who can find where it lives. So we clear this thing out at the root, and Spider-Man's free? That's the plan. All right, then. It has a stronger hold on him than I thought. All right. Weaken the symbiote, take back control, use our powers to save Spider-Man. Where do we start? We have to find the source of his pain. Follow me. I'll try and lead you to where it's darkest. But I can't promise what we'll find. Them all. The problem solved. That's not what Pete thinks. No, but it might be how he feels. All these villains. He really thought the suit could solve it all. Is that me? You caused a lot of pain, man. A debt I will spend the rest of my life repaying. Something. House. I haven't asked Pete about her in a long time. What's wrong with me? When you get caught up in one part of your life, it's easy for the rest to fall away. Come here. Oh, man. All I see is a process, not a destination. It is her. She's dead because of you. I never meant for her to get hurt. This is your chance to make it up to her, then. Your power does have the same effect in here. Yeah, I guess it does. Looks like we're at 
feast. I built my life around this place. This will probably be the closest I'll ever get to seeing the inside of it again. Not that I deserve to. Lee, why did you do it? What did you want? Revenge. Norman Osborne's the reason my parents are dead. So I dedicated my life to making his hell. I'm sorry, Miles. Up there. That's the source. If we clear this out, we just might be able to save him. I can transfer all of my power into the symbiote. I think I can neutralize it. And free Peter. What'll happen to you? I guess we'll find out. <clears throat> well, if this is my last chance to say anything to you, forgive you. It's just not in me. But I can't carry this hate for you anymore, man. So let's set things right. You and me. Suit. Whoa, what 
is this? Miles, where did this come from? Leonide went in your head to clear out the symbiote left inside. He had to drain his power into it to save you. It looks like it had an effect. Wait, you two work together? I wasn't about to let you die. Miles, that's... After so many times saying it, thank you seems soft. It's okay. I know. I don't deserve that kid. We lost you. Guess I should thank you. I spent years of my life consumed with vengeance. I lost everything for it. You two reminded me that that's not who I am. When you help someone, you help everyone. Where are you gonna go? To set things right. Your way. Wow. Reforming your greatest enemy. Can't say I've ever done that. Maybe MJ was right. Why would the city need me when it has you? I don't know. This city still looks like a two Spider-Man job to me. Bump. I think Miles just saved my life! What? What happened? There was symbiote left inside of me. It started taking over, but Martin Lee gave me his power. It feels different. Like the voices are gone, but the power is still there. That's incredible. MP, just wanted to let you know. I got my byline pulled off that article. And gave my landlord notice. Does that mean? It means the world is going to get turned into an alien wasteland. There's no one I'd rather be glued up with than you. Aw, the feeling's mutual. <laughs> Keep an eye out for Harry. I'll let you know if I hear anything. OK, while I look for Harry, <sighs> Dr. Connors, hello? He's here in my lab. Got to call Miles and get over there quick. Miles, meet me at Connor's lab. I think Harry's there, and it doesn't sound good. On my way. Should be a shortcut to Connor's lab near Central Park. I've got to find a way to get through to Harry. He's in there. I know I can reach him. Just hope he doesn't hurt Connor's. Son, we are your 
sun. Look at us! We are healthy. Strong. This is what you want. Isn't it? Stop, Harry! We can help you! Where's the rest of it? do with that thing? I think we're about to find out. You need to know. Harry's gone. Host and Symbiote are perfectly fused. I'll find a way to save him. You can't. But you can still stop the Symbiote. How? By killing the host. Please, save my boy. Spider-Man, I know you're seeing what I'm seeing right now. We've got a lot of New Yorkers being attacked by these... things. I'm on it. Stay safe out there. All he needed was that meteorite. Now he can heal the world. This isn't what we meant. There are people trapped inside that store! It's okay, they're gone. Those civilians are in trouble. I'm coming! Those symbiotes won't stop until they get inside! I'll take care of these things! Just stay inside the bus! This area is not safe. If you don't have a place to go, Beast is open to anyone. You saved me. Miles, we have to talk. No kidding. There are nests popping up everywhere. I'm sending you coordinates now. Got it. Watch yourself out there, man. This is something else. Harry. 
I'll find you, buddy. I'll find you. Somewhere. That suit's not an alien, is it? <laughs> it's time for a Miles Morales original, you know? One of one. <laughs> Looks good. What happened, man? Harry got the meteorite. I, uh... I couldn't stop him. Connor said we can't save him, so we have... I can't lose him, Miles. I can't do this again. I saw May when I was... in your head. It's not your fault, Pete. She wanted to save you. To save all of us. She never thought about herself. Even when she was struggling to breathe. If May... my dad... If they were here, they would want us to stop thinking about them. They'd want us to help people. To fight. Harry's still in there. And we're gonna fight like hell to get him back. Call the play, coach. Let's split up. Cover more ground. You find the meteorite, I'll clear that nest out. You got it, Spider-Man. started. Turn into symbiotes. You are safe here. Everyone you love is safe here. My head. I have to find a way out. Why would you leave? We are here. You can be too. You, Peter. Us. This isn't where I belong, Harry. Neither do you. Come on, Miles! Come on! Let us heal you. Bring us, Peter. Haley? What are you showing me?
Haley's in trouble. Pete, I saw the meteorite. It's under the Harlem subway station, next to the bridge. Heading there now! Wait for me though, man. Harry, he's after you. I have to go help Haley, but just wait, all right? Whoa, whoa, back up! What happened? I got sucked into the hive mind. Saw this vision of the meteorite underground. But I've got a bad feeling. You think Harry's there? You serious, Pete? Just give me ten minutes. You cannot do this alone. Right. Call me when you're done. Sorry, Miles, but I can't waste any time. There's the subway entrance. Miles has to be right. That's where the meteorite is. Just have to clear out this bridge. Everyone stay in your cars. I won't let them hurt you. Harry! Man up! I know you're here! You found us. Yes, I'm here, buddy! You, not now! I don't have time for this. Maybe... No. Come on, Spider-Man. Almost done. Harry! Can you hear me? I'll find you, buddy. I'm coming! Just stay down! There, the subway tunnel. Hey, everything all good with Haley? Not yet, but you still owe me a few more minutes. Hang tight! Haley! No! What are you doing here? I was... I was trying to save... <gasps> You're incredible. I, I like you so much, and I think you like me. Do you want to go out? Hey, on a date? Is that a yes? <laughs> well, it's a date then. After all this is over. Hey, buddy. I talked to Dr. Connors. He says you're too far gone, but I know that's not true. Harry, I messed up. It was terrible to you. Your dream, our dream, healing the world. I'm sorry. Peter, we need you. 
I'm trying, buddy. I just need that meter right, okay? Miles, I'm not seeing a rock. No? Hold on, I'm nearly to you. Thanks for coming, Pete. We want to show you something. MJ, we all need to meet at Bad May's house. What's going on out there, guys? It's the meteorite that the symbiote arrived in. He's using it to transform the city. I know where it is. And we're gonna steal it. Time to game. I'm in. See you guys at home. Central Park Reservoir. The water system. Pumping goo everywhere. Adding more and more people to the hive mind. If all those symbiotes got out of Manhattan. Goodbye, Earth. Hello, planet goo. The meteorite is the source of all the power, right? Creating goo, creating symbiotes. But it was useless until Harry repaired it. Yeah. And that particle accelerator is what damaged it in the first place. Cut off a piece at low power. Right, so what if we crank the power up? Like way past 11. Might destroy it. And free everyone connected to the hive mind. Theoretically. But that reservoir's gotta be mobbed with symbiotes. And you know Harry's not gonna let that rock out of his sight. Unless he sees something he wants more. Me. Just, you know, for illustrative purposes. Harry's still Harry. He thinks he's healing the world. But the dream isn't complete without... His best friend beside him. I can lead Harry away from the meteorite. And I can handle all the symbiotes. While I grab the space rock. For illustrative purposes. All right. Fire up the accelerator. <sighs> no more hive mind. World saved. We all get churros? <laughs> Theoretically. Pete, what Connor said about Harry being too far gone. If you can't save him, are you won't ready? come to that. You two will be able to destroy the rock in time. Let's heal the world. For real this time. Or Harry and his friends. Here. I figured you could use a sonic touch. <sighs> They're just standing there. What are they waiting for? Look, I can't thank you both enough for everything. Come on, bro. 
with the Spire team. <laughs> Don't anyone forget it. Gonna sit in there and play with your pet rock all night? It's you and me, Harry. Like we always wanted. me first. Yeah. 
sure your plus one isn't invited to our high school reunion, Harry? Harry? Meteorite. You took it from 
Spaß. Different man. 
No, we don't. It'll kill them. And then it'll kill you. Let's heal the world, Pete. Together.
here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Pulse is weak. We gotta move. What have you done? What have you done to him? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm coming with you. Wait. traces of brain activity, but his chances of coming back are very slim. Just keep him alive. Get the G serum ready. ASAP. For the last few years, tragedy has tried to tear the city apart. But we somehow kept going. We battled sickness, evil, Cataclysm. We are tired, anxious, stressed, numb. But we have never lost hope. The city needs to heal. We're all ready to return to normal, but what is normal? What if it no longer exists? 
Over the last half hour, I've talked about how these events have changed me. But what about you? In this ongoing series, I will be talking with people throughout the city, exploring our new behaviors, new routines, new thoughts and feelings. I hope you'll join me on this journey. This has been Mary Jane Watson, and you're listening to The New Normal. Episode one, done. Nice. <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, are these good to go? In a minute, I want to show you something first. Okay. It has molasses in it. Yum, I'll take those. <laughs> Thanks again for the donation, Peter. Have you talked to Miles about? Not yet. You ready? Uh, Miles. I've been meaning to talk to you uh, about something. Uh, I mean, I have been talking to you there all, all the time. It's, it's, it's great uh, to talk. So many good talks. Uh, I just haven't been talking to you about what I should have been talking to you about. Pete. Uh, wait, uh, let me start again. I got this. All of it. Go be Peter Parker for a while. Are you... Are you sure? It's... It's a big city. I can handle it. As long as I can still call you for advice. You don't need it. <laughs> Maybe not now, but... There'll come a time. I'm here for you. Always. Hey, bro.
What do you want? The Spider-Men. You know who they are, don't you? Why? They ruined my son. Good. We all have to experience loss. Even you, Norman. What are you writing? The final chapter. Hi. I uh, hope you're hungry. Food's almost ready. Why don't you go show her your essay? He worked so hard on it. guy in Harlem, probably seen him volunteering in the city, helping out his city council mom, and trying to live up to his hero dad. Yeah. Haley, this is Albert. Uh, hi. Nice to meet you. Oh, and uh, <laughs> this is my daughter, Cindy. this? Lance and a thumb drive? They say you should never plug in a drive of unknown origin. But I know Norman, I think. Peter! <laughs> I put this together for you because I knew when we got through this crazy time, Whenever we got through it, I wanted you to have these. And I wasn't positive I'd be here to give them to you myself. Harry, 
After the Emily May Foundation was destroyed by Craven's hunters, I went to see what I could recover before it got boarded up. In the box, you'll find a piece of bark from my mom's tree, and one of May's blossoms. And I thought, if you gene splice them together, we might get a hardy enough plant to produce seeds. How? Oh. Well, okay. drones we salvaged from the field studies? We just leveraged their relocation data sets to plant those seeds around the city. You're some kind of genius, Harry Osborne. Let's get those bees working. I know, I know. It'll be years before we see the results. And who's to say where you and I will be a week from now, let alone years from now? Which is why I did this simulation to show you. So Emily and May will live on in the city, and of course, in us. I love you, Pete. I really do. And I know the Foundation didn't end up going the way I'd hoped, but there's still no one I'd rather have tried it with. I bet by the time you get this, we'll have already started a new Foundation. Just me and you. From scratch. Go us. Go us? something for you. We're in good health. Love you. using some kind of qubit-based algorithm, but I built a decoder table, which is actually kind of genius of me because... Cool, cool. What does the message say? It's an address. Looks like an old subway terminal. Been out of service since the 80s. Think it's a trap? Nah. Doesn't have a trappy vibe. What kind of vibe, then? I have no idea. And that's what scares me. Seeing this? Bro, what the hell is happening? <laughs> Look at this, a spider hero. We were all saved. Um, hi? Who are you? Me? I'm just a bartender who does favors for people every now and then. And I've learned that rogue spider bots are dangerous and bad for business. Let me take those off your hands. Whoa! Thank you, Spider-Man. We can always count on you to do the right thing. You're welcome. And if Miguel comes looking for these, tell him finders keepers. Wait, who's Miguel? <laughs> What the hell was that? I, uh, wish I knew. <laughs> <laughs> 